puppy hole, you can put your sauce Oh, in. thank you. Oh, all right. I'll just toss it in there. Shit, are we live? Oh, fuck. What happened? Are we live? live. Yeah. <laughs> We're live. All right, so tighten up. Yeah. Right. Let's get in there. All right. Good? All right. No. Where's that cord? Hey, everyone. We, all right, so uh, an abrupt beginning, but hey. All right, well, we are live uh, in Tokyo, at, yes. in Odaiba Islands, uh, at the pre, the 15th Pre-Cooperation Cup right now. Yes. And we're going to be cutting over to some matches that are already in progress, if we can figure out who they are. Right. All right, so here we go. That is uh, our Japanese commentary friends over there. All right, they, they, are, still, they are still engaging in commentary. Yes. Um, so what's going on, everyone? Right, no, the matches have not actually started yet. We're good. So in the meantime, what's going on, everyone? My name is Andrew J. Landy, a.k.a. Duralath. Uh, I commentated at the Fall Classic in uh, North Carolina earlier this year. With me is one of our favorites, Thomas Shin, a.k.a. Arliath. You might have seen him from all of the Street Fighter V tech mining that's going on. Arliath, how are we doing today? I am so scrubby right now. <laughs> How I'm so free. How long has it been since you played? Like, I honestly, played Third Strike. I mean, I played yesterday yeah. in a smoke-filled, dingy arcade <laughs> on the second floor. Okay. You know, in the in the red light district of uh, of Ikebukuro. But right. aside from that, I uh, haven't really gotten a whole lot of games in. But everyone from the other the other East Coast American team uh, that we played with last night, yes. uh, with Nika Ko, with um, uh, Mutant XP, uh -huh. uh, Frankie, and the others, they're, they're in really good form. And I'm actually confident that they'll do really well tomorrow. I, but today yes. is the Pre-Cooperation Cup. And Pre-Cooperation Cup is special because this is where you get to see your favorite low-tier, fantastic <laughs> characters yes. all teamed up together. You want you want five necros? You get five necros. You want five Qs? You're gonna get five Qs. All it's right. Gotta start right now. I think here we go. All right. Uh, this is Matsuda-san. Yeah. Basically, he, the big Kahuna behind everything, right? Yes. He runs this every year. Mm. He's also the owner of Game Newton. Mm. He's also speaking a language I totally can't understand. That's good. All right. We're just really happy to be here. See what teams we've got coming up. All Ryu. Right, it's, uh, it's block three with a defeated permit. Uh, 12, 31, and 61. All right, here we go. Oro versus Ryu. The new teacher versus the students. All right. Unfortunately, we were trying to figure out who these teams are at the moment. All right, very good. While we're waiting on the, to, while we're waiting to get the info on the teams, let's go ahead and get into the action here. Right now, both players kind of feeling each other out. Oro with great limbs, able to play really good keep away. That's trade there. Ryu with a good anti air stand strong. Still again trying to feel each other out, trying to gauge the process. How do we want to play right now? Well, wow, almost half the time is already eclipsed in this match. No big life leads. Nice overhead there. Another overhead. Oro really playing the keep away game. Fireball's trade. Again. All right. Oro oh, with a corner throw. Throws. And he activates Yagyo Dama. Super 2 with a fireball. Gets that strike throw there. And the throw back into the corner. Oro looking good for the advantage. And there it is. Round 1. Going to Oro. There we go. Round 2. All right, now Oro not not with a full meter just yet. Ryu has one stock. All right, both characters with one stock. Again, trying to play this neutral game, trying to stay trying to stay spaced, 
trying to get feel each other, get that lucky hit to start their offense. Here we go. Nice low parry. Only gets a stand forward for it. Nice low forward confirm. Shiku Hudukin. Tatsumaki's in. That's safe to approach with. Overhead, overhead. Whips the throw. Oro now on the offensive with pressure. Backs off. Establishing space. One more time. Low strong. Nothing. Building more meter. Now, Oro's very dangerous in that with Yagi Odama, he has access to an unblockable setup. A very easy unblockable setup. And he gets three of those. Right, so you notice that the meters aren't all equal like in Street Fighters 4 and 5. The meters differ between the characters. So not everything's the same. There you go, with an unblockable setup. Juggle. One more. Here we go. Walk a little forward. Dash, dash. Jump, jump. There's a cross up. Character 1 on the Ryu team goes down. Oro team up 1 0. All right, and we are. We're zooming it out of oh my this God. child. <laughs> I love it. All right, very good, very good. His child is inspiring him, bringing him good luck, bringing him good vibes today. All right, all right. I have translated. I have translated teams for the people. All right, thank you, Arlyth, for the translated list. Uh, but you know what? Um, uh, we need to get a copy of the blocks. Like the Japanese uh, uh, streamer tab. Okay. All right, so here we go. All right, now this time Ryu pushing a little forward. Nice counter sweep there. Ooh, crash fish shot on Pierce to stay in the corner. All right, it's 1231 and 2 Okay. All right, Oro is now out of the corner. The fireball tried to chase it down, but Oro read it and blocked. Another EX fireball. EX fireball, a great tool for Ryu. Safe on block, safe on parry, even. Activates Yagyodama, corner pressure, but he tosses out at the perfect angle. Oh, uh, neutral throw. Now, the bad thing about Oro's neutral throw, you can mash out of it. With all the strike, with all the strike throws, uh, the mashable throws in this game, if the opponent mashes fast enough, they can mash out of it. And with Oro, since it has such fast startup, you can actually mash out after one hit. By the way, this this Ryu play, uh, this Ryu's team uh, has Kuni and Banao on it as long as well as, as, well as uh, Nami Chain. Oh wow! So it's kind of a stacked Ryu team. A very strong Ryu team. However, it turns out Oro right now is uh, currently considered to be in the upper echelons. Yes. Uh, at least in like in the most recently published uh, tier list by Boss. Yes. B O S S. Uh, he firmly believes that Oro is uh, actually A tier, which is. Kind of new because Oro is uh, recently, or, uh, up to recently considered to be a bit here. You know, it, it makes sense considering how great his normals are, the pressure he gets with Yagi Odama, unblockables, a harder unblockable to get out of, I think, than Urien's. Urien's is much easier to get out of nowadays. That's true. Plus, his mobility is really good, too. Oh, like yeah, that. Again. His dash is right under, a, uh, right under the jump in and throws it for the kill. Yeah. That low profile dash, it goes under fireballs at certain ranges. It's amazing. And he gets tagged with the EX fireball right there. Yeah, wow, corners him within the first couple seconds, keeping him in there. Or doesn't have a chance to chicken kick out because Ryu is keeping it, like is keeping his distance and not and not overextending himself by going into the corner. Now I find it very interesting. He's done a Jodan twice, and after the Jodan, you get a follow-up. He's gone for just regular standing pierce. He doesn't go for uppercut or tatsumaki afterwards. He's going for a 50-50 after every time. Nice parry there. Oro goes down. Scores 1-1. You, you notice how Oro tried to super jump out and Ryu just jumped back with him. Yes, he read right. it. Just did not like wasn't an anti air. It just prevented him from using any kind of like jump over double jump shenanigans in order to get a cross up. All right, score is one one for this Oro versus Reuse showdown. And again, folks, most of the teams you're gonna see for pre cooperation cup are five man teams, and all of the players are playing the same character on each team. So that's why you're seeing five Oros, five Reuse right now. The same guys in different clothing. Shinsho Ryuken, interesting choice. Not exactly the best Super Core Ryu, but still a very viable Super, huge damage. Yeah, it's actually really rare for uh, for anybody to see Shinsho Ryuken being used. It's usually, it's usually Shinko Hadouken because of the amount of EX meters that you get. Right. However, you can't, you can't really use Denji in the world because he is a big pickup, and he's got, the big, he's got one of the biggest stuff in the game. So, I mean, and not to mention, he's got a ton. Allows him to recover stuns 100% faster than normal. Ah, oh, yes. Uh, one of the big things about this game is that taunt actually means something in this game. They're actually quite useful. So the attack boost, defense boost, stun recovery boost as well. So if you're seeing taunt in this game, don't think it's distracting because indeed it's got a use. By the way, maybe you might have forgotten that uh, you can't back to the camera the game. So when Oro is running around with like three grand pieces of garbage floating above his head, yeah, that's um. That, that 
that chip damage is real. Okay, so this is the first we're seeing of Oro's Tengu Stone super. It's a precious uh, super, just like our lion said. Now, there's, now the thing about Oro, he's got two versions of his supers. One is a regular version where you're going to see three stones with Oro, for example, but if he activates using two or three buttons, that's the EX version. And what it is, you're going to use that more for juggles, so you're going to confirm with that one. You're going to see juggles right now, you might see it. There it is. Ten there it is. Five. There's five hits. Yes. Or uh, five, uh, five locks. Five stones. Unlimited juggle meter. Yes. And it gets caught. Follow up. Oh, oh drops he off. dropped it. All right, now he's making some room. He, he's, got that, he's got that liberty. Right. Uh, lo that luxury to do that. Oh. Nice carry. Okay. How's uh, he going to set up the super? Oh, this is bad. Let's get out of there. Oh, opts to go in. Quarters himself. Reus. Oh! Boy, made this. That could have been huge. Make this comeback? Oh, no. I'll throw that. Oh! 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 He had the read on the uppercut, but the parry didn't come out the second time. That multi hit uppercut from Oro. Low, high, high. Low, Very high. Very low, high, high. Very good. All right, Vanau looks like he's... No, Vanau's going next. Oh, Vanau. For the, for the first time in my life, I have, this is a, I, have, I am not seeing Vanau wearing a Hawaiian shirt. Is that, is that his trademark? Tom? Yeah, it's, usually he's wearing a Hawaiian shirt. I don't know. Maybe the man is all business this year. No Hawaiian shirts. We're not leisurely the, here. The leader of the Ryu army? Yes. Uh, building a meter. Oh, oh, he taunt. Okay. So, Tom, can you explain Ryu's taunt to us? So Ryu's taunt uh, allows him to uh, allows him to recover stun throughout the rest of the round at an enhanced rate. Uh, unlike Oro's, which has to actively be used to drain stun. All right. So, oh, wow, oh. he really wants to control the ground with those EX fireballs. And now, now the Oro is going to be generating meter at a way faster rate. Yes. The uh, the air chicken kicks you're seeing. Easy way for uh, Oro to build meter. Again, we're playing this full screen game right now. Neither player wanted to commit until they've got the bars ready to engage. EX laming it out. Yes. 30, Still laming it out. 30. He's really going to let him. Wow. wow. Okay. Daring he's gonna, he's gonna run the clock down. Activates Tengu Stone. Oh, right, normal version. Okay, he's going to go for the chip. Oh, low force. Get the Shinko And another taunt. That was unnecessary. That second taunt was totally unnecessary. I don't know. He might be paying for Whoa. it. That was tricky. That was a cross up. All right. Catch him. Cut the back dash. Oh no! Oh, no! We'll see those super super. Corner throw. Oh, that's super. Oh, oh. using it. Doesn't need it. All right, doesn't need it. Good idea. The idea. Just dash up. Dash up and sweep. Or after the block chicken kick is very minus on block. He's got a lot of ways you can punish him. That, that time he just kept it simple. No need to burn meter. Right. Yeah, now now he's pretty much got full meter. Yes. He only has to worry about Oro gaining meter again. Uh, if he lets him, or if he gets if he gets a launch combo off. All right, nice on that stand around. Roundhouse. roundhouse kicks, by the way, of Oro's do some of the highest stun of the game. It's uh, it's almost like thirty percent, like twenty five it, at least. It's like twenty five percent stun. If you get hit by four of those, you are fucked. Or, or you are you are done. Yes. So, uh. He's gonna, oh, I thought he was going to super cancel after the fireball. Oh, he nice. That's a rip anyways. Another taunt. All right. That was the first taunt of the round, so he doesn't really have to worry about the taunt too much at this point. Right. All right, about the, uh, about the stun. All right. You really still oh, got a super on him. There nice. it is. Massively negative on block. But you can't parry that grab. That's the thing. Right. So earlier, that aura was doing low forward to fireballs, right? And if you establish that pattern, it makes your opponent want to red parry the fireball after the uh, after blocking the go forward. So what you do what you can do afterwards is you start baiting your opponent into uh, into red parrying your uh, your grapple, uh -huh. and that will that would not only screw him up but it also would also possibly put him in the corner. Uh, and, and it would have and it would have given him a knockdown. All right. So for now, playing against the next care uh, things against the next Oro, still taking it easy. Oh, he's he's already he's already winning the meter game. There's the first EX fireball of the round. There's a, sec there's a second time. All right, now this aura has switched back to the Yagyo Dama Super. Yeah. Catches them low. Yeah, this guy is gonna try to get uh, Ryu in some traps, uh, some cross up traps. You'll see here. Uh, you'll see later, possibly. If Benal, uh lets his guard down. Benal with a low forward confirmation. Is the Shikwadukin? There's another time. 
caught the dash there that time. All right, now again, Will eight to build meter. Oro with 1% life left. He can touch him wow, and... Wow, he's... Oro's hunting him down. Oh, oh, oh no. There it is. Oh, but he, he's a corner. Oh, did he drop oh. that? Yeah, oh, he, he dropped he, 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 he dropped that. So generally, what you'll see, you'll see in the corner, Oros will do the chicken, those launcher combos into the chicken kicks, and they'll do crouch press canceled into Tengu, or excuse me, into Yagodama. Oh wow! Oh, that medium kick of Oros is incredibly good poke. That might and be. And he's also though. home in as well. Yes. Lost in the corner. Oh, all right. I was too early to do a delay chicken kick for a launch. Oros can actually trigger a launch uh, for a midair, like as he's about to land with a kick. I uh, stand fierce there from Ryu. Because it looks like you're got, he's going to throw you and he doesn't. Because he hovers off the ground. Toss him across the screen again. Oh, the punish! Oh, if he had caught... Nah, if... Oro, like, Oro couldn't have uh, canceled the Yagyodama, it wouldn't have worked. It wouldn't have come out in time. Right. Uh-oh. Look at again. Fine. Oh, oh, and he got to take round two. Oh, round two. Well done. The best part about it is the players are really enjoying the game right now. It's, it's a great time. They're laughing it up. They're having a good time as they're you playing. You can hear how much fun everyone's having right now. Yeah, I don't know if you guys can hear the ambient noise in the crowd, but everybody is cheering right now with what's going on. Nice berries. Nice. Caught the dash. That had to be a. You know the reaction to a read. That had to be a. That had to be a read. Go for it. Oh, oh, got sunk by two hits. That's fine though. Giant stomp ball for the... Oh! The, the not so shimmy. Oh! That's not the full combo. He doesn't get the full combo. Oh, here we go! Oh, that could be One, a blockable? Two. Oh, no, he didn't... Oh, all right, here we go. Pressure. Oh! oh he has wow. not used that overhead. Ryu is on the ropes. Hey! Oh, wow, Manal goes down! The Manal has been slain. So who do they send him next? Now we've seen Supers 1 and 2, again for Ryu, again this Ryu picks Super 1, opting to stay with good confirms. All right, now Shoto Sweep, not very safe, but Aura didn't get much of a punish off that. Dash in, throw. Now, both of Aura's throws, neutral throw and any directional throw, it always ends up throwing him, the, the opponent in the opposite direction. So, it's good if you need to revert, get everything back to neutral. But you're not going to get a forward throw in the corner at, at any point. Sweet, nice. Using the EX Fireball to stay safe, overhead. Hollow Brown Breaker, as some of you players might know it. All right, using fireballs to delay the Yagyo from coming. Ryu fighting out of the corner. Low forward, try to parry that. Nice. Now he's been great about calling out those dashes. He's not letting Oro dash it for free. Oro might need to change the range before he goes in. Oh, he, he's trying to play much more aggressive than now it is. Yeah, look at the range he's fighting from. But he gets a toss in the corner. But this is bad against Yagyo Dama. He used, out. he used Jab Yagyo, which uh, I believe uh, flies a little lower than uh, the, the Fierce right. Yagyo. There, there's four different versions of Yagyo Dama. They, ha they have different angles. The, th the first three versions have different angles, and the EX version is just a gigantic, like it's not, like Super Saiyan, like it's not ball. Yes, oh, Fear Ball. It's, it's overhead. Interesting. Uh, this is going to be a kill. Oh, oh not enough chip. Low forward. Nice, but he burned a meter right there. That's actually pretty good in Oro's favor because now Ryu's only starting with a little less than one meter. He would have had one and change. Again, thinking about the future as he fights for the future, the theme of Third Strike. That throw is so good. That was Compa a like combined with the with Oro's fast dash speed. Yes. Ridiculous. Nice walk back. It's weird. You, you can't really shimmy in this game because it's also going to be parried and stuff involved as well. Low forward, nothing. Uh, but, oh! Oh, he did the fierce a little late. I think he had activated Chicken Kick already. Yeah, That's he did why it was activate Chicken Kick. It made him, uh, it made him airborne. 
Oh, though, still looking very healthy. Oh, oh nice. Austin before the year Marble Grand. Now oh, there's that shimmy. There's a shimmy. That was a shimmy. There was it. You win. All right. We await your return, warrior. Who's up next? Welcome to the world of I'm so engrossed yes. in, in the match yes. right now. I, I can't even. I'm losing well, well, track of everything. Oh, is he team captain? Uh, we had our captain now. He, he's wearing. He's wearing the team tag. Taisho. Ah, uh, Taisho. Okay. The, the, the team looks incredibly serious right now. Right. They don't seem like they're having fun anymore. No, 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 no. No more joking around at this point. When your tournament life is on the line, you gotta play hard. But now it's legendary Ryu team. All right, now we're seeing a little more of what we saw in, in previous and the uh, earlier matches. Again, right. Oh, right. Oh, he caught he caught the fireball. And Oro is out of the corner. Oh, that's nice, the great counter poke. Ryu has a really great counter poke with Crouch Fierce. Especially on a grounded parry, on a low parry, you can throw that up. It hits limbs, and you cancel into EX Joe down for a jump. Look at that! He's just gonna let him hang himself. Throwing fireballs won't really work here. That's right. nice, good counter poke there for Moro. Gotta set it up somehow. Uh -oh. Stays in front that time. Oh, I thought he was gonna car throw it uh, back in the corner. Interesting. Oh, the throw. It begins. The nightmare scenario oh, that he was worried about. Oh no! The, the main problem about Oro's throw game is that his back throw is one of the best in the game. His forward throw is stupid. Like, as in, useless. It's, a, it's, it's basically another just strike throw. Yeah, it's, it's a mashable throw. Right. And unfortunately, mashable throws in this game are garbage. Right. With uh, Oro's with Oro's mashable throw, uh, like we were saying earlier, it starts up so slow that the opponent can still mash out while the throws, while the throw animation is happening, and you end up only getting one of the hits of the strike throw. All right, Ryu on the offensive, corner pressure, full forward, EX Fireball. Another EX Fireball. Nice parry, but the throw is a little too far away. Activates Yagi Odama. Uh, not what he wanted. Good blocks. Ryu's got it. Oh, nice. Nicely done. His team claps. Alive by a friend. Ryu team still going strong. All right. The team discussing. I think we know who's going up. This is dire. All right, we got captain now. All right, this is a battle. I believe this is a Taisho battle indeed. Final member of each team. All right, here we go. Using uh, the Laker color, yellow and purple, purple and gold. Again, this full screen conservative game. Showing the limits of my knowledge here. Even though I've been playing this game for almost like 20 years. Alright. Both players just really waiting for it. Oro though with a slight lead. Look how little damage is actually treated. With and, and the match is almost half over already. There's the Noble Ford Fireball. Oh. Nice anti-air fireball. Wow. Sweet. Overhead. Back up. Wait for it again. The Ford Fireball. That mobility is some of the, oh. That mobility is some of the most annoying I've had to deal with. Now, right. Yeah, I go down in the corner. Oh, good parry. Nice overhead. Nice jump back roundhouse. He cannot catch his Oro. And look, he's gonna let him go over the here. He meets him in the air with a jump roundhouse. Oro team one round away from taking this match. Are you ready? Go. Oh, that point. All right, feel it out. Fireballs clash. Mood's a little intense right now. Oh. Uh, a little bit. Jab uppercut gets swept. Now Ryu with corner pressure. Go for it as parry. Remember he was throwing those EX Fireballs earlier, he was worried about uh, getting carried, and then he used, he used the EX Fireball to cover yourself. Oh, that was amazing. Oro, one of the characters that has a corner throw. Burning, wow. Oh, air throw. Uh-oh. Oh, air throw. Oh, yeah. it's looking bad. Uh-oh. Oh, can't take, take, can't take after that. Oh, true unblockable. 
Hey, another unblockable. Oh no, he oh, doesn't. Oh, he dropped it. Dropping the bomb. Oh, yeah, he's going raw. He's going raw. Sweep, sweep, sweep. Third sweep, no good. Shot back, medium. Activate Yagyo Dama. Oh, causing two different angles. Oh. oh. Gets it. The Oro team does it. Yes. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> uh, well fought. Ah, uh, the Ryu team. Better taste of defeat. Yes. Manau's team is already out. What, 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 what a way to start off pre-co-op Cup 15 with, with an epic Oro versus Ryu match. That's something you normally don't expect. You're normally gonna, a lot of people they expect, you know, Chun-Li, Ken, and Yun. So we're going to cut into a different match right now. It looks like a Dudley team versus a Ken team. All right. Arlyth is going to look up who is playing right now. The action going. Nice. He carries. Blocks. Low forward. Shifu. Ken versus Dudley. A match in Ken's favor. Ken a little oh. more mobile. All right. So who do we have? Oh, it's Kokujin, Gunfight, Loli team. Oh, wow. So leader of this team, I believe it's Kokujin. Now the uh, Dudley team very strong. Jump in. Backswing blow. Dudley. Oh, my God. Another backswing blow. Oh, this Ken team is stacked also. It's got Hebo to you uh, and Spellmaster J. Oh, Spellmaster J, you say? Well, Spell, we, we have to see Spellmaster J because the actual translation of his name. No, no, don't yeah, go there. Let's not go there. All right, nice. anyways. All right, here we go. All right, the, the early jump against Perry. Low forward, shoot. With. Ken with the corner pressure. He's going to push on the corner. No. Uh, wake up, baby. Throw whips. The sweep. Dudley can't do much over there on that sweep. Oh, he's trying to win on the footsie step. But Dudley still has an impressive life lead. Low forward, shoot. Yet again, it should be a little more even now. Big cross up. Big oh. cross up. Big cross up. Oh, all right. All right. Wait. It is It is Spell J. <laughs> Old man Spellmaster J. I think Spellmaster J might have been playing Street Fighter longer than some of the uh, Street Fighter players have been born. Oh, oh gunfight! Gunfight! French Dudley is up. Vive la France! Vive la France! You might have seen him, he's been streaming Alex from Street Fighter V, but he, as a third strike player, he played Dudley. Here we go. Throw. Another throw. Okay, now that overhead, it's a two hit combo. Two oh! Hit. Oh, he didn't have a super, he didn't have a super yet at the time. Look at the corner pressure. Trying to keep him contained, but as I say that, Spellmaster J on the offensive now with the corner pressure. Throw! Spell J, by the way, a former SBO champion. Yeah, SBO in, uh, what, uh, do you remember what year? Uh, I can't remember. Might have been multiple times. Oh, oh. No, he baited him into an uppercut. That was, that was hard. That might have been excellent. He decides to... Go with ducking upper cancels into corkscrew bow to complete the kill. Gunfight looking very healthy right now. Oh, oh, oh that's gonna oh, be that's huge. Gonna hurt. Look at that stun damage. Dudley has some of the most explosive stun in the game. Him and uh, him and uh, Makoto. I agree. Yes, definitely. Alex as well, actually. All right, here we go. Oh, uh, no four, nothing. No four, nothing yet again. Oh, look at that range that he's trying to oh. Alright, he tosses out. Push corner him. Oh. I'm not sure what that ducking was. Dudley's jump ins are really difficult to parry, by the way, because he, he can vary the timing up dramatically using uh, Jump Fierce and Jump Roundhouse. Oh, it didn't fall for the oh, bait! Did no punish! That uh, and... Oh, oh the punish on the whip punish on the sweep! Wow! wow. He still got spell J! Oh. Wow! The that whip punish! Sick. The whip punish! He was able to see that. He was able to see that the sweet whip immediately. Gunfight goes into ducking, does not cancel into upper, but instead just empty cancels, ducking into super. There it is. Well played by Gunfight. And remember, ladies and gentlemen, this is just pre-co-op cut. There's still so much more action happening this weekend here. So make sure you stay tuned. Do not change that. Do not change that address. Make sure you bookmark it. Make sure you like the channel. You're following it. You're keeping up with all the updates. All right. I think it was a uh, a missed pick. So no, I don't believe there's a. No, they have to kill it off. Yeah, they have to kill it off. 
So that's uh, one of the drawbacks of doing everything on the on our on arcade is you can't really just hit pause and reselect. So we're gonna go with that. So tell me your thoughts right now on all the matches we've seen so far. Uh, I I can't even keep up with what is going on. Um, I can't. The game has been around since 1999. Uh -huh. uh, it's practically it's practically old man status, just like Super Turbo. Right, right. right. So it's just one of those things where you just accumulate all this all this like random knowledge. And we didn't have a lot of the hitbox tools back then that we used to. We didn't have like we had some of the frame data, but oh my god, like we weren't nearly as technical as we, uh, like as, as we are nowadays for uh, for playing Super Five. I definitely agree. We had to. Look at everything off of you know, uploaded files to servers and downloads me for never again. Alright, so here we go. Gunfight coming off that impressive victory. There we go. Are you ready? Go! Taking the white Ken. Gunfight has really good neutral for that, I have to admit. Like he he uses Dudley's like he uses Dudley's footwork really well. But alright, got himself out of the corner, which is great. <laughs> wow! Random uh, machine gun blow. Okay. Ken now with the advantage, but he's backing up. Now we're fighting neutral. Oh, that's a big oh, punish! That was a hard read. Getting that did not pay off. Big damage. Stays in front. Fight. Had to fight his way out. Nice! That was good. That, uh, that anti-air time you were talking about earlier, Tom. Dudley with really good ways to modify the timing. Oh, oh it's too late. Nice! Let's go, guys. Prepare <laughs> strike. Now. Gunfight giving him the business. Short, short, super! The other thing is that what of what of Dudley's uh, biggest weaknesses in third strike? Oh, good red parry right there. That red, that EX fireball is actually safe on parry, but right. uh, but the Ken, for, for whatever reason, this Ken decided to uh, press the attack. But yeah, Dudley's biggest weakness is that it, is that he has no low footies. Like the only one that reaches out with any distance is that crouch and roundhouse kick. And that's a huge commitment. Oh wow, he opted to just go for uppercut right there instead of burning it into a, a meter combo. I think he wants to save it for third round. Uh oh, oh, he got him in the corner. Oh, oh good pick to confirm. Far stand strong. Link into super. Ken with a myriad of ways to confirm into a super. That's why he's such a great character in third strike. I'm pretty sure every player in this room has a pocket catch. Miss that pocket combo right there. He's doing, he's doing delay they jump in with, uh, with Jump Strong. Okay. Instead of Pierce. Wake oh, up, Super! Let's hit with the Wake Up. The 2001 special. Oh, landed in front. That is that is such a tricky, ambiguous uh, follow-up afterwards. Oh, I definitely agree on that. Nice. Not a lot of things... Not a lot of moves aside from Super has caused hard knockdown in this game, but right. with the hard knockdown, Ken gets an ambiguous jump in setup where he can land on either side of you and force you to guess, where's he going? Oh, try to go for the rush again. Is he ready to make himself? Oh, he's not gonna reach! He's, he's jab first instead of fierce! Before nothing. Oh, that dash up. Gunfight! Two wow. notches in his belt! Look at Koku Jane in the back, in the white hat. So happy with his teammates play right now. Koku Jane doesn't want to play. Right. The last thing your captain ever wants to do is actually play. Best case scenario, you just go the entire tournament without ever touching the stick. Gunfight looking like the man to beat right now. Who would have thought that the Dudley team, the Dudley team, might potentially take out a Ken team? Well, you know, I think it's the nature of Third Strike. You know, a lot of people think that it is just a Chun Li Kenyon dominated game, but when you've got character specialists, it's anybody's game at this point. That's true, especially when they're when they start to uh, collaborate and come up with uh, counter strategies against uh, not just not just uh, your character but the players themselves. Yes. 
What's really important about Quantum is that it's kind of a combined knowledge of like, oh, hey, I played this game, this guy all the time at this arcade. Right. Uh, I, I know that he likes to do this against Sunday or that against Sunday. You can exploit this, and so your knowledge of your matchup uh, can actually work against you uh, at cooperation coming to free cooperation. All right. All right. It looks see. like it looks it looks like Gunfight might be downloaded at this point. Fair strike now. Alright, does Gunfight have any gas left? Oh yeah, fatigue is a factor as well. This is true. Oh! The, uh, he might have exposed a pattern of himself, so I put himself there. Great zoning from the Ken. Oh, this is just intense. Oh. Alright, there is recovery on the ducking, so if you're not... If you're not confident, you, know, you can get thrown. You can get thrown out of it if you don't cancel into anything. You gotta be very careful with that. Ken fishing with the uh, standing pierces catches a lot of Dudley's moves. Watch your legs. Oh, one more time. He's not. Uh, he's not punishing those uh, those sweeps. Right. Now that he has super, he can do it. <laughs> Another. Uh, there right. That same pattern. Oh, he wasn't able to react to the throw in time either. Oh. Oh. Down yeah, goes he's the like gun. You win. Alright, who's next? Let's see who it is. Is it Gokujin? No. 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 Yeah. Alright. Well, Unfortunately, we can't hear the um, we can't hear the, the Japanese commentators either. Same. Oh, he's using the same color as Gunfight. Yep. Maybe he's looking for a little bit of that charm. Hoping it'll come with him. The sweep is no good. He's, he scouted that. Wow. Ken already... much faster fight than before. Ken extending that life lead. Sweep no good again. Punish. Low so forward. many hard reads from this Dudley. He's going in there. Wow, again. Not really paying off, but I mean, he's trying. You know, at this point, no. just go for it. Let's have a little fun. Oh, try to use the backswing though. Not enough of a, not enough of a commitment from Ken's part to uh, their punishment for it. Ooh, throw out of the cross under. Ken's, uh, Ken is just like throwing out those crafty jabs with the swords just in case. Uh, got him? Oh, oh, you got him! Barely. Oh, whoa! Weird thing. His body clipped forward because of the crash around house. Nice. His gotcha. Ken is jumping back and forth like a loot. Short, nice. short, super. Again, Ken, a million ways to combo into. Uh, oh, wake up, super! Yeah. Wow, he didn't go for the, he didn't go for the ambiguous cross. Nice, nice. There's the punish. With punish. There's the punish. There we go. Final round. Go for it. You gonna seal the deal? Another sweep. Oh, could have, could have canceled into it. That roundhouse, arguably Dudley's best uh, best button, I think. Uh -oh. Ooh, wow, that's, that was a good parry. Yeah, you know, he's been abusing lows for the entire match. That's it's about true. time. Uh -oh. But, no, he didn't break that stage. Didn't no. <laughs> Got himself out. Wake up, EX upper. Dudley corners himself. Ken, Ken just needs like one hit confirm in a super. Throw. Maybe he even needs that. Shoot. Got his signs of blowing on EX Fireball. Oh, is that's not gonna reach. Not for full damage. Oh, no! oh he gets it anyways! Oh, looks like the Ken team is on life support. Oh no. Oh no, they're Oh! He's calling him out! Oh. He's calling him out! Oh! Here we go. There's blood in the water. See a point and a peace sign to the fans out there all around the world. All right. Here we go. General Ken, Taisho Ken is on. 
by the way, you have to remember that uh, let's remember that Cooperation Cup is not a single elimination type of tournament in the beginning. Uh, these are pools. So you have a pool of, uh, of, three, of three teams, uh, and then you have to win the majority of the games in it. So just because you lose doesn't necessarily mean that you're necessarily out. Oh, okay. Ooh, big, big if, combo. If all three teams happen to lose the, lose the game, then, you know, like, weird things can happen. There's that stun you were talking oh, about earlier. Yep. Bop. Hey. Oh, that back swing. Wow. Keep it simple for big damage. Dudley yeah, team, right. one round away. Now. Nice. Again, that uh, stand around has a great buddy for Dudley. Low forward, EX Fireball pushing. Dudley fighting back. Low forward, EX Fireball again. Ken pushing towards the corner. Lands in front. Strong Fierce, Fireball. Strong Fierce, Fireball, no super. Damn, this Ken is getting away with the basic. Stop. But his basic is impeccable. Look at that, that great anti-air. They're still alive. Ken is not going down without a fight. Here we go. Girl, girl playing on the other cabinet. Oh, it got the sweep. sweep into the corkscrew blow. Crowd punch works this time. Oh, didn't confirm that in the super. Kokujin would have gotten that every time. Ah, nice. E EX show Ryu. Good anti-air. Oh, blow, smash and blow on the wake up. Oh. Hey. Wow. There it is. Wait. Dudley team. <laughs> Look at how happy Kokujin is for his Kokujin's teammates. Like, I never wanted to play. <laughs> I hate this game. <laughs> Great stuff from the Dudley team. But again, like you were saying, Tom, the Ken team is not out just yet. It is pool play, so. All right, who are we going to see next? Let's see who we've got. Ah, just well you have no idea. Oh, John Gambon. So we're choosing sides right now, looks right, like. We're gonna switch to a Yang versus Oro team right now. I've honestly never really seen Yang versus Oro. It's not a matchup you normally oh, so see that in. It's an Oro team from earlier. Oh, okay. Which is uh, Team 61, which has a Yude, Hutan, Hasegawa, Juno, and Yudi. Okay. Names that I am not familiar with, unfortunately. Okay, so here we go with Oro versus Yang. How often have you seen this matchup? Ever? Uh, not often. Oh! Wow! Okay. Some tricky CMB stuff right there. I'm wondering if it's Oro's little hitbox that contributes it's to that. Could be. Oh, By the way, uh, Oro has trouble trying to juggle Yang with his, uh, uh, with his bread and butter. Yes. Uh, the, the strong the strong punch and the chicken kicks. Right. The, the, if he does wow. one hit... Did you see... Was that a wake-up roll kick? Wow. Okay. Strong Ferris Ferris. Like, oh. He threw the cross By the way, you notice after his target combo, he waited. He delayed the activation of Sei Yimbu. Yes. It's to screw up uh, the timing of Quick Rise for the opponent. Okay. Yeah, because you have a lot of time to do that. You can you can throw the very first frame that the palm hits, but if you wait, and then uh, right before they're about to hit the ground, uh, then you pretty much guarantee a hard a hard knockdown. Because okay. right there, you saw him Quick Rise there. Very easily. Oh. There's Almost done. Almost done. Activates. EX. Oh, oh, there it is. Oh, that was the EX version. Oh, high fives all around. High, high fives all. Oh, and hugs. <laughs> wow. Oro team advances. Oro team doing work. And yes, well fought. Well fought. This is one of the, uh, the great things about the. Uh, you, know, you normally don't see that for, for most Yangs, uh, using Super 3. Normally most Yangs will opt for Super 2. Uh, just like Ryu, it's a lot of EX meter, and Yang has so many ways to cancel into the EX slash. But this time, you saw against Oro, Super 3. So, anyway, we're going to another match here. Ken team versus Elena team. Might be the uh, Ken team from earlier. Elena, such an interesting character. Well, for Ryu, and yeah, now, you see, he'll do double Shoryu. You actually don't need a Kara cancel against Elena when you get a jab Shoryu. You can actually do doubles. Like it's a lot of the other characters, you actually have to Kara cancel either a crouching forward kick or a crouching roundhouse kick to get the extra range to push Ken forward to do the to get the same. Elena though, looking very healthy. Here we go. Go for it. Now Elena using Brave Dance. Elena's will switch between Brave Dance, which is her easy, the best, her best confirmed super, or Super 3 healing. This time we're opting for the damage. 
Elena, also known kind of as Chun-Li Light, kind of the same mentality when you use her. Great normals, easy confirm super. Great car throw as well. Now you're seeing Ken with the corner pressure. Oh, by the way, so yes. the Ken team is a Spell Jays team. Yes. So it's going against the Elena team that has a Atsugari, Banba, Sei, Boiler, and Odin. Okay. By the way, shout outs to Hismith third uh, over in. Uh, for uh, for translating all these team names, huge lightsaber for us. Right. Oh, Ken is still alive. Here we go. <laughs> yes, that is. So I don't know if he's recovered yet from no. the previous loss. Right. The hype might be too much to contain right now. Oh, jump in roundhouse. Gets a super. Push to the corner. All right, Elena establishing that space again. Oh, another oh. jump in roundhouse. Great wave. I think he's very timing on that just a little bit. Making it a little harder for Elena to parry. Backs up. Oh! oh got he's him. in a brave dance! The cojones. All right, that back roundhouse right there. Great bite from Elena. What it does, it makes her a little airborne. It pushes her back. It pushes her out of throw range. And it will avoid a couple of blows in the game, too. It'll counter low attacks yes. pretty much, too. Like that. The problem is that it's got such long recovery time that it's kind of an invitation for your opponent to just like uh, to either jump in or do something else. Guess a chip kill, nice. Got him with that. We await your return, All right. Let's see. Yeah, I'm for this. Unfortunately, there are a lot of other matches that we don't get to see. Right. Uh, but. And we have no control over it as well. Uh, but yeah, there are a lot of really good teams out there that uh, that will occasionally uh, get rotated as well uh, for, for the main stages. Alright, here we go. Oh, nice. With the slide, caught him well. Yeah, just so you know, there are like 66 teams of five people. Right. And again, that's just pre-co-op. That's pre-co-op comp. This is not the main event. The main event has something like 90 teams. Almost 500 players. But there's right. All right, confirmed into super. Elena's got one on deck, though. Ooh, not sure. Crouching jab to counter her roundhouse shenanigans. Okay, trying to run away now. Trying to make the Elena overextend herself. Elena not having it. Refusing to get trapped. Oh, tries to get the EX Rhino Horde for the overhead. Oh. Wow, Ken running away, run away, run away. Ooh, oh, that, should be, that should be it, that should be it. He caught the parry, low strong, confirmed into Brave Dance. Here we go. Strong Ferris, oh, late, no. Whoops. Big damage. Oh, didn't blow the EX meter uh, with the uh, like, with the Rhino Horn. I think he didn't have enough meter at that point, yeah. so he had oh, to settle way, for a scratch. Sorry, the battle smash is the overhead, not the Rhino Horn. Uh, earlier, okay, I, I mixed up my moves. Oh, building meter. Wow. Now he's at one stock. Oh, oh overhead. And didn't deep enough to do it. Get the jungle off. Oh, no, too, too far, far, too far. The extra work I think. Nice. You win. So for those of you who are wondering, who might be new to Third Strike, when you see those universal overheads, those are activated by pressing both Strong Punch and Forward Kick. Now what you saw there, if the, the universal overhead lands while the while you're while you're falling on the downward arc, you have enough time to actually cancel into super. Or and if your opponent is crouching, you have even more frames to hit. Ah yes. Uh, in Street Fighter Three, in Third Strike, um, getting hit in a crouching state. It inflicts not only 25% extra damage to yourself, yes. but uh, also additional hit stun. So there are there are some confirms you'll only see when the opponent is indeed crouching. Right. All right, here we go. I believe it might be the only uh, Street Fighter series to do this. Ooh. You tried to put punish there on the uh, roundhouse, it was no good. Strong, nothing. Good exchange here. Oh no! Oh, oh no! Laid on the punish on the hurricane kick. Oh, forward, oh he missed the double uppercut. But he, 
He punished the whip throw right there with another low forward shippu. Ah, uh, dash back, cross up, nice. and there it is. Oh my god, that EX spin kick is such garbage. It's so good. Now. That is the EX Hunter that Chris and Terry wish he had. <laughs> right you are, Tom, right you are. Hey, Ken with his ambiguous cross up setup. Strong Fierce Fireball, super. Right a lot of times, this walk up, walk up in a target combo works so well because you think he's gonna throw you, and he's like, he just like bops you in the face right afterwards. Right. That walk, a walking pin is so scary in this game. But you see, walking pick up punish. Max Rangel is strong. A throw whip. Another throw. Oh, wow! I'm surprised you didn't get uppercut there. Nice. Oh, Elena abusing those car throws. Oh, her car throw range is so good. That's the one thing Ken doesn't have in this game. He doesn't have a good car throw. Right, he has like a backwards car off of his back, uh, back medium. Nice. Oh! Oh, wow! Oh, that was sick! Wow. EX Malice Mash, Go. and then baits, baits a throw to back. Uh, throw. Shimmy, big more shimmies. Oh, oh wow, well. no hit for him in a super. Oh, uh-oh. Uh -oh. I, oh, oh wow, still missing the, uh, the second uppercut. Yeah, now correct me if I'm wrong, you don't need a car on that second uppercut, right? Yeah. On Elena. Uh, it's, it's, you do, but it's not as hard to do. Okay. But somehow he's missing. Oh! Oh, max damage. Max damage. That's one of the other great things about Elena with Brave Dance. Oh. EX meter. Before the Fireball to find out. Dash him. Nice. Oh, Elena T. There we go. You win. Ah, uh, oh, the man. Eh? He's like, really, oh, guys? Oh, you're making oh, that guy. Old man says, Whippersnappers, I'm going to show you how it's done. I got the pizza. If he loses here, he'll never get a ticket to up on stage. Oh, do we want to hear the story? Or his pants. Oh, no. Here we go. He's not going to go full porn star. <laughs> oh, he's going to. Not, wow, that's a late carry, by the way. You have to know it's coming. You can't offer it like that. Nice that's Elena is using her standing slip kick for jab, but like really well as an anti air. Should I have to do it? Buffering a carry right before it. All right, he got the cross up. As far as I know, Strong Fierce Fireball Super does like three points less damage than Strong Fierce Super. So if he had actually done Strong Fierce Super, he would have killed on that Super in game. Yeah, I think you're right. Nice. Oh. Up the neutral. Oh, Strong press fireball super yet again. It is, however, easier to confirm. No. Oh, short, oh, short, short, short super. He gets three of these. Oh. Oh. Wow. Oh. oh, I'm crouching. Oh, that's got to hurt. Oh, wow. Oh. Atlanta's fighting away. Oh, oh no. That's got to be punished. Oh, yeah. man. If he had that. If he had that throw punish, because yeah. he had the shinny right there. Yes. Oh, that would have been so good. Yes, Belgian knows he was lucky. <laughs> that guy knows he was lucky. <laughs> oh, man. Sometimes you need a little bit of luck to win in this game. You can't just be 100% good every time. You know what they say? Better luck than good. Oh, they look worried. Catalina is not, uh, not statistically a match in, in Atlanta's favor. It's weighted towards Ken, so. <laughs> if you want to put it that way. Go. All right, nice. Ken's back throw is so strong because it almost guarantees corner. Oh, oh wow, I thought he was going to go uppercut. He might, have been too, he might have been a little too far for the jab uppercut. Or if he tried to use uh, Stronger Fierce, he would have gotten only one or two of the hits. He wouldn't have gotten the full uppercut, and as a result, he would have gotten punished. Okay. Dash up throw. Wait, is he healing? Healing! healing! Oh, it was oh, but short, 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 super! How do you say healing backwards? I don't know. <laughs> Uh oh! Ooh, that okay. was tricky! Nice! Tricky hidden balance smash overhead on the recovery. Okay. There we go. Air exchange, low forward. Oh, try to go for a ticket to uh, car throw there. 
Oh, it also so has cool. another meter for healing. Can't do anything after that. Now, guaranteed steps for healing, yeah. which he's got a plug and I need too. Ken Stanley Roundhouse in this game is stupidly good. Yes. It's a it's a great it's a great poke. Has high priority, and it's safe on block. Right. Oh no. Uh oh. That's fine. Don't let this man get a lead. Do not let him get a lead. Elena always has a lead. Auto attack. Back it up. Oh, max distance. That's good. good. Walks forward just long enough after the parry. Throw attack. All right, so one of the guaranteed setups for Elena. Off a back throw, she gets a full heal. Now I'm going to build meter. Uh oh. Oh. Uh, oh, what? he's missing his card throws! with all over the place. Oh, he's missing his card throws. Oh, he taunted for extra damage. But he was a little late. He lost it, though. He was late on the taunt, though. Yeah. That's... He's not going to need it, at least. Yeah, at this point, Lena's going to have to burn EX. Oh! What was that? He uh, thumbs up all around for the Ken team. All right. Yes. Congratulations to the Ken team. Yes. No, Master Jay is showing he can still bang with all the whippersnappers. Oh, oh, I all right. We're still going. We have another player. Yes. Uh, this action is intense right now. All right, back to Brave Dance for this character, for this player. So, Elena versus Ken is 7-3 in Ken's favor, according to Boss's tier chart. <laughs> yeah, I can see that. Elena is such a big hitbox. Ah, but these, these legs, oh, she's wow. so laggy. Capoeira showing strength. I think Elena is almost as tall as Urian. Yeah, I, I, I want to say so too. A little strong nothing. She just never stands up to her full height. Right. She's, she's always in that dance. Oh, position. no. You can't do raw malice like that. Right. A lot of players are definitely looking for that raw malice at that point. Star Chris. Uppercut, uppercut. Oh, there it is. Now, now, in the corner against most characters, you don't need to car a double uppercut because the range is so much closer. You just need to do one more. A couple of characters you do need Kara on, like the twins, but for most characters like the Shodos, Yurian, oh, Makoto, uh, Elena. There we go. Yeah, you just need only regular jab uppercut. See, that, see the thing about EX Mount, uh, EX, uh, Mount Yes. Uh, uh, it's got, uh, it's got homie on it. So if you use it at a closer range, it's not expected. Right. If you use it at max range in neutral, then it's, it's way more tolerant. Like a lot of players, they're going to see, just, they're going to look for that yellow flash and they instinctively know, parry high. Yeah. Like you know what it's going to be. Oh. And the corner is good too. Oh, oh use it as a throw it, bait. Beat it the throw. Well played. Wow. Isn't discouraged. Jeez. Nice. Wow. Oh, missed the juggle afterwards. Okay, back around oh. us. Another one, oh, another one. Oh, no. Get it too late. Wow, this Elena still has a full bar meter. Or a meter. Yeah, she's got one meter of Brave Dance. Cross up. Oh, no. Deep cross up, but no. Kick gets the corner uh, throw and another cross up throw. Has like, it has like no hit stun. One more throw. Four. Four. Oh, he went up finally. He went up for five. Thank God. Looking for that low strong confirm. Throw, throw. Cho oh. Cho super. Uh, super. Oh no. Ken looking very healthy at this point. Oh, oh yeah. the throw bait. Oh no. Fishing for it. Good series right there. Went for it. Very good series. Rihanna Elena pulls through. Wow, okay. Ken team looking to see who goes in. Discussing it over right now. What are they seeing about this Atlanta team? And again, cooperation between your fellow teammates. You gotta know what's going on. Alright, so that looks like let's see what's going on here. What's going on here? A little bit. I'm not sure what's going on. Discussing. They're, maybe they ask who's who they have left. Who's still who's still available on their yeah. team? Just to plan out. Do I want to throw out? Yeah, this, I mean, there's a lot of strategizing that's involved here. Yes. Team order. Team order is going to play a huge role. 
Even you, though it's just the same character five times in a row. Right. You know, like some some people are going to be more comfortable against certain players than others. Right, you are. Characters can be played in so many different ways in this game. There's not just a oh, you have to play this character, Turtle. You have to rush with this character. It's, you have to use this super. Right. Unless so, you're Chun. Unless you're Chun unless or Ken. or Yun. Or 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 Ken. Or Ken, yeah. Certain supers in this game are just too good to pass up, but other characters, they you know you have your options. Like Ryu can use supers one, two, and three reliably. Oro two and three. So. Makoto one and two. Makoto three if you're one. insane, and you really hate blocking. Ah uh, yes. We're we'll, guarding in Japan. We, 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 we won't we won't discuss super three with Makoto. <laughs> Unless, unless, unless your name is Mike Z. Yes. All right, so... We'll, we'll get to that later. All right, so it looks like we're waiting. I, I believe it looks like we're waiting on another team, maybe, or... I'm not sure what's going on. Yeah. Oh, uh, there might have... Oh, you know what? He might be complaining about six. Ah. Uh, I don't know. So uh, one of the few drawbacks about playing on an arcade is that invariably... You know, Machinery might get messed up, and if, if it if it malfunctions, it does take a little bit you know, to get in there and fix it. It's not like you can just grab another arcade stick to. It's not like you can just grab another arcade stick to, you know, really just switch out or borrow one. But you know, what? the best part about it playing on arcade is everybody's on the same machinery. Pretty much, yes. yeah. So. And you know what? If you really want to. You can you can be that guy and request side change. Uh, like, no, yeah. no, 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 I don't want to play player. One. I, I don't want to play player two. There are and, players that are. That and, oh, that's right. There are certain setups that only work if you're if uh, if you're on one player or two player side. Right. Like not the not the physical cabinet side, but right. like the left side or the right side of the screen. Okay. And so if you if you have a setup that only works if your character is on the left side of the screen, uh -huh. you want to play one player anyway because your chances of doing that are better. Right. There are certain players that have a a, a strong a preference uh, side. We won't go. We won't go into this, but uh, nope, nope. <laughs> <laughs> but anyway, folks. Uh, but yes. Anyway, folks, we'd like to uh, take a moment to thank you for joining us here for Pre Cooperation Cup. We're here in Odaiba in Tokyo, Japan. My name is Daryl Ath. I'm being joined here by our Lyeth. guys. This is literally just the first hour of Third Strike action here at Pre Cooperation Cup. It's been madness already. We've got a whole weekend of this full. So please make sure you bookmark the site, follow the channel, make sure you don't change out from it. Our life, I can't even I can't begin to speak about how crazy the third strike is that I've seen so far. What, what are you thinking right now, man? How, how are you feeling about these matches? I look at these I look at these games and I just want to say start coughing cigarette smoke because that's all I can remember from what like, watching the high level matches that I've played and seen throughout the past throughout this past week in uh, in Japan. But it's kind of like the the cost of doing business. Right. However, uh, yeah, the level the level of third strike play here has been consistently high for the for what has it been 18 years at this point. 18 years. Third strike is now technically legal. <laughs> if you wanted to date third, that's a that's I a. I mean, not that we haven't been smashing third strike's buttons for the past 18 years, <laughs> but okay. uh, let's just let, let's right, that's just the way it'll be. Right. Uh, all right, let's uh, let's switch over so. and. Uh, there, so now we're now we're seeing who uh, managed to get out. So it looks like so the Oro team. Yeah. Uh, managed to take it. Uh, managed to clutch it. Okay. It looks like there was a Urian team as well. Yeah. If you if you beat both teams, right. you're guaranteed out. And that was a uh, oh dirty music team. Oh. oh the, so uh, it's not just the, the the ones that we were watching, but also the uh, the ones in the other blocks because right. there, there are multiple arcade machines. There, right. I think there's what. Eight, sta eight right, stations, so, and we only get to see two of them. All right, so it looks like uh, I think they've got that Ken and Elena match almost set up, almost ready to go. Here yeah, we go, back in the Ken and Elena match. All right, the shooter is fixed. Here we go. With more beaten third strike action. All right, the throw was a little high there, and he was able to duck it using a little short. Oh, uppercut, uppercut. No. Whip again. Nice counter throw from Elena. Another throw. Backs out. Well, the player is keeping that zone in front of him. Who's going to engage first? Ken! Low 40 X Fireball. Strong. Nice. Elena fighting out. Oh no! Punish! That's, that's the round. Okay, here we go. Into the heat of battle. Go for it. 
Can't seem almost there. Oh. Oram, oh, now it's the EX Melon. Throw with, low strong, low strong. Oh, oh no. Ken's low strong so good. In every game, every game it's so good. Because it's a strong move. Ha 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 ha. Back to the match. Who the hell like Capcom USA even came up with the same situation? Oh, forward kick, short kick, roundhouse. I mean, roundhouse was a roundhouse back in the day, so. Well, not for every character. Not, yeah, but for the, you know, for the main character. Dash up low forward, EX Fireball. Came with a corner pressure again. Trying to whittle Elena down. Strong Fierce, nothing. Dash oh a throw. One more. Ah, uh, there's that throw game you were talking about. Oh, but the dash throw from Elena. Elena's still alive. Final round. Go for it. Almost. Low forward, nothing. I didn't know Elena had a more chair color. We don't get to see Elena very often, that's why. That's true, huh? Who <laughs> plays Elena? People who like to lose. No, well, wait. No, no. Unless you play Super 4. Like no, kidding. but like... It's, oh, oh, there it is! Max range! Max range! So strong. Now, Elena is typically not considered a high-tier character at all, but if you don't know how to fight against her, she's annoying as all how to fight against her. She's very offbeat to a lot of players. And again, magic experience is going to play in there. Whoa! You see that low board almost came up, but the dash throw was fast enough, and he got right. the dash throw before the, the low board. And this kid is he literally, he was on full stick of butter. They barely only got to use an EX Fireball, and that's wow. it. Whittle down. He is not happy with his, he stepped off the machine, disgusted with himself. All right, here we go. Oh, hi. Uh -huh. We see you guys in the back. Do your job, Tom, do your job. Meanwhile, this guy in the, in the front is like, oh my god, what am I going to do? <laughs> what do I do against this Ken? Okay. All right, here we go. Dash up sweep, okay. The sweep, not exactly, you know, not a bad choice at this point. Ooh. But the uppercut. So Leaf tail. Oh, yeah, that's not punishable. Oh, no, it was reversal, it was reversal. You don't want it. Go for it. Try to go for parries again on that. On the fireball. Oh, oh, didn't go for the X. Dash it up. Nice. Go for it. There we go. That was good. Ken team angry. Ken Keep team it alive. Ken team want win. Now the air engages between. Oh, two. nice. Wow, he just doesn't give up. All right. Strong, He's strong, strong. He's gonna uppercut moves. after every single block malice match. He has nice. He scouted, punished with. He's punishing those whip throws every time. He's got one more bar to do that. But oh, no, no. Nope. Oh no. Oh, he has, he has an EX meter. Do uh, he's trying to horn. Punish. Too far. On the ropes. On the ropes. That would have been good otherwise. Been good. Oh, I like yeah. it. Smart. That would have been good otherwise. Universal overhead, making himself airborne so he can't be thrown. If he, had, if he had blocked it, high chance it would have been EX Shore you or low short EX Shore you because Elena was on chips at that point. All right, here we go. Go. Damn, all the colors of the rainbow on Elena's head. Wow. There's an uppercut again. Jab uppercut. No, I'm not a special. I don't care. I'm going to uppercut you. Yes. This isn't Street Fighter 4, man! All right, here we go. Well, only, only the EX uppercut's gonna have invincibility. Wow. Like, he doesn't care, because he gets to get her off of him. Yes. He's gotta think about that EX uppercut, every, or excuse me, the jab uppercut every time. Get... Oh, whoa, that was weird. Interesting exchange. Now let's smash throw. Nice. Oh! Nice chase down. Oh! Short, short, oh no! You know what, you gotta kill her with the uppercut uppercut right there. Or maybe only one uppercut. So, no, he could have gotten, gotten a strong, he could have gotten a jab uppercut. And it would have been massive damage. Great reaction there to catch the anti air. That's wow, a full the short! Balls on this. No fear! Dash up throw. Alright, All right. first of all, here, show you. Corner throw for Ken. They cross up this wow. up, show you. Oh, that's right. Uh, when, Elena, when Elena quick rises, uh, she temporarily has a collision box. She can just pass right back. Oh, missed the juggle! Oh, but he okay. did it quick rise! Oh! Wow, sweep! Oh, oh that could have been super. Oh, is that punishable? 
Oh! Oh, oh he went for it. Oh, I think he did a Okay. Oh. No, no, no. Too, too, too risky to try to parry anything at that point. Too risky. Wow. I thought he would have had a red parry yet. Hello. Nice. Oh, he doesn't have any super to follow up his bomb punch with. He could have he could have punished that the sweep with uh, Brave Dance. Yes. Shadow sure sweep when uh, an opponent has super, oh. not the best Good. choice. Okay. Yes. Throw. Well, yeah. Both players are scrambling. So jab short, EX uh -oh. fireball, pressure game. Yeah, good follow of the fireball. Yeah, land in dire straits right now. Nice, he's got that trying to, trying to fish and uh, counter blows. Oh, oh no! Hey. There's that uppercut! There's the uppercut! There's that uppercut! Yes! Ooh, well done to the Ken team. <laughs> Well fought. We await your return, warrior. Well, all right, so we're seeing the teams here. Yes. Take your, take your bows. All right, such a great, again, just, you don't see Elena play like that normally. And now we're getting high level Elena play. Just amazing, just simply amazing. So. All right. You know, he got a lot of mileage out of the, uh, just out of jab uppercut. I'm wondering, did he just mess with the, uh, every Atlanta player's mind at that point? I don't, I mean, it's kind of scary to, no. because you kind of want it, like you kind of want to respect it or not, but yeah, that's a, that's the first time I've seen a Ken player just go, oh, are you going to block the mountain smash? And I don't care afterwards, I'm just going to uppercut. Right. Now, the other option, the safer option, the, uh, would just be simply, you know Malice Smash is going to hit you twice. Right. Unless you're getting up, or unless you're recovering from midair in, uh -huh. in, in, in a visible state, uh -huh. uh, where it could be one or two hits, that's the situation that would mess you up. But in this in this case, in mid-screen or in the corner, you know it's going to be two hits. Right. So you block the first hit, red parry the second hit, you get a free punish every single time. Ah. Uh. Right? Uh. And it wasn't doing that, but it's... it's um, so it kind of makes you, it, it, it kind of messes with your head and makes you think, oh, it might be safe. I might be able to get something off of it. Right. It kind of encourages them to keep doing it over and over again. Okay. Um, so I, maybe that's just the way he likes to play. Maybe he just, or maybe he's just bad at red parry. Hmm. All right. Now you mentioned red parry. Can, uh, now there might be a couple of viewers out there that don't, they know what parrying is. Can you explain now uh, what parrying is and then what red parrying is? So parry. So parries you can do in the air. Uh, you can do crouching parries, uh, standing parries, right? Uh -huh. and, um, and of course, it's limited. It's almost it's limited, just like blocking, where if uh, you can uh, the attack that you can block high or low, you can also parry high or low, uh -huh. right? Yes. Red parries can only be done uh, in a block state, uh -huh. right? It's it's much stricter. The timing is much stricter than a normal parry. Right. Um, and if you mess up, you're gonna get hit in the face. Right. Pretty much. Right. So what advantage does a player have to red parrying then? Well, you don't take damage. You don't take damage you, for you one. Yeah. You instantly recover. Uh huh. Right. And uh, it it creates no, like traditionally safe uh, frame traps or options or uh, or true combos that are block strings. Okay. Are no longer real block strings anymore because you just get to you just get to counter them. Okay. However. Any parry, red or blue, uh -huh. uh, uh, will freeze the game for about 16 frames. Six, 16, right? one six, okay. 16 frames. Yeah. So if you're if you're really if you know that you're about to get parried on the second hit, and that second move of yours is uh, or the second hit of yours is super cancelable, you can just have it wound up and ready. Right. And it's and you have literally 16 frames to see the flash happen and just like hit the button. Okay. So right? there, there's like even more mind games within just. Red pairing and what comes up after the parry or the yeah. red pairing. Yeah. So like you know, Ken doing things strong, uh, strong fierce uh, target combo. Uh -huh. uh, we haven't seen anybody red parry the second hit of that yet today, uh -huh. but it's very possible to do that. Um, and uh, uh, not to mention, uh, yeah. oh, and uh, not to mention uh, things such as uh, Yoon and Yang's uh, target combos as well with that palm strike at the very end. That one is that one is also really easy to red parry at the end, but. Uh -huh. um, but if you try to parry and then punish, then you can easily get super canceled. All right, super. Uh, all right, so folks, uh, we are still underway here. So again, do not change your dial. Do not touch that screen. Do not change your website. We are still going here with Cooperation Cup 2017, the 15th annual Cooperation Cup. Changing a couple things here, just making sure that everything is clear to go. 
I'd like to give an up, uh, a huge shout out to Twitch for allowing us to have an English broadcast stream. For all the lovely viewers out there who were asking for it, this is because of you. Shout outs to Twitch for, again, listening to its viewers and making sure that our viewers are well taken care of. Wow. You guys can hear how, how crazy it is in here. If you're hearing over the mics, what's going on? Lots of people shouting, lots of people cheering with what's going on here for... Right, okay, we're, we have about 10 minutes until uh, Block B and... Or not Block B, uh, Zone 2. Zone 2. You and I are going to be playing in Zone right. 2. Uh, pretty soon, we need to introduce the next uh, uh, commentator that will be taking over. Uh, right. Um, but we need to flag him down. Uh, that's all right. We'll just edit a message. I mean, okay. we have you have a smartphone. You can definitely do it. Sure. So, yeah, we'll be rotating out. Both uh, Arliath and myself are part of an all Makoto team. That's that's right, an all Makoto team. I'm gonna I'm gonna bad manner here, and uh, no 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 don't do it. <laughs> but again, th this is just the hype that is Cooperation Cup. So if this is your first time watching any of the Cooperation Cup materials. You guys are in for a real treat. Again, there's going to be lots of high-level play this whole week. And so, again, like I keep saying, please do not change that stream. Do not touch that website. Follow the stream. Make sure you're getting the live updates because you do not want to miss any of the action here at Cooperation Cup. So, so we're waiting on it. We're going to fly our uh, next commentators uh, just shortly, waiting for Zone 2, I believe, to start up. Is that right? Yeah, I, I think uh, I, yeah, I think, look, I think Section 2 is going to start. Uh, also... Shout out to all you guys on Bikeade that are still keeping this game alive ah, in yes. America without any arcades whatsoever. Uh, shout out to the old uh, Family Fun Arcade crew on the West Coast. Right. Uh, the old Tokyo Game uh, game Action crew on the East Coast. Uh, everyone in between. Um, man, it's been a long time that this game has been out. And there's still, there's still a lot of love for the game in the US. It's just that there's not a whole lot of places to play. And there's no good way to get it on a console these days, unfortunately. But yeah, you could uh, you could still just play it on Fight Kid, or if you're if you are dedicated enough, get the game on uh, the CPS3 board. Do uh, go the Super Gun route and a CRT monitor, and get some get some sticks at it that can that can support that. Okay. Okay. All right. We're gonna take a break, and uh, we'll be uh, we'll, we will come back later, and we'll also introduce uh, the next the next guy. who will be uh, RKF later. intermission here we should be back hello thanks for joining us here at cooperation cup can anyone tell me if the frame rate is a little better now Not yet. 
だからなんか打率が違うのだからみんな日本で All right, let's uh, translate some of this moon runes and uh, give you the brackets. All right, Ten Masters team. This is the new block. They're doing it in uh, two divisions, B block. Ten Masters team has Hirai, Deshiken, something E, Matsuken, and Kose versus Ikemen Paradise. This is an all Chun-Li team with Modelu, Maruko, Ryan, Shinta, Oji-san. Followed by uh, group number C, which is Penguin Sanshimu, which is an all Yang team with Nihashi, Ion, Hirokazu, Hoi Hoi san, Shisoko. It says we're broadcasting at 60, however, I don't know if this will hold. I don't know if this will hold. Alright, is this better? Does the Gaijin internet hold up to the 60 frames per second? Take a look at all the uh, beautiful faces participating in Cooperation Cup. It's an older tournament with the average... Okay, how's this? 60 frames. Much better, yes. We are Comcast and our T-Mobile plans are holding up, our U-verse. If you are one of the few people that uh, live in a Google Fiber City, please turn it up to 144 frames per second. Blistering 4K, oh! Seems to be a good uh, Distribution of players from all over the different regions. That looks like a foreigner team there on your left-hand corner. I think. And there's darts in the back. This is the uh, Tokyo Leisure Land where um, every year the tournament happens. If it uh, drops for the frames, do let me know and I'll tune it back down. But there have been uh, requests to Let's see how I look in 60 frames per second. Glorious Nippon. Oh. Even though this message won't reach them, if we could uh, all migrate to the uh, Gaijin stream away from Game Newton, that would be great. Uh, there have been reports that the 
Gaijin hieroglyphics of the English is、um, stifling the Japanese population from typing in their native channel. So Trump commissioned the English stream、uh, with Twitch, and here we are. We made the room for you, but it seems like a bunch of you guys are loath to leave there. But we have、uh, since up the、uh, bitrate, and I will be translating the、uh, names for the teams. Does that sound fair? Can we all stick here, please? It's not a personal opinion, but a、uh, order from the、uh, organizers. I know, I know. We want to go into the glorious Nippon chat, but well, think about if you're in a gaijin and you're in a room full of people talking Asian. Asianese, like it might be a little uncomfortable for you too, right? Like you're, you're sort of disoriented. You don't know what's going on. Okay, they're starting back again. Hey, fight for the future. Even though this was in 1999, and we fought for the future, and we got、oh、Street Fighter Four, and we got Street Fighter Five. Out of it. Oh God, the game sound is so loud. Dear Lord. Hold on, I'm gonna. Is, is the sound okay? Does it sound okay, or do I need to turn this down? All right, the hey hey hey's are starting. I'm gonna switch out to our、uh, new batch of fresh commentators and leave you be. Okay.、Uh, yeah, if you guys need any help with the、uh, stream, please feel free to leave it in chat, and I will try to assist. Shout out to Hanzo Gonzo for hooking up with the、uh, advice. All right, peace out, guys. Gunfight. What's up, people? And welcome to Cooperation Cup two,、uh, 2017, the 15th. And now we are rushing into the second time zone, and we have on stream、uh, Pearl Rice, Chun Li, playing yeah, against, against the Ken. The Ken.、Yeah. And do we have? Do we have, do we have the pools? Do we have the pools? I don't have the pools. On, I know, don't think we do. I'm sorry for the lack of preparation, but we are having good matches. So bear with me. And let me see.、Uh, is there a way to check the brackets? No, I don't. No, I, I mean, no, I mean like, I mean the teams are in the book, but they don't have the ball. They don't have the, they don't have the、uh, brackets. Nah, I don't think so. Okay, let's go. Let me. Okay, normal. We try to leap attack, but the timing was off. I would like to figure out who okay, they were playing. Okay, what? Oh, yeah, this is good. That's good. All right. One second, please. Okay, Ken is a friend now. Nice. Oh,、uh, just missed the finish here. And Chenny closed the game okay, with a troll. Okay, so the Chumbi team with Ricky Maru. Oh, okay, nice. That's probably their anchor. Is now has now been the first player. That was Pearl Rice. Player one, first player has the. It's just I being the cop. I don't know. Thirty-six.、Yeah, so. I just looked it up. Team thirty-six. So it's team thirty-six. It's Shippu Dotto. It's Kiraki, who was an Elena player. Naga from West Japan. Kabetsu. He is known for. I think he was a virtual fighter player. He has actually won the title of Cooperation Cup team with Ricky Maru and Matsudacho and Shigeki. I don't know. I think this is a pretty strong team. Because I want to see the faces. Yeah, yeah. They are a very solid team, but 
Um, the Chun Li team has not only Rikimaru, but has Mochi and Oryu as well. And they have Chun Li. <laughs> and they, and, and, and they, they are Chun Li. And they are Chun Li, yes. So they got five of them, and Ken has lost the first match. Alright, Ken. Ken has lost the first match, so now we're having the second player against the okay, first nice player. Nice NGL by Chun Li. Yeah. And I would like to find out who's playing, but he has some scarf sands. <laughs> Caps on, I couldn't see who, who, who it was. Yeah, the I'm Japanese sorry. always cheering for, for their teammate, right? Okay, yeah, nice throw, you put the pressure. Good parry. Good punish. Uh, I, think, the I, I think Ken should, should, should switch the timing here. He's always hitting at the same timing, so it's, it might be difficult for him to get in. Huh. He did it though, but Chani nicely ran away. Okay, Good nice throw. throw here. To secure the round. It was kind of risky, but uh, it paid off, so. Yeah, okay. I mean, he was, he was blocking, so, you know. Yeah. There are two things that you can't block in this game. One is throw, another is dungeon. There's a first super, oh. but yes, this sometimes happens. Sometimes happens. And it's a good That's punish. But Close to a max punish. Okay, nice nice setup here to... Uh, he still has bar. He might have to use it to get the round. Oh. Gets the back throw in the corner. Uh-huh. Oh, nice Low. one here. Oh, oh he missed the late, Little too late. Bad punish, but he decided not to use the meter. Yeah, I, I guess he, he wants he, to keep the meter. He should have used the meter right there. Uh, I'm not sure because he would have, he would not kill. So I guess it can make sense for me. Kind of. Okay. Yeah. Well, he's got a lot of bar right now. Yeah. I, I think he was saving up for the third one. Maybe he was not too confident about the yeah, second round. So. I mean, but it's it's better to win 2-0, right? It's safer. That's true. But if he were, if would have done the super and lost the round, it would have been pretty bad. Yeah, but both of them kind of kind of like making mistakes. Oh. Probably nerves, maybe nerves, but um. Pearl Rice should be fairly, I mean, relaxed because he has Mochi, Ori, and Rikimaru yeah. in the back. Ah, that's there right. goes the little forward soup, Shoryu, Shoryu. Yeah. So I guess you were wide there, KF, now. Well, you like should have used the, the super on the second round. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but that's like one of the most ideal ways of um, Ken winning yeah. because he can deal massive damage without using meter, actually building meter at the same time. That's true. That's and true. the second player is Taro Kichi. Taro Kichi is a Mikado player. Oh, I don't know him. And but, yeah. Mochi, uh, who was also a Mikado player, he used to teach him a lot. And I thought Taro Kichi would come first, but uh, I guess per I guess they decided to play, have Pearl Rice first. And I'm sorry, uh, but I still can't figure out who's uh, player one. I don't know either, so... But okay, he's a Ken, nice but he, and, he's, Ken. and he's pretty good. Oh, he's kind of relaxed now. Got yeah. the four hits, got him in the corner. Middle kick, uh, what we call the middle kick. The middle kick, middle yeah. Kick the the standing roundhouse. Yeah, the, I guess cross -ups. Stand, standing roundhouse, yeah. That's okay, oh, I did Chun-Li's a, Chun yeah. a bit tight. Chun-Li's a bit tight. Oh, Ken goes relaxed. all in right near. Yep. That's nice. I think he's confident from the. Yeah, he's really confident. From the last yeah. round, he won with the perfect. Well, e. That's actually one of the ways um, Ken can win pretty easily against Chun. Yeah. Is make him push a button and punish with a super, a super or a DP, right. preferably a DP. Oh, nicely punished. Good, yeah. really punish. But he doesn't have meters. He's got to. He's got to throw. He's got to get, get him in the, the corner, push the button, and throw. See, he knows it, so he's mashing DP. Yeah. Yeah. Look at the meter. He's got three. It's okay if he loses this round. Yep. There's N the nice overhead. Nice And he, he built one super so. Yep, one super against three. What yeah. do you think? But Chun Li built meter pretty fast, so it, it can go either way. Uh, uh huh, uh huh. Middle kick. That is punishable when he stands. That was pretty risky for the Ken, the low EX fireball here. Three low shows, but no super. Ah, uh, the switch side is good for Chun Li. Nice reaction here by switching side. Uh, nice parry here. There's a super finally. He needs to build one more, oh, I guess. I nice hit confirm. Okay, let's by see. The way, same that, setup. That jump, jump round has a mad, uh, mad good. He did the same tricky stuff as before. In walk again. Oh, <laughs> interesting. This is punishable. The, but the Chinese. Oh, that was. No, no meter. What's back happening fit, here? Back fist would have been best. Yeah, that's true. Oh, uh, we can feel the, the pressure was too too bad here. Like so, basically, this match oh. was full of mistakes, but yeah. Chun Li pulled it out, and exactly. it's it's natural. It's a natural thing to do when you make mistakes in a big tournament like this. Chun Li team getting hype. Yeah, I guess the the player was feeling the pressure. The the miss didn't feel pretty good on, on the Ken side, so... Yeah, I mean, Ken felt kind of relaxed. Okay, I, I, I so guess he, he, uh, he was kind of relaxed the first one, but then he, he lost the second one and uh, he was scared to put to push button. Because uh -huh. the, the Chani, I think the Chani got the read on the Ken and uh -huh. she started to parry, so... I, I, I guess the Ken was a little bit afraid uh, to play his kind game of, on the of, second yeah. and the well, third I mean, one. After the second super, he uh, taunted for uh, the, uh, off uh, the attack boost. That's but true. I thought... He should have pushed him into the corner or something, but uh, it's over now. It's so over now. So next match, yeah. Third player. <laughs> it's pretty fast. No second chance here. You miss, you lose. You're right. You're right. It's bye bye. 
especially the foreigners, are not used to this kind of format. Yeah, that's true. Chun Li with that clinch of the win, he, she is feeling pretty relaxed now. Okay, Chun Li ran off the corner. That's pretty nice option. Getting them defense well. Oh. Middle kick, crouch hit. It hurts. Low forward super for the win. Nice confia. I think he's dead. Bang, bang. Yeah, yeah, he's dead, yeah. The last two it do a lot of damage, so. So gunfight. How is it you team with Strong, strong players. I was really happy to be invited in that team. So. Okay. Well, because that's what this Chun-Li player is feeling. Exactly what he's feeling right yeah, now. Yeah. Like, when you have like really strong player behind you, uh -huh. you can play your game. You, yeah, yeah, yeah. There's still yeah. a lot of pressure because you want to do well in front of those uh -huh, really, really uh -huh, strong uh -huh. guys. So yeah, that's a, that's what he's thinking. He's got nothing to lose right now exactly. because he's got Mochi Ori and Ricky Maru yeah. in the back. And he already did some work. So. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You already did some work. So who cares? So he needs a mix up. Fairs, back fairs, nope. Yeah. So the co the confidence is, is pretty important in the team Ooh, tournament. Wake up buttons. Wake up buttons. Wake up buttons. Also happened in first right Chip, 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 chip. <laughs> forward super. No need to. Oh, look at that. Look at the face. Yeah. Look at the expression on his face. <laughs> and see, <laughs> Ricky Mars is like... Ricky Mars is like judging him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Exactly. <laughs> it's like, that was uh, not ideal, I guess. Looks like a pretty strict <laughs> sensei. <laughs> yeah, he's sensei. Yeah, actually. <laughs> so the Ken, player, Ken team is down to their fourth player. Oh, I know. It's Kabetsu. Kabetsu. It's oh, Kabetsu. Okay. Nice, you know it. I did it. I'm sorry. Uh, yeah, I know him. He's still playing Cell Strike, but so, yes, I, I thought he was a King of Fighter player. Oh, yeah, I King think. of Fighters. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Yeah. And he won Street Fighter 4 Togeki. Uh, I think he, so. And he won two years ago. Oh, wait, three years ago, maybe. Cooperation Cup. Yeah. Team of the Ricky last Mario. year? Not no, last year? No, two, two years ago? ago. Two years ago yeah. Oh, okay. He teamed with Ricky Mario Arashi. Yeah, and so, so yes, cabbage too. It's cabbage, actually, cabbage. Cabbage. The vegetable cabbage. I don't know where it comes from. I don't know. I think he likes cabbage because he's playing the green color. So <laughs> that, that's it, man. That wasn't difficult. <laughs> so yes, um, cabbage, cabbage too, known for his solid play, but we see this DP. Probably Ka watching the dash in. Yeah. He's cabbage too is pretty strong because he has the really good mind games. Yes, he is mad good. He's mad good. Actually, our team, two years ago, we lost to cabbage too. Oh, I see. In second round pools. Oh. In second round tournament, I'm sorry. Yeah, it's pretty good. So yes, corner pressure, ideal way for Ken to win. And I like his style because he does really play simple, you know. Yeah, he's, he, he, he doesn't really know the simple. game in depth, but the mind game and the and the spacing is really uh -huh. so good. And one thing about Chun is that Chun doesn't have any dive kicks or anything. Yeah. So she can't like punish you from the air. That's true. So yes, you can basically focus on the ground when you play against Chun, just like that. Yeah. He doesn't have meter, but he has time for time to build okay, it. Okay, the, the setup the was in front. That's good. Okay, beating with oh nice we finish here by Chun Li. Not trying too hard out from Ken, I yeah. like it. We're gonna get the, the corner carry. But well Chun has to spend a meter basically yeah. to get the round here. That's true. So Ken wants to make Chun Li spend a meter or low parry into DPDP. DP. Oh, Didn't use the super. Missed, or I, I think missed he missed the super, it. I guess. Going for a bit punish? Oh uh, no confirm here, it's pretty hard. Yes, that that's distance from the Shotos, that's Ken, Goki, Ryu, or Akum, I'm sorry, and Sean oh, Sean included. That distance low forward is mad strong yes. against any character. That's true. Because basically there is like a hit box right outside of the hurt box. There's like there's like basically three, two or three frames where it has only hurt hit boxes at the tip of the leg, yeah, at the tip of the foot. So basically you can't do nothing. You can't punish that. Yeah, it's really hard. And but Chen Li has the option to get out of the corner with the wall jump. Oh yes, but so Ken I does have his tools. Yeah. She, she can cut, cut, cut her up with the EX Tatsu or stuff, uh -huh, but uh -huh. I think it's still worth the risk. So what we can so what we can say is that was good corner pressure. And yeah. now here's here's Oryu. Oryu, yeah. Very Oryu, strong Chun-Li player. Unfortunately, he cannot come tomorrow. <laughs> oh, that's true? That's really? It? Why? Yeah. I think I heard it was work. Oh. So he's betting everything today. Yeah, walk on the Sunday, man. It's pretty rough. <laughs> Especially during Cooperation Cup. <laughs> Welcome to Japan, man. Welcome to Japan, <laughs> Welcome yeah. Japan. yeah. So yes, Oryu playing his so usually offensive style. But yeah, it's pretty offensive. He tries to put the pressure with the cover throw. But he's backing off right now. And uh, he, yes, he's watching those overheads. And that, that low forward I just yeah. mentioned is really good. He needs two more throws, I guess. Whoa. Okay, nice read. I, I don't nice know why speed. Oryu jumped. Not nice to jump here, but I, I guess he was waiting for the show you can, yes, right? Yes, I, I bet he was waiting for uh, DP or it was a missed input. Yeah. Hey, Kabitsu is really strong with the low forward because just right before pushing the button, he did a little step forward mm -hmm. to increase the range. It's really hard to to zone him out when you do this. So, with cab, cab, so should we pronounce his name Kabitsu or Cabbage? Cabbage. <laughs> cabbage, whichever, right? <laughs> for a French guy like me, I think Kabitsu is easier to say. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> so he went for the red parry. He was greedy. He's going to pay for it probably. Or maybe not. He did it. Okay, nice escape. Oh, 
No punish you. I guess you missed the input. Probably the easier scenario was to use the use the meter right there. Yeah, I and think then so. back off and play a slow game. So, the, so tell me, Gunfight, what's the best anti air in this game? We just saw it right now. Best anti air in this game. I think it's a. Uh, you you have to throw a move that you can can tell. No, no, you can. You have to dash under. That's the best. Ah, uh, it depends. It depends. You have. And it, you know what I mean, right? What, what? Yeah, I know what you mean. But in Cell Strike, I think the, there's no one best stuff. You have to mix everything every yeah, I mean, time. Yeah, but every time, you, if you can react to a jump in with a dash under every single time, you're not gonna get hit. That's true. That's you're true. You're not gonna get hit, and we just saw that. And Chun Li, with her low forward and her car throws. That, that's true. Dash, dash under. That's like dash if, if you miss it, you get oh, wrecked. Yeah, if you, you get wrecked. It's hard. <laughs> so he missed the low forward. Low. low he missed a low jab punish, I'm sorry, it's super. Oh, he doesn't have any like special weight. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you so much. Okay, Ken is in the con Ken is in control now. Okay, nice distance. Oh I think it was at the tip of the leap attack. What, what happened? Uh, I just killed the Chunny with leap attack into uh into super. I thought I thought Chunny was winning. What happened? No no I, Ch Chun Li was winning and then I don't really know what happened here. Oh, I didn't, I didn't Look at that wedding ring. He's the wedding take ring. It off. He's gonna take it off. This is the power of wedding, guys. Oh, he doesn't. So if you want to get good at self strike, just does, marry. Yeah, he does not <laughs> care about his fiance or wife. So. Oh wait, yeah. They I have just, mochi. Wait, they have mochi in the back. I thought mochi would be the fourth player, but they have they have Rikimaru came out fourth. Uh, I think Rikimaru is not happy, so he wants to kill the Kens, you know. Okay. Okay. But Rikimaru was with Kabetsu when he won, right? Yes. That oh. was the day. Uh, that was day two. Yeah, so yeah. Not pre. So maybe you want to face because you know you knew that maybe if Mochi go, oh, yeah, he yeah, will yeah, beat yeah, him. So maybe right, you want to right, you right, want right, to face right. his friend. Maybe you're right. So it's like Yo. I know you. Yeah. I know you, Cabbage. I'm just gonna cook you. Yeah. This is Ricky Maru style. Let's see. So so let, let's see how Ricky Maru does now because hey. I heard he was not oh. playing that much lately. So. So, we, oh, so yeah, they're playing right in front of us, and Taro Kichi is yelling out every yeah. single time Ricky Maru <laughs> lands a hit. Confidently landing a red parry into back first super. Okay, yeah, nice one out. Okay, nice parry. Okay, oh yeah, hey, hey. Right, punish too. Nice punish. And like by, by parrying he everything, he, he built so much meter. That is Rikimaru. We just saw Rikimaru. Although he is not at his prime, I guess. No, no. Yeah, that's why I was saying but like still, lately still. he's not playing that much. Yeah, but still, I mean, what we're seeing is Ricky Maru, right? Yeah. Like, yeah, we just saw uh, not practice <laughs> Ricky Maru yeah. because we just saw uh, <laughs> two whiff power grabs. Nice, but nice. good defense. Yes, that roundhouse is mighty strong. Nice see, TP. Cross oh, up, nice blocky. It was kind of hard to see. Fake cross up. So Chun has full bar. Two hits and it's done. Oh, good nice jump one. in. In the corner, building meter. Low oh, bar. yeah, no confirm. But he, and, okay, that's fine. And so called the Emperor Punch. That's Crouching fine. strong, one of the best moves in the game. No doubt. Yeah, it, you can do everything with Spudging Strong with Ken. I mean, the clutching button not too I good. Mean, that move is probably broken. <laughs> I would like to ask the developers why they made it that way. Because if you see the hitboxes, you'll see why. Oh, so I prefer so not to watch. Final round. <laughs> Chun Li has full bar. There's one. Nice confirm here. There's one. Corner pressure. And I wonder is it. Okay, the leap yeah. attack. This is classic Rikimaru style here. But I even if you wait for the leap attack, it's so hard to. Uh -huh. To make yourself stand up. Yeah, but that's actually. Uh, yeah, I'll talk about this later. But uh oh, oh, we might see something. Oh, he we just might see the something. Oh, that he missed the, he missed sure. the confirm here. That's too bad. He had the game. Carry. Oh, oh, nice. That coaching strong here. Fierce uppercut. Mexican yeah, uppercut. Is pretty happy. <laughs> okay, he's hype. He's hype, and and we like it, right? Yeah, we, we like it. it. You gotta be like that. Of and course. So here's the anchor. The, the anchor. passion, the passion here. We can yes, feel it. We have mochi here. Mochi. Um. 2015 pre cooperation cup finalist. And Rik Rikimaru puts back his wed wed lost, wedding ring. Oh, he lost against <laughs> the Makoto team in the finals two years ago. Yeah, and yeah. And he just saw Rikimaru lose, but Mochi, he's been he's been putting in some time. I'm a good friend. Yeah, he, he might be one of the best Chun Li right now, right? Uh, no doubt he's one of the best Chun Li's. Not but he's seen how he plays. Rikimaru did look pretty confident in yeah. the third round. Landed two supers. But Rikimaru, I think he, he take a lot of risks. So sometimes he might not pay off and you can lose. Yeah, but he had a lot of missed inputs. Yeah. So we might see a zero, zero, zero. So look at the up, upper left corner. We'll see points zero, zero. Not a P, but not zero, P. zero. <laughs> so Mochi pretty, so pretty solid here. Yes, Mochi. Mochi known for a solid like, play, actually. Yeah, yeah. if you play Chun Li really solid, like. Um, he he the, is solid, you don't need to but he is logical at the same time, yeah. which is pretty hard. And this is the best way to play Chun-Li, I guess. Um, 
Yeah, I for, guess for, so. For, for, I, I think so. so. I guess so. But you, but you can lose against uh, people who are pretty like risky. Uh -huh. I won't disagree, but yeah, that is. Well, at, at this time of day, the best play style is the style that wins, right? Exactly, <laughs> exactly. So he doesn't have any like extra like special setups. Oh, that was and very that nice. That was a good read. That the, was a solid read. He the, read it. The, the delay yeah, that on the was medium delayed punch. To target combo and target target combo. Yeah. Which is max punish. And Mochi does not want to lose here. He does not want to lose. And I guess before the medium punch, there was a parry here. He, like, right. I think he, he was covering everything. Oh, yeah, 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 right. That, that was pretty, pretty strong. Okay, so Ken doesn't have much meter. And Chung has 1.3 right yeah. now. This, I told you. The I dash, told you. The dash. dash under. I told you. Dash under super. But yeah, pressure. And, and there's a habit like when you dash under people, mm -hmm. the other one always throw when they, when uh -huh. they land, right? Uh -huh. This but is a habit you need to get rid of. What it is is you don't suffer damage. Yeah. No meter. And yeah, I miss see input, I guess. a lot of the Chun Li players struggling with the stick a bit, a little bit, because I see a lot of mistakes. Yeah, good whip punish. But the, the, the stick are pretty loose. Good whip punish. So good Mochi, whip. hang it Good on. work. Good work here. Hang it on there. So who, who, who is now? Wait, how many? Ken Mo was the third player or fourth player? I'm sorry. I'm I have no idea, man. I, I lost track. <laughs> yeah. Sorry. Sorry, but stream. I lost yeah, track. Yeah, we just cooked this much. Is uh, it was already started, right? Ah, uh, thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Uh, can't can't check, but we'll see. Make make right great again. Okay, nice 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 name here. <laughs> so which block is it? This is it's block eleven that we have. Okay, let's go. And so I mean, like all the players are like using red Ken, so I don't know which is which. So. Yeah. But we can say for sure that Kabitsu is out and Mochi is playing. Uh, yeah, Mochi is playing. Okay, nice dash on it. You're always dashing on it when you jump in. Like Erkaz er er was idea, said, yeah, yeah. Don't suffer any damage. And while I wasn't watching, Chun Li had made a comeback. Yeah. And there he is. <laughs> Ricky Mara getting hyped. Everybody Ricky getting hyped. And he's laughing. I mean, he's relaxed as well. That, that's pretty nice. Mochi, we actually came together this morning. <laughs> oh. And he was saying, uh, Ken, uh, no, Ken. But. Why? He played Chun Li. I mean, like. It's still good matches, right? Yeah. And look at the block that we have. It's Ken, Chun, and Yun. Yes. This the, is top the, the top tier. The top tier block. Good idea. Good read. Nice, nice yes, block. That's the way Ken wants to punish. Nice red parry, but. I parry for the meter. He's building meter. He's building meter, right? Right? He's building meter. Yes. He does not give. He does not care if he loses that round. He wanted the meter. Yeah, that's so true. He pushed every single button that he has. And now, look, he has a 1.6 bar. And probably his scenario right now is to land a super. Yes, there it is. Build one more bar. Yeah, yeah. One more bar. Oh, there's a second one coming. Okay, there's you don't escape from corner. Oh, I think yeah, he. That was a super. The, the super, was, that was uh, super was okay there. Yeah, the uh, dash. So there's Mochi still. Yeah. Ricky Mauri is pretty happy. I like it. Oh, yeah, I like, like it. he did two dashes and the two dashes were punished. <laughs> so is it See? over? It seems like it's uh, over. It's, yeah. It seems like They're over. So it was the last, the last can, Mochi, guys. Thank you. Thanks for, the, thanks for the big smile. Thanks for the big smile. So you have a pain? Maybe like if you write, uh, it would be easier. Yeah, I guess right? so. You have one. So, so the, the stream. The I stream. guess the Ken was too risky. Like he, he wanted to get in too much. Uh yeah, maybe you're right. Like at the beginning of the round, he dashed in. He got but, punished. But actually, Ken kind of like ran out of things to do because yeah. Mochi was playing a solid game. And so. So I guess the. So Chun team beats Ken. That's yeah. Now this is, I guess this is a. Uh, Which block? Make first strike great again. EX Tatsu for the win. Oh yeah, that's what that's uh Yes, this is New York. Coming people, from New York guys. People, New York. This is Team Nika <laughs> First KO. time at Cooperation Cup for, for a lot of these guys. Gavin is playing right now. Maybe for everyone. Right? I would not like Who to is be that? Gavin is playing? The Ken? Gavin, Gavin. Okay. Against the Ibuki. Stream, I would not like to be biased to any team, but this is an English stream and we are watching New York. New York. So, forgive me if I become a bit biased, but I know yeah, you guys will. You, you just have to... So obviously you need to cheer for the for yeah, the challenger, yeah, right? Yeah. I mean, obviously they don't have an Ibuki in New York. <laughs> really? I don't know. No, they don't. They don't. They don't. They don't. I have never seen an Ibuki in New York. Well, I I've been there twice. <laughs> and there's no there, Ibuki at all. No Ibuki whatsoever. But Gavin is doing pretty good right now, so he must yeah, know the so matchup. Far, yeah, I guess uh, Nika Nika Ko would be anchor. I guess oh. I'm guessing because he's overall the best player. That's true. And he did he did so, a lot of tutorial on, so on every I'm character. Guessing New York team is not down to their anchor yet. 
Okay, but so I do not know. Cell drone, Ken has no advantage. Ken has the meter. Ibuki is meterless. I'm not oh. familiar with some of the players of Ibuki. I'm sorry. Yeah, me too. I, I don't know where the team come from. So, but I know some of them, but um, not all of them. Really? Sorry. I, I think I, I don't know anyone on this team. I'm, I'm sorry. sorry. I'm sorry. Okay, okay. Well, so the lack I should of know. I should know. Of, um, Ibuki. Yeah, and Ibuki is a pretty tricky matchup. It's, it's, it's not easy. It's not easy because uh, a lot of stuff are, are safe. A lot of target combos, so it, it might be hard to deal with stuff. But here, so Gavin. Gavin played pretty solid. Please. Anyone? I don't know. He, he has a surgeon is, mask. I'm sorry, but the surgeon at work managed to clinch a win. Yes, we see some thumbs yeah, up. Yeah, Nikkei. I like it. <laughs> and that's mutant XP, right? Uh, Ah, Frankie says like mutant XP. Don't worry, don't worry. Uh, okay, okay. He, uh, uh, wait. Yeah. He is Go. Go from Goomba Prefecture. I'm friends with him, but oh, he, yeah. does, he does not have the name Go. So I do not know which <laughs> one it is, but he <laughs> played by the name of Go. So let's let's call him Go. And I guess Go, but I don't know. It's either Energy 005 or Hete. <laughs> I do not. I have no idea. Okay, so. He has not been playing, I can tell you. Because oh, really? I have never heard stories of oh. Guma players still being active. Is there a scene there anymore? Um, honestly? No. <laughs> <laughs> no yeah, no. but as a, as a time passes, it's hard to, to keep yeah, playing the I game, mean, especially in small cities. Yeah, I wanted to mention, but uh, I wanted to, want to mention this, but uh, no. over 200 arcades closed down in the year of 2015 in Japan. Oh, that's pretty sad. So it's a, it's a really sad thing. So I wish all of you that has an arcade close by support the scene, yeah. go to the arcade, play some games. Don't just stand there and talk, play some games. Yeah, you have to support, you have to put the coin in. Yeah, support the scene, support the community, and then if it's third strike, you here, you can come over to Japan at this time of year and yeah. for the biggest and event. most high level tournament. Oh, so he's look at that. Um, he's doing pretty he's well now. He's getting hit by, he's getting hit crouching with a jump pit. Yeah. So that's proof of not playing because when you don't play games, what you lose is mostly defense skills. Yeah, that's true. If it's offense skills, it's like it's it's it's, it's like it's like in your veins. You you got the muscles. Remember, it's yeah, like that's in your true. muscle memory. But but if you open and do strange t strange stuff, mm -hmm. it doesn't respect you. It's hard to deal with oh, that yeah, because yeah, you yeah, don't yeah. have the reflex anymore. I mean, like yeah, you yeah you ponder for a bit, and then yeah you, so like, you if you if you think a bit in this game, you get hit by that. So yeah. there's no time to think. Yeah, you have to know. You have to, if you don't know. It's hard to uh, to compensate your your, your bad spot <laughs> if you don't know if you don't playing the game. Especially the the the, the pace are so fast, uh -huh. you can lose in, in two openings. Yes, that is true. It's too fast. Kids, kids, children, watching the stream, that is true. Yeah. Candy. Oh, oh no, thanks. Okay. I'm good. Thanks, thanks, thanks. So bad, bad punish, back there. Oh, uh, the middle troll. So yes, Gavin is. That Gavin is always playing sure you can. It's no, like Gavin, he's playing Street Fighter 4. Yeah, I mean like um, <laughs> I don't know about Street Fighter 4, but so Gavin, he, since since he doesn't know much about the matchup, he's trying to play solid. Yeah. And he kind of knows about the damage output of Ibuki, so he says if he if Ibuki comes closer, just just smash. Just show you. Yeah. Just TP. So but that's his plan I mean, right as now. long as the, he's open and doesn't punish him, See, yeah, he has all the reason to keep doing it. Yeah, and, 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 yeah, and they're missing punishes right there. Yeah. He has Part no reason pressure. to respect his opponent. Nope, not not now. So it's okay. It's okay. He's got two bars. So he has to bow. See, like he, he lost this run because he didn't he didn't do a shot. You can. You see? That was a very very bad punish by Ibuki. Yeah. He got the stun and punished uh, and continue to combo with the jab. I, I think the, the pressure is too much on his side. Yeah, I mean, Ibuki is kind of nervous. And obviously, he didn't have to spend the meter at the end of the round. Yeah. But he was too scared. See, look at that. People get hit by jumpins crouching. Oh. What's up with you? So oh, it doesn't matter right there. Are we going to see a punish? Oh. Oh, that was a very, very okay. bad punish. He, he did, he, but he, he did but got he the... Was, <laughs> but he was lucky. The EX, the EX to Muji. Yes, yes. Should have spent the meter right uh. there. One he's more super. Oh, there he he's is. He's too scared. See? Good decision. Good decision. He's too scared. One more throw. One more throw. Did I have to use the yet? Oh. Good reflex. Good reactions. Um, allow me to say, let's go New York. Let's go. Let's go New York. Let's go next level. Hi, Gavin. <laughs> oh my God, that was just too much, wasn't it? Yeah, yeah, that was too much. That was a little bit too much. <laughs> Come on, respect, please. 
So yeah. yeah, the reason um, why New York decided to play Ken is that um, there is a Ken main, Frankie 3S, who is not the same guy with the West Coast Dungeon player, but uh, they decided what? to stick together rather than trying to make. Was not the Ryu player? No, 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 this is Ken. Oh. So they decided to stick together rather than like you know being divided into uh, different teams. It's I hard see. to make a team. Yeah, so they said let's stick together and they decided to play Ken. And so yeah, I guess everyone has a Ken, so everyone yeah, can play a Ken at, well, kind at of, some level. Kind at some of. level. <laughs> of course it's still hard if you if you're not his main but Yes, I would not recommend Ken to a novice player because <laughs> yeah. Ken has a lot of things to do. It's DP. Oh Oy, the tone like here it. to build the damage, but so mostly for hit. the one disrespect, I guess. One more hit, one more hit. Ah, uh, nice. Oy. Not enough chip, didn't fire the DP. He was he's waiting for it. Oh, what's going There's on the DP. here? What's going on There's here? <laughs> Kevin, um, I've teamed with him last year. He does have bad fast no. reflex when he's really focused. Yeah. And he, when he's really focused, he does not hear the sound of the outer world at all. He's really focused. He doesn't hear any sound. Yeah. Wanted a DP right there. He wanted a DP. But I, I guess it's kind of the same for me. When I'm playing, I don't really hear what's happening yeah, around me. I mean, he, he hears nothing. Yeah. Absolutely nothing. <laughs> That, that's like that's a good point. It's good that you focus on the match. Oh, nice, nice weak kind punish of here. Like, kind of like a confirm. He's ah. not gonna go for any wonky setups. I, I guess he saw the light punch. So nice. you can punish a light punch. I don't think no, so. No, <laughs> no, not like he, he, he punished a light but punch. There's the DP. But you know, there's the DP. He, he did the low forward, and during the low forward, Ibuki threw the light punch. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. So he didn't have to to weak punish. He just I had see, to confirm. I see, I see, I see. So yes. I, I guess that was it, I guess. Oh, uh, this is Don, Don Duncan. He, oh, this is Don. he lives fairly close by from my house. <laughs> oh, so he's a good friend of yours? Uh, not really. <laughs> <laughs> I see. But you know him. Kind of, yeah, you kind of. He's your neighbor. Not really, not, not, not that close, sorry. <laughs> sorry, I fixed my face. Doesn't live next door? No. So, so I see, we saw Gavin beat three already, right? So yeah, I guess so. Maybe they're down to their anchor, but all I can say is Ibuki is mad nervous as yeah. a team. Because they were missing with uh, punishes everywhere. And, and so, sometimes like, Japanese people are really nervous when they play like uh, uh, yes, Japanese international people, team. I have an impression that Japanese people are more, much, much more weaker to nerves yeah. than the foreigners. There's a DP. Because the style is so different. Though. So, uh, so let's, let's make a bet. Is he going to seal the round with the DP? Yes or no? I think so. Because like the only lost round. What, that was when uh, he didn't do DP. Okay, you're right. So he has to do DP to win. So this See, is not, like, yeah, this he's going to win the round. He did a DP. <laughs> so this is not going to be a bet because I think he's going to win with the DP as well. Uh, There's a DP. I think he has like 80% uh, on, on the eat right. ratio. See, that's like the lack of experience. You have to parry yeah. twice. But it's okay. He's, he's rocking Ken. He's landing a lot of DPs. That means he's going to win. That's true. Oh. <laughs> uh, <laughs> I, we, we can really feel the tension here, like there's many, many mistakes. Yes, we see a lot of mistakes right there also. So, oh, he lost the round, I'm sorry. I lost my bet. No, 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 sorry. He question. did DP and he lost the round. Okay, okay, okay. But maybe he, w he will not l lose the match. Let's see. So we'll see. I mean, I'm sure, I'm sure they have Nico KO in the back. Yeah. And they still have the, like, this is the first one on the I New York team, know. right? I don't know. The first one on the second one. No, they've been playing. For a little while, so I don't know if it's the first player or not, but I don't think Gavin would come first because Gavin has a fairly good Ken. Oh, I see. I see, I see. I think Hold That or Mutant XP would be coming first, but apparently they're not playing right now, so. Yeah. I'm guessing Gavin's see. like around the third player, I think. Yeah, I think he still have like Nika in his back. So yeah, Nika, he, Nika should be in the back. He, he can play style, so, so without, he without needs problem. one more solid read. Oh, that's good. One more throw, and maybe chip. Yeah. So Ibuki is strong now, strong at, at this at this point. Oh, nice! We finish it. She can chip. Chip, 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 chip. Oh, the extra two. Oh, I think if we if we have done extra two, we would have hit the Ibuki, I guess. Uh, Maybe he missed the input. No, that was not a high jump, so it probably would have not reached Ibuki. If it was uh, a high jump, if it was a high jump, probably it would have reached uh, Ibuki. But I'm sorry. Now here's Mutant XP. Yeah, let's go. I thought he was gonna play first or second, but he's yeah. a Necro main, right? What's that? He play Necro. He does play Necro. And he's known for his YOLO DPs. Let's see. Let's see. Is the, like the YOLO DP, is that a trademark from New York? Uh, Everyone is really. doing DP. <laughs> not really. I'm sorry if I offend people. <laughs> but, <laughs> but it's all right. It's all right. It's good. If the DP works, you have to keep doing it. Oh, look at that. Mirror kicks all day. Ah, uh, This is mutant trademark. Roundhouse, right? <laughs> Maybe right. 
Nice use. Wow. That was pretty solid. Oh, yeah, yes, it's a P. It's a P. We pretty Japanese. We Japanese express the P. Green. Right. A lot. <laughs> you know. You know what? No. Green because the life bar is green. Life what? bar stays green when you win with P. Oh. So we really? say we we kind of like yell out green, green. Ah, green. I see. I see. I didn't know that. So that was Thanks. green. And that was green. Okay. We don't. We were not going to see another green, but. Mutant looking pretty comfortable. Pretty yes, nice. He knows should have done DP here. He knows he make a little bit more than Gavin, I guess. Oh. Went for the unnecessary red parry. There's the DP. There's the DP. Low shot, low shot. Ibuki has low life. She's gonna die any moment. Yeah, and Ibuki is like, I think she's cracking under the pressure. Well, like, she, she's, she's, really, she's really off on the on the range. Oh, what was that? Yolo, I like it. Oh, nice punish here. It was pretty tricky. Oh, I should say random, not right Yolo. Low. Just random. This is from UK. Oh, he's greedy now. He's greedy now. The Ken's greedy now. He's gonna stun. He's gonna stun. He's gonna stun. Oh, he's gonna stun. What did I tell uh, you? Didn't, yeah. he didn't get all the parry. He went too greedy. That that but might be the turnaround here. What's that? That might be like the turnover for the oh, Ibuki maybe, team. Oh, maybe, you know? maybe we'll see. That was a pretty clutch moment, I think. Uh, yeah, I mean, like that that shippu, random shippu was totally unnecessary. Yeah. If it was ran, if it was accidental, I'm sorry. Yeah, the super on the corner, right? Oh yeah, the super on the corner. Yeah. Yes. But I guess Mutant is fine. He still have control of the of this round. So he decided to spend the meter. Interesting. Playing safer now. Doesn't want to take the necessary risk like yeah, he did he, the, yeah, the different round. Yeah, he knows that super was unnecessary. He, he got punished for the good punish. That was nice. One more throw to secure the win. Oh, oh. DP. <laughs> okay. Okay. That okay, okay. That was nice. Uh, that was ah, I guess that was over. Right there. <laughs> So yes, it seems like New York, Team New York, wins Mon against Ibuki. Yeah. Uh, allow me to say congratulations, because congrats this is an Engl English stream. <laughs> Sorry if I'm being a little bit biased. No, congrats to the winner. It's not being biased to yes, congrats right. the winner. Thank, thank you, Gunfight. Oh, come on. Thank you. Come on. So, what was that their first match? That, I guess that was you have no first. idea. I guess that was the first. It's hard, it's hard to keep track of stuff here, right? Yes, there are a lot of cabs. Good job, uh, Nikkei. You didn't play, but good job. <laughs> and we can't even see ourselves on the stream, so we, yeah. just, don't, we, have, we just have to say hi, mom. Just hi, folks. Maybe we'll see our faces someday. Is that, hey, when you stream in French, is there something that you say, like hi, mom, in English? In English? Not really? Not very much. Not really? Okay, I, sorry I asked a bad question. No, no, I don't have almost... I just speak... I try to speak English. Right. English is not my best language. I do my best. Okay. <laughs> so, yes, this is um, back to the Rikimaru team. And uh, it's White Chun, so I guess it's Oryu. Where was the... You put it on there? One second, one second. We are playing against the Yun. Oh, nice. Oh, he missed the combo. This is going to be... This block eight, right? This is going to be tight, I guess, because Yun team is very solid right now. Nice confirm here. And it we might can, be over soon. We can hear Rikimaru scream here. Lightning legs for the win. So Oryu beats... I guess, beats I guess that was the last game, too. Chun Li team has won, I guess. So, so they won their second match too. So I guess they are making so it out of the are, pools, they right? They are two zero. -oh. They are qualified. They are going into in second round pools. Congratulations to them. Are there second round pools today? Uh, I don't know if it's pools or. Uh, I don't know how it I'm works sorry. actually. Maybe it's a tournament. Well, they, well, they are going to second round. So Chun Li defeating Ken and oh. Yun in the first round. So last year, like the the way the tournament worked was like the the second one, the second team of each pool make another group pool. Oh yeah, um, that was something like oh, this, yeah, right? Oh yeah, yeah, it was cool. Yes, I'm sorry. Mm. Uh, the first one is uh, qualified directly for the top 16. Uh -huh, yes, yes. Uh, top, top eight. Top, top eight. eight. Top oh eight. yeah, top eight. eight. Top yes. Eight. So from I think 2014, they had top 16, but now they only have top eight. Yeah, because top 16 was pretty long, right? Yes, it's very long. Because they want everything. They want to do everything on stream, yeah, I guess. Yeah, they got like this entrance ceremony and stuff. So. Yeah. Also, I guess I'll, I'll be doing this this entrance this year. I guess so. Oh, I'm pretty happy about that. Th thank you, my teammates. I have to thank them. <laughs> okay, the Q. Ni nice command throw here. Let nice me, combo, the taunt. Let me find the tools that we're okay. doing right now. Na okay, they, they try to take... Okay, nice, nice block by... Oh, they did the YOLO super. Wow. I, I guess it's... It was it. Because it's it's good. You have to take is the risk over? to win. Is it over or not? I don't think it's over. They're getting mad high. Well, the... Uh, he stood up. That means I think it's no. They're playing rock paper scissors. I don't know. We we, we don't have control on the feed here, so uh, we don't really know no, what what side. Uh, yeah. Do you know like if you look at that screen, like the in info info. Yeah, but they're playing right there. And so the Q team. 
Is there a Q team here? Uh, oh, I think it's this yeah. one. Yeah, the Q and the U, right? Yeah, 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 that's what I thought. But, but. Rumina, what? I have no idea. Do, do you know some of these players? Uh, yes, I do. So uh, I, I want to see the color. Um, okay, so I think this is. Ah, this is Billy Ken Colors. Block 12 that they're playing right now. I see. This is a Q team and uh, a Yun team. Yeah, you ca cannot command throw here. Yun Ganaging is too fast. And this Yun team is basically from Western Japan. Kerubo, Kawapa, Saru, oh, I see. Kitagawa, and Chui. And I think Chui's is uh, uh, Tokyo area, but uh, oh. others are... But yeah, wait, they... they oh, ah, they come from... Oh, yeah, they, it's Tokyo. kind of like a mixture. They have Tokyo and they have West as well. I see. That's pretty nice. Yeah, it so nice. it's pretty like nice. a, a, a real Japan team, you know? Oh yeah, Japan All-Stars, kind of. Japan All-Stars, that's true. Uh, Q so could have party all oh, the finish. So nice. Yun's pretty nervous, he's missing hit confirms. Yeah. Oh yeah, 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 that, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, it's blocked all for sure. Right. Okay, okay. So yes, um... Sorry, we don't know which player. But it's Q they against are. Yun. Pretty hard matchup for uh, for Q, but he, he can make it work. It's not the, the worst one, right? Uh, Q Q's can still manage to beat Yun. It's a bit annoying because Q has that long, long, long car throw. Yeah. But basically, Q can... Uh, punish? Thank you. Activate? Yes. And the combo for Q is easy and it hurts. Yeah, that's right. We might see it. No, maybe not. And if he's able to, to boot the troll to, to build the up the defense. You should not be missing the Mander. Uh. Because the Ender against Q is mad easy. Yeah, and uh, Inder is the most important stuff wait, 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 in Genejin. He, he changed super. Q Why? Changed, I don't know. Is that a mistake? Or maybe I... he, he knew who is facing. Maybe, right? maybe. You're right. But, but even though. Super one is not. Uh -oh. oh, okay, okay. Uh oh. He made okay. me lie. He made me lie. Okay, looking mighty grim for Yun. And two. Oh, that was a very really bad decision from Yun here. The might be the over. Punch. Might be over because. Nice uh, pacing. Taunt, taunt. He's not gonna taunt. Yes, there is third one. So yes, now for for the viewers at home, it's when he taunts, his life increases. He becomes harder. He's gonna be pretty hard that's for the Yun. That's what we say. <laughs> that's what you say. That's what we say. Hard and soft. Yeah. When you have a lot of life, he's hard. When you you Yun was waiting for the wake-up super, yeah. Yep. <laughs> so, yes, um, worked out for Q. Yeah, I think the, the Q is, is playing pretty good. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Just playing they this game. They are playing rock, paper, scissors to decide the order. They do not care. Uh, uh, maybe no one is uh, like uh, wants to face Q. Um, like, uh, I can tell you that. Like I don't well, like to face Q. Well, you're going to face it eventually. I don't like to play against Q. I like playing against Q. Against Q? Against Q, yeah, it's easy. Yeah, but you play Yoyan. Aha, <laughs> good point. <laughs> I don't know, but... <laughs> Yo, Yaz. Oh, that's Yaz. Yaz is here. The French chun -Li. Commentation, commentator here. <laughs> you want to see head. my hair? Oh, no, no. I, I need to hide my hair. I'm sorry, guys. Alright, so still Q Yun going on and Nice nice block here. And he switched he switched super again. Is it switched super again? Why? I don't know why. Oh nice palm here. <laughs> okay. I, I do not understand what Yun is afraid of, but I don't understand he's not activating. Oh uh, now he is. This is gonna be But what it seems like to me is like the, the Yun player doesn't really know the range of the dive kick. I mean he uh, See like they always make him weak. I mean I don't I don't really understand what Yun is doing right now. He's just, it's just like it's just like any other casuals that we see in an arcade. Oh. So it's like he doesn't really care. Seems like. Yeah. Or. Oh, they don't know Q. Or is it? Is this? Is this the way he usually plays? It, <laughs> I don't know. I don't really know. It seems a bit too risky. I think if he builds meter at a, like a mid range, Q cannot really do anything. Yeah, he you're, have right, to you're right. You're right. You're right. Actually, if absolutely. he only do like crouching strong, Q cannot really beat that. Um, dash punch, sure, but I mean, you can block. Yeah. There it is. There, there's so a, just see, build meter and uh, see. Uh, I, I think he o always miss the dive kick. Uh, also, always landing in front. Of wow. Uh, dash punch. He might dash be dead. Ah. Uh, Taunt. Wake up. Pressure. Why? Why, why the taunt here? Like he has more. He doesn't have that much life. I don't think the taunt was that necessary. But he did the parry and uh, it was a really good decision. I guess. I agree on the taunt because. It's a little bit hard to tech, tech that that is the quick stand. That is to tap down when you fall when when you uh, 
when you fall, when you get knocked down. And uh, after trying to uh, tech or quick stand after an EX uh, dash punch, yeah, it's pretty, it's, it's a little bit difficult because the timing varies. And so maybe he might have expected him Yun not to tech, and that if he doesn't tech, he has a lot of time. So oh, just I taunt, see. So just taunt instead. So I guess it's a pretty In good the setup. Meantime, yeah, just I see, I see. gives you a little bit of meter as well. Oh, the, the tone build meter? Yes, it I does. I didn't know that. Every, every single character. That's, yeah, you are the researcher of Star Strike. I just do roundhouse. Okay, round I, I just do dart shot. That's all. <laughs> so we still have Q and, uh, uh, and uh, it's pretty... The Q is, pre is feeling pretty good. It's strange that Yon is like, suffering so much. Like but, you said, Gunfight. You know. I mean, he can basically yeah, get just, a little meter like this. Like it. And what it seems to what it seems to look like is that Yun doesn't want to play the long match. Yeah. That's alright if he does if he does taunt three times then sure. No, 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 he already did three taunts, so he do, like the Yun doesn't need to attack, he just needs to build the meter sure, and, yes. and, and attack in gain Jin. Yeah, exactly. So yes, this is how it should go this is how it should go. Yeah, but he, like he missed the dive kick, misses misses uh, the timing are really off. Wow. Missed the end on Q. This Yun is, bad. is missing a whole bunch right oh, now. Oh, and they get hit by the and dash getting punch. getting hit by everything. I, I think they got scared. Like, when, when you look like at those matches, you feel, you feel like the matchup is for Q. Mm. <laughs> but that's not the case. I mean, okay. The matchup is like 7-3, right? Um, I do not like numbers. It's pretty hard. I do not like numbers, but I would not say this is easy. Oh, nice. So oh, you didn't know the third one. Okay, nice when you, when, Even when you talk about matchups, the, the numbers or the values, they fluctuate a lot because there is a parry system. Yeah, I knew it was coming. Palm. Oh, no, Palm. Why? Palm. Palm. Now, are we going to see a good ender? Yes, finally. Thank you. Yeah. Just do the basic one. If you don't know the fancy one, just do the basic one. I mean, like, you don't have to be fancy. It's Q. And he's, soon. He's so big. Any combo will land on Q, yeah, basically. Yeah, that's true. Oh. A badly spaced launch punch here. I mean, both players are making a lot of input mistakes. Yeah. But because Yuna has no life, it costs more. Mm. Q can make mistakes, it's fine. He has a lot of life. Stand is so he doesn't well, care. Well, now he has. <laughs> Standing jab. So I guess the Q won. Oh, it's not over. Oh, sorry, no, no, sorry, no. guys. They got, they got one more, I guess. Okay, I no, got they, it. They're pretty happy. I got it. I got it. Are they drunk? <laughs> <laughs> are they drunk? Okay, they're not stoned or anything, <laughs> but I got it. As you can see, stream. This is they are losing right now. Are and they losing on purpose? They are losing. And they are trading high fives. Like it, it feels like it's it's uh, backward. The Q are really sad. Oh yeah. After they're winning. And we have Kokujin in the background. Oh. So we kinda assess the atmosphere. They don't really care if they lose, right? They're just enjoying the atmosphere, right? Yeah, I see. I can Probably. understand that. But or they might be making a bet or something, I don't know. <laughs> the one who will lost badly. I don't know. <laughs> um, I don't know, but this. Um, so, so maybe it's the time that the Yun will like the reverse OCV. <laughs> maybe you know. L let's check that. So the dive kick are better on this Yun. The dive kick are way better. Oh, he tried the V slasher, but um, no, why? <laughs> I see. He. They're basically trying to style. And go for show, I guess, uh, at yeah. this moment. Oh, nice punish. But the Q don't... Oh, I see. Th that sure was... Can. That, I think that was pretty obvious. Well, yeah, but you just do it. Yeah. You just do it. But maybe it was so obvious that the Q didn't believe it. <laughs> it was like, oh, no, it's right. too obvious, man. You won't do it. But just do it, right. Hmm. Okay, nice, nice defense by the Q here. He doesn't activate. Look, he doesn't activate. Now he does. Uh, yeah, those matches are pretty strange, right? <laughs> um, you, uh, uh, I think you should activate right away whenever yeah. you can, but they're having fun, so it's all right. Yeah. Are we going to see a combo? Nice, nice uh, combo. Uh, the up kicks are a little bit too fast. You can, you can have more. Oh, oh, okay. Wake up super. And he's dead. 60% like this. Wake up so See, he did a wake up DP on the last round. Now wake up super. Respect. Yeah. <laughs> yeah you have to answer. He has to but, answer him. But he does have, he does not have meter. He should activate. He should activate. There you go. Okay, now I think you don't want to lose the third one. The, the pressure in the gauging is good too. Nice. I, I think the, the serious level just 
went a little bit up. He doesn't really have to go in right there, but he, he, he ought to go in. There we go. That's oh, what I'm nice about. combo. That's what I'm talking about. Thank yeah. you. Nice combo there. Not death quite, but... Okay, go for the for the safe stuff, I guess. Oh, I'm sorry. Fix my face. He's dead. So yeah, maybe we will see a reverse to CV. Maybe, maybe. Um, probably he's anchor, I guess. I don't know. They lost a lot. Yeah, but... You just want to style on them. Apparently, yes. <laughs> it does. It does seem that way, but... Interesting, as I said. Um, style, you don't really style in big tournaments like this. But apparently he is doing it. But uh, I feel like the, especially the pre cooperation Cup, it's more like a festival. Uh, it's but serious, you can play serious, but yeah, most but people here want to have fun. Yeah, but some are serious. <laughs> some are serious. Are you serious? I am serious. See, there you go. But I can understand if he wants uh, to have okay, okay. those fun. Totally understand what you mean. Pom, pom, pom. Okay, yes. it is that the is the Q exclusive combo. Yes. Pom, pom, pom. They're not car palms, they're just walk up palms. Okay, just keep the Q in the corner. No risk here, no need to, 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 to apply he's, pressure. He's not, gonna, he's not gonna spend meter. He's not gonna spend meter. He wants free hits, he wants free hits. So there you like, go. Th this sequence is really annoying for Q, jumping every time. Yeah, so when he doesn't have uh, life, Q does have a kind of an ear with a close jab, but does not work that well. Yeah. Launch, palm, palm. palm. No, no palm. Okay. Shoulder. Into Half of his meter are back. Okay, let's see the combo. Oh go. yeah, the combo. Oh, he missed it. He missed the low, fo low, low strong, I'm sorry. Okay, he has the grenade gene. And I, I think he's dead. Thank you. Uh, no, that scales a lot. Oh, after the target, that's true. Those are not car palms. They're walk up palms. Oh, no P no green here, no green. No, you know what? You know what? No, he wants playing serious. Yeah. No, he wants playing serious. So yes, uh, but uh, in a way, it does make sense. Oh, he, I know him. He's Honmono. He's using Honmono? the. He's, he's going to be using alternate color. So, Honmono is the real. Honmono means real, yes. The real Q. This is the real. What makes sense is that the way they played before is trying to go in, right? Yeah. Do you know the fastest way to build meter in this game? To eat and block. Huh? To, to 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 eat your opponent when he's blocking, yes. right? Or, or or hit. Yeah. Hit obviously. So what I'm trying to say is that. You go in, and then you touch your opponent with whatever move. Yeah. That gives you faster meter. Then, backing off, and whipping low strong. So may that does kind of make sense, because they want more meter faster. Yeah, I can understand. Going in. And they want to push Q in the corner, and uh, don't let him Back to right. do, do his stones. Oh, that, that should have been an ES. Okay, roll. Okay, so yeah. what Yun is doing now... It's going to be pretty rough for the Q team right uh, now. No, he's, he's like He's uh, trying to play a more uh, speedy game, yeah. more fast-paced game. But I, I can feel a little bit of like the, the Q seems angry. Q no, seems, Q a little seems bit angry or pissed off. I don't know uh, why. Q seems a little bit annoyed. Yeah, I understand because Yun, has, Yun is an agile character. See, see that's what I said. That's yes, what I mean. that's what I mean. Right there. That's true. Okay, nice turn. That was a nice uh, neutral throw because neutral throw does more stun. It does less damage, but it does more stun. And he did get the stun. Yeah, knee on the face is pretty hard, man. <laughs> <laughs> knee on the face. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> Does the stun. Exactly. That's why. It's, that's why it's really good on this game. By means, uh, by means of graphics or like uh, the pictures, that knee on the face is probably the most painful yeah. throw <laughs> in the game. Okay, the Q is controlling. Ah. Uh, Are we gonna see a dive loop? Nope, we're not gonna see a dive loop. Okay, still have the pressure. Okay, get the command roll. Miss the combo. You wanted to style he was, he was on greedy. him. No, 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 that, no. That was that was optimized. So he was greedy. Yeah. But I mean, what? Oh. I guess that was a mistake. No, 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 no. That makes sense. That makes sense. Oh, because, oh. <laughs> because um, Yun was airborne, obviously. It was up kicks, and if Q, uh, it looks like a mistake. Yes, it does look like a mistake. But yeah. What was it actually that you don't you don't mess up your inputs and you get, you don't get up kicks? Hey. He was walking forward. He tried to crouching, uh, crouching forward. So uh -huh. maybe like the, the motion was like uh, he did the DP by mistake. Uh, that might be true. But uh, if the up kicks would have hit right there, that was a second hit only, meaning he would have a follow up after that. Oh, I see. And so if it would have hit, he would have a follow up after that, and he would be able to activate. So I see. that was a do or die move. 
and if it hits, it might have been able to kill with the next gain agent. Oh, it just, just went all in. So, um, well, they lost. I'm sorry, but um, it did make sense. Oh, let's see some Alex. I love Alex, man. Alex. Let's go, Alex. Which block is it? Uh, give me a second. Oh, is Genki here today? I think, he, I think this is Genki. Oh, it is Genki. Oh, it's Genki. Oh, that was the block that we were watching. Okay, let's go ago. Genki. So the best, best Alex in the world, safe to say and that. Down. And he did the P, uh, no double P though. Nice block. So if if some of you guys play Alex in Surf Strike, just watch this guy. The way he plays, yeah, the way exactly. the way he stands, everything is uh, is really really strong. It's so I don't know if Genki went first or I. I don't oh, they have to they have to face the New York team after right? Yes. I hope they, they didn't play yet. I hope so. Wait, so. Uh, is it over? It is. It is. Looks like it's over because it it's does done. seem over. Oh, I wanted to see more of the Alex team. So Genki clinches off the win for his team against Alex, the Ibuki. Godfathers, Uematsu, Genki, Zako Plus, and Kuma. Yeah. So I, I guess Ibuki is out, right? So Ibuki team has gone 2-0 two oh and 2. That means they are out of the tournament. Yes. I'm sorry. Sorry for but the Ibuki. One third of the team are gonna be gone in the first round. So practice more and see you next year. <laughs> yeah, that's pretty hard to hear. <laughs> I mean, but it happens. Try next time, it next happens. year. It might happen to me because I'm going to play in the third block. But last year, I think we lost in group for my team. We, lo we, lo oh, yeah, we lost in group. Oh, yeah, you lost in Kogu, right? Yes, that's, that's true. Marco almost OCB. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. But yeah, he lost yeah, yeah, yeah. on the... That's pretty rough. So this is now we are watching. Which block is it? Is I don't know this that guy. Bagon, so, uh, but I guess th this this batch oh is yeah, almost this, over, this right? Is the Ricky, this is the Ricky Marble. That's Oja, 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 a uh, uh, veteran. Yeah, looks like Originally a veteran. Originally from uh, West Japan, Okayama, or uh, sorry, Hiroshima, my bad. Oh. Hi. And uh, some of you people that can read Japanese may have seen the site, the Bantetsu. The which bon is for um, which is a very very friendly site with a lot of basic third strike skills and techniques and knowledge. Oh, I and, guess I saw um, that. He, it has all the basic yun combo and, and enders and stuff. And he is the he is the owner. He is the website master. That's pretty cool, man. That's pretty cool. The Bantetsu. They are the all bon in Japanese. Yeah, but you have to read Japanese, right? Yeah, I don't think they took it down. So yes, their team. But I, I think if there's videos or pictures, you can see uh, even I if don't, you don't understand Japanese, right? I don't right? think so. I don't think he has a lot of base. So the team is the Bantetsu children. The Bantetsu children. Makes sense. Yeah. Everybody has seen the Bantetsu. I have actually teamed with Oja back in, I think, 2005. 2005, man. 2005 Cooperation Cup. That was... 10 years... No, 12 years ago. 12 years ago. So, yes. Wow, that, was, um, um, that was held at uh, Shimura Newton. The other game Newton. Not the Oyama. Uh, I don't know. I, I was not there it, in 2005. It, uh, I'm an old man. This I, is an old game. I didn't know about that game at the time. At so you were back in France, right? Probably. I was in France, but uh, I think I started this game in 2006 or seven. All right, all something right. Something like this. So I could have beat you, I could have beaten you free. Yeah, time. of course, of course. Oh, that <laughs> was that was that was <laughs> that was that was proper decision making <laughs> because um, target combo into a. Uh, Activate and then into up kicks is very hard. Yeah, it's hard to do. Now that was again proper decision making. He's he's he, he has a smile on his face. He's having fun. He's liking it, but um, some people that know him, he's known for his nerves. Really? He was really he's, nervous. Oh, uh, that but makes now sense. Now he's a grown he's a grown man now. Oh, uh, the pressure like by Ken. Well, sorry, fix my face. He's about to lose green. Green. Ah, the green. The green is here. The Bantesu goes down, I guess, or do they have some? Yeah, like. You cannot blend in because he didn't really do any mistake here. Okay, the, the, so we the, have Shintaro, I'm sorry. Ah, uh, Shintaro. Shintaro, a uh, Tokyo player. Of, uh, yeah, I know Shintaro. Originally from Chiba. And, and he uh, used to play a lot at Game Versus, right? I yes. used to see him a lot there. Yes. I, at the at, at moment, he wa I was thinking he was living there. He was actually kind of living in Game Versus. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, he's very, very That's good. Very strong. Young. He used to sleep at the stairs. <laughs> I see. <laughs> That's some pretty dedication here. So... Um, Shintaro, he was... With a nice hat. He was playing from, I guess, two, early 2000, I guess, because I've known him for a long time. And he was yeah. playing at um, uh, the arcade uh, named uh, Matsudo um, Sonic. Sonic Bean? Not Sonic Boom, but Sonic Bean. Sonic I guess. Bean. And uh, it still exists, yes. People are still active. 
I do not know about Zerg Strike, but I think it was famous for uh, Fist of the North Star, Hulk Tunnel Ken. Oh, yeah, he used to play Hulk Tunnel Ken. Yeah, that's a, that, that's a good game. So yeah. he's up and playing. I don't know, he's been playing a lot of five, not a Street Fighter oh, 5. Oh, I like this guy. So. <laughs> Oh, he missed. I don't know about his. I don't know how, how much he trained. But I think this. he has really much, a lot of experience with Yun. So even yes, if he doesn't really play the game very, that very much, solid. he, he, he knows everything basically. <laughs> nice and here, here. Very aware of the range. Good reaction. Oh. This is the Ken team. I think the, the Ken yes, was. The uh, Ken team. So if, if the Ken team loses, they're out. Yeah, ah, they lost the match before. So wh who's the blue Ken? Uh, I'm I trying to know. figure out, but. <laughs> I know I know three of them, but it's got to be Naga or Matsudacho, whichever. Oh, Ma oh wait, Matsudacho is, I think, red, so I think this is Naga. I'm oh, sorry so if it's I'm Naga. So let's I'm go Naga sorry, against Shintaro. If I'm, just, if I'm wrong, but I think this is na Naga. Oh, uh, it's, it's a corner pretty pressure. rough stuff for Yun here. Corner pressure is bad times for Yun. Yeah, and uh, he doesn't have meter, so it's pretty hard now. That's Just why Ken is going in like this. Nice overhead. Yun, Yun didn't stand right up here. Going in. Nice show, you can nice confirm here. Nice confirm. You think that's a confirm? Let's say it's a confirm. No, I don't think so. I don't <laughs> you think, think he just so. went for it? He knew. Well, this. I uh, think it's even better if he knew. Well, this debate, this debate goes on forever, whether you can hit confirm low forward with Shotos or not. With Chun Li, obviously yes, right? Oh yeah, of course. Yeah, you have sure, you have sure. all the time you want. Yeah. You, yeah, you can do something else and then, oh, it, it's, and yeah, okay. Yeah, you can I do whatever you want. <laughs> you can, like, you know, go to the vending machine, get yourself a drink, and then push buttons. Yeah, exactly. Sure. <laughs> but, um, Ken is difficult. It's said that Chun Li has about 17 frames. It's not 21? I heard it's 17. I heard 21. <laughs> well, whichever it is, it's a lot Yeah, but enough. it's 17. Well, well okay. So, okay, let's so stream. I think um, you're right because you know more. No, 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 no. It's hard because it, it depends on, it usually depends on where you start to measure the. Measure the frame from. Oh, so, well, what I heard is 17. You have 17 frame to the, the the cancel window. I don't know exactly, but I heard it's uh, 17 win window. Oh, we're here. Hello, guys. Um, so yeah, I heard it's 17, and for Shotos, I heard it was around 12, 13, or yeah, 11. that's what I heard. 12. I think I heard 13. Okay, 13, 12. I think it depends but, on Ken, or but, I think it differs. If but it's when you do it in match, when you when you compare Chun Li. And Ken's low forward during match. It's it's not only four frame difference, right? Um, what a difference four <laughs> frame makes, right? Um, well, I think it's a lot of difference, but I don't. Oh, okay, I, don't. I can go with twenty one if you like. Fine. I don't. But I don't really know, I'm sorry. Uh, <laughs> what we can say is, Chun Li has a lot more time to yeah. confirm. And yeah, so getting back to the point. Yeah, the point. Um, the Shoto's is low forward uh, hit confirm is not that easy. It's but, hard. Uh, you know, in the heat of the moment. Actually, you can react to something yes. or something, meaning like when they like whip a button. Like as you said, w w when we were watching ah, the when David was Ken, playing, right? yeah, he broke in Ken. So Ken will push low forward. He will buffer super. And if he saw something move, he pretty confirmed. If he saw something move, yeah, exactly. Push, push, push but, a button. But, but that's not the, uh, really the true confirm, right? Uh, that is not like. If, a if you go in training mode and put the dummy in random guard. Oh yeah, exactly, exactly. exactly. I think with Ken, it's almost impossible uh -huh, to confirm. Uh -huh, uh -huh. With Ken, it's possible. Oh yeah, yeah, well, Chun, you have to have that. But Ken, if you do the, you, you put the dummy in crouching state, you do random guard, you cannot confirm. Um, <laughs> you yeah, cannot you're, confirm. Right, you're right. You cannot. Right, it's it's too right. fast. Basically, hit confirms is, um, I think I think you you do it with your sound basically. Right. Because sound travels faster, right? Than than the visual. Actually, well, I guess it, right. it depends on the people, right? Uh, you no, you do it with the sound. A lot of people do do it with the sound, basically, or or like maybe both, I should say. Because sound helps you a lot. Okay, Maybe, yeah. so wait, wait, wait. You go to an arcade, right? So the, yeah. You go to an Everyone's arcade. screaming. <laughs> yeah, everyone's screaming. And let's say your cab does not have sound. I'm fine. You're fine? No, 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 no you're not. I'm fine. No, you're not. I, I used to play at my place without sound, with music. And sometimes when I went to the arcade, I put my earphone with music. I didn't hear the, the sound of the game. Okay, fine, fine. Let me tell you my experience. I went to UK. The cab did not have sound. I did have a little bit of a struggle. Oh, I can understand. It's hard. <laughs> so yes, um, this is the end of so the point, the turn point. two. Is yes. it possible to confirm or not? Well, <laughs> no. Okay, I can't. I can't. I can't. So okay, so we are <laughs> at the end of turn two, I guess, or zone two, or whatever you like to call so, it. I'm sorry, I and we will be rushing into what time is zone it now? three. It is now oh, it's 12 or 12.30. So sorry. I think it's going to start at one. So it's going to be like a 30-minute break, something um, like this? I don't know. They will be setting up. 
obviously. So it's hard. So we don't have the. We, uh, we want to, to, to give you the result of the blogs, but uh, yes, it was kind of hard to keep track it. of everything. I think the Japanese stream is following it now, but we're not getting information from them. Yeah, I'm pretty so jealous of their screen. They have everything. <laughs> sorry, stream. Sorry, stream. If you're missing out, I, if I, if I, I can't tell you all the information yeah. that we have. We are on the same but boat. <laughs> We are on the All same right, boat. So, um, yes, this is a Japanese tournament. We are on time, on schedule. It's Japanese organization, always on time. Of course, no? of course, of course. That's what I'm saying. It's like the train in Japan. <laughs> yes, they <laughs> it's like the train, every always every on time, guys. So, so one thing I can say is probably... Uh, oh, wait, sorry. Uh, the Rikimaru team is through. And the... Uh, and Genki team, I guess, is through. And I the think. Ken team is through. Ken team is 1-1. One, one. This, sir. The Ken team is going to the playoffs. Ah, so the Chen. The Chen. Oh, yes, that's the oh, sorry, my sorry, sorry. I thought that was like complete another block. Um, I hope to uh, get back to you with all the information for the yeah, it's, teams it's that went through for the first and second time zone. Um, okay, sorry, stream. We can't. We, we're not. Uh, okay, we're okay. not actually. Um, able to watch the stream chat. We can't follow them. Sorry. So, yeah, we saw uh, what what they saw. Huh? We see what they see. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So, so um, oh, there's the bracket. Like, if you can see from far away, you can try to try to give the results. I don't yeah, know. I'm not, I'm not gonna catch up with them. So. It's too far for me. Yeah, Even if I far have far glasses, far. I cannot see that. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Even my glasses are useless. So, um, let me just in the, in the meantime, um, let me tell you a little bit about how the, the format of this uh, tournament. I don't know yes. if Arliath and Duralath uh, follow you guys, follow up with you guys. But this, we are now currently in the first round pools, and first round pools is a three-team round robin, and they will play each other. Yes. The team that will that ended up first place will go into second round. Nice. Yeah. Nice. nice. All right. So. Okay. Well, I'll be playing next, so I gotta catch up. I, so, I, I, oh, you're gonna play from one, right? I, I'm playing. Yeah, I'm playing next. Okay, I see. All right. Okay. So it seems like Japanese stream is going to take a break. So we yes, will guys. as well. But let me just finish uh, my uh, brief, brief explanation of the tournament format. Yes. Is that they will have uh, second round pools, and the teams that went two and zero, oh, or the teams that went one and one, and they had a playoff. Apparently, none of the teams did have a playoff inside their block. The playoffs will happen when they all the teams end up. I think the one. playoff is not a team tournament. Like last year, it was you yeah, have I, you have to send one player to play yeah, the playoff. Yeah. So I'm saying that the the playoff inside the block, that is a uh, playoff playing uh, having the playoff with three teams inside. When they all end up with one and one, they will have to have one player as a representative uh, of their team yeah. and play for their life. And if they lose, that's it. It's pretty so, harsh. Yes, pretty harsh, the man. First, the first place teams will move on to the second round pools. And the second team, second uh, sorry, uh, second place team will go into the playoffs. Playoff. Where, as I said, they will have one player as a representative of the team. Yeah, you send up your captain. Yeah, you send up your captain or whoever came from <laughs> the farthest. Yeah. Because <laughs> uh, you put you put the pressure on every on one person's shoulder. Yes, yes. It's pretty hard. You put all the burden on his shoulder and see how he does. So. And so yes, uh, <laughs> second place has to go to the playoff. Third place, unfortunately. They can come back next year. Train some more <laughs> they and come back. back. We will see you next year, son. <laughs> so, oh, so teams, you do not want to go 0 and 2. Yes. So you know, like funny things can happen. Let's say your teammate OCB somebody, some one of the teams, and then you lose the other match. Yeah. So you're 1-1. One, one. Yes. And then, let's say you didn't play. You didn't play. And then you move on to the playoffs and you send your captain, and your captain loses. It's done. And you didn't play a match. And you, and you did play not only play one. a match. Only one. <laughs> no, no, you did not even play a match. If you're, if you're not the captain. Uh, but if you're lost, if you're lost uh, during the, the group pool. Yeah, if you lost, if you you're, lost, you're, yeah, you, you, can lost play, one. you can play one, one, one game. <laughs> but you lost. <laughs> the only but, game you play, yeah, you lost. Yeah, the only game you play, you lost. <laughs> so, um, yeah, things can, those things can happen. But, I mean, you're a team. Yeah, but I think they have no choice. There's too many people here. Um, I, think, I think this is a very, very uh, well-made format. Yeah, They've yeah. Um, tried to figure this out. It's a five on five on five team, so. And oh yeah, um, we are having more and more entries every year, right? Yeah, that, that's pretty crazy, man. Uh, that is crazy. Yes. So, uh, the game came out in 1999. 1999, so May 12th, if I remember right. I don't know this <laughs> this much. You have never <laughs> just turned the on the CPS three cam. <laughs> and there's the it's written. Huh? It's written on it. Yes, when, it's when written. Yes, oh, it's I never so pay attention. We are. We are not so taking a okay, break. So yet. let's take a quick break, right? I want to go to the bathroom and uh, maybe grab something to drink. Okay. And, and you have to get ready because you play next, right? Uh, yes, I do play next. 
You don't want to train a little bit in the casual area? You don't, yeah. need, you don't need to? <laughs> You're too good? Okay. I never said I don't need to. <laughs> oh. All right, so stream. Um, thanks for joining me. Maybe I might see you later again. Yeah, and I think I will be the Japanese back after. I don't know. The Japanese is going over the brackets. Not sorry, the blocks. And they're going over the results, but I'm sorry, we're not getting them. So, but if you want to see check, uh, just tune in in the Japanese stream. They're going to speak Japanese, but you can see the bracket. Well, you can't read Japanese. Yeah, but you, they can see the round and the cross. Well, some of <laughs> well, you, can't see, you can't read the names, right? <laughs> oh, come on, you can read Japanese. <laughs> so can I, but... Yeah, yeah. None of the stream can. I wish I could see the stream chat, really, but um, I can't see him. I would like to see um, how many viewers are actually tuning in. And, uh, and uh, all the players and all the fans of this game watching all over the world. Good yes. afternoon, good morning, so thanks good for evening, tuning in, wherever yeah. you are. Which, which, whichever time zone you are, thanks for tuning in. And, and, and yeah, see so you... Uh, I will definitely see you I'll later. Break. Oh, yes. Oh, they have the block. There we go. Um, 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 so this happy is wedding. Happy wedding. Yurian, uh, the Q team, they went all the and Remy. So Remy team moves on. 2-0. Oh, oh, do Yurian you that? Check, check Sagero shite. Chuck oroshite danzai. Oroshite danzai. Okay, okay. Uh, ah, Piero team. Oh, they, oh nice. Oh, the Piero team, yes. The Remy team, they went 2-0. Oh, so they qualified. So the oh, the team is pretty good. So Piero. One of the, the team Take. at the bottom, 2-0. Oh, they will be advancing. So sorry, stream. We're not going to cut. Yeah, we don't have the control on this. Okay, gunfight. You can go. You can go take. You can go to gents if you like. To jazz? You can go to the gents, uh, the toilet if you oh, like. Oh, okay. Yeah. I will go to. Just take a break, guys. Maybe, so maybe this might last a little bit, little bit. Okay, so catch you up later. Okay. Good later. luck for your match. Later. I gotta grab Thank a break. You. I'll be gone in a couple of. I'll, I'll, I'll be gone shortly because I've got matches to play. And I wish Arlias or Duralas would come over. Take a break too. Yeah, maybe it's better. All right, so. <laughs> It seems like they're going to let me, so I will take a break right now, and I will come back later. Uh, thank you, stream. Thank you, stream. I will see you later. Peace. doing on this fine Saturday. Um, just a quick update. I think we're running ahead of schedule. So the next wave of uh, pools will start at 1. Right now it's 12.45, so in 15 minutes. Um, people are 
plain casuals right now and getting food and uh, are doing their little smoke break. So we're just going to chill out for a while. If you're coming here from uh, Flowstream, thank you very much uh, for joining. Unfortunately, we had to migrate over here. So all you Flickers out there, um, yeah, we appreciate your, your uh, presence here at the English stream and uh, also appreciate Dean Newton for um, allowing us to do the English broadcast at Cooperation Cup. Uh, one of the very fun tournaments of the year because it's team-based and um, I think it's just much more fun, like the Capcom Pro Tour, as the name implies, is the Capcom Pro Tour for, for professionals. Uh, but here there's a better spread of skill sets and uh, you can sort of mask your own weakness in a team if you have like a super strong anchor, right? Like, I guess five Qs, a team of five Qs has a better chance against five Yuns than, no, is that true? I guess, I don't know, strength in numbers and all that. Um, but traditionally, yeah, team, team tournaments are more hype if you listen to like the volume of it, like one-on-one -on -one is a very esports, but uh, if you want to experience the hype of a tournament, team play is definitely where it's at, at least when it concerns uh, Japan. Um, shout out to the sponsors, Udeal, Split Frame. I didn't know that they were here. That's actually really cool to see them. Um, Twitch, that looks like an old logo. Game Newton, uh, the organizers of Video Game Museum Robot. That sounds interesting. Pro Arcade Gear from Arcade Shop, shouts to them. Always get stuff from them. And uh, Esports Square and Red House and U Deal. Sorry, I'm late. No, you're okay. We're, we're taking a break, actually. Okay, good. Um, so I don't know the uh, status of the Gaijin team, but I, I, I do remember a band of hooligans that I had dispatched a Ibuki squad, a squad of Ibukis. And uh, they were very New Yorkish. if you look at their attire. Uh, we didn't get to show their shoes, but best believe that they were rocking the Tims, Timberlands. And um, yeah, I mean, uh, people come in from all over the world. So I guess fine people flew up from New York. I, I think there's a couple Australians over here. And of course, Gunfight is from France. Uh, I'm not sure where, are there any other foreign teams? Uh, let me know. You could check out the uh, brackets at here. I think Hizmet Third, who is the mod of this channel, had uh, done everyone a huge favor and edited it, so I just pasted it in the chat. Shout out to Zin. Interesting to find someone else with the letter Z. They did have Yan no, they didn't have Yankees hats, they had Mets caps, which makes me very fearful of them. So if you're from NorCal and you see like a San Francisco Giants paraphernalia or Golden State Warriors, they're usually pretty friendly. <laughs> but if you see someone from uh, rocking Oakland Raiders gear, they're probably very dangerous in the same way that a, a Yankees cap is pretty much uh, innocuous, but a, a, a guy in straight up Mets gear, um, probably, yeah, don't want to get stomped by their Timberlands. Who is this? Who is Zin? Explain the heat, okay? Um, you know, so one thing I want to say about this tournament, because I didn't understand why every year these like over 500 people get together to discuss this game and partake in the beauty of Third Strike. Apparently, the game like the dinosaurs before them who had perished from the meteor is on the brink of extinction. Right now, I think so. And and the uh, the reason why is because 
the Third Strike boards are no longer serviced by Capcom. Obviously, they are running hard at work, uh, operating the Street Fighter V network, the CFN. So if your board breaks, if you're an arcade operator and your board breaks, you can't send it into Capcom to get it serviced. Furthermore, to my understanding, correct me if I'm wrong, the CPS3 board has like a self destruct timer and what's it called? You can't like phoenix the board. I might be spreading false information. This is just what I've heard. But Third Strike um, is creeping towards its death. So the people that maintain these boards, these arcade operators, have to treat the, the boards with the utmost care. Um, so you, you have them like with like uh, gloves, like they're working at an Intel chip factory, handling them. If they're broken, that's done. Unless there's some, you can't buy a new uh, third strike board. And of course, everyone doesn't like to play the emulated model on the console or on PC or what have you. They want to play the real deal. So these machines, these third strike machines, um, are yeah, are, are limited in their existence. Yeah, I mean, you could, okay, if you, how should I say, when I say that you can't Phoenix the board, I mean, if you're a legitimate person, you can't go to the Phoenix company and be like, Gene, revive it. You have to go to somewhere in the dark uh, corners of mainland China and pay someone like a crazy genius uh, engineer to, to Phoenix the board. But if you don't have those means of going to like Guangzhou or something, your board's pretty much dead if you spilled like Starbucks coffee on it. Like that's GG. So uh, if you enjoy, and the same thing is happening for CBS2, Cap Capcom versus SNK2 as well, or any of those older games. Um, so it makes me rethink uh, my stance on emulators. Maybe it's a good way of archiving games that otherwise will face extinction just from the natural entropy of the board. You know, things decay over time. It's not uh, reasonable that these things survive, what is it, 1999? Like, if you try to wear a pair of Nike shoes, a vintage shoes in 99, it'll probably crack. Uh, these things do age and decay over time. Um, you know, arcades obviously are not the best ventilated places. Uh, people spill drinks on them, they fight. And um, yeah, so I just hope that they take good care of it. Um, conversely, something like King of Fighters 98 will like never die because they have an infinite amount of engineering resources in China to create and re-Phoenix and revive. They'll just drop the little Chinese Phoenix down on the board and like, whoop, it's all good. So if you're a fan of these uh, Japanese games in Japan, support it, uh, which you are doing with your viewership. We appreciate that. That's just what an arcade operator told me. I don't know. I'm not a technician. Someone can correct me if I'm wrong. Like, if I wanted to buy a third strike board right now, a new, brand new spanking one, can I get it? A legitimate. Ooh, okay. I'm looking at the chat now. Samba de Amigo. So that, that chipboard on the Samba machine does work unless you punch a hole through it. Yes. Yes. In fact, the uh, arcade operator who, who, who shall go unnamed actually had a board break in, tried to take it into Capcom, who was like, yo, if this isn't Monster Hunter, uh, we aren't servicing it. Because it's not a new game. If this isn't Resident Evil 8, we're not reviving dead games. DED. So if you're a vintage collector and you're hawking things on uh, Facebook Marketplace or, or eBay, now is the time to store up on your uh, CPS boards and sell it to maniac collectors. Okay, looks like things are going to get on their way, so I'm going to uh, probably invite Arleth back to the um, commentary, but it's uh, very nice to see you all coming in and enjoying the game. Another request is that the uh, Gaijin migrate to the Gaijin room. 
but uh, uh, plea as I might, uh, it doesn't seem like anyone is really listening to me in the Japanese room. Which makes me think, what is the point of having an English channel if all the weeaboos are going to be in the Japanese channel? This is, this is not a rhetorical question. I actually would like to know. Like, is there a point to doing these channels? Notice that there are no Japanese in this room, in this chat room, that is. Whereas there's a bunch of gaijin infiltrating the uh, regular Japanese channel, much to the distress of uh, the native chatters there. But me, being uh, from Model UN, I, I do like to see cross-cultural pollination and kumbaya and everyone hugging it out. So as best as possible, I don't like to segregate, but uh, for the sake of you know, commentary and language, I guess there is sort of a need. I don't have a, a really good solution for it. I guess everyone here in this room are the type to watch Dragon Ball on Toonami with the dub, but the people in the Japanese chat are, are the hardcore people on Crunchyroll that turn off the English subs and just watch it in pure Asian needs. Now, if there's a legitimate concern, uh, one of them being, of course, uh, not having the overlays, but then again, you can't really tell who's playing in the Japanese uh, stream, like who's on deck. You can see the team names and the score, which is great, um, but unfortunately, we don't have that capability to give you the bigger screen here. Now, if you're watching Dragon Ball Super on dub, you're probably looking at a time lag of about three months. I think everyone knows this, but the voice actor, actress rather, of Goku is a girl, is a lady. I think Bart Simpson too is uh, also voiced by a woman. Now, if you grew up on on uh, analog TV and you had nothing but the uh, dumbed version, I don't blame you. But we should all be graduating to the superior, pure sub version, as every true weeaboo should do. Luffy, uh, I think Luffy is also a girl. Goku is also a girl. Bart seems I remember being a girl. Which is really cool. I wouldn't have known that had I not wikied it. All right, here we go. Uh, I believe we're gonna start off again. So, yep. Well, gonna hand it back to our uh, bona fide commentators. So, is, is Arlo? Uh, he's trying to round up somebody else, but if you thought I'm gonna call him back and get him back in. Okay, no, I mean it's not. A, I can hold it down for him, but um, yeah, when, when he, whenever he returns. Yeah. So when I went to those comic uh, conventions and I saw people lining up to to get the signatures of the people that do the dub voices of Japanese anime, I. I SMH'd. I was like, what? You can get famous for creating inferior product? What is that? It's like, yeah, I'm the voice of Vegeta. Well, the Vegeta guy is pretty epic because he did the over 9,000. But man, like, if you're the voice actor of Krillin, you can get signatures from people? Really? Hmm. Hey. All right, our next block is block one. No, that can't be it. All right, I'm going. I'm, I'm going. Don't worry, I'm going. I'm, we're waiting for Arlo. He's playing like random money matches or something. <laughs> we'll get him back on deck. Don't worry, you'll have your pure Japanese com uh, third strike expertise commentary.
Okay. Hey, Daigo streaming. Okay, okay. I'm out. All right, you guys have chased me away. Enjoy uh, the rest of the stream. Uh, this is going to be, you know, the sort of the second half of uh, the pre crew Cup. Um, yeah. Enjoy, guys. So I now you guys have the block thing, okay. but I don't know which block they're on. Okay. Uh, but this is just a little easier to, to, to see rather than, than yeah. rather than the super small one. But it's, that's also here for you. Gotcha. Thank you. So this should be all the this should be all the pools. Okay. okay. Now what pool they're currently on, I, I do not know. Okay. Got it. All right. Thanks so much. Cool. We gotta copy these. But Great. we still only have one side of these, huh? That's quite all right, man. All right. Ladies and gentlemen, I hope you're enjoying everything you've seen so far at Pre-Cooperation Cup in 2017. Welcome back. My name is Duralath. I'm being joined once more by Mr. Thomasin Arlyat. Man. I'm not Lei Wulong. You are not Wei Lu Long. Wei Lu Long. I, I can't talk. Lei Wulong? <laughs> I very may well be Robert Downey Jr., though. Here we go. It's all right. You won't accuse me of being Vega, anyhow. Uh, so we're about to get started. I think it's Zone 3 that's coming up right now, right? I think so. Yes, it is Zone 3. Okay, very good. All right. Oh, all right. Uh, I'm going to introduce... Uh, we're going to have Gunfight on again uh, okay. to do commentary. Cool. Uh, along with you. Okay. So, uh, all right. Let's do it. Switch it up, commentators. Real quick, guys. All right. Here we go, bringing back to the mic, Mr. Gunfight himself. Of course, yeah. All right, so starting off, a classic matchup, Chun-Li versus Yun, both players in black clothes. And we're welcoming in, take a seat, get settled. Okay guys, what's up? Gunfight on the mic. Yes. How are you doing, man? We're doing great. Uh, we were able to. We watched a lot of your Dudley fight earlier. It was amazing. Thank you. So, I try. I try. Yeah. But props to the the other that I talked to you saved the, the first match, man. Oh really? Against the Helena. All right, very good. So, so let's go. Let, let's try to commentate the match. Yeah. Who, who are they playing now? So I'm not too sure just yet. I can't quite see who's playing. Um, I think this block are over. So. Uh, 16 block. It looks like. Now. 16, right? Yes. I see 16 up there. So we've got... I don't see that one. So I guess now it's those blood, right? Oh, the Chun-Li and the Ken. Okay. Not Ken, the Chun-Li and the Yun. Okay, Yun is doing great, huh? Very well, yes. Okay, sorry guys. Let, I'm just trying to find the bracket here. Right. See who's playing, but... In the meantime, we see a perfect from the Yun. I don't, I don't know whether... Oh, it's Mester team. Oh, okay. Mester Yakun. So I, I guess... Yeah, this is like maybe the Yun 1 team, the, the strongest Yun. Okay, very good. And yeah, the, the Yun who's playing right now is, uh, what's his name? I forget. He, he, he lived in the U.S. for a while. Lived in the U.S. as that... Uh, He's really strong. Issei, is it? Ah, it's Issei. Yeah, yeah Issei. Issei is, Ise is strong. So anyway, when I was watching the match like uh, against the Chun, he was doing like really good damage. So yeah, I guess that was it. That's him. Good, good. So it should be very, very strong, very, very compact match. I don't know if you had the chance to play against him, but uh, he's really, really strong. I think the, the one time I saw Issei was EVO 2009 when they had the uh, they did 2v2s and he teamed with Justin Wong. Oh, I see. And they ran the table. Yeah. Unbeatable. He, All right, here really, we go. Like, his style is kind of different from the other Yun from Japan, but he's really, really strong. Yeah. All right. And always playing the black color. So, so let's see what's going here against the Chun Li. I would love to see, to see where he is, but. I okay. guess I couldn't find the bracket. So. Right. We'll find it somewhere. Right now, Yan. Oh, it, okay. It's, 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 oh, it's 18 block. Okay. Okay, it's Yakun, Kenzo. Oh, KO is them too. He's a master and. Kiyashinsu. I don't know this one, but. Okay. I guess the Chun I don't know this Chun Li too. No, I'm not too sure who that is either. But that's fine. Let's go. I guess that's not like really famous Chun player, but they're still strong. Everyone can compete here. There's no rundown player. Okay. Everyone is pretty strong, so. Good, good. Yes. You have to take like every match seriously. The last hit of that good agent Ender confirms yeah. the kill. And build some meta. Okay, nice weave finish here. Like, oh, okay, uh -oh. Chen, Chen take back the, the control. 
Wait, that, that's really good because like Issei like make a, a decision really fast. You need to get out of the corner. Yes. He still have life, so he, he can take the risk. Right. You don't want to. You don't want to stay yeah. in the corner too long. Yeah. If you stay in the corner, basically you're dead. So you have to make a decision here. Right. Especially like in South Strike, you have to make decisions. Mm. If you don't do nothing, you will lose. Especially against Chani because she has too much control. Right. You have to make a decision. You've yeah. got. You've got to be active. Exactly. Oh, nice. Okay, nice pressure here. Okay. Nice. Nice mix up. He has the setup behind on. So that was pretty nice from Chani. Like if you quick rise here, if you roll, uh -huh. you have to deal with a, a front or back mix up. Right, so Yan can Yan can choose which direction yeah, he yeah. wants. It's really hard to see. Okay. It's almost impossible to see. Alright, so yeah. another ambiguous setup from Yan. So, so Chan delays the just does regular wake up. Yeah, just don't quick rise and it's fine. Oh, okay, so. But it's still hard because you still have to deal with the mix up, but at least you don't you know which side is going on. Okay. <laughs> Why, wise words for any Chun Li players thinking about how to approach the unmatch if you've been knocked down. So here we go. Okay, I think like he says he's on the rampage now. Like it feels really easy for him. I, he, I think he's so familiar with the Chun Li matchup. Yeah. He's unfazed. You know, every Japanese player really knows Chun Li well. Right. <laughs> now, let me wrong. Is it true they they always say it, it's now the, the game has progressed to. How well does my character just fight Chun at this point? Hey, what do you mean? Well, what, what, would you would you agree if you say that when you look at the game, it's how well does this character fight Chun Li versus X character? Like that's why Yun is so high in the rankings is that he tends to fight Chun Li very well, as opposed to a character like say Alex or yeah, Alex is almost impossible. It's, it's, <laughs> I don't, I don't, it's I'm an Alex player and it's terrible. Yeah, it's terrible. So, but you, yeah, but I think the matchup is still in Chun Li's favor. Okay. Not so many Yun players can do really well against Chun-Li, but here I think the, the level difference is really high, so... Right. You see? Not, not that the Chun-Li is bad, no. that Issei is too good. Right. You see, like you just said, Issei is on a rampage right now. Yeah. I, I think in like, the range where he stands, the, the, the mix-up, the timing, everything is better than the Chun-Li. I agree, the yeah. The is kind of overwhelmed, even though the, 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 the pace is not so fast, but every button he press, uh -huh. it's... Yeah, he, he's standing right outside of, it looks like Chun-Li's standing fierce range. He's negated the low forward. And when he sees the stand fierce or anything that the Chun is uh, stuck out, it's been a roundhouse every yeah. time. Exactly. Really good stuff for me, but, say. But Chun has, has to move forward. Too. Yes. She, even if she blocks, it's good for Yun because Yun builds metal. Right. And, she, and he, he pushed Chun in the corner. Ah. So after that, you just need to maybe two or three moves in when Chun blocks. He builds a lot of meters. Then Yun backdash. Oh, okay. not too cutting strong, and then you have Kennedy, and you come back. And then you can start advancing one more time. So, if you don't fight that back, it will. It will never over. Okay. It, it's like a loop. Right, right. It's like a loop. <laughs> so you have to, to, to fight back. Right. Okay. All right, now it looks like Chun, this time, uh, was on the offensive. Yeah. Back in neutral now. Like you said, fighting back a lot better. Yeah, better. The challenge of that key. All right, first good agent. So now you just block. You just take the block, fine. All right, you got attacked by the overhead. Right. It's hard to see, but... Uh, okay, nice end. You build like almost out of the gate. Right. All right, another back. He's got back. Feel so like he doesn't even feel the need to activate to end the round because right. he knows he's in control. Yeah, he says feel pretty good. No pressure. Here. It's fine. Shoulder activate. Like, I, I think you should accept that. Expect that. Okay. You should try to parry. It's risky. Because oh. if you parry, you just, just get stuck. Break, but okay. If you're like aware enough, you can block that. You can mm. parry that. Okay, so here we go. Chun Li. Now this time, yeah, yeah. she's got she's the dominant one. Yeah, doing much better now. And I think what's scary is that she's sitting on so much meter already. Okay, nice. Oh. I, I think you just oh yeah, because in first right, like there's five untroubled friends on waking. Up. Right, right. So w waking up with like the three friend buttons, it's good. Like it builds the troll. Yes. Okay, another. Oh wow. I, I don't know what happened here. I didn't see. <laughs> right. Maybe, maybe he might have gone for a command throw, I'm not sure. So the Chen is fine here, she's in control. Right. One, she's got one meter, almost two, okay, nice. uh, that's game. Oh, that was not even, oh, it was combo, I don't know. I think it was combo, right? Yeah. Like the meaty, back, back, yeah, meaty. like a three out of five stuff. Yeah, meaty back fierce, uh, confirm, super. Oh. Good job, Issei, I believe that finally yeah. goes down. Let's see. Yeah, but you know, the, the, what's coming next is even more scary also. Right. 
it up, Yaku. Or maybe this one is a. Uh, yeah. I don't know how to read that. <laughs> it's kind of how the katakana looks alike, you know. Right. But there's still Yakun is still behind. Ko is still here. Right. And Mestel is here, so. Oh, it's a star-studded lineup, apparently. Yeah, yeah. This is like the, Very good team. The master of Yun. Ah, yes. So let, let's see what this Yun is doing. There we go. It's a nice special. He has to get in jeans, okay. Oh, um, that was an activate, yeah, but he got lucky. That was a mistake, but he got fine, turned out well. Yeah, nice finish. He, he was too close to activate, I guess, but it's fine. Mm. Finish your combo. Yeah, half of the meter. Okay. Okay, nice pressure by Chani. She has to mix it up. Right. Uh, this is a mistake because I, I guess she wanted the, she wanted the confirm for the for the heavy. Kick. Oh yes. But she just missed the input. I don't know what why they do that, but. She get out the corner. Right, oh. she jumped away and she jumped away and then Yun has the space to get out. Right, she gave the advantage away. Go forward. Nice car throw. So basically with Chan you need to control. You don't need you don't want your open up your opponent to escape the corner. Okay. Well, look at the pressure. Yeah. Gets opened up. Hey, 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 hey. 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 Okay, classic end though. Cross up. Doesn't take the risk. Fine. Classic sequence here. Okay, nice challenge here. This is this is pretty nice. Oh yeah, that, that was like like a 50-50 situation for them. Right. Being airborne would have been the best bet, though. I think if he tries to hit anything else, if he tries to confirm it anything, if a super comes out, yeah. then an airborne reset. But he, he was kind of far to eat uh, you know Michi, so true. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, let's go. I think. Okay. We don't see the match here, just the face. I don't know. <laughs> look at, look no, at the it's not the match on there. That intensity. <laughs> I think he's in the correct character select screen. <laughs> Alright. Well, I think this is the last player for the Chani team, right? Uh, I think Ise beat three. three Ise, guys. It's out of the two or three. So maybe it's the, the last one, the captain for the Chani team. This might be number four. Uh, so I haven't seen the I haven't seen Taisho yet with uh, the name tag. Oh. Maybe, yeah. Alright, Yun turning it on. Oh, nice parry! Yeah, I guess that was an option select. Maybe like a SGGK. Yeah. Just a block, block the character, you know. Alright, nice nice and, uh, conversion. Of the meter. Th that's right, really strong. A little strong into up kicks. Yeah. Okay, nice throw. She can, she can make uh, the comeback here. Maybe two or three fears and then one super can make the, the round. But. There you go. Oh, you inactivate, it's gonna be hard for Chen. Okay, nice oh, throw here. No. Oh, she had. Yeah, she had to challenge. Yeah, it's hard. Yeah. You, you, you have to, to, to take the risk to, to challenge that. You, you right. cannot let uh, well. Yun jump in front of you. Like, often they'll say that you could choose just to d defend, but then your chances of losing. It just grow to 100%. Yeah, but even you know, you'll get you'll get timed out. But you can choose to fight it. You'll get knocked out faster. But you give yourself a chance to win. Yeah, that's true. Like, especially against Yun, because he, you can you can beat Mita. So if you don't attack, you will build Mita and combat in the engine. Right. And it's hard to fight. So you have to kill Yun without when he has no Mita. Right. They, uh, there was a oh oh no that, that's that yeah. Okay, I oh. try try the loop, but it's, it's kind of hard to do. Oh, there okay. we go. I think it's over. Was that, was that game? Or? I think it's over. That was the last Chani player. Alright, yeah, they're getting out. Well fought by the Yun team. And, and Yun, like, when you fight Yun as Chani, it's hard. You, you cannot really react spinning bird on wake up. Really? Because if Yun do a crushing shot, uh -huh. the move whiff and you can punish. Okay. So it's, uh, it's So his hitbox is too low. Yeah, it's when, too low. Okay. Or uh, could Yun also uh, dive kick at the and find the sweet spot? Yeah, but I don't... He can do that too. That's okay. True. That's true. But it's not really worth it because I think he can like trade and you get like, uh, hmm. how to say, you get you get back to the other corner. But if you time rail the, the crushing shot, okay. you can eat meaty and make with the spinning dot. Oh, okay. And then, and then you can punish. On the big punish, right. Yeah. So again, I want to thank everybody here for joining us at Pre-Cooperation Cup. This whole weekend is going on. I am Duralath and being joined here by the man himself, Gunfight. Uh, We've seen some spectacular action. Let's see. I want to see if we can get uh, into a little more of this. Just waiting on the next scene here. 
Okay, okay big... the match are back, I guess. All right, here we go. Switch back. Oh, Dudley. Dudley against Yu Yen. Yeah. All right. I think this is a pretty interesting match. Yes. That's hard match for Dudley. <laughs> really. All right, you are the Dudley specialist here, so oh, you've got to... Not anymore. <laughs> not anymore, not I don't anymore. know. <laughs> we saw your Dudley earlier during the stream. It looked like you were doing impressive. We saw a lot of great whip punishes. Thank you. And of course, you had you know, the man himself, Koko Jin, back yeah. there, so... Like, when I have those guys back, I can, I can play. Right, right. The pressure is not as high as uh, it used to be. So, yeah. Dudley versus Yurian. Uh, what do you remember? I see Yurian in favor. You're in favor. Yeah, definitely. Okay. It's really hard to, to do the ground game because even if you if you take the risk to parry the Yoyan low move, uh -huh. you cannot really punish them. Really? It's, it doesn't, it's too far. Oh, okay, okay. And Yoyan has many good anti air options. So it's really hard to get in. <laughs> it's really hard to get in, and Yoyan can build meter. All right. This is nice. So it's just block the sweep and you walk forward to, to do the All right, nice one from here. One, two, three. See, at this range, it's kind of hard. Right. Dali, you feel like Dali's got a fish or you yeah. might have to look for a, a confirm or uh, uh, a punish? I see a lot of mistake here. A lot of uh. mistake, guys. Oh, it's Kairu. Okay, it's Kairu, Kairu guys. Really, really strong that lane. Okay. Cool. Let, let, let me check. Yeah, there's too, too many brackets here. I don't know. <laughs> okay, let, let's keep on the map. Right. Nice. So the setup it is like uh, you see the setup it is uh, it's like it's like a safe jump like if he parries Yurian can cannot really get anything of it right he lands early enough you can still take a throw yeah. you cannot punish with punching here for example oh, okay nice next step they didn't get the uh, the cancel there now he gets the Aegis. yeah it's hard to deal with that see the, those this range is really hard for the day this finish. Yes. This is the, the, the most optimized finish here. Okay. You cannot sweep because it's too slow. Ah. So you have to show you. You have to do a, I think Always slide and show you. Jabba yeah. and then, okay. So you have to know it's like a matchup knowledge. It's hard to do because you have to do it fast. Ah. But I think I do know the matchup really well. Okay. Let's see, who are they bringing up? Let's see. Yeah. So yeah, basically this matchup is hard because you can control the ground game. Right. It's hard for Dodet to get in. It's really, really hard. Here we go. And even if you jump on Yuyan, Yuyan can really mix up the anti -air. Right. Uh, he, he, can, he has a choice between the launcher, he can uh, anti -air strong, yeah. or even just uh, jab. Yeah, he can jab or like the strong into counter into fireball. He right. Can mix his option really well, so it's hard. It's hard. Oh, nice. But of course, like you play the day, so once you, you're in, it's, it's, uh, it's good. Right, you're, 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 in the, you're locked. Yeah, but you have to get in. You have to get in. All right, Dudley is trying to force his way in. I'm not down here. Oh, you didn't see the other way, okay. Just want to break the mirror, I guess. Nice escape from the corner here. Uh, you can see that no one wants to be in the corner. No. When you're in the corner, they just jump out. Yeah. Just fight, just get out. Yeah, yeah. You, oh, it's Air Craft Team. Okay, RKF let's go. Team, okay. But you you have to take the risk. Even if you lose some life, uh -huh. by getting out of the corner, it's really good. Right. It's, it's like sacrificing. It's, uh, it's better, it's uh, the lesser of two evils, as yeah. I say. Yeah. You don't want to deal with uh, Yoya and Nero. No. Okay, nice luck here. Alright, he did backswing blow again, but that time he got stopped by a strong. I think he's looking for that now. Oh, nice. Oh, that turns up. Okay, nice zoning here. Yeah, yeah. Yoya cannot finish here. Okay, here we go. Oh, nice, oh, nice wake up. You have to take the risk, it's fine. Yoya cannot really punish. He can punish, but not that hard. Like, he'll maybe EX tackle at most, but yeah. not worth it. Okay, nice pressure by. Okay, headbutt is really annoying against Dudley because he has an easy big hitbox. Oh, uh, but he's huge. Oh, what, what, what was that? I think he, he missed. Okay, he has the mirror. Oh, yeah, another meter. Okay, I think it's almost. Oh, oh no, too early. Oh, oh the. <laughs> oh, yeah, I, I can see. I can see Aki wow. not believing what happened here. <laughs> I, I think like it, it was like a little bit of confusion. He got lucky. Right. He got lucky. Okay, nice confirm here. He had the pressure, the timing for the rose. No, you're not to block. Nice block here. Again uh, with a jump and backswing blow. Yeah. I think he noticed that Yoyan always takes the throw. Okay, he tried to fish for the Yoyan low move here. Yes. With the day, if you do crushing pierce, you can beat Yoyan low move. Oh, there it is. The nice neutral jump around house. So he was in the lead, so no need to take risks, just to control the game, it's fine. Right. With uh, that big a live lead, you don't want to take 
you don't want to risk anything. But it was just staying outside of the dance band. Yeah. So it was basically no risk for them there. Even the trade was fine for him. Okay. So you don't, you don't need anything. Just stay out of the, the dash band. Like this cannot get thrown. Mm. So it's fine. Oh. No risk here. All right, looks like it's RKF coming okay. up. Let, let's see those uh, fancy combo, man. <laughs> let's try to see a combo video. Please. Wow the crowd. Oh, uh, okay. Tackle, yep. This is the best punish. Okay, nice. So ju jumping on us is really good for Yuyan too. It's hard for the letter to deal with that. Right. Oh, you oh, missed the no. punish. Ah, uh, the block. He was fishing for the block. Right, he, keeps the he kept it simple that time. Yeah. The mirror saves, keeps him cornered. Yeah, I guess this is good for Yuyan. Nice throw here. Oh, oh he, he read, read it that, that time. That. Yes. That was pretty, pretty nice. He took the information from the last game, yeah. saw the back swing blow, punished accordingly. That was kind of risky by Kyrie Ky the other day. They, they didn't need that. Oh. Okay, nice pressure he did. <laughs> RKF just wants to get out of the corner. Yeah. RKF looking very healthy right now, screen wise, but it's still at a life deficit. RKF is like fishing for Paris really a lot. Okay. I, I don't, I don't, I don't know if Kairu just noticed that, but if he noticed, he has a way to finish up. Okay, nice parry. Ah, oh, he missed the combo. But that's fine. You get the throw back in the corner. Aegis set up. Jab Aegis. Just building some some meter. Okay, nice. Okay, got him off. Nice. Get to the other corner with the parry. That was pretty cool. Oh, I think that was a mistake. The trash. He wanted oh. to take the throw. Oh, oh! He didn't block everything. Breathe a sigh of relief. Yeah, yeah. Can feel the pressure here. Yes. <laughs> okay, nice piece here. Oh, oh this is gonna hurt. Oh, uh, it's a medium one. Right. Not bongo. Short, short, super. Okay. Oh, a very deep jump in. It's kind of hard to deal with because he can do empty jump into uh, low, right. into crouching low. Right. Shot, right? We saw a crouch short, uh, he can do crouch short uh, jet oppo or crouch short uh, super. Yeah. So it's really hard to do it for Yoyan. But I guess RKF took too much risk here. Right. He, he wants to parry, that's his style for. Right. Sometimes it doesn't work. Like, you know, in just like, even if you play good, you can lose. Right. That's what makes it hard to, to accept, I guess. Hey, it's, that's, the, <laughs> that's the beauty of the game. Yeah, you know? that's true. Yeah, there's no one universal answer. So, see, even if you make the, the good choice or good stuff, you open, your opponent can read you and beat you. Right. Good, solid play. Yeah. And a little bit of luck. Like, yeah, but luck is part of the game. Yes. You have to be lucky. Yes, sir. All <laughs> <laughs> right, nice air to air. Okay. Nice question. Okay. Okay, Dudley is trying to fish for the run out into the X machine gun blow. Yep. But he got the confirm for the crouching strong. Nice of that. Oh, I think he could have combo there, but I'm making it anyway. Oh, nice. Okay. Now you notice he's thrown corner game. He's always thrown roast. He's never gone high. He's yeah. always gone sweet. RKF took advantage of that once. Actually, like if he's not stuck to you yet, and if you go for the sweep. Yeah. If, for example, you can go out and uh, do crouching strong, it will. Right. He, he has to dash and then crouching strong, but it's hard to do. Right. Cr crouching fierce, I mean, it's hard to do. That's, that's why he's not stuck to you yet. All right, there it is. There was, a run out. there was the overhead first time. Another overhead. Good throw attack. Oh, that's There's that crouch fierce, just that's like you said it. That's what I said. Oh. But this is not reaction. This is just like anticipation. Right. Know? He, he knew that yeah, something you have to was know the distance. Right. Like the ground game is part of the mind game. Right. You have to know the distance, what, what kind of move your opponent wants to throw. Right. Made a good calculation and it yeah. paid off. Very, very good. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> pretty you see that crouch fierce. Yeah, that was a really good performance. <laughs> and oh, yeah, from my Dudley friends just made it, but unfortunately for Air Cave. All right, so here we go. It's going to be hard. Okay, now we have the cane against Akuma. Right. I love Akuma in this game. So so fun to play. It's it's very it's high hard. damage, but yeah, I agree. It's hard. But he has every option, a good Karatro. His mobility is really good. Yes. Oh nice we punish him. He didn't compare with the Sukado. 
Okay, just running away, doesn't need to take risk, he's in the lead. Okay, nice. Okay. There it is. Yep. I think this is guaranteed chip here. Yeah. Not, not guaranteed. I, I guess the Ken could have maybe like red parry on the fourth hit. Yeah. And then white parry the last one, maybe punish, but it's hard. Nice. Caught him. Yeah, like. Buki has no life. Okay, nice escape there. So Demon Flip is like, I think it's per frame. Uh, not on the ground. Right. So it's a really good escape option. Oh, no end here. here. Right. He was afraid of the parry, I guess. There you go. Get out of there. Nice escape again. Nice parry throw, putting the pressure. Ken doesn't roll. Maybe he missed the input, I don't know. Right? Uh, no confirmation. Right, he called out that dash. It's fine. Akuma is in control here. But, uh, like, actually, like, Ken doesn't need to, to, to go all in like this. Because one opening takes so much life. Uh -huh. Oh! oh that was a little bit strange, but okay. I don't think he trusted it. Oh, oh that's nice it. Yeah. It's easier when you do the fireball. Right. Oh, it's matchy. Oh, <laughs> don't do this, please. Oh, no. Don't do this, please. No, no, no. <laughs> Come on, matchy. No, oh, this is match. Oh, one of the best Akuma in the Oh, game. okay, it was match. He's really, really good. Let's see. Let's try it. This is a 10 too, right? Let's see here. It's hard not to have the bracket, you know. Alright, so here we go. I think this is okay. Against the Ken. Match. I don't know the Ken, but okay. <laughs> uh, let's see here. So, Remondo plus Capes. Okay, so we have know. match controlling so far. Oh no. Okay, nice, nice, really nice. I missed the, the camera show you here. But it's fine. Nice pressure here. Uh, again, that demon flip you saw, you were talking about yeah. that escape, but he chose for the throw that time. Like, I think this is no respect option. <laughs> if you go, if you wake up like this, I mean, if you do the, the heavy one to get out, it's fine. But you just do the small one and go for the throw. Oh, okay. It's like, it's really cocky. <laughs> and it works, so it's nice. Uh, there's that escape. Escape. Oh. But you, you, okay, nice confirm. I don't know if it was a don't Oh, yeah. Ooh, no, par no okay, parry? I guess he missed the parry, I don't know. Yeah. Sometimes execution doesn't happen. Right? Yeah. But I, I guess he could have blocked it. Right. He had the life. Okay, nice. One, oh, two. Okay, the life. Big damage. Nice setup, you see? He eats the reset. Okay, nice move him here. He has the setup, no setup. Shallow dive kick for a throw. Oh. Uh, that might have been see, a. That was a read. I guess he, he was expecting the demon kick. Right. But Machi was not in the corner, so it was almost no reason for him to do that. Mm. That was a good read, but not at the right time. <laughs> throw, throw. Oh, oh nice. It's fine, just one hit, he has no super. Alright, one bar. One opening from uh, from Gookie can make the, the game now. Or maybe he will try to chip, I don't know. Waiting for that magic moment. Yeah, this is pretty tense now. Like, I think Machi is still in control here. Even if he if he's, there it is. Life, he's in control. Yeah, nice reaction. Yes, nice reaction. very good reaction. <laughs> <laughs> it was dangerous. Almost fell off of the stage. <laughs> uh, match just, match just I guess it's over. Okay, Great. so the goalkeeper team won. Well fought by Match. Yeah. yeah, yeah, like you said, he was waiting for that perfect moment. He was still in control. Ken oh. threw a fireball and yeah, exactly. rest is history. But, yeah, we. we, we we could see that Ken was not really in like right. not so much confident here. Right. He was not sure what to do. So yeah, I had a request uh, yeah. from from uh, Niaban actually. Niaban. Just a shout out for uh, for you. You want me to answer him in French? <laughs> if you'd like to. <laughs> oh no, it's my friend. So, uh, hello Niaban. Yes. Actually, someone told me earlier, do not speak French. Uh, okay. Yeah, it is. So I'm not allowed to speak French. Ah, uh, very English right? stream, so that's quite alright. I can speak French a little bit, it's fine, right? <laughs> So, uh, Bonjour, Niaban. Va te coucher, il est tard en France, là. So, uh, again, <laughs> folks, thank you for joining us here. You're still watching Pre-Cooperation Cup right now. Your commentators for this English stream are Daryl Ath and Gunfight. Yeah, again, do, we're here, we're here. do not change that stream channel. Make sure you are following because there's going to be, again, huge action all weekend. This is some of the best, I repeat, the best third strike you will see in your life. So do not miss a single moment. Here we go. We're going to deal drop pool, right? This is pool, pool stage. Yeah, we're still in the pool stages. So, okay, I'm rooting for Dudley here. Dudley changed a pretty tough matchup. Right. 
Oh, he missed, he missed the... Johnny missed, too many misses here. The, duck, the ducking gun came up, but nice confirm on the elbow here. <laughs> Deadly jumping one off, it's uh, really high and it, it's it's pretty easy to confirm into a um, into super, so it's a pretty good option. You have oh. to mix up, you have to mix it up with the... Uh, oh, you have the matchup chart. So right? I, yeah, I have Boss's matchup chart. He has this matchup listed as 6.5 uh, Chun-Li, 3.5 uh, Dudley. Uh, I don't know, Boss chart, uh, I think it was pretty accurate about the, the plasma, you know? Okay. I think Dudley is at the right place here. Okay. He's a kind of mid-tier character. Yeah. Right. And Chun-Li is a hard matchup, but I don't. I think 6.5, 3.5 is a little bit too much. Maybe 6.4. 6.4? Six, six okay. Yeah. It's a hard matchup, but it's, it's not the worst, I guess. Right. I still feel that Doug, uh, Dudley, if he scores that uh, first knockdown, yeah. he can dictate the pace and he's got to force Chun-Li to be defensive. Yeah. And, and Chun-Li has a, the, the good kickbox for Dudley's combo. Right! So everything helps really much. And he has option to... Uh, you're not countering the ground game, but you can make it well. You can make it well. The sweep is good. You can like do the jumping run out to catch her. Right. So you have option. You have option to get in. It's hard to get in, but it's, it's doable. Look at, so look at this. Dudley's already at two meters, yeah. and Chun-Li just got her first one. And yeah, the, like the, the building meter at the beginning of the, of the match, there was some debate about the, the Dudley player. Uh -huh. Some player prefer to go in right away because Chun-Li doesn't have meter. Right. But for example, Koku Jin always say, just build one meter and then you go in. Okay. That's his game plan. But right. for myself, I don't do that. I just try to push her in the corner right away. Right. You want the screen control. Yeah. All right. Ch because now it's hard for the best. He has meter, but in, in this situation, in this spot, he doesn't have the chance to right to, to get the cross to go, right? So it's uh, almost useless. And that was good there. He had the low forward. He could have spent the meter, but instead he, lightning, he got lightning like he said. Now it's, now it's almost impossible for Dudley to win. Really? If you lose the first round, it's hard. Yeah, he's got a burn <laughs> meter. The matchup is even worse. Ah. But it, it, you can win, of course, but yeah. your odds... You odds know, are not in your favor. Yeah, exactly. Right. The, the best situation, I guess, is to kill Chun the first round. And maybe you will lose the second one because she will have meter. Right. You want to start the third round without maybe Chun Li at, at the maximum one meter. If you start the third round with Chun-Li 2 meters... Chun-Li oh, Chun has all the advantage in the world. Okay, chip, chip the... Chip. Oh, it's BBK. Let's go BBK. Really good other player. Wow. See, now it's hard. Chun-Li has 2 meters. Right. And Dudley only has 1 and almost a half. So, like, one mistake, one clutching forward, and uh, you in the corner, it's, it's gonna be hard. Dudley's gotta be very careful here. So he has to get in, he has to take the risk. Okay, Chani misses a uh, range. Uh, no confirm, he missed that too. I guess that's not what he wanted, but... Oh, oh no! That's the good fortune we needed. Okay, nice punish. Could have done more damage, I guess. In the corner, you can do uh, some pretty good combo on Chan Li. That's it, yeah. But yeah, that's it. See? Chan Li 2 meter. Right. Even if she missed one, yes, she got the position. It's not that bad. Right. She had a life lead already. Yeah. So, oh, it was definitely looking good for the Chun Li. All right. Okay, let's go. I think but that's not this. That's not that bracket. Uh, not sure. Who that... look, look at this man in the hat and the glasses. Oh, he's a. Uh... You don't want to be recognized. <laughs> <laughs> Who is this guy? I don't Incognito. Know. He's Q. <laughs> that's right. He's Q. Let's see. Oh, I want to see the, the Hugo team. Uh, the Hugo team would be amazing later. All right, here we go. Okay, I don't find the bracket. Yeah. It's fine. All right. So this does let through the, the rocket uppercut. Okay. He, he wants the damage. Okay. He wants the damage. All right, now he sacrifices a little bit of EX meter for that, though. Yeah. But yeah, because of the damage, it's, it's maybe kind of a good choice against, like, maybe the Chen will run away. Right. Because, because you can ma maximize your, your Right, mid. right. Mid screen throw. See, like, in this situation, when Chen Li do the back pierce into fireball, you always have to try the red parry. I agree. Always. I always agree with that. It's 100% favorable for you. If, you. if you have the parry, you have the good punish. If right. you miss it, you lose maybe you lose 10 like, of life. Yeah. It's no big deal. Yeah, the, the, uh, it's worth it to, uh, yeah, to go. It's really worth it. 
Oh no, he missed the dodge. He did right. He did, he did the, the strike because if he had, did, if he had done the upper, the, right. the, the super would have bounced out. Yeah. Right? Okay, Chun Lee no respect here. Chun Lee still has a bar as well. Training Dudley after getting hit. Okay. Dudley has two meter, but he has to work for it. Oh, nice. Nice combo. There it there. is. Okay. All right. And even that, you have to hit your lower, I guess. Yes. Oh, uh, he missed the combo now. Uh, he was afraid right there. I, I think that was a mistake. I I'm not sure. It was kind of strange. Okay, Dudley is back in the corner. It's going to be hard. Chen could have combo with the super here. Right. Uh, Dudley was crouching and yeah. that roundhouse works. Another confirmed. Yeah, he missed. I guess he's not confident in the in this confirm game, but okay, nice escape here. See, this is why it's hard. Like the, the range, the Chen is playing right now is really good. Oh, that could be the opening Dudley needs. Yeah. One more hit. Okay, the setup on Mitty. Ah. Oh, good read. Yeah. Of course, oh. Of course, of course. You have to do it. Yep. Yeah. Like I was saying, the, the, the range Chen is playing right now is the best one. I agree. Because if Dudley jumps. You just have to walk on that. Right. So Dudley has to, to switch the... To, to maybe come closer or go far. More far. Okay, building meter. Uh, Chen has two meter now. Right. Opted not to spend it that, on that low board earlier. Yeah. Nice. Stan Strong could have been there. Just keep Dudley in control. He's fine. See, nice, nice walking on there. Dudley has to run away. He has to build the meter because... Yes, it's going to be pretty hard for that day, I guess. Chen, you don't have to take the risk here. Oh, oh okay. no. the buffer, the buffer was bad. Corner carry. Oh, no, goes for the big oh, set, that's it. Set up, yeah. Pretty basic setup, but you, you cannot react, so you have to choose. Right. But actually, like for if you if it's front or behind, you can choose at the last moment. At the last moment, you choose your guard. Uh -huh. If you hit in front, you parry. If right. You hit in back, you have the block. Right. You tap the direction, right? But it, it's another 50 50 because if she eats low, it's low, then yeah. you, eat, you eat the low. Yeah, that's the same. <laughs> so either you have to choose higher or low. Higher or low, and then side or side, right? <laughs> you have to choose. It's a 50 50 in the 50 50, I guess. All right. Delhi team is sending up. Oh, this guy is pretty crazy. I was with this guy in team last year. Oh, He's yeah? pretty good. <laughs> He's pretty reckless. Oh, okay, so this should be high octane, yeah. high fast pace. Very good, very good. I hope so, I hope so. Don't make me lie, please. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe this year is like another style, I don't know. <laughs> yeah. Who knows? Let's, let's have some fun. Here we go. Uh, with this color. Maybe he's one of the world Dudley color. I don't know. You <laughs> okay, see, this guy go in. Right. And by eating Chun Li, the meter is really good. Right. right. So he already has one meter of the damage. And Chun Li has barely anything. Yeah. So you have to. You have to Nice confirm here, Chun-Li was crouching. Right. Okay, nice reaction by Chun-Li here. I don't know if it was on reaction or not. Okay, nice option. Just walking around. Oh, wake up legs. Yeah, these guys go in, like I told you. You have to go in. Right, you have to be the one dominating. Yeah. Like Chun-Li doesn't have meter, so you don't you don't have anything to be scared of. Right. Okay, nice, nice one by Dudley. And like the second one is pretty good because he has meter, Chun-Li doesn't have one. So he, he has to kill Chun Li now. Right. It, that's his chance. If he lose this round, it might be difficult. Actually, like, now it's fine for Dudley to get hit by the super. Right, because then she would yeah. start round three, no super. Yeah, exactly. Oh, again, another. Uh, but well, she. Okay, I don't think she wanted to spend it just yet. Good. Now she's got double. That was a pretty bad round for Dudley. Though the third one's gonna be difficult now. Mm. Oh. Okay, we didn't see what happened here, but I guess Chen Li got the confirm. Yep. Okay, she doesn't take risk, just backing off, waiting for Dudley maybe to do something. Oh, she, can, she can whip finish that, you know the sweep. Yeah. When, when I play like really strong Chen Li, when I do sweep in, uh, in whip, I always got the punish oh. with, the, with the super. Right. Okay. Nice zone maintained. Oh no, uh, caught the dash. Okay, nice. She's in the corner. She, he doesn't spend the meter. Okay, nice. Now is Dudley's chance. Oh, yeah. Oi, short, nice. short. One more. I think he's going to chip. Oh, nice. Uh, always nice. go low. Doesn't change if it works. I got always I, go low. <laughs> yeah, you would you would think after going lo low twice, he would try to go higher throw. Yeah. But the beauty, the beauty of Yomi, yeah. I think he thought he thought that the Chun Li would think high. Yeah, that's true. He was thinking, okay, we'll change now. Yeah, he's, change. he's gonna change it. No. <laughs> All right. 
I don't know what these guys do. Oh yeah, this Dudley is pretty aggressive. I think he's, this is the good style against Chan Li. Mm. Just take it to her. Yeah, you have to take your chance. Yes. You see, it's a little bit different than... Okay, he's jumping in. But maybe this Chinese defense is uh, a little bit better. I don't know. Okay, nice uh, block here. Good punish. That was a really, really nice block. A nice counter carry here. Oh, really oh. nice. He baited the troll. Oh, he put himself in the corner. Mm. Maybe that's the mistake that will cost him the round. Right. Chen is pretty aggressive. Dashing on dead is pretty risky. Okay, nice. Oh, that was Chen's chance. Okay, yeah. Oh, nice. He wanted in. to chip in. Yeah. <laughs> He's laughing. <laughs> well, the uh, best case scenario right there. Good Dudley. Yeah. Chen has to meet up his fine. It's the second round, so he can take the risk. Okay, nice leap here. All right, all right, that's one. Okay, what, what is the setup? Okay, the troll. I guess the Chen wants to, to kill Dudley without spending the meter. Oh. So, like, if you play Dudley against Chen you have to be aware of that. Uh -huh. You have to, to know or to feel when the Chen player wants to spend the meter. All right, Dudley looking. Okay. Oh, oh but the spinning bird. He did it too early. He did it too early. I, oh. I, I guess the Chen maybe saw the, the sweep. I don't know. It's possible, you know. Okay, tough friend for Dudley here. Okay, nice. Oh, he missed the super. Could have got punished, but the Chen didn't know the punish, I guess. All right, another corner, but corner pressure. Corner. Okay, still no, nope. no parry on the fireball. That was his chance to get out. Right. That's an easy uh, stand roundhouse yeah. into machine gun. Exactly. Oh, okay, there's nice a little corner. Nice low profile here. That. Finishing gently, gently. It's going to be hard now. Same mistake as before. Yeah. Like, at, at this range, it's, it's not good to, to buff. The machine gun, the EX machine gun. Right. Because the, it's only good to, uh, to challenge the fierce button. Mm. Uh, yeah, now, it. correct me if I'm wrong, Chun Li, if she's crouching and she gets hit by it San Roundhouse, it'll yeah. whiff the yeah. machine gun blow. That's why it's not that good to. Uh, ah, to right, right, right. You, you have to be standing right right uh, after the, the, the fierce thing. Ah. But I, I guess the Japanese Chun-Li doesn't do that move anymore. They, they know that Dudley they, can punish it. So. Right, so they just go into uh, the ducking. Yeah. Yeah. Now. Okay, try. All right. It's a bit of, of meter management here. Try to get in with the high jump. Uh, okay, chun is back here really strong. This is the wall. The, the great wall of Chun-Li. The great wall of Chun-Li of China, <laughs> exactly. It's really good because you can cancel into a lighting kick, right? Right. Okay, nice, nice for the dead. Reverse the situation. Chen is in the corner. Oh, nice confirm here. He's in control. That was nice, too. Nice sequence here. Yeah. Doesn't have meter, so. Oh, oh no! Tried to fish for the for the low parry, but didn't pay out. Chen is in control now. That day is going to be hard. Oh, this is chance. He missed it again. Nice setup here. <laughs> there you go. Spend the meter. Spend the meter. That, that was kind of funny. That yeah. was kind of jumping everywhere. Are you ready? No, uh, Dudley have the round here. Yeah. Okay, let's go. He can still make it. Uh, Dudley trying to walk her down. Yeah. Maybe Dudley could have tried to do like a ducking super here. Maybe. To, to, uh, when Chen Yi did the, the stomp on his face. Oh, right, to, catch, to try to catch. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, Chen Yi can parry, but... Uh, oh, nice. Oh, oh nice combo here. Oi, hey! Oh, that oh, was pretty nice. Great combo. Oh, he uh, uh, confirmed. He, okay. I, I guess he didn't want to spend the meter. Right. Yeah, paid off. He got... Uh, oh. Ah, this is Yomoda. Okay, this is really strong, Dudley. Yeah. Really, really strong. All right, here we go. <laughs> Round three. Round <laughs> three. Okay. That then Chen Yi are stuck, so I think it's gonna be fast. <laughs> Can go either way though, but okay, nice sweep here. Got him. Nice confirm. She's in the corner. Nice oh, confirm. nice confirm again. Probably has room for one more. Oh, why did he put himself in the corner? Try to escape here, but Chen Yi. 
Oh, oh okay, nice. Not dead. Okay. Alright, uh, here again, we go. The same, the same stuff as the last match. Oh, oh no! Yeah, no! Yeah. You have to choose, you have to choose. Yeah. I, I guess he was scared of the Liban match. Wait. All right. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Everything went down when, when he put himself in the corner. Right. Then, and then he started to panic. Yeah. And then he, it was really like, I don't yeah, know. He lost every every yeah. sense of uh, ground footing he could. Exactly. But I can understand, like, it's a classic mistake. You want to, to finish like, that again, right? Right. You don't want Chun-Li breathe. Yeah, I don't want, want Chun-Li getting any breathing room, but yeah. you gotta take risks. And sometimes those risks it's, don't pay it's off. It's an honest mistake. Yeah. But you have to know when to right. when to, to, to calculate keep the, tempo the risk. down sometimes. Right. Okay, let's go Kaido. I think it's the last one for the Dudley team, right? Right. The last hope for the Dudley. Okay, let's go Kaido. I'm I'm a little bit biased here, but see he's, he's doing the the, the Kokujin approach here, building one meter and then and then he will get in. Then he goes in, yeah. yeah. Oh, okay, nice. Backswing blow here. Nice one. Again blow. with a backswing. Yeah. Oh, yeah, the, the three frame man. Maybe it's even two frame, I don't know. <laughs> Coaching uh, job is really fast. It's, yeah. Okay, nice. Yeah, this out. move is good too because she really has good range and he put the. Ah, oh, he missed the punish. Yeah, the forward piece is good because if, if, you, if you open a block, it, you have. Good, uh, good range. Okay, good yeah. range. The pushback is really good. Oh. So you don't want to. You, you want to use that move maybe to get out of the corner or a touch. Ah, see, like oh, I. Oh, there it is. There's that red parry. That's a red parry. So you have. This is like. There's no risk in doing that. Hi. Okay, nice fishing for the job. You recognize the pattern here. Ah, uh, no super here. Fine. Oh, um, uh, there goes the perfect. Okay, he wants to kill him. He wants to kill her, but. Okay, nice. Okay. He's not dead though. Okay, nice. Okay. The third is fine. <laughs> but I, I think Chun is fine with this situation. Now she has two meters for the third round. Right. This is intense. Yeah. The, is this the last player for the Chun team? I want to say yes. I didn't pay attention, I don't know. Hey, we cut into the middle of it, so, yeah, so I'm not sure the count. It's hard to keep track of everything, you know? Right. Okay, Chen is in control, one one meter and a half. Uh-huh. Dudley's in the corner. And Dudley just have to wait for his for his moment. Maybe the moment will never come, but he has to wait. Right. Uh-oh. Yeah, I think it's... Corner pressure. It's gonna be hard. Low? Oh, no, it's a that's throw! Like, that's his moment now. Uh, he's scared of the X-Filling belt kick. Ah, uh, smart. This NTR man is so good. Yeah. Anti-air jab. Yeah, Chun just said the, the max max uh, crouching forward range. If if you don't let jump. Right. That's why she's playing far away. She's a really good decision. There yeah. it is. Max crouch forward. There. Yeah. There we go. That's. But I think like he was too scared of the spinning belt X on wake up. Right. He had to get in. He had to take the risk. Right. Especially with Dudley, like in, in this situation, if you don't take the risk, you will lose. Right. Like this, this knock up, this uh, wake up situation will only come once, you know. You gotta take your shots when you can. I yeah, mean. you have. You have to take the risk. Yes. You have, you have option to beat uh, Chinese X spinning belt too. Like like the same as Yun. Mm. If with Dudley you time your crouching shot correctly, uh -huh. you can beat the spinning belt. It's hard to do, but yeah. you can do that. Right. All right, so I'm, I wish I could see. I was, believe it or not, that match actually happened right in front of us, and I was trying to see if we could get the uh, which block it was. But oh well. I don't know. Oh, Other can, can you cut the Japanese? There's nothing. Oh uh, yeah. So. Very so, hard matchup, man. So so far, just. A ton of great matches, and the character variety here is just insane. Uh, we saw an Alex team and a Buki team earlier. You're not you know, the, the sad thing is you're not going to see a lot of this character variety outside of Japan. But yeah. it's great that we're doing this here. That we see all the characters represented. Like Sean has representation at this tournament. Oh, there's a Sean team. Uh, I don't think there's I think a tomorrow is only one. Tomorrow there's there. one Sean player. Yeah, team I saw that on the team 91. Oh, yeah. So that this was. 
So that was block 19, apparently, or... This is like 19, yeah. That's yeah, let's see if I can pull the 19 block here. Okay, he's here. So that block's going on. I don't know if okay. they're going to... Rebellion, oh, Yoyan team. Oh, Yaritai Dake. Right. How about the Dudley team? We lost against the Chun Liu. Okay, so that... that Aya to Y shots to Kaisha. Okay. Okay. So I know they're move, they might be moving on to a different block. I'm not too sure yet. So yeah, the, the, I think the Dudley team is going to be maybe... She can go, they can go to playoff if they... Right. Oh, but they won against the Yorian. They won against Yorian. Oh, so I think the Yorian team is, is out, right? I oh, think no, they have to play against the Chun. I think they have to play Chun, so... Oh, sure. So we're going to switch back over. Yeah. We're actually switching to a uh, different match now. Yeah, where is On the other side, we've got... The number one. I cannot see which block it is, so... But I'm also done so it's great. Yep. Wait it out. Nice parry. Okay, nice option here to, to make the parry to be safe. Okay, nice movement by Ken here. All right, Ken looking very healthy. If I could just wait out, maybe... You could go for it. Uh, they made a confirm. Oh, nice punish. I think it, I don't know. I don't, I don't think it was actually. That might down. not have been a punish there. They might have just been, hey, just go for it. Yeah, yeah. That, that, maybe like he wanted to uh, to buff, you know. Yeah. The run out, but the run out maybe he missed the input for the run out. Only the EX machine gamble came out. Ah, I see what you mean. <laughs> I don't know. Maybe it was on purpose, you know. Maybe he, he saw. He All saw right. maybe. Now this got the pressure right now. Nice block by Ken. I think he saw that because he just crouched at the last moment. Uh. Nice reset here. Okay, can, can you spring defensive? I think it's the good way to go against that lane. Right. You don't want Dudley to, to, to come close. So. Okay, nice one. Switching uh. position. Should I have don't you try? Nice finish here by Ken. Good, strong pierce. Oh, no parry. No parry here. Oh, oh no. no. That was kind of fun sequence. Oh, yeah, I don't know why Ken uh, jumped out on the wake up without parrying. Got him. Was Mr. Mr. I don't know. Why? why? Uh, you get a sweep, that's about it. <laughs> Just do it, guys. <laughs> okay, Ken is doing good now, controlling the range. Okay, nice sequence oh, by Dodd here. Cooper. Ken wanted to move, but you cannot move here. You have to block. Oh. Oh, yeah, really, nice really good play by Dunder, just aggressive one. Don't let his chance get away. I'm, I'm, I'm wondering if it's this block here with the Dudley and the Ken. No, but that was the match. Oh, no, that, no, that can't be because match played earlier, right? Unless match's team is over there? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. A lot of guesswork to figure out, but that's okay. It's all like, I think they have like a six set or eight set, right? Right. So it's hard to keep track of everything. But I guess it's just buggy, maybe. Okay. So here we go again. White Ken. I don't know this guy. White Ken. Okay, this Ken pretty aggressive right away, dashing. Okay, the sweep. Ken, look at the control, that pace. Yeah. Okay, nice one. Like, when Dudley doesn't have me there, you can yeah, boost the sweep. Just sweep all day, it's fine. Wait, what's he gonna punish with from max range? He can, he can only punish with uh, ducking super. Ah. But he's really hard to do. And if you don't have meter, you cannot punish. Mm. You can block, of course, but... But... <laughs> but if you start to block, you can just do the rundown. Standing rundown, so when you get hit. Yeah. Okay, short, nice setup here. Short toe super, here comes Dudley. Oh! oh. You don't have to have to confirm, but that's okay. Nice sequence here. Like, this Dudley is pretty aggressive, so... And he hits really hard. Mm. Can look in at pressure again. He tried to go for a parry there. Yeah, I think so. Okay, nice confirm, confirm by Ken. Then they're trying to uh, to low parry. Okay, you don't go for any setup. Just just get the throw to get the more damage on the next one. But I guess it's over now. Oh, nice bait big, here. Big damage. Big damage. Ken is in the corner. Okay. Oh, he missed the confirm here. Let to get this one. Uh, still alive. Yeah, nice. No good patience. Great patience. Just have to wait. Sometimes doing nothing is the best stuff you can do. Right. <laughs> Go for it. Ooh, give him a hug. Yeah. Give him the hug. Yeah. A little too far though. Yeah, yeah. I guess he missed the, the ducking. Okay, nice parry here, but was not ready for the finish. Nah, okay, just great gets out. By Ken. 
doesn't want to, to deal with Dudley in the corner. See, like he tried to parry the strip, I guess. Uh -huh. Oh, oh punish! Yeah, great punish. Maybe it's unpunishable in the corner. I didn't know that. I didn't know. It's really, it's really interesting to see that. Uh, oh, the parry was there, but not ready for the punish. Yeah, I guess he was uh, baiting for something. Some, sometimes Ken goes like for a fierce on wake. Right. And they delay the show you can. Like this, if you parry, the show you can spam out. Well, yeah. So I guess he was trying to bet that, I guess. I still feel like Dudley could do something to win this. Oh, oh he no, went he went for it. In. He, he went, went all in. But good patience, good patience by Ken here. Yeah. All right, again, defensive Ken proving to be the the thorn in Dudley's side right now. Yeah, it's, it's really annoying. Like when I play against like good Ken like this, it's really really hard. Ah, you know, I guess just, I... just like jumping away with round out, uh, it beats every option. Really? Yeah. Okay. Not not everything, but it's hard to, to deal with that. It's a good good high percentage option. Yeah. If I jump on Ken, Ken just have to jump out with round out. Good to know. It's a really good option. Okay. All right. So let's see if this Dudley can make some good adjustments. Yeah. And this this move is really good against Dudley. You know. All the far fears. Very, very big up box. And even just if Dudley jump in and parry this, it's hard to punish. Right. Because he has really low recovery. Gets a throw. Nice taunt for power up. Yeah. Maybe you want to annoy my the Dudley. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, nice move one by Ken here. Low strong, you can link or cancel super. Okay, nice, nice finish here. Take the risk with the parry. But no super here, I guess he wants to keep. Okay, nice finish. See? But he was not sure, that's why he went for low shot twice. Right. Okay, nice right. confirm by Ken here. Pretty good. Engage. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, oh no! <laughs> Tried to read, but okay. Nice combo by the here, building some good meter. Nice pressure. No confirm on the on the tower, the medium kick though. Mm. Nice air to air. Early roundhouses. Yeah. Dali looking to control. Oh, he could have super here. Okay, Dali is he's out of the corner now. Dali gives some space, but it's fine. He There's a super. Got a jump in. I guess that they just realized that he can jump on this cancel. Mm. He's really abusing that now. I think it's good. It's a good read. Oh. Ken doesn't anti air, so. He always Again, watch. free jump in. You have to challenge the, the jumping. You have to. I mean, he's got a great uppercut. You can use EX uppercut as well. He can jump out. You can, uh, can jump, you know. Jump back around house as well, like you said earlier. Oh, okay, oh, nice. That's good. Good. That was a pretty convincing game by, by the third layer. But I don't know, the Ken was doing pretty well in the first round, and then, I don't know. Like, he stopped playing. I think he, uh, I think after a couple of uh, failed uh, anti air attempts, I think he just froze. Yeah, he, he was scared. To, I guess he was scared to anti air. Right. But you just have to, to mix up your options, you know. Okay, so. All right. It's still the Dudley against the Ken, I guess. Maybe it's like block 17, maybe. Maybe you're right. It might, it might be block 17. Okay, let's go. Alright. I, I don't know what number, what... Is it the last Ken or the last Dudley, the, the third one? I don't know. We have no idea, nothing on the screen, yeah. so only the match. Yeah. We'll keep you guys updated as we possibly can here. Strong, fierce. A little too far though for the uppercut. See? Yep. Really good option. It's not easy to react, but... Okay, oh, nice, nice dash. To switch the position. Now that is in the corner. Nice over it. Didn't, didn't react there. It's not that hard to stand there, but you have to expect it sometimes. Mm. Okay. And then he tried to parry on wake up, but it's not really a good option to try parry on wake up. You know? Right. <laughs> don't, Especially don't, against Ken. Don't guess. Just, just yeah. defense. Okay, All right. Nice. So the cam is just running right now. See, he ran away, and when he's the corner, he tried to switch position. Ah. Jab is good too. Great anti airs, but nope. Okay, nice. Ah, oh, he missed the ducking here. Too bad. Nice finish by Ken. Okay, getting out the corner. 
trying to, to, to get some control on the ground. But I don't think it's getting in pretty good. Mm. Nice, good parry. Oh, what? I think that was a mistake. Yeah, Ken didn't want to spend the meter here. He wants to keep it for the... Right. He wants to keep it for the kill or for the third round, I guess. If he gets in, uh, if he gets Dully low enough, though, yeah. he, might, he might burn. Yeah, now he, now he can use it. Oh, nice There it is! Nice there it is, yes! What was that neutral jump on couples? That was, uh... Like, that was really good. I feel oh, like he, he probably would have done neutral jump, parry, expecting EX Zephyr, if anything. Oh. And then, but he saw Super instead, but the Super went right under. That was like a really, really good read. Yeah. Like he knew exactly what he was going to do. <laughs> but yeah, I guess this can know a little bit more about the Dudley matchup than the other one, so... Mm. It's gonna be hard for the Dudley player, the next one. All right. I'm just looking through a couple of notes, maybe. Maybe. You think they have notes? That's like player have notes too? Maybe. Everyone is just looking at the mobile phone. I know. Maybe they're just taking the message, you know. Just checking Facebook. I'm on stream. They're sending to their family. <laughs> That's no, me. I'm, I'm, I'm playing. I'm playing now. <laughs> I'm on TV, man. Please watch me. <laughs> I won't lie. I'm guilty of that. <laughs> okay, let's go. Yes. Maybe the last one. I don't know. Right. Go. Okay, basic Dudley color, the normal one. Oh, that's nice, Fortress. Nice this, right. Hey, Ken could sweep you. Oh, yeah. The only time he swept, he got destroyed. <laughs> right. I'll oh, try to bait here something, but. Right. Yeah, I think Ken is recovering now, playing the, trying to slow down the pace. Nice confirmed, though. Ken is in control now. Oh, that was too obvious, but he got the throwback in the corner. Nice. Yeah. There's the jump right roundhouse. This is, this is the best. Like, the trade. Wor worthwhile trade gets the kill. So yeah. even if he doesn't read that, he parry. He doesn't really get anything from that. Right. He can maybe, maybe pierce, but... Yeah, that's, that's not so much of a damage, you know? Yeah. And it resets the situation, too. Yeah, exactly. So. Oh, not open here. Oh, what happened here? Tried to red parry? Or maybe he was surprised that he blocked? Maybe, he yeah. didn't believe? <laughs> Wasn't paying attention. Oh, okay, nice watch your legs. Okay, roll set up. Read the overhead and then press the button. Yeah, Dudley is the minus one, I guess. After the overhead, so... Yeah, got the top boost there. Oh, nice parry. Oh, no. Okay, nice block here again. That can has a really good read. I was waiting for the super. Yep. I think he, wait, he waited too long. Yeah. It's good that we can wait after a parry because then they can cancel with the super. Right. Okay. But you have to know the timing that when then they cannot super anymore. Uh oh. Uh, okay. But it's just a sweep, so. Yeah, just a sweep. Still fine, it's no big deal. Uh, can try to, to low parry something here. Let's confirm super. Okay. One more. Told you. Okay. Oh, uh, it's too late. Uh. I think was he doesn't combo at the end. Uh, I think the pin just gave yeah, it I, it was kind of late. Yeah, it, was, it, was, it looked like the... My, my usual tell is uh, if Ken's head is still turned yeah, yeah. on the overhead, then you know if his head, if his head is neutral, yeah. then I think he did it too late. But yeah. he might not have... Yeah, you're right. I think that was too late, I think. So. Because after the delay player on the camera, I can see like... Right. You know, I, I think he knew it. Though. Excellent. Okay. Oh, it's still not about the Ken against uh, the Dudley. Let's go. Okay, this. Okay, wait. Maybe I know this Dudley player. I don't. Know. All right. Maybe I was, I was in his team last year. <laughs> I don't remember. It, it, it's possible. One year ago, I don't, I don't remember. Oh, now he's playing Red Dudley. He's angry, maybe. <laughs> oh, the fierce. Okay, you should, you should try to Red Parry here too. I agree. Nice. Dudley with the corner pressure. Nice. Nice, pressure. nice throw. The throw is really good. I think not so many Dudley players use the throw. Mm. The throw is really good because the opponent always accept, like, uh, expect low or high. Right. So if you throw them a couple of times, they will move. Mm. It will be easier to open up the, nice. the, the, the guard after. Ah, I see what you mean. Oh, I tried. Ah, Dudley could have finished here, but it's kind of hard. 
Got him. Nice confirm, yo. Nice confirm. Good job, good job. All right, can he close I, it I up? I like his T-shirt. <laughs> oh, that's awesome. <laughs> okay, nice finish by Ken here. Uh, you went for... Wake up. Oops. That's a burn meter. Okay. Okay, okay. this time. One, one more, yeah. I knew, I knew. One more? Yeah, one more. <laughs> Come on, dead lad. Uh. Whatever he got. Okay, we are looking at burgers right now. <laughs> oh yeah, why not? What, what is it? All right, so gonna go on the uh, deli with a great corner pressure. Oh no, go forward, Jesus burger. Oh, uh, Ken didn't have the meter here. He got a duck and super, oh. that was a sweep. Overhead, oh, there it is! Right nice, really nice. That's it, Dudley team takes it. What, what, what is he showing? What oh, is no. Is his son? Oh, how cute! Oh. It's really cute, man. So, see, that was the phone thing. He had that queued up for when he finally won. He fought for his family, man. Yeah. Uh, then can go, go home and be a family go man. Go home and be a family man. Yeah. <laughs> All right, good good stuff to our uh, our Dudley teams there. I guess I called it. That might have been that might have been them. Uh, I don't know. So I guess I, I guess this batch is almost over, right? Yeah. I see the blocks are uh, slowly coming to an end here. Yeah. Just gonna see if we can cut over to another game here. There we go. We got. Oh, you're gonna get oh, so this is uh, rebellions. This was on uh, block 19. Yeah. Oh, okay. Let's go. Arcades. Yeah. Oh, nice. Gets the reflector. Oh, so is playing right now. Okay. Okay, nice, nice. There we go. Looks go. angry. He wants, to, he wants to do well. RKF wants blood. Oh! oh nice confirm here. Have to deal with Chinese mix-up now. Okay, oh. choose to, to headbutt here because you, you're, uh, you're not grounded. Right. After the first one, it's still a good option. But Chinese can punish that really hard. Okay, nice setup. Combo nice. video? Combo video? Chinese. Oh, no! Oh! Dash up. Tackle, but no meter. Oh. oh. He did some fancy stuff here, some, some charge positioning, but Chun Li just negate that. <laughs> Chun Li, oh, oh, dash throw. Yeah, it's, it's really hard, man. The, the ground game, the, the mid range game against Chun Li with your Yan, man. Right. It's so, so hard. And, and, I, and I think the sweep into the EX head, but. <laughs> was really hard for, for Eric. I think After that, that he was really sad, I guess. Right, that, that must have shook him. <laughs> he was thinking, I'm going to do something really cool here that's going to turn the tide, yeah. but the sweep just said no. No, no. All right. I don't want no cool thing. I don't need that. <laughs> I'm Chun Li. I don't need that. Right. <laughs> I have the Great Wall. I'm yeah. good. I'm not cool. I'm strong. That's all. <laughs> no problem okay. here. Okay, let's go. I think maybe Yoyan should, should deal meter. meter right. Bit, I guess. Just trying to go in like this. I mean, I can understand, you know, Chun Li not having anything to really be a. Uh, to, to, you know, no meter to really worry about, but. Yeah, you want to go in that sure, but. But Yurian without meter, I think it's worse than Chun without meter. Yeah, exactly. And he has like. A, even if he opens up Chun Li, he doesn't have anything behind him. He right. has no damage. Okay, nice sweep. That was really risky, though. Okay, use, oh. use, use your mirror, man. Use your mirror, please. Right. So now it's too late. Chen is too far from the... Oh, I still use it. Oh. Okay, that's fine, that's fine. Take the risk. Uh, I guess he could have like uh, used the meter before he put the, the Aegis in front of Chen. Right. And try to build another one during that and, and keep the control. But it turns out well for the Yuyan, so it's fine. Oh, oh yeah. That's, try, try to finish the jump, but Chen was aware of that. Nice take here. Nice over it. Really risky because Chen can finish that. Oh, he was. Oh, this is pretty good. Oh, he oh, missed no. the crush. Okay. Okay, nice. Oh, nice, nice chase down. Nice chase down. Nice chase down. Okay, he's laughing. <laughs> oh. Okay, so. All right. 
Hey, that's the Chun-Li that uh, clutched, uh, oh, closed yes. it out. That's the Chun-Li that, uh, that beat the, the Dudley, right? Yes. Right, I don't know him, but he's really good. Yeah. He, he seems really calm, you know? Now. Yeah, after uh, that grueling Dudley match, he, he, he's got to feel confident. Yeah, yeah. So, controlling the ground here. Okay, nice. nice. He's really aware of uh, your yen movement here. Building the meters, you know, by eating your yen. That jab in the air. Yeah, and, and standing strong is really good against Yoyen too. Because like it, it prevents him from dashing or doing the crash. Right. And you still have time to recover if you jump over. And you do another NGR. It's really, really good. See, if you do this, you can do anything. Finish, yeah. Neko punch! The cat Neko punch. punch. Go. So pretty so solid Chen here. It's gonna be tough for Yoyen. Okay, nice throw here. Nice read on the head, but could have finished that with the uh, with the knee into the super, I guess. But oh, oh I bro. Think that was a mistake. The, the dash for the chain. All right, corner game. Okay. Another oh. meter. Oh, I think the knee. Oh, nice. He got the up. Loop, fireball, tackle. Yes. yes. No, coach. He should have crossed. It. No, that's that's a really big mistake for the Yoyen. Mm. If you stand, you cannot punish. Nice parry there. Oh, nice blade here. Was risky though, but... Right. Oh, oh really nice. nice. Really nice. <laughs> A lot had to go right perfectly yeah. there. Okay, Yoyen is stuck. Chen is stuck. Can go his own way now. Oh, oh there nice. you go. Oh, yeah. Oh, nice. Oh, uh, that was... It. Okay. Again, that headbutt making him airborne. Yeah. But Chen is back in control now. Okay, nice pressure to get out of the corner, do the EX Aegis to, to, to be safe. But now Yuyan has no meter, he's back in the corner. It's gonna be tough for him. But if he can still make it, like one, one parry or one. Uh, one good Aegis combo, yeah. yeah. Oh, oh he burned it. Yeah, he burned it. I don't know about this. Uh, a nice one. The jumping one is really good. You can hit your opponent in the face. It's hard to block. Try to crush there. That was really, yeah, just to get out of the corner. But now, wow. Oh, oh no, that's game. He missed the, the punish. Okay, okay. The tackle. He didn't choke. And if the tackle didn't kill, he had enough. The meter gave him. It gave him one meter right there. He would have had Aegis. So. But that was not the last Chinese player. Okay. All right, let's go. So I guess this is the last Chandy player, right? I think so. I think so. He's the captain. It's right, the captain. Taisho. Yeah. To try to try to cool down. You feel a little bit stressed, right? Uh -huh. Taking his time, feeling it out, making sure the hands. Yeah, he's, I'm not sweating. Uh -huh. <laughs> It's, it's, it's really tough to be like the last one, you know. Right. All that pressure on you. Everyone expects you to win. Right. Yeah, the hopes and dreams yeah, yeah. of your team are riding on you. The last hope. Okay, Chen is just building the meta. Fine. Right. But she, she's work, I think she's working back too much. She's, she's in the corner. It's not a big deal. Trying to uh, uh, look for the wall jump right there. Yeah. Yo Yen, I think he missed the opportunity to, to catch her. Again. Okay, nice. Nice follow here. Nice idea by Chen Okay, she, he was, she was waiting, but no punish. She missed the super, but. Uh, it's not gonna kill, but. Uh, so I think it's almost good for Chen that uh, doesn't kill because she can build meter now. Right. Little bit. And she's basically got a confirm yeah, yeah. into a meter now. So, limit it, it's still good for Chen Li. Yeah. She doesn't kill. <laughs> I think yeah, the theory that Ryan told us back uh, when we were at the Fall Classic was don't burn your meter unless it'll either kill or it'll give you a good position to kill and then yeah. you can still uh, build the meter afterwards. Exactly. Three overheads, four overheads. Yeah. He's angry. <laughs> <laughs> He's angry. Okay, nice front house here. No confirm though. Uh, no, confirm no confirm again. Does not believe in. Oh, okay, nice. Okay, change maybe. Okay, nice. Just to use the meter, man. Send me, man. Oi! Oh, that's... One mix-up? I think... Oh, no! 
Maybe try to chip, I don't know. Oh, yeah. The trade in Chun Li's favor. Yeah, she doesn't even need to try to chip. Yeah, right. yeah but that was Yu Yan mistake. He should have used the meter, man. Right. He has the opportunity. This is one of the worst feelings in the world when yeah. you, you, you lose your match and you see how much meter you have. And if it's, especially if it's full. Like, I, I can't understand, like, you don't want to spend the meter because if you spend it, and then the third one's gonna be really, really difficult. Right. But, you know, you play your yen. If you don't use the meter, Chen Yi will get out of the corner and you can, you can right. die. It's like that point you you have to you have to put it in. And all especially in. like the Chun Li will know that you don't you don't want to use the meter. Right. So, so she will she will move more freely. Okay. So it's it's really hard because you give your opponent information. Mm. Okay, I don't want to use the meter. I want to right. Use the meter. So the Chun Li is fine. So now you now the Chun Li because you've told her that you're not going to use the yeah. meter, she's going to be she's going to be able to bully you more. You're right. Exactly. And yeah, Chun Li is one super like it's uh, forty percent of life. So. Oh. Go. Oh, I hear Taisho Taisho, so this is it. That's Fierce Chun versus Roundhouse Urian. Just calling colors. Nice sweep. Okay, try to read the jump in. Alright, finally Urian's got that meter. Yes. Okay, not sure jump to bait. Not sure jump is good against Chun Li. Especially if you eat her with the tip of the round house, mm. it's kind of good, it's really good. Okay, nice block. Try to red parry here, but it's fine, not, not so oh. much damage. The Chen is jumping. Uh, oh, no! Yeah, because because of the other head, it was too, too low for the mid -side, but Nice. See, this guy used the meter, I don't care. Right, exactly. Use the meter! Use the meter, it's fine. Yeah, you have to kill her. You'll get it back, eventually. Yeah. You can afford to take some risks in this round. Yeah. Because Yu Yan can, can build meter against Chen Yi, it's fine. Yeah, he has good range, so he can keep Chen Yi out a little right. bit. Alright, so that's good so far, burn yeah. one. He won't do damage, but he will be able to build meter. Right. Okay, this match is interesting. Okay, nice block here. Okay, just looking at each other, don't, no one wants to get in. Okay, nice finish on the headbutt here. Oh, nice walk back. Yeah, I guess now Chen Yi doesn't want to, to spend the meter to kill Yuyan. Right. That was a, the shallow knee drop. But she has too, too, too much life lead, so... Alright. Alright, fully stocked, here we go. Okay, last round of all for this match, guys. And last round for both of this team, because it's the captain for the Yuyan and the Chen Yi. Uh, See, she cannot punish. Right. Oh, nice, nice game with the roundhouse. Oh. Okay, nice new. I think Chen is jumping. Oh, yeah. Oh, nice wall jump. Chen Yi escaped that. It's bad for you. But now, like, Chen Yi has full meter, so Yu Yen can build meter time. Mm. Chen Yi cannot build more, so. <laughs> right. It's already, it's already full. Oh, oh okay, nice no. Nice profile here. That was really smart on the. Wow, wow, wow. He takes the risky on wake up. He's not scared. Yeah, he, he needs something. You need an opening here. Oh, oh nice. nice. Maybe that's that's what you need now. A little bit of momentum. Double throw. I'm not sure. One more? No. Okay, let's set up. Chen cannot move here. Okay. Yeah, looking for the wall jump. A little early on it though. That was fast on the Chen For the Chen player to wait a little bit. Yeah, you have to be aware that Chen has the wall jump. Yes. But it's hard to catch up. It's hard. 25 seconds left. Oh yeah. no! But, oh, this is gonna activate, activate the other side. The okay. dash. Oh! oh, that oh. Was nice. Wow! That was pretty wow! Nice. Yeah. What did I just see? Yeah. Chani just threw that. That was the biggest mix step. Wow! Of his life. Yes. Wow! And, and there was no reason to stand up, but there yeah, was you know, no reason to stand you, you up want whatsoever. To get out. You want to get out, but really, really good matches here. Yeah. That's. That was the most... Yeah, because he's going to sweep at that point. There's yeah. nothing else he's going to do. Yeah, that's the only button that hit uh, yeah. at this range. So. But it's hard to be aware of everything during the match, you know? Right. So. E everything is really fast. What can you do, right? Um, that was really good matches, right? Very. Uh, fitting, I think a fitting end to, the, to that block. Yeah. Very, very fitting end. I don't know. They're just, uh, the players are just discussing it out, just talking. Hey, great yeah, job. Job. Give the man his just due. He won that match. Clutched victory. <laughs> that was really clutched. Yes. Really nice.
I guess in this pool, like the Yuyan went one one, right? I believe they one they won one. Yeah, I think everybody like it they might have been one one. Right? I think it was yeah, they all beat each other. So oh, so maybe that's why they they just stay here. Maybe they they're gonna play like some some sort of playoff. They might have to do a play a, a last chance playoff. I'm wondering. I wonder then if the last chance playoff they would have to do is the same like what uh, all the other teams that lost one 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 have to do is that. Uh, I think this playoff is it's, it's not the the real playoff. Right. It's like only for this group. Right. So, and then uh, I think every block number two will go to the real playoff. Right. Like another bracket, but it's really hard. Yes. But it's gonna be a solo tournament. Right. Uh, my yeah, my team we we got we we got into the losers playoff. So. You guys are uh, looking at that. That's the actual score right there. Oh, okay. So rebellions. Oh, I think the, the score is not updated yet, but uh, right. The, the the rebellion team, the A team, is the Yuyan one. Right. So I think the the C should be uh, around because they won against the Chun Li. Right. So yeah, every team won one here. Yeah. So rebellions won against the Chun Li team. Exactly. So everyone is one one. Yeah. So yeah, they they've got to do some sort of playoff. It looks I like. Think so. I, so I think it's, it's it's kind of the same as the, the next one. They they will have to send the captain and. Uh, yeah. They will be like. So you guys are gonna get. A, it looks. It sounds like we're gonna get a preview of what's going to happen yes. in the. Uh, and the next playoff will come. In the, yes. in the next round, loses playoffs. So, uh, if you guys are looking for a preview of what's what's about to happen, so the teams that won one and lost one in in the brackets, they get sent to a separate bracket where they all get pulled together, and each team sends their best representative to playoff, and it's basically just one giant playoff, and you know, king of the hill uh, advances. Yeah. It's like a single elimination bracket. It's yeah. really hard, man. Yeah, you've got to you've got to pick the right you got to pick the right player and for your and team. It's first to one. Man. Yes. It's first to one single elimination. Right. So no two <laughs> out of threes here, guys. No losers bracket. It it's all on. In Japan. Right. So <laughs> I think so. I'm not too sure what we are completely waiting on. The judges are talking to. Yeah, I don't know. The judges are talking talking it over, Maybe and we're gonna see what happens. Selecting the captain, right? Right. Oh, let's so yeah, let's go ahead. See, yeah, so yeah, so see if you see what's going on yet. And yeah. block 19, each team won one lost one, so we've got to figure out who advances. All right, so here we go. So who who will go for the? I think for the Dudley team, Yomoda is going to go. Maybe. Looks like it's Yomoda, the one with the. But well, you cannot see on the screen, but uh, I have the cabinet in front of me, so. Right. So yeah, Yomoda is going to play. For the Dudley. So first match is going to be Dudley against. Uh, I don't know. Uh, let's see over here. Look, looks like the the Urian, no? The Urian, okay. I don't know. So they're just queuing it up real quick. We're just switching back to the commentators cam briefly, and then we'll switch right back as soon as they cut to the action. Wow, what a treat! Block 19, a very well balanced block. All right, I think here we go. Tasha battle, here we go. Oh yeah, against the Urian, but I, I didn't see who was the Urian player. So. Okay, let's go. All right. Single elimination, All one right. to one. Take every risk you can at this yeah. point. Oh, pretty nice. nice. He goes for it. He goes for it. That's pretty nice. Uh, throw tech nice. again. Oh, nice entry here. Nice one. Caught him. Caught him low. The Yuyan was just standing still, man. Right. Yomoda's doing great here. I, I think he's angry about uh, the one loss he got. Right. <laughs> in the group stage. Wow, the exit, but. Uh, no. What did... Okay, went for the confirm here. Yeah. Okay, the jumping right now is really annoying for Dudley. Okay, nice story here. Nice oh, nice man. Oh, I think he did uh, the crush too low. Oh, that was... It's still fine. Did you know that he was going to try and parry there? Really aware of, uh, of what's happening here. Okay, Got nice him. Nice punish here. Nice punish. Oh, nice block here. Okay, he just escaped the troll. Oh wow. Okay, nice. Oh, he was not crouching, no. Nice sweep. The, the sweep is, the, the range is really good. I think Yurian's got some of the most underrated uh, poke and footsies yeah. in this game. They, they, they are just slow, but they are good, but the recovery is kind of slow. Right. So, like if he did the sweep and, and then the jump, it's really, really bad. Right. But they are good. Oh. Okay, nice confirm here. Go for the overhead. What's going to be next? Oh, overhead, but... Yeah, the... The headbutt made him airborne, so he could escape out the corner. Nice punish again. Really Ooh. aware of the that Yoyan is gonna jump a lot. All right, he scouted the overhead that time. Oh, okay. Tackle, I guess. The corner. Didn't get the combo, but it's yeah, really good setup. He had broke the mirror, push Yoyan back. Okay, so the jail. Oh, 
Oh, oh no! Oh, got him! Tackle! Oh, oh no! Oh, oh, that's it! Wow! All right. That was really nice. You can feel the pressure, yeah. Okay. One more, one more. <laughs> wow. So you have to play the Johnny now, right? Right. That was really good match, though. So, they, so what they're doing right now, they're playing uh, John Ken for side choice. Oh, yeah. Or maybe? Yeah. Oh, this 22 p Oh, he just wants, he wants second player side. So now we're setting up Dudley versus Chun. Yeah, like Chun Li and Yo Yan, tough matchup for Dudley, but Yomoda is making a good decision here. Right. Making the Dudley walk. Pretty good. I think he has a good chance against the Chun Li. Mm. Getting tips from his teammates, yeah. knowing, all right, this is yeah. what you need to expect. Look out for this. Do this. Exactly. Okay, let's go. I, I think if the Dudley wins, I don't know, I think they still have to, to play the Chun Li and the Yo Yo. Right, they so we need to decide who's going to be first, second, and third. Right, we yeah. got to see who goes to what uh, to what bracket. But maybe there will be a tie again, you know. Uh, another the, tie. The, the Chun Li win, and then, then, then Yo Yan win against the Chun Li. Then we got to go to another another playoff. Yeah. They have to do it all over again. Go through all the teammates. A <laughs> uh, little bit late on the sweep here. Right. Oh, I guess it was oh, okay, nice. We got the second one, the combo, the corner pressure. Oi, I can't find it. I think you need to play. Uh, I need I need to play, sorry guys. Alright. I'm gonna pull back. I'm gonna pull back our alliance onto the mic. Thank you, gunfight! Thank you. Good luck to you. Come anytime. So, back on the All right, good matches. Welcome back to the microphone, Tom Shin, Arliath. Hey. The matches we're seeing are just amazing. We are now in the middle of a playoff for who advances to which bracket. Oh, I, no. I had to step over a huge pool puke on my way over to this table because these matches are so sick. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Doing very well. Dudley, one round away from setting his team up to you know, advancing out of pools. I mean, it might be another three-way tie. It, it could be. In which case, would they go to the second player on each team? Um, could be. Or you just select. You, you might have to select different one, uh, reps. Who knows? Yeah. Let's say like a different rep if it ties again. But it, it's just one of those weird things where like Chun Chun can beat Dudley. Right. Dudley beats Urian. Urian beats. John, Chun. It's John Ken Paul yeah. all over again. All right, Charlie's alive. Both of them. Dudley with the meter oh, advantage. Oh, that was a that was a super misconversion right there. Right. Chun Li's a, a hopping roundhouse kick. Uh, only on crouching characters can link it a super. Right. Oh, I missed Carl. Look at the posturing oh. right there. Super, yes. Take the advantage now. Oh, uh, spinning bird, good wake up. Searching for it. She didn't even press a button. She more you forced him halfway across the stage. It already has him in a corner. All right. That is how scary Chun is. Another throw. Oh my god. Oh, that was a little forward. Fishing yet again. Looking for that. Trying to counter that low short with the roundhouse. There's so much respect going on. Oh, so much respect going on right now. I feel like, oh, he's going to parry it. Oh, oh the back sweep. Oh, yes. Sweet, sweet. sweet. Scoops, scoops, scoops. And that's hey, it. That's it. Dudley team. Dudley team advances. Team advances. Dudley team moves on. All right, so we still have, I think we still have one more match to play though. Chun team versus Urian team to determine who gets eliminated and who moves on the loser's playoffs. So it's, we're still, it's still anybody's match at this point for Chun Urian. We still need to figure that out. I think, I, I don't know. I need a nap after that. <laughs> I don't know, unless there's something else that we're missing here. Maybe it's over, I'm not too sure, but we're gonna go back to our commentator camp. Tom, you had the chance to sit and relax and watch some of those matches. How mind blown are you right now? I need a nap. He needs a. <laughs> I am exhausted. He needs a nap. Uh, we're, like we're not done yet though because it looks like Chun team is sitting. They they just played John Kent for side. Wait. Ch Chun team has switched sides. They're on the one piece side now. Oh, I guess it would. Because remember, Dudley team won twice, and then. Oh right, because they still have to figure out who's going to go into the playoffs. So playoff. losers' playoffs still has to be decided. So playoffs, right, right. right, right, right. Okay. So here we go. So, so the. Uh oh! Oh, game's all screwed up. Uh oh! We just glitched the cabinet. 
Yeah. We, we glitched the cabinet. Uh, all right, it's going to move over to one. It looks like the board is actually glitching out. All right. One of the worst things about... Wow. Okay, so we moved oh, over. Switch we switched feeds. We're on a different cab. Okay. I think we're going. So the Uriu team still has a chance. Yeah. Loser of this goes home. Oh, nice. Oh, this is go. looking wow. dominant. Oh, but the wake of legs. But yeah. chop it. Give me the Atlanta Braves. Chop. Chun team one round away from escaping to lose this playoffs. That was a gifted chop right there. Ooh. I'm surprised she looked Curry that walked forward to try to throw him. Oh no. Oh. Shallow. Chun team. Down step in the corner. Oh. No, no car throw. Yo, Chun is giving me that corner mad respect. Look. She does not get a wall. She yeah. does not want to get thrown in there. Yeah, this this match, if Chun's gonna win it, she's gotta win mid-screen. It's really oh! oh! This can do it! That's it, there that's game, go. that's game. Hey! Right. hey. hey. Your team advances to Ar playoffs. RKF is a happy camper right now. You knew he did not <laughs> want to get eliminated. Well fought. Wow. What a trip. We actually have live feeds on every single cabinet setup. Yes. Uh, in the front of the stage area. I, I can't, yeah, just amazing. Now, now, folks, that was a preview of what you're about to see in the next round. Losers playoffs is going to happen where, again, each team that won one and lost one in each block gets to select their top player and then they play up in a single elimination tournament. Again, no two out of threes, no losers bracket. This is for all the marbles. Right, single, so. elim single elimination death match. Right. Um, it doesn't have to be your team captain. If you have, if you have somebody who uh, you think is insane enough to just uh, about it and just blitz through everybody else right. before they can figure out how they play, yeah, I'll just do it. You know, just, just, and whoever might be in the best condition right now, right? Because your best player might be exhausted, right? From playing too many matches in a row, right? So there's a good chance. So I think we're gonna pull up the results of block 16. So it looks like the Alex team. Oh. The Alex team from Block 16 advanced. Uh, looks like uh, Kazuya. Oh, that's Kazuya's, Kazuya's team. Kazuya's okay, team. Okay. Hirochan. Hirochan. Shuruji. Sakurada. Yeah, strong team. Yeah, it's a very good team. And then it looks like I believe it's the Goki the Goki team advanced. Oh uh, no! Wait, wait. There we go. That's been updated. No, excuse me. The Necro team, it looks like, advanced. The Yang team is out. Uh -huh. So we're just looking at the uh, results here. Just amazing stuff we've seen from every player today. Mind-blowing third strike action. I can't, like This is my first time in Japan, folks, and I'm just utterly amazed at what I'm seeing so far. So we're looking more at the matches here. Yeah, matches Goki team. Uh, I need to pull up a, the, the list by his mid third. Right. Again, shout out to his mid third for translating the player list for us. He got modded for uh, this channel. Really? Shout outs to a his mid. Congratulations on being a mod, brother. Want to give a shout out to a couple of, uh, actually, Facebook groups that are representing Third Strike. Uh, first of all, Third Strike Europe. Shout outs to Third Strike Europe for providing a lot for our players. Uh, over there in Europe for Third Strike, keeping the dream alive over there. Give a shout out to all my Third Strike junkies, uh, one of the largest groups for Third Strike uh, on Facebook. Again, if you're on uh, Facebook and you love Third Strike, join Third Strike junkies. I'll approve you right now if I really wanted to. I happen to be one of the mods there. So. Oh, oh big surprise. This Yoon team. Uh, this the, horribly stacked Yoon team with Yakun, KO, Issei, Mester, and Hyacin. Right. We, we, had the, we had the privilege of watching that, that match, and Issei just rocked hardcore. Wait, can you go on a match? Not right. like a steamroll? Right. Not like a massacre? Oh. It, that, that wasn't even there. He, he was out for blood. It was, it was, was, was kind of pretty. I'm not going to lie. All right. All right, what else do you got? So I don't know. We're just shuffling, oh, shuffling okay. through the. Uh, we are shuffling through the the blocks as we go. 
right? So there. What is that name of the before the Ken team? Kwa Kwa Kwa. Kwa Kwa Kwa. Magajin. Magajin. All right. Yeah. Sorry. Thanks. Okay. No worries. Good stuff. So now we're just again just looking through, getting kind of getting an update on some of the matches you guys didn't get to see and some of the blocks, so you guys can see who's advancing and who's not, who gets to go home and prepare for actual co-op cup tomorrow. And again, folks, remember, this is only pre-co-op cup, so the action is going to happen tomorrow as well. Ugh. This has been an intense day of Third Strike. We've done our, we've done our best to play and just expect a... Folks, if you get a chance to go to this event, please make it out here. You will not be disappointed by what you're seeing. All right, so yeah, now the, now the, uh, the, okay, so second round, so the playoff happens. Right. Uh, this goes on for about an hour and a half itself. Right. For all the, team, for all the teams that uh, did not qualify but didn't get 0-2. Uh, yeah. Uh, then we have a different set of playoffs. Okay, this is the second round. Got so, it. so by the way, as promised, I'm seeing people joining Third Strike Junkies already. Uh, oh, shout out to William, William G. Uh, let me just, oh yeah, four of you guys. I'm gonna give you guys hella shout outs right now. Again, I'm your lead mod, Andrew J. Landy, AKA Duralath. Uh, I'm just loading it up here. Philippe Mendez, David Seron, oh. Jacob Donabedian, James Coates, Mark the Blue Manu, William William. I'm sorry if I'm butchering your names, but yes. Oh, by the way, yeah. uh, underneath the name, right? Where it says like Shinobu here and uh -huh. uh, uh, Tana, uh, Tana Peru. Uh -huh. uh, those are the chosen. Uh, oh, so the, the, the representative for each team. Okay. Yeah. So. Wait, wait, wait. Oh, actually, wait. Are the plus ultra doesn't need a representative. I'm, I'm gonna pull something really quick. Miracle. Miracle. How the MOV's team. Owen two. Am I reading this correctly? What? Am I reading this correctly? Wait, wait. What is Chokin doing on that team? I, 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 wow, is, is this for real? It is, am I seeing this correctly? MOV's team is eliminated. Yep. That is, whoa. I didn't even know Chokin used Chun. I thought she used Elena. I, I, I have no idea. That's so random. Ooh. Okay, so oh, even more blocks here. So this, uh, So we have the information for the second round now. So we can get rid of all these first rounders. Let's toss this over there. Let's go, you know, kill some, you know, some trees. Good stuff. So we'll be able to pull a little more information for you guys as we go along. But still, wow. Just that Urian team. The Urian team. I don't know. Maybe it was who clutched it out. I'm not too sure. Adding even more members. Yes, welcome to Thomas C., Alexander O., Tycho, Michael Irvin S., Abraham Aranda. Yes, shout out to you guys again. Third Strike Junkie is one of the largest of the groups uh, on Facebook for Third Strike, so. All right, uh, so we're gonna take uh, a quick break for now. Um, and uh, let's see, while everything is still preparing for the next set, and uh, we'll see you shortly. All right, so again, folks, thanks for joining us, but do not change the channel, do not leave us. We will be back shortly with some more Third Strike action, so hang tight, guys. Real fast. Oh, okay. I think there's
ライブ誰も見てないけど。
Welcome to the Cooperation Cup, the annual uh, get-together of all things Third Strike. I want to take an informal poll of how many of you in the chat actually do play this game and understand what's going on, or are we just all filthy uh, 09ers or 013ers? Or do we all just pretend to love this game? All right, we're going to go back live in a three, two, one. Our, our commentators are getting some nourishment, so they're on the. Uh, oh. Dozo. Oh, thank you. What happened to Tom uh, and? They, they went to get lunch. You actually have lunch too. I, I bought for you food. food. Um. Okay. I don't know if you eat or not, but I just bought well, food. Oh, I do, me. but I don't have to eat now. Okay. So it looks like. They're not going to be back for a while? Well, one night. I think they're eating outside if you want okay, to join Okay, okay. If you want to join them. So now, we Both are moving into five, huh? second round. So we're not going to be seeing the New York team that moved into second round beating Genki's team. Oh, you were, I don't know my, my, I don't know if you mind uh, disclosing, but you were giving them sort of a, you were guys in a huddle. Give me, me, some advice. me and New York? Me and New York, uh, you mean? No, me and uh, New York team. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I was giving them a little bit. Do you, do you yeah. mind disclosing what type of advice uh, you may have been giving them? Well, they asked me a very, very simple question. Yeah. Is that, how do I play against this certain character? Okay. So which, uh, it's, a 12, it's a character named 12, which you don't see anymore. You gave them advice how to fight against 12, as 12, if yes. that character uh, didn't have it? Well, the 12th team's name is Endangered Species. It makes sense. And <laughs> they gathered like five of the top, top 12 players. Okay. And who do we have? Who do we have? Who do we have? Seiju-sen. Seiju-sen. Seiju 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 oh, this is Haitani, okay. Boss, Shibachi, Kochia, and Izu. Izu, the first um, SBO, the first time uh, winner. Oh. Hi, Tony. Uh, as you know, pro gamer. Pro gamer, yeah. Boss, said to be one of the best players, uh, best Thursday players in B -O -S -S, Japan. B-O-S-S, the boss. Shibachi is from Yamanashi, which is central Japan. And Kochia is in Tokyo. And They're Hi. fighting against the Ken Masters team. Hirai, Deshiken, Shie, Matsuken, and Kosei. Can you tell by the color, like who's who? Matsuken is playing, I guess. For uh, Ken, and I think this is. God, I love this stage and the music. I think it's High Tiny, but I don't think he's gonna come first. Can we, see, can we see them playing, actually? Are they playing on the stage or not? She got on there. Right there? Oh, I can't see. Hi! I know all the faces except for Chibachi, so. Okay. Oh, there we go, there we go. Whose face is that? That's one of the four I know, so that must be Chibachi. Chibachi. Okay. Chibachi from from Central Central Tokyo. Central Japan, sorry. How long does it take to, from Central Japan all I the way here? I don't know. If they have a bullet train, it will be very fast. If they don't, it's gonna take centuries. I just want to get a, a good idea of how far people travel to this event. Um, a lot of people travel from Kyushu, which is the most southern island, excluding Okinawa. So they take the they take the airplane, of course. Some people like flew in this morning. Some people took. Took a hotel last night. 
Well, right. they're spending a lot of time and money just to play in this here. tournament. Yep. And so Matsuka in playing safe and solid, about to win the first match. He's waiting. As his name says, Mach Matsuken, or like Machi Ken, waiting, waiting Ken. Waiting Ken, defensive Low Ken. Low super for the win. Oh no, sorry, this is a, this was a Ken side? I'm sorry. So, it's not Matsu Ken, it's supposed to be Shie or Kosei. Shie, if I remember right, plays a purple Ken, so okay, it must so, have been so Kosei. So that blue wall that you see behind this gentleman is to block out the sun, and you can see it sort of glaring okay, in his so face. So this is Kochia. And, uh, Kochia usually playing at an uh, arcade called Capsule Nagayama. Look at the glare. Which is the western part of Japan. I've been there once, it's a nice place. They've got like all the new like, uh, uh, music games and stuff, okay. but they have three third strikes. I don't know why. <laughs> so Kochi, I know her solid play. What? Just do it, kind of DP. It works. It was a buffer. Makoto just ran into it. Corner pressure. He wants to command grab badly. Nice. Get out the corner. Get off me, kick. That was a lot of throws. Lows as well. Sweeping, sweeping. Oh, nice sweep. Oh. He had the win. He missed the confirm. I As he had the win, he probably hesitated if he wanted to fire the super after the middle punch, but he decided to do the short, and then the dash punch didn't come out. Either way, he would have won. Oh. So, so Makoto wants to spend meter early. So she can build it up again? Maybe she doesn't want to. Yes, she's going to spend it. So she would like to build bar and then win the round easily. All right, here comes so the back. meter yes. charging. Ooh. Get off me kick! Ooh. Third strike is a very well mode game. That kick, like backs off and with throws and with lows as well. Uh oh. One more throw. One more throw. Ooh, that's tech. <gasps> that was, that's kind of like the jump tech. Wow. Dash up EXDP. Yes. This Ken is crazy. And the thumbs up. Um, well, he, he was ahead of a round, so he was allowed to do those kind of stuff. Two frame startup, invinc totally invincible on in startup. Makoto had basically nothing to do except for parry. I so this like is Shibachi, I heard the voice from the like Japanese commentary See, This screen has glare and it's bothering them. Look at this, reflecting in his eye. Yes, that bothered us uh, a couple number of times in the past past two, two three years. Okay. So now we got these kind of um, uh, blinders. You know, barriers. Or yeah. Blinders or whatever. And Duralat is back. Oh, hey, there's your lunch. <laughs> Hi, hi. So Chibachi, I don't. Oh wait, the first player must have been Izu, I think. Probably Haitani would be staying in the back. So now Makoto is the third player, Chibachi. Ooh, good on here. Get out. Now there's the first command grab. Ex, thank you. One more and stun. Ooh, good choice. It's stun. Grab, command grab. Yep, for more meter. Fierce death punch. Thank you. What are those things that are dropping in the background? Is that popping in the back? The, 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 the fruit? Go. This thing from the tree. First I think that was an A. Parried the Hayate, nice. So Ken wants that low forward DP in the corner. Woo. Get Lost him in the corner. the corner there. So I wonder what Ken's game plan is right now? Wow, walk up throw, walk yes. Walk up throw, not even dash. Ken does have a longer throw range than Makoto. Did opt not to spend the meter. Spends his hair. One hit away. Ken has meter, so he, it's doable. Nope, not no more. There's a high five. Oh, I like that it. That is a strong high five, and it's often at the end. That's how we play. We don't play for money, but we do play for fame and glory still. And some Americans didn't believe in that. I told them we still play for fame and glory, but other people was like, nah, nah, we have to play for money. And both make sense. I like uh, it. <laughs> That sounds like a New York state of mind. Now we can see the stream chat? Oh, do you, well... Oh, I don't, have, I don't really have to. But if you... Let me put it over there. Never mind, never mind, never mind. Let me put it over there. How many watching? 3,000? So now here's Shie, known for his footsies. Shibachi versus Shie. I heard he wrote some kind of manual regarding footsies. Thank you, Z. Oh, thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you 
Sir. So how many viewers do we have? 3,000? Oh, Red Parry through the target combo. Make a KO, be KO. Not stunned yet. Good with punish. Damn, look at these high fives. Boom, boom, boom. He's blowing himself. Oh, a thumbs up. A Street Fighter Five. Yes. So she, um, Alaska Lance beat Shie in pre-cup last year. It was not on stream or anything. This is uh, Makoto is very mobile. And does that have meter? Ooh. What does he want? Missed it, but definitely. It was it's supposed to be a DP, I guess. Wow. One Might more. On the Chest landing. with the EX. Woo. Good reset. Just do a DP. Whoa. Play's not, not off not to play John Ken. That's it. We'll see another high five. Yes, we will. Is that is that Link difficult? Hayate into Seiju Sound? So wait, Ken Masters is pretty much in trouble, I guess. They have three more left. They've got Hirai, they've got Deshi Ken, and Amatsu Ken. And who's gonna sit? Deshi Ken coming up, right? We'll, we will see the green Ken, I guess. Is the famous Deshi Ken? He's the famous Deshi Ken. Said to be the best Ken in Japan right now. Oh, look at that pre button warm up. He's just giving the Astro City, the Blast City, a nice scratch on the back. How's your team doing? <laughs> Our team's in the playoff. Oh, wow. So, okay. not ideal. Of course, the, the New Yorkers did better than us already. Ooh. <laughs> All right, Dexken, the GOAT. As someone say, is he still the best Ken now? I don't know. Um, they say he is. I've never played him. All right. So I can't say too much, but a lot of people say he is. So let's just say he is right now. All right. Oh. Misrecognition of the distance. Uh oh. He doesn't like he doesn't like the cab obviously because he never misses that. Not the best punish, but okay. Nice pressure, nice backdash. Ooh. Ooh. DP. I knew it. Aye. Thank you. Good. DP. Miss a second parry. Make it the middle punch DP just in case. Are you ready? Go. Ooh. EX, thank you. In the corner. Let's see. Good parry once again. Ready for stun. Ready for stun. One more. Aye. Good punish. Yes, Makoto can basically dash in, so can only dash in, so he was waiting for that. Low for a super for the punish. Don't do that, it might break. There's a, there is a glitch. <gasps> really? I can he break did, the game? He didn't spend the meter, and he got the throw, he was lucky. It's not done yet, but Makoto has full meter. He's beating Ooh. Deshigen with glare on his screen. So wait, sorry. Hi. Ken has no meter, but still good when they're the corner. Oh, Bait oh there you are. Baited the... Oh, he was waiting for a whiff punish. He was pumping. One more hit. One more hit. He off to use the meter. Oh, and he should have gotten the super there because that was that is what you call oh. a DED setup. Oh no! Went for the oh, chip. They capitalized on this. Ah, no punish. What should he? What should the Makoto have done? There? I don't know what Makoto should have done right there. Um, dash up! Hayate might have been a good punish, but yeah. that's not too much. I'll also go. So, did you need to eat? Uh, anyway, there's food for you over there. Okay, thanks. Okay. Hey, so welcome, Tom. How are you feeling? Uh, much better, thank you. <laughs> what was it, actually? Um, I won't say on air. Okay. Yeah, okay. TMI. All right. So we got now Boss. Boss Makoto. Boss Makoto. Oh my god, seriously? Boss does play multiple characters, and he answered with Makoto this year. He thinks, he, he thinks Makoto's cheap, doesn't he? What's that? Doesn't he think Makoto's cheap? Uh, or the Ken? Well, every character's cheap. Oh, okay. <laughs> so yes, um, Deshi Ken is the third, I think. Ah, uh, okay. And the Makoto team only has Boss and Haitani, Pro Gamer. 
Oh, all right. But this block Here's is just like right. what we call, what Japanese call a death block. Yeah, death ball, yeah. Death, death ball, yeah, death ball. <coughs> so I think you know what I mean. Everybody knows what I mean, I think. Right. And you'll see, you see the names and then you see what I mean. Because they've got, we've got match goalkeep as the third team in the same, same pool. Jesus. So I think one will move on and two have to go to the playoff, which is very, very long. And you don't want to go in there. Mm. If you have seen the tournament before, you would never want to, you would understand why. And so Dishikan, playing, playing phenomenal, I guess. I mean, he's, he's doing Oh, it. wow, he tried to do a hard read there. He, he wanted uh, probably a max punish against the back jump, because if Hayate hits in midair. Then he gets a back to juggle. Yes, he gets, but, he gets a juggle. Uh, yeah, yeah that's, that was a hard read. So he, obviously he buffered a super after the Hayate, but it didn't hit. So he, it was just kind of like a do or die play, and he died. That's it. Right. So, but you do those. But you do those in tournaments sure. when you when you have a high Chani behind you. Yeah, single elimination. Yeah, one final. game. You do those. Yeah. So high Chani needs to beat three of them. Deshiken, Matsuken, and Hirai are left. Oh and can he do it? God. We'll see. But you've seen him pull off miracles before. True. But those are really strong hands. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see. Wow, good yeah. reaction on that sweep. Yeah. Because the sweep is punishable on block. Right. With a dash, with a dash, dash punch or dash up throw is not a true punish. Wow. Ugh. It's funny because um, don't do that. It's gonna break. All right. <laughs> he kills it with that. the with the neutral throw. It'll, it'll uh, create, uh, crash a game. Yeah, I heard that it uh, like it like does some kind of damage every time you do that. Oh, to the board itself. That's what I heard. Ooh. Oh man. Made it low, low parry. Deshikan's spacing is freaking impeccable. Yes, yes, yes. Are you ready? Yes, Bro. obviously. Oh. And I also noticed that uh, Fos or uh, Haitani is not really going for Kaksa. Not yet. Like, he should be going soon, I guess. Okay. But it's like he's trying to condition him to block twice after like all the all the normal attacks. Uh -huh, like crashing uh -huh. kicks and he made uh, strong punch. Oh, he got out of the corner. Barely. Yes. Barely. Read the back jump. Oh, got him in the corner. corner. Can Desha can pull it off for his team? Can Desha can pull it off for his team? That's a guard jump. You see that on Street Fighter Five as well, right? Uh, he went yeah, for the red yeah. parry. It was it was a red parry to state you, but he missed it. Mm. Oh. Definitely a miss input, but I do not know what it was. Jab confirmed a super? No. Um. Jab usually you would you would push short after that, right? Yeah, but how did the how did the high attack come? Yeah, out? that's what I'm thinking right now, because it it it, it wasn't definitely a miss input. But I don't know why that came out. Because I thought he was going to set him up this entire this entire game. Yes, 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 yes. For yes, and it was seemed to After work. Jeff, right? Yeah. And it did seem to work because right. Hayate is Hayate. How much? Uh, well, Hayate is a quarters of a forward motion. Which is faster, Hayate or Karaksa? I forgot which. Uh, Hayate is Hayate is much faster than Karaksa. Okay, so he that means he had a, he had a good chance of getting Karaksa right there. Yeah, he did. He did, but he but he messed up somehow. I don't oh, know. Right, I don't know why. Back. Oh, sorry. So now what do you got? Hugo and Necro. Ah, oh, this is gonna be long. Oh boy. All so right. yes, it said that Necro doesn't really have to jump. Let's see here. Hugo I think Necro. this is. Oh, okay. This is what <laughs> Team Hayao is sick. Team Hayao is sick. YSB Hayao, Ebara, Sano, and Hamza. Hamza from Kuwait, right? Uh, I think so, yes. Okay, and we got Ikeyama, Tamu, Yoshihara. Yoshihara, the artist, oh. the artist. I didn't know he used Necro. He does use Necro, okay. right? He used to play online as well. And, and Sugiyama, Sugiyama and Bakasu. Bakasu is from Kyushu. Oh, I didn't, I haven't heard of him before, okay. And we have, Yoshihara just lost to Hugo and- No. Is it, is it His art is godlike though. Uh, all that. the all the official like third strike looking art that you see for this event is done by Yoshihara. Yes, yes, uh, the booklet as well, the pictures and everything. Yeah. Oh, so this is Tamud. And it said that Necro doesn't really have to jump in this matchup. Because Necro has longer limbs. Uh, true. Okay. And, uh... But he can force the Hugo to have to jump. Yes. And okay. the super art, you can really, uh... You have a lot of choice. You can use Electric Snake just, mm -hmm. for, just for, like, better ground game. Sure. Slam Dance as Annie Air. Mm -hmm. And, uh... Magnetic Storm. 
okay. works like it oh. works as a whiff punish, it works as an anti air. Now, is it likely that uh, Necro will stun Hugo during the course of a match? Um, if he gets like two electric snakes right after another, there's a high chance. But aside from that, he wants to use it more like a more like a super, uh, like just for the damage and the corner carry. Then. Uh, yeah, and spacing as well, and it's safe on block. Oh, that's true. See, in that distance, it's safe on block. Okay. So Hugo needs to find a way. I, yeah, I, yeah, wow. that that is totally unreliable. I, w I would like to ask the developers about that because that does not link in that distance. So yes, Necro doesn't have much trouble building meter. True. Max Strong is amazing for that. Ooh. Ooh. That was a good read, actually. Snake Fang, Snake Fang. A lot of negative, but Q has nothing. Hugo finally has a... Oh. Oh. There's the pressure. He wants... Wow. So this is how basically Hugo has to win. <laughs> exactly. One mistake. Well, I'll, actually it's two or three, but... Okay. Ooh. Really? Wow. Did he actually hold, press, uh, hold punch for too long? I don't think so. Um, I forgot the startup for Hammer Mountain. Hammer Frenzy. But... That low jab, it's pretty good. It doesn't, it doesn't have much recovery, so maybe it wasn't a guaranteed not. punish. Yeah, I maybe mean, it was the distance. But was if it was a if it was a 360, that would have been a punish because it's a it's a parry jab. Right. That means automatic plus plus four frames. So a uh, command grab would be guaranteed. Ah, uh, I see. All so, right. So yeah, if it's a if it's a heavy move, you get plus two. If it's a Special middle move, zero. Zero, yeah. Not many people know that outside of Japan. Yeah. The, the game in America is mostly played without the benefit of, uh, of a lot of frame data or uh, uh -huh, uh -huh, mechanics. Uh -huh. It's hard to get them now. Well, it's easy to get them now, but yeah. it was hard to get them get them uh, back in the days. Yeah. Like 10 years ago, we certainly didn't really have that information. Oh! Red the elbow cannon into a hammer mountain. Hammer frenzy, whichever. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> Whatever, yeah. Wait, I... Oh. Uh -oh. Four, five, five, six. Oh my god! Oh my god, nice! High level play! Couldn't he go on uh, back strong into electricity right after that? Uh, no. Oh, okay, so just back strong. No. Oh. Is it, uh, can you pull it off? Oh with with that fancy combo. Well, it's optimized, not only fancy. Wow, he's catching all the snipes. He's not letting him get away with any sniped overhead. Hugo, Hugo can try for a red parry oh, once. Oh no, no. Look at snipers! Can't anymore, can't anymore. Oy! You know what, Tom? That crouch strong from Necro uh -huh. with a palm. That is called any air punch. In Japan? In Japan. Well, it is the actual name. It's oh, it's it, actually called anti air punch. Yes, it's, it's, it's called any air punch. Oh. And it got stuffed. <laughs> yeah, by the body splash. That body splash has amazing priority on it. Um, Yeah, that is probably one of the best moves that Hugo has. Yeah. Cross ups, pressure, whatever. Even jumping forward, like jumping in at the last second, because you can vary its uh, you can vary the timing on it. Yes, so well. yes, yes. It hits so deep. And as Tom said, like varying the timing in this game is very, very important. It, it's one of it's probably the most uh, uh, like commonly used tech techniques in this game to win. Actually, to change the timing of everything. Right. Like, like not only not only, you have like various timings, only with just one jump in. Like Yuan has dive kicks, and Hugo can do right. Can use the might be, you, might, uh, you might be trying to uh, defeat someone's parry just by doing it earlier than later than normal. So wait, now I remember I gave all my soul belongings to Mutant XP. <laughs> and I forgot about it, so I gotta go pick it up. Sorry, after this match, let me go for a All second. Right. For a second. Oh, no problem. I'll be back. Stream, I'll be back. Oh, so many snipes. So, Nick, so, so now we have YSB, right? YSB. Are YSB and Hayao still considered the best uh, Hugos in Japan? Hayao! Hayao, yes, I think. YSB, okay. I don't know. Okay. But, but one thing I can say is a lot of people like him. Yes. A lot of people like him. Sure. I don't. I don't. <laughs> <laughs> and yeah, the there's also Hayao's, you know, like uh, pictures and photos that he takes of himself, and some of them are kind of questionable. Kind of, yes, yes. <laughs> he dresses like Yurian, right? Yeah. He, dresses, yeah, I, he just lo he loves a banana hammock. <laughs> I don't know why he just loves a banana hammock. Oh, Ooh, that is hard to do with the necro. So look at the timer. It's running out. Yes, they're gonna. They are going to play a long game. 
Oh, he finally has it cornered. Oh, Ooh, good read. Go. Good read. He has the life lead. Leap it But he could he get his bacon block a, a last second uh, electric snake? Oh, look at that. Uh oh. Taunt for the damage boost. Oh, that was oh. that's an overhead. He was well aware of that. Three, two, one. Activate super. Oh, yeah. oh. Instant overhead. Snipe. Are we playing Marvel 2? <laughs> <laughs> Instant overhead, man. That was Magneto right there. Magnecro, I'm sorry. Magnecro. Yeah, Magnecro. 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 Oh, Magnecro. Oh, it did not go into super after the two jabs. So now he's down on life, so he's got to move in to get a little bit of life back. Or. Oh, base that Necro has to work with. Well, basically, this is tough. For, see, look at that. Oh, so, yeah. See, that confirm. is probably not punishable on block. Hit confirm. But well, you might see a stun. The damage boost. Yeah, it was too far away from the corner. Oh, 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 I thought he was going to get the elbow cannon there. Yeah, we were about to see it. Uh oh. Oh, oh I got there you go. You called it. Electric stick toward the win. Yep. Mag Necro. Got. <laughs> Except no triangle chop. Well, you don't need it if you have that. <laughs> <laughs> you don't yeah. need it if you have that. <laughs> Yeah, his mid screen hit confirms are really good, actually. Uh, what it, what makes it even e oh here's Hayao. Oh boy. What makes it even easier for the Necro players to hit confirm is that it's like even though they let the super out, it's safe on block, so there's no pressure right. basically. They just stick it out, just like you know, just randomly empty yeah. buttons. Yeah. And if you just miss, sure, fine. Oh, you, just, well. you just stay back and build meter again. Right. So that and, and he has a great tool for building meter. Which yep, is he strong. does. Back strong is really mad fast. <gasps> so let's see Hayao. Let's see what he's going to do. Known for his, you know, uh, input speed for the Giga Spreaker. I'm surprised he decided to commit so hard with the uh, Elbow Cannon for Anti-Air instead of Back Strong instead. Uh, the Elbow Cannon has a lot of, uh, uh, doesn't have much recovery time. So you, you, you can move right away. Okay. So. Oi! Oh! Wow. It's not gonna be enough, but Necro doesn't mind playing this, playing like this. I, what else are you gonna do when he's stun on the like jumping back when he's wrong? Uh, I don't know. I don't know what was the best choice. Probably Electric Snake was the best choice. Ah, oh, it's so yeah. scary. He had, he had gotten him too with the body splash. And when you're in trouble, just tap low, just tap down. <laughs> Something will happen. This game's so grimy. <laughs> um, there are reasons why people quit this game and people <laughs> people started this game. Right. It's all because of the parry. Yes. It's an it's the good and the evil at the same time. They let you get away with so much fraudulent strategy. <laughs> yeah. Like you can't even call it strategy anymore. It's just tactics. Wait, you just close your eyes and tap down. Right. And something happens. But but and, and but, then you react. But it's not everything. The stream. Don't get me wrong. It's not everything. So, uh -huh. There are a ton of moves that like that you can that are safe even if parried. Like Cut. Yuri jumping right house, for example. Oh, that's not safe. Not safe. That's not safe. Even at max, just, even at like okay. That's not safe. Trust me. <laughs> All right. See, oh, so Ooh, there, red parry there was a red parry, but I didn't, I don't think he would have burned the meter, and he needed to burn the meter probably to get a punish, which is a ex lariat. Okay. But maybe he just wanted to parry for show, parry for show. I just noticed he has. He has Giga's Breaker. Yes, he does. We might see it. We might see it. Oh. Maybe not. Maybe not. Uh, two. That's going to hurt. That's going to hurt. Oh, my. Damage boost. We are running out of time. Uh. Oh, no. That was, like, that was obvious. That was oh, obvious. No. This is looking bad. Red parry. Oh, uh, no. I missed red parry, too. Woo. There's no. Uh, I think this is a lost cause. Spamming the anti air punch. Yeah. There you see it, people. There you see it. Necro and Hugo. Not that easy. Uh, of course they're happy. They beat Hayao to ISB, <laughs> right? Of course they're happy. Yeah, with Necro. Good job to good job to the Necro team. Sugiyama, Ikiyama, Tamu, Yoshihara, and Bakas. So oh he. Oh boy. So now they have to play Oro. 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 I, uh, so I was looking at bosses' um, uh, tier list, and oh. he puts Oro at like. Uh, Fourth place right now. Yeah, this year. It, yeah. Really that good. It does. Ugh. Oh, see, I don't want to argue with boss, but okay. it kind of does make sense because yeah. basically it's like a one-hit kill. Right, and his and his mobility is really good. His, oh, Chun Li, Alex, seriously. This is why the RX RX quit Alex and played Yurian. Ah, I didn't realize he was an Alex player originally. He was Alex, but he quit because he couldn't win. 
So what? Well, who do we have? Who do we have? Uh, it's uh, block three, six, forty-one. Pearl Ice! Pearl Ice! Pearl block Ice! Three. Block three. Pearl Ice. Yes. So we have Pearl Ice, and that was Team Genki. Team Genki without Genki. What? Where's Genki? Uh, he's in another team. New York, New York uh, beat him. I see. So. So oh, now. What? What's he doing here? Are you ready? Uh, Is that Shen? Shen Chong? So this is either Hero Chan or Chelsea. I'm not sorry. Sorry, I'm not really familiar with the colors. Alright. But maybe you might know what happened. Um, wait, two years ago? Wait, three years ago? Two years ago? Is what happened is that in top eight final uh -huh. tournament, Alex team beat a Chun Li team. I remember that. I do remember that. So, it, so it is doable. Okay. I held an upset, but it's doable. Yes. It is doable. But by the way, uh, when you're pairing Chun Li's lightning legs, is it always in bursts of three? No. Four. Four. Bursts of four. Okay. Okay. So basically, Alex needs to put Chun in the corner and just just maul her. And it seems like Dura last has a word or two about Alex. I'm gonna jump in quickly on the mic right now, and it's not an easy match. As soon as Chun Li has meter, Alex has no offense, maybe 5%. You have to get the corner and you have to maul her. It cannot be pretty, it, it can be as ugly as you want, but you've gotta get that damage in before she gets that meter. Agree? Yeah. Okay, kind of. <laughs> <laughs> kind of. So I mean, it, he has a, he has a couple tricky tools to kind of to get in. Yeah, but I mean, if you if if not everybody can play like Genki, right? Yeah. See, and well, you see, Alex's offense is supposed to be pretty good. Like some characters do have a lot of trouble, like Yun, like Yurian. They have a lot of trouble. Well, Makoto has has her tools, good enough right. tools. But Anchuli also has her tools. So look at that. See, they got full meter, and they basically got nothing to do. <laughs> and. Second round goes to Chen. Third round, let's see what happens. So this is Ricky Maru's team. Pearl Rice, probably first or second. In the team, Powerbomb, whiffed by uh, Roundhouse. So Alex he does not even have a situation where he can use his meter. And because the EX slash elbow is punishable on block with a super. Right. So basically, oh, oh there's a finally. big chance. Hey. Put her in the corner. Uh, I wouldn't use the super. Because the super puts him in the corner as well. Puts oh, her in the corner. True, as right. well. it does that was a nice whip punish. That's random. It's not gonna oh, it is gonna reach. <laughs> wow, what a hard reach. Alright, that was on a hard reach other than that. that was uh -huh. Oi. 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 I'm surprised I didn't get red parry there. Dora getting hype. I'm it's, surprised I was on it, red parry. It is hard to red parry when you're down to the last pixel. It is very hard. It's not te it's, technically it's easy, but you know you're in the last pixel, and then when you nerves, when, nerves, nerves of course, yeah. of course, of course. And when you know that you're you're down to the last pixel, it's, it makes it even harder, I guess. Right. So we have Taro Kichi. So apparently, Pearl Rice was first player. Taro Kichi, as I said, Mikado player. Bochi and Ricky Mario, I think, taught him a lot of stuff. What does that mean, Pude Rice? Par uh, Pearl rice? Pearl rice is actually a brand of a rice. Really? In Japanese. <laughs> and I do not have any idea why he's named Pearl Rice. I have oh, no Pearl idea. Rice. Pearl Rice. I yes. see. It is a brand. Got it. I have no idea what it means, but... <laughs> well, mochi is, is... Mochi is like rice cake. Right. The rice that cake I understand. Is, I mean, so that's made of rice. Yes. So Pearl Rice kind of makes sense if they're teaching, if Mochi's teaching Pearl Rice. Wake up suplex? Wake up suplex. Suplex? What is suplex? Powerbomb, right? Power Powerbomb, right? Powerbomb, I'm sorry. Oh, wow. That was a low profile. <laughs> oh! That's what you call a gimmick. Oh, what? That took balls, though. That gimmick took balls. Ah! 
That's the same unblock at least. Chun-Li can't punish out of block, fortunately, right? That EX, oh. uh, EX, not, uh, not Hopefully Johnny. she can't. <laughs> She ducked under. Yes. Oh, that was good. The jump timing on that is pretty hard. You got to wow. delay it as much as possible. And so, yeah, for Why Alex to... Why she have to be so tiny when she's crouching? Uh, clouds crouching middle punch. Yeah. It's very, very low profile. Oh, Kazuya! Kazuya! Oh, boy. Kazuya, yeah. let's go, Kazuya. I teamed him with him how many times? I teamed with him twice? No, maybe three times. The co cup. He hasn't been playing. He hasn't been playing. He, he admitted he hasn't been playing. I see. But he's Kazuya after all. Let's see what he can do. Oh, that's a jumping medium kick. It has a long reach, but you don't right. get nothing after that. Right. If it's deep, you do. If it's if it's not deep, you don't. Yeah, you, there's no conversion off of it. Not really. Ooh. Well, he's got it in the corner now. Ooh. Overhead aiming. Oh, cross out. Gimmicks. Oh, yes, there any? No, they didn't have there any. It will combo, even though she's in there. Still alive. Still alive. So basically, what Alex has to do is, you know, really commit. If right. you if you low parry, push a button. Don't block. Because <laughs> you're not gonna win blocking. So when you when you parry, you gotta push a button. Yeah. Nice. Although and Chun-Li's just gonna like press hot gate. Oh, like that. All day, back, back here. Not really, but she, apparently he is right now. So you got something. You, you might have an opening. See, meaty. I mean, maybe he's using maybe he's using a hotkey to try to bait out the uh, EX double stuff. Air, oh, air barn. Nice. Rent the air barn, but Alex doesn't mind spending meter. That's true. So, uh, what else is he gonna use it on? Exactly. That builds hella meter. That standing middle kick. Ah. Two uh, boots. Two boots. Air Stampede! Oh, Batista Ball! <laughs> Are, we... Are we gonna see Batista Ball? Are we gonna see German Sausage? Are we gonna see... Oh, two boots! Any shoutouts to those tension guys? No, family, family <laughs> yeah. fun arcade, right? I've yeah. never been there, but I wish I could've. I know. But you sent Rip. me that vid! Family fun arcade test vid! Yep. Two boots, Air Stampede, oh, Batista Ball! <laughs> John D, the legend, Dr. Sub-Zero. Uh, so who are we gonna have? Who are we gonna have? Kazuya goes down, so we are going to have the bulldozing machine. Sakurada, I think. He's gonna maul you. No matter what. I think that I think I think he's anchor, but see, Sakurada, he uh, beat Gavin last year. Ah. Uh, when I teamed with him. I see. And it, we were in the playoffs and Gavin just like Died it instantly. I remember. See? We were team, Tom. We were shocked. We were team. That's true. And we selected, we nominated Gavin as our playoff. Uh, yeah, and he went rep. and he just got mauled. He just got killed in a so flash. So if anybody knows this matchup, it would be Sakurada. Yeah, so Sakurada got to got, got to do his thing. Just like jump in oh, or picking, do whatever. He's picking Renna color, American color. Well, that's Sakurada color. <laughs> <laughs> All right, good boy. We're in Japan. But we're having an English stream. Shout out, shout out to Renick though. He was on stream. So it's not Sean easy. already has a meter. Ah. And you know what makes uh, Tarokichi play really relaxed? Because he has Mochi, Oreo, and uh, Rikimaru in the back. Oh my right? god. So he can do his thing whatever that's he wants. Battle. Yeah, and that's an uphill battle. Whoa. Here we read the habit right there. Interesting using the, the elbow the, or the uh, shoulder check to the top top. Wow. It, I think she will spend the bar. Ow. Air Stampede and negative three on block. Is it? Ooh. It is. Okay. And Alex tried to push a button and she only pushed a button faster. That's right. why I low forward one. Gotcha. Try to steal a turn, didn't work. Well, so if it's if it's in like close range, well, throws are guaranteed. Right. The throws are three frames. Yes, throws are three frames. And we we might see nothing Almost happen. Meter up. See, look, like I think it's Mochi and everybody like advising him what to do. I'm surprised she didn't. Uh, well, no, she, you don't have to go for that when you have Mochi or your Rikimaru in the back. That's true. You don't have to go for like hard things or anything. And, or, and you don't have to get every punish. Yeah, I mean, you could just mash throw just like that. True. 
Another battle. I, wonder, just... I wonder if he's trying to make uh, the Chun uh, look for another uh, sweep, just in case, but no. Because now he's jumping in a lot. He's not and, playing the ground game anymore. And Chun Li's aiming for an anti air low forward, just like she did right now. Ooh. Committed. Ooh, missing foot right there. The hell? I don't even know what's going on anymore. Like I, I thought he, I thought this was hopeless for a second. Well, Alex oh. bet all his life already for the yes slash elbow, and, right. he, and it worked. Like again with the crouching roundhouse that goes unpunished. Ooh, Mr. Convert. Stops. Super. Oh, Red the EX spinning bird can go to wake up. I like it. I like it. That's all I can say. I, I like it. I just another round. <laughs> and you're sweating already. I'm about to pass out. All right, all right. Oh, everyone has a full stick of butter. Chun already cornered. Alex is not going to chase her in there. No wow. EXs. I missed again with a miss. Twice. Misses yeah. twice. Yeah. Wow, Hakkei, nothing. OK, I think Sakurada got it downloaded, so I think he can do it. Oh. Yeah, he's three, reading the three, card three, throws. Three, three. He's, he's reading the, the tell for the car throws. And he's missing it. Wow, this is getting really ugly. Oh, he got it! There you go. So yeah, um, basically, in close distance, Sakura kind of downloaded his habits. Uh huh. So he was going for a max punish, basically, and it, and it did sort of work out. And yeah. he did make his jump ins work. And, to, and Tarokichi was trying to low forward at any other low board. Uh -huh. And he noticed that it's not gonna work, but he stopped there. He noticed it's not gonna work, but he didn't know what to do after that, he, so he decided to block. Uh, and then Sakurada sort of like went in. Right. Successfully. And and he bet all his life on the second round EX slash elbow at the end of the round. Because that is punishable on block, and it's easy. Not like the sweeps. So, he bet all his life on that, and it worked out. But, but, he has Oryu, Mochi, and Rikimaru. <laughs> all right, so who's playing right now? Oryu. Oryu, okay. Oryu, Oryu cannot come tomorrow. He has work. Ah, uh, that's a shame. Unfortunately. So he's betting everything today. Got it. Good sweep. And... You know, it's really funny. There are 66 teams in this tournament. Uh-huh. Of five people each. We would... Back in over America, 66 people in a single third strike tournament would be amazingly huge. Yes, yes. Well, we got times five. <laughs> For, for the side tournament. <laughs> well, this is not actually a really a side because oh, yeah, I mean, it's like, still just a serious. Yeah, but uh, like said, like I like I said, like Oreo, he has got work tomorrow. He's betting right. everything today, right? Right. But tomorrow's got what, like ninety six teams. Ninety one or whatever. Or okay. Whatever. So. <laughs> Sorry, I like to inflate everything. Uh, <laughs> I mean, yeah, it's like you should like sit back and watch. You don't even you don't really have to talk. <laughs> it's, it's good matches all around. Yes. Already. So wow! What? He swept the, the dash in? She he swept the dash in. Wow, Sakurada playing amazing right now. He's playing amazing. Ooh. But the mighty power of low forward just, just kills everything. That's a lot of respects. From Chun Li? Yeah. Instead of trying to do a high-low mix-up? No, uh, I think he decided he, should, he doesn't really have to do that because with punish, a good one too. See, see what happens. <laughs> see what happens in tournaments. We don't really have to like yell out every single move. We'll see. They'll sit down and block. Because oh, oh. it's on point. One more power bomb. Oh. <laughs> Did you see that, people? Did you see that? He did not use one overhead. Yeah, I think maybe he used one in first round. And but then sweeps, sweeps. And he used sweep, sweep, sweep. And it was sweeps till the end. And, and any one of those block sweeps was a free super for Chun. Yes, yes. And that distance, probably a standing first might have do the, would have done the job as well. Yeah. But in any case, it worked. And we only do that in like big tournaments like this. We don't really do that in casual. <laughs> Now it kind of feels like the pressure is on the Chun-Li team. Um, they got Mochi and Rikimaru, and Mochi's known for his logical play. He's going to play cool, calm, collective, boring. No, no <laughs> I, I didn't say that. See, oh, right. see, 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 punch, see, right. see, 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 that was punished. I see. 
that middle punch is a pain in the neck. Yeah. For a lot Alex. Of frames, right? A lot of, uh, it's very, very safe. Even though it's parried, and it's almost impossible to whip punish. I see. It just Ooh. like it just like goes back so fast. Right. Oh, nice buffering. He's walking into the corner without pressing a button. That's amazing. Um, that's how Alex like has to do it, I guess. <laughs> Can it give me any other solution? I don't think so. I don't think there's any other solutions except for jump. See you don't oh. see you don't have to go for the red parries and stuff. You don't have to. You can you can put aside the difficult stuff or the yeah. risky ones. So because she has an advantage, she's in the lead. You right. know, why why risk it? Yeah, why risk it? That's it. Exactly. So as you've seen already, and and, and you've experienced last year and this year as well, that we, especially in Tokyo area, doesn't take much risks. I and see. that's how we play it in actual tournaments. Okay. But Sakurada, he knows what to do. <laughs> All right. And he so knows, knows how to exploit this. And he knows what's necessary to win against right. Chun-Li. So that's why he's taking risks, and it's working out so far. Are there any particular regions that have a much more uh, YOLO type uh, of The West is more uh, more uh, offensive, I should say. Okay, so Kansai area? Kansai area is a, a lot more... Uh, oh, I, don't, I, I don't really like to use the word YOLO because they've got their own logics. Sure, sure. <laughs> It's strange, he's missing a lot of car throws. Uh, Ryzy said that. No, not Alex, Chun-Li. Oh, uh, chun -Li's missing car throws. Them sweet, <gasps> miss input for sure. Power bomb, oh. Batista bomb. <laughs> hey. Wake up, five frames, get off me. That's a five frame round. That is a five frame round. Oh. Get off me. Oh, that's disgusting. That is disgusting. But that's the power of Chun-Li. Please, people, don't quit because of that. <laughs> don't quit because she has a five frame and super. And you cannot throw the first six frames of wake up. So that was unthrowable. Oh my god. But, 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 she was pushing a button. That means if you would have went meaty, you would have won. Right, right. So it's a mind game. It's always a rock, paper, scissors going on every single moment. That is an insane amount of throw invincibility. Six frames? Yeah. You think so? I think so. Okay. More than three. Like, I would have thought for the amount of time that throw startup would be for the uh, for the player getting up, uh -huh. that should be the amount of time of throw invincibility. But the fact that it extends beyond that to the to the point where you can do a wake up heart attack that can confirm into a super. <laughs> that's that's mind blowing. You're right. You're right. But the developers did say they made Chun Li a strong character intentionally. On purpose. Yeah, on purpose. Yes. Bastards. So this is this is uh, Teranosuke. He's from the Fukushima area. Ah. Known for his solid Alex, Alex play. I think he's the anchor. I think he is. Maybe they got one more, but let's see what he can do. He's gonna sit there forever. <laughs> if Chunli's gonna do nothing. Eee! I guess Chunli can't really do anything after pairing and standing short, huh? Um, she can. She decided not to. That's it. That was a hit confirming to super. super. Alice is in the lead. Ah, nice. Oh, Batista bomb. <laughs> is he feeling himself? I think he's feeling himself now. Um, <laughs> he, he is the type of guy that feels himself a lot. Okay. He All is, right. he is. Does he pop off at tournaments? He does, he does a lot. Okay. He does a lot. <laughs> right. He does a lot. But he can't pop off yet. Right, right. He's got to beat Rick Amaru. That might have been a target combo that doesn't leak. Oh, Mak right. Makoto has that as well, right? Yes. Target combo that don't leak. So see, he's not even teching. He doesn't mind. Because he doesn't want to get involved in a mix-up, and he's got plenty of meter. Did he get this? Ooh. What? ex yes. Oh. Bad punish, but... Yeah. It was supposed to be a hockey. Uh, hockey, back first. Yeah. See. Okay. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, he's gonna change. Oh, wow. He almost screwed that up. A lot. No, no, no. He didn't go for super. A lot of miss inputs from Chun Li. Yeah. And you'll see what Alex is going for. See, he wants to jump at the right timing of the low forward. Mm. At the exact same timing as they as as Chun Li with the low forward, but for okay. the super. So Chun Li basically has to block or take the hit. Right. If it's jumped in the right same right timing. So Alex is basically going for that. 
And that standing medium kick goes over the low board, right? A lot, and it builds hella meter. Oh, it's, it, that didn't know. Wow, oh, she's so short. Now she can use the meter. Woo. <laughs> now, he's, now he's not missing. Uh-oh. Still alive? Uh, lead man. You're still alive. Hi, hi. Lightning legs? Nope. Back up, low forward. Oh. See? See? She doesn't mind backing off. Okay. She still got plenty of room. Oh, my God. There we go. Tom, there are two things that you cannot block in this game. One is tension. The other is throws. We just saw what happened, right? Yeah. Unblockable, four frame, mad range. And you just like push three buttons, and bam, that's it. Uh, <laughs> with more range than a crouching and strong. Uh, or jab, I mean. Yes, yes, you can throw like outside of low outside jab. Outside jab range, yes. So wait, so the match is gonna change, so I'm gonna get my stuff. Okay. For a minute, I'll be back. Okay. Fight. All right, we have here. All right, block two. Need block four. Block two. All right. Dudley and Ibuki. All right. I have. I. I rarely ever see this match. Usually, I want to say Dudley wins it because you know just hits harder, but Ibuki's just uh, she's slippery. I don't think I don't think Dudley wins this match at all. Really? Yeah. Ibuki, all right, so all right, Dudley's one of those weird body types uh -huh. where she gets to just run train on him, uh -huh. even if he's crouching. Oh. Like a lot of her stuff, a lot of her uh, target combos and stuff that normally miss on crouching, uh, crouching characters will fully hit him. Because he's a big, he's a and, big baby, yeah. Low profile. There's multiple ways for her to low profile uh, the course through low as well. That's right. She can like parry in between and then like slide under, right? Yeah, pretty much. Yeah. Or just like, or use a max range roll for it, or God knows what else. Right. She has so many options. All right, so here we go. All right, let's see who who do we have here. Oh, this Dudley. I got his name. Oh. What's going on, guys? Uh, Duralath back on the mic in place of RKF here. We'll be back shortly. We'll be back shortly. We're just stepping in real quick. Well, it's a quick breather. Here we go with that gold Ibuki. That jab, it's so frustrating when you're a big when you're a big character. She just mash it and boom, 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 boom. And then get a mix up. Easy. Oh, you're right. Low profile. Yep. Whips on the up. Uh, whips on the roundhouse. Yeah, it just makes a ton of it'll make a ton of stuff with. Oh my gosh. Ibuki is one of those characters that can reliably stun Dudley. Right. And the jab, that. The like, jab. The, the Dudley is so fat when he's crouching that uh, Ibu can use the massive plus frames over a jab uh -huh. lock to just uh, to start advancing and bullying him. All right, she got the slash. If, if Dudley parries into the jabs, he can be standing roundhouse. Okay. But, but he's got to take a risk if yeah. he get and if he's just like one frame off, he's gonna get tagged by a jab, jab, and it's the same shit. It's the same oh. stuff all over again. Wow. He really has to bully her. Now. Uh, Dudley's on the board. Oops. <laughs> nice counter poke. There we go. We still got another meter ready. Scoop. Wow. Oh, I didn't look. Okay. Good conversion. Good stuff. Dudley burst damage real. I think that's the uh, that's like the equalizer in this matchup though. Well, I, I mean, Abuki's got control of the space, but it's like Alex Chun, one touch. Right. Dudley's got burst. Or some games Alpha Strike. Yeah, right. Now, Tom, you spent time as an, a Buki player as well, so. A little bit, yeah. Yeah. So a lot of this should, should seem a little familiar to you, just the way that everybody's approaching. Let's see. Here we go. All right, last game, uh, Ibuki now pressuring. Wow. Went for it. Nice confirm. 
Here we go. Overhead, no good. Unblockable overhead, I swear to God. Oh. <laughs> she's just she's getting tagged. Yeah, there you go. You got a challenge at that point. Yeah, the Ibuki wasn't able to build very much meter, so she couldn't use uh, EX, uh, EX Kunai to start getting in. Alright, gets the blocks. Uh, too risky. Doesn't match it, so she's safe, but oh wow, tagged by the core screw blow yet again. Another backswing. Watch, wow. watch your legs. Safe. Uh, In case you try to do anything afterwards. This, this guy's positioning against Ibuki is impeccable. Oh. Right, he got in. Oh, nice. Avoid oh. Rida. Nice. Right. Good parry. He's been on a tear today. All right. Here we go. Looking ready to play. Maybe a little nervous, not too sure. Here we go. We got Blue Ibuki this time. Throw. Uh, good conversion. Didn't send an E meter though. Mix up. Cross side. Try to go. Almost done. I think in one combo, she's like underrated with her stun too. Yeah. yeah Ibuki is really good stun damage actually. Like one mix-up is comparable to like Makoto or or even Dudley, what he can do stun wise. A right, no, same, same side. Oh, oh back swing. Uh, yeah, nah, it's gonna punish that dead, dead, dead. What? That job gets carried once. It's a free run house. Yeah. It's like Gunfight said earlier. You've got to you've got to be willing to chance it. You've got to be willing to risk. You got to fight it. Yeah. Opens up with slashes. Corner throw. Oh, all right. One, two, same side. Gets, gets beaten though. Throw, 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 back to the neutral. Nice jumps, jump forward. Yeah, Ibuki has a really good handle in this round. Oh, that should have been a super. You gonna go for chip kill? Good blow for. If he gets one more meter, oh, oh nice jump back. Smart. Okay. That works. Very well played. Very well played. Oh, nice! The cross under, ducking that under. Was, that was a big dance special. That was a big dance. Ah, uh, shot us! Oh, beats oh. the throw! Instant, instant. It's because we got get. Or this is not good. Okay. Slashes are safe. Okay, here we go. All right, the Ibuki's got a meter again. Uh huh. Trade it. Trade it with the jump around house. Oh, Ooh, nice. Get her. Oh, that, that was so good. Oh, and it's a confirmed miss it. Oh, my lord. Hey, it's playing it off. like, I got this. I got this. I got this. There is a reason this Dudley was able to single handedly get his team out of the pools in what was a death pool. Yeah, that playoff, the playoff earlier, immaculate play. Perfect. All right, so here we go. Let's see who, let's see what the Ibuki team sends up next. All right, nice, uh, good low parry. Oh, the hop kick. Searching for that low parry yet again. See him dancing. Nice, uh, the high parry that time. Oh, oh. A little taunt there. Yeah, but the, I think it's totally boosty if you actually hit him with it. Right. I think it was just you know, positioning, like you would do a could shallow be. dive kick. Or it could just be an ass. <laughs> yeah, that too. Oh. Oh, nice. All right, good conversion. Nice. Uh, Ibuki doing well to keep the distance. Yeah. Not enough meter for a chip kill at this point. There it is. That was gonna. That was gonna be steps into super. Yeah, you want it's a damage. If the damage was at forty three percent, only if she actually gets her deep rock. Otherwise, nothing. Right. All right. Ibuki's 
Look at the chicken man of this match right now. Dudley, though, trying to use some ducking shenanigans, trying to force, force his way in. Abuka, though, still playing the range game. Not really trying to get in there. Nice. Slashes. Nope, not this time. Dash up, dash up. Uppercut. But no, it was knocked down and the super didn't hit. But wow, there it is. That's it. Yeah, I will say, it is one of the best feelings if you actually get the full parry on that super. But the, the uh, first kun I get thrown, it also... Yo, look at this guy. Side. See, I love his style. Incognito. As Bob in his head, love it. He looks it. like he's stoned. He looks like he's stoned. Gee, I don't know. I, I don't know, Tom. <laughs> <laughs> and, you it, know, he, if you ever played at Belly Butt Arcade, anybody who walks in stoned, Kiss your quarter goodbye. Oh no, okay, no punish oh. on there. The back swing beats the uh the escape. Saves look. the meter. Wow, oh, look at this. This is gonna be a perfect what a bully! No, oh, commentator right. curse. Ah EX Jet Jet Upper. He's playing that relaxed state, I love that. I see a lot of players that lean forward, they're kinda into the game. He's he's casually like, alright, I got this. I'm not worried. All right, so here we go. Oh, I just noticed he's not using force but he's using rocket upper. He, wa he wants that damage. Okay. Still trying to find that perfect spot. Sliding in. Nice. Wow. This evil key is fighting at really interesting angles. How so, Tom? Um, like the uh, constant use of kunai at ranges where they can't really uh, do the ducking and get like a whole lot out of it. Okay. Um, oh, that's oh. gonna hurt, and it was low, so he gets the full damage out of that. Doesn't bounce out too early. Nice. Good challenge. Oh. There you go. Cross up. Oh, that did deal much damage because Dudley was crouching. Twenty-five percent extra damage. Oh, nice. One more kunai? Um, what? It's a bait. It, no, I mean, just in case he did something. There you go. Into the kick. Right. The, the active frames are insane. Final round. Go for it. Oh, I see. The uh, Dudley Fair is Fujiwara. The, the stone Dudley or, uh, the Yeah, the Dudley Fair is Fujiwara. Backswing blocked. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Abuki. Gets that weird wonky dash. All right, Ouch. bounce out, bounce out. Too oh. high. Not over yet. But Ibuki doesn't have a whole lot of meter. Just one stock. It's gonna be a long road, but two combos could do it. Goes low after that. Has him near the corner. Traded. Ibuki on. But almost has two meters now. Could do it now. Could definitely do it in two in two guesses. Oh! Nope. Perry. Nice. Wow. Well done. All right, so I think Team Dudley is still searching. Who are they throwing up next? Or is it? All right, so it looks like we're cutting over to Oro versus Hugo. That is block number one. I think. Well, he's holding block one right now. Oh, yes. It's uh, Hayao's team versus a hated hermit. Uh-huh. Oh, nice shoot down backbreaker. All right, so Oro opting for uh, Super 2, Yagyo Dama. Oh. Nice. Get the Lariat. Lariat. Oh, wow. Wake up EX uppercut. Oh, and he gets it. Oh, oh nice. Overhead. Of course he's going to use Yagodama uh, unblockables. This matchup is ridiculous for Oro. Oh, did you see that? 
He got dunked. Ridiculous good. Throw him in the air. Alley oop down. Yeah. Fourth best fourth best character in the game right now is Oro. According to according to okay. boss. We lost earlier. There we go. Oro doing well to keep that distance, but now he's cornered. Trying to find his way back to the neutral. Oh wow. Activate Tiago. Fierce Tiago oh. to stop the shoot that backbreaker. And he gets a small juggle afterwards. Oh try to use max range overhead too. Ah, that roundhouse. As Oro is like not dancing in and out of range, but just like baiting the Hugo to do some stupid. Oh, nice, interesting, nice. Max overheads again. Build a little meter. Use that standing forward to keep range. But nice. oh, got hit. Good parry into super. Hugo uh -oh. eats an ex upper and chicken uh, kicks. Yeah, you had to parry that the other way. You know what I should do tomorrow? What's that? I should just get make a sign and just paste it to my shirt that should that just says no Corona. No Corona. I have I have been asked that question at least three dozen times online. Only three dozen. At least, at least. All right. So here we go. I love watching Corona also. So, he just never pays a cooperation cup. He's I'm not a social kind of guy. Uh, so I'm seeing that this is YSB? Yes. All right, here we go. So far, not too much damage mitigated by the, uh, you know, not too much damage inflicted by Oro just yet. Oh. Your YSB fighting his way in. Nice jab. You can never corner on Oro. Right. Oh, oh, the body how splash. Doing it. Clap. <laughs> Give him the clap. Give him the super hammer mount. Intercepts him with the air body splash. Ooh. Reversal oh, this time. Uh oh. Uh, this is not good. He still has an unblockable hit left. Oh, oh nice he's parry. With the parry. Oh, the chicken wow. kicks hit from the other side. Wake up. Grab worth a rush. It. Put a little makeup. Hello, where's it? Oh, uh, he called uh, it this he... time. We'll throw. Backbreaker. See the chiropractor. Your, broke, your back is broken. Go. Here we go. YSB proven he's still got the goods. Nice jump, Harry. Yeah, playing that range. Takes the throw. All right, yeah. only two hits of that. It's really sad that you can mash out so quickly out of that, out of that throw. It, it starts up so slow. He's got to wind up, go around the body, and it's an instant cr uh, cross up, too. Hey, you see, if it was a neutral throw and not a forward throw, right. if, he had, if he still had a separate forward throw, right. Oro would be so much better. I highly agree with that. But it's kind of funny that after, what, 17 years of playing this game, 18 years, like, only now do we see Oro being slowly accepted as, like, top tier? You know what it is? It, part of it is just the meta of the game has changed and the way everybody plays now. With, Every with no balance patches, no season updates. Yeah, we we don't we, we we don't need nerfs or buffs. <laughs> we don't need any of that stuff. We buff our own characters. Yes, Oro used to be mid tier. Look at him now, fourth best in the game, according to Boss. According to Boss. Oh. Activate. Yes, use this uh, fierce. Wow, those ex taps are eating up like two of the hits or three of the hits. And it's not looking good for uh, Hugo right four now. Four hits, I believe. Uh, yes, four. 10 seconds for Hugo to make a move, but it's not looking good. Oh, uh, it's not looking good at all, no. Nope. That's fine, though. It's fine, though. Yeah. Build a meter, build a meter, Run, build a meter. run. Right yeah, there back. you go. Yeah, there you go. Stop, stop. Smart. Sometimes you've got to use all 99 seconds on the clock. It's totally worth it. All right. You know, the very first time I ever played against YSB, uh -huh. I thought Hugo versus Makoto Free Way for, in Makoto's favor. Free for Makoto, you know, yeah. It generally is. Yeah. He scraped me 8 0. I, I, I didn't want to ask you about your YSB story <laughs> until like after the match. 
No, he, he can turn it on. Every, mm. Everyone always says, you know, Hayao is like the, the god of Yugos. Right. But I really have I really have to give Yugos a lot of credit as, as, as one of the best Yugos out there also. Nice. Antair stands short on the cross-up. He's also really entertaining to watch. Yes, he is. He's a very active uh, Yugo. I love it. Oh, can, he, can, he, can he do this? Ooh, Biotic. Oh, oh I tried to intercept again. Body splash. Wow, oh, ultra throw. Clap. Down. Get him. That's so strong. Da, 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 da. Oh. He, he got ahead of himself. That would have been such a oh, sick no, read. What I'm, what I'm wondering, were the inputs eaten up that he didn't complete? Because he might have been go, trying to go for a uh, meat squasher. And instead, he ended up. Uh, I'm wondering that. that that's, yeah. No. No, I don't think so. Yeah. yeah. Because why? Okay. Because why would you do low short into jump on that point unless you're because, trying to go throw? Because it might have been low. I mean, he might have thought it was a low short, low short throw into the meat squasher. Right. That's what I was. Yeah. I see what you mean. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> go. Yeah. I'm not well, so convinced it was a mistake in uh, execution. Anyhow, now we have Hayao. Ah uh, yes. We're talking about Hayao being the uh, gold standard of all Hugos. That icy blue Hugo. Oro actually has enough time after baiting the throw, uh, if he dodges the throw with the chicken pig, to, to actually get the knockdown. Nice, good throw tech. Swats him out of the air. Oh, uh, now I got thrown into the corner. Oh, uh, did you Oh! <laughs> Gigo needs more meter. I also noticed Hayao's using Gigas Breaker. On, on Oro. Interesting choice. A character who spends quite a bit of his time in the air. Uh, you know, but he, he needs one parry. That's it. Does he even need a parry? I don't think he need. I don't think he needs a parry. Hayao does not need a parry. Now this, that's 26 it's, seconds. It's I gonna think, be a touch of Gigas. Right. Good blocks. Oh, what is this dancing? Is this some new German dance? Uh-oh. Uh, there's no time to do a Gigas now. Uh, oh, I mean, that was, I mean, that was cool. That was a good read, but... <laughs> you wait. I'm ready. Go. Touchy Gigas. Touchy Gigas. I want, I want to see I, it happen. I will, I will chug the rest of this monster. Oh, this, uh, I'm sorry. This, um... Uh, Unbranded energy drink. <laughs> if, if a Tachigigas gets out, I will take video and post it on my Twitter. Oh, tried to red parry. Now, if you saw the size of this of this uh, bottle, <laughs> oh, there we go. With Maybe the... you can see why I'm so eager to take this bet. Right. We got the ton off. So he the... didn't do the full ton for the damage boost, but he did. But he did get enough for the uh, the, the stun recovery. Oh, uh, uh, defense. Yes. Right. Uh, oh, the, oh, he almost had the combo there. Ooh. Chase down with the Lariat. It's sense. I still think Ohio can do it. I, I believe. I believe in Hayao. Oh, but the back fist. Oh, no. I still believe in Hayao. I don't care. Oh, oh. what is he doing? Oh, wow. <laughs> oh, crazy stuff going on there. Corona, no. Or not Corona. Hi out, no! <laughs> Good stuff. Well, Fab, but you know, it, it proves that, you know, Oro definitely belongs in that upper echelon of players now. I mean, oh, character, excuse me. By the way, this is what I was going to chuck. There, there's no logo on here. <laughs> yes, Just letting this, you know. This tiny ass bottle. I was like, yeah, I'll chug the entire bottle. Okay, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Good stuff uh, to our players here. We're just waiting on the next matches to come along. Oh, I these, these cans are so cute. Look, look, how, look how cute this can is. You are I right. can shock, I no. can, I can shock on these. No, Tom. It'd still be alive. Tom. It's still less than the size of a full can. Ugh. I'm, I'm so worried about you sometimes. <laughs> anyway, great job to our competitors here. The Oro team hated Hermit advances. Hey, uh, uh, supposedly a second rate Oro team. A second, a tier two, yeah. Yeah. Not He's abusing top tier. Oh, lordy, lordy, lordy. That's fine. I mean, Oro takes a lot. And uh, Oro Hugo, I mean, I, I looked at what the unblockable combo was for uh, 
for Hugo, mm -hmm. it's it's so weird because you gotta you gotta be charging. Right. One hit, one hit of launcher, uh, fireball, chicken kick, and then Whoa. it's 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 some. It's okay. it, It's like at that point, dude, I'm just picking super three. Okay. I don't. Know, <laughs> I don't have the patience. I I, I play or all the side. So it's so good though, because he's gonna eat. So let's take a look at some of the blocks here. So you see the uh, results here. Yeah, Team Hayao is sick. 0-2. Oh, my God. Wow. Tamu. Yeah, Oro and the Necro teams advancing. Oro team it, Oro team looks like they're in uh, losers playoffs. The Necro team looks like they made it. Is there a second? Payoff A and payoff B, yeah. Right. <clears throat> I guess, yeah, I guess there's a next uh, a secondary playoff. Right. So, uh, again, you're looking at the results of that. Of what just happened, that latest block, that was block number one of the second round. Did RKF die? I don't know. He's probably doing something else. He's probably getting ready. Um, of the uh, block two of the twoist round, by the way, if you take a look right there, the twoist, oh, the twoist round. Uh, looks like the Makoto team. That looks like, is that Tominaga? I'm, 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 that's, is that Mimora? A chance, a chance Luca, Luca and, and um, uh, Shibu. Shibu. Yeah, so they advance. I heard they've been wrecking. And it looks like, yep, the Ibuki team advances. And Deadly team is out. Oh, that Deadly team. That's right from earlier. Oh, oh really? That's right. So that happened. That's, that is what it is. Like I said, like, yeah. there's the Ibuki a, team, yeah, Ibuki team, uh, yeah, there's a lot of killer teams there that went 0 2. So it could, it, anything could happen at this point. It's not, not just, again, it's not just a Chun Li. Well, I mean, but look, it's Tomi Naga's team. It is. Mimora and Chance. And Chance, yeah. All three of them three of them alone are, like, ridiculous. Right, it's uh, such a strong team. Shifting to block number three. Chun team advances. Uh, let's see. That Chun team. Your, uh, your, your reading is better than mine, of course. Well, I'm going to cheat, and I'm going to use... He's going to use... Uh, his mitts list here. Shout outs to his mid. Oh, Ricky oh, Ricky Maru, Maru's team. Okay. Mochi, Oryu, Pearl Rice, and right. Tarokichi. And then Team 41, the young team that looks like Yakun's team. KO Issei. Wow. Oh, no. KO's team? Yeah, KO's team, yeah. Kenzo. Wow. And it's uh, my, my heart, Team 16, sure. the Alex I mean, team. That's, a, that's just a death bracket. Yeah, it is a death bracket. Poor, this poor Alex team. What do you expect? I mean, what do you expect out of, you know, well, the... I mean, yeah, they made, they made it winners like out of winners from the Rome bracket. So. Yeah, out of the two round. So, uh, move to block block four. Oh. The Yang team. I heard the the Yang team uh, did very well. Of course. Oh, well, Roshi Hikari's on that team. Oh, uh, Roshi. Okay. You know, think about that. And it's then like uh, shout outs to Team New York. Make 3S great again. Yep. Uh, they are one and one, so they're losers playoffs. Uh, the 12 team actually uh, almost Moto, makes some, wow. yeah, Moto making some waves, but unfortunately unable to uh, capitalize. But shout outs to a 12 team. That's yeah. almost almost unheard of for uh, for third strike. Uh, such a low tier character, but yeah. still he's willing right. to do it. All right. Just for clarification, uh, Frankie 3S is not the uh, the West Coast original Frankie Melendez. Uh, he's an East Coast uh, player named Frankie Nunez still, uh, from New York. Still a very solid player. Uh, yes. Shout outs to the uh, Make 3S Great Again team. I mean, that's a huge showing to make it to uh, uh, two round. I can't call it a second round because it's two round. Yes. All right. Oh, of course. Okay, so the uh, team that made it out here is uh, uh. Hidai, Deshiken, uh -huh. Chie, Matsuken, and Kosei. Okay. Uh, it's Team 11. And then the Makoto team is Team 62. That's like Makoto Team number two. Right. And wait a second. That? I think not... you went too far? Or? No. I think I might have a problem here with this translation. Ah. Uh. Oh. No, I think that's the Haitani. It's oh, was the Haitani team? Okay. Okay, so it looks like block six, block six doesn't have full results. I'm not sure why, but uh, oh well. Oh. We might still be waiting oh. on a playoff between. Oh yeah, it looks like they're waiting on a playoff. But the Q team. Wait, 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 wait. TM is wait. on that team. Wait, wait, wait. TM is wait, on the team. Wait, wait, wait. What? <laughs> the Q five. TM is on the team. What? Of course, Bento has. Beto is in there, and he's a really strong player from a place called Big One up in uh, Minami Urawa in right. Saitama. Uh, plays with um, RKF, RX, and uh, Sugiyama all the time. Um, all right, so now we've got now we've got these going on. So right now it looks like the Dudley team advanced all the oh, way. Oh, Gunfight's team advanced. Yeah, Gunfight's okay, team. Gunfight made it all the way out. Gun, nice. Gunfight teaming with Kokujin. Mm -hmm. uh, 
Let's see. I see Coco Jin. Is that Aiku as well? I think so, yes. Yeah. Team 5. Team 5, that's Loli, Coco Jin, Ike, Hi Hirahata, Ike, sorry. Hirahata and Gunpa. Uh, it really is Aiku. It's Aiku, okay. Yeah. <laughs> Shout out to see our translations. Well done, yeah. Yeah, Piro's uh, Remy team uh, got wiped, sadly. Yeah. First round. The uh, Young team got wiped uh, second round, it looks like, against, or in the uh, final round against the W oh, team. Oh, Ushi was on that team. Ushi uses Yun? Yeah. Yeah. I thought he used, uh, he mained uh, your hand. Yeah. Surprisingly as well, RX. Oh, yeah. RX's team. You're right. Gets stopped early. RX. Wow, I wonder who the rep was. Crazy stuff. Again, showing you. It's anybody's game here at, uh, at Cooperation Cup, so. Oh, I see. So Hirahata was um, the guy, and then uh, Ushi. Okay. So is that so is that double circle just who, cl uh, who clinched it or? It, I think so. Yeah. Okay. Interesting. But I would love to know. Uh, I it was probably RX that uh -huh. represented uh, team uh, the uh, the C team there. Okay. But interesting. Crazy stuff. We just shout out, you know, I, I, I'm, look, I'm still just looking over everything we're seeing here. RX being out earlier, MLV's team being taken out early on. This is such strong teams, but you never know. This game prides itself heavily on having strong players play it. I, I'm betting a lot of people within the chat are were instantly saying, Chun -Li's, a Chun-Li team will take this, but last year a Chun-Li team lost, right? It was yeah. a Makoto team that won. Mm -hmm. uh, that's why, that's why you know, the whole Tominaga joke uh, exists. It's like, oh, right. oh, look, it's Tominaga. Tominaga 5. Uh, yes, the MOV team was an all-Chun team. Most of the teams here are, are uh, most of the teams here are fully just five characters, five characters on, on their own. Uh, that's the that's the nature of pre co-op cup. So you get players that you know aren't normally playing their their uh, their main characters. For example, I played on uh, a Makoto team, Die Hard, and I was you know I'm an Alex player, but the heck, I just wanted to play Makoto. Uh, the Make, Make 3S Great Again team, all Kens. Uh, we had a couple of Chuns on there. There's an Alex player on there, but you know the spirit of pre co-op is just lots of fun, and it's just a great way to start off the weekend of co-op cup. So. So I'm gonna switch back on, and uh, here we go. Here, switch back. So again, thank you guys for joining us here for the English broadcast of Cooperation Cup Weekend. I am Duralath. I'm being joined by our Lyoth here. We've been at this for hours, and we love it. Right, Tom? And many more hours to go. Many we, more. Uh, we're gonna be stuck here until 9 p.m. Yep. So and so about 4 p.m. right now. So yeah. there are yeah there you are going to see some incredibly sick games here. We'll yeah. be mopping the pl the floors of vomits. <laughs> there yep. will be sickness everywhere. It's, it's just so good. I this this game is so grimy. Unlike you know like a game like Street Fighter Five, where uh, it's like oh the the frames who has advantage uh, who like whose turn is it? It's it's. It's much more rigid, right? Right. And you got Street Fighter 4, which had all the set play and stuff going on, right? Uh-huh. the hell is our third strike? Third strike? It's just like, ah. Third strike is music. It, it's, it flows. It's, it's a straight instinct. It's just like, yeah. Uh, oh, my God. Okay. So I'm going to switch the screen backs here and, uh, again, taking a look at some of the blocks that just happened. Uh. I, can, I can barely remember... Or comprehend what the hell is going on in that game. Right. This game. Um, so we're just making sure again we're taking a look at some of the uh, taking a look at some of the blocks here that happened in this two round of uh, pre cooperation cup. Again, matches team going 0 and 2 in this two round. Tominaga's led team going to. Uh, Oh, so I'm told that the the double circles are actually OCVs. Oh, okay, so... And TM, that's why there's one player on there. Right, okay. so the, all you needed was TM. Like, like I said, it was TM on the team. Okay, yes. Nice. 
So again, guys, make sure you are following this channel. I mean, you're going to see a lot of great Third Strike action this weekend. You don't want to miss it. You're going to see a lot of upsets. You're going to see a lot of sick play. But above all, you're going to see Third Strike, arguably one of the greatest fighting games in the world ever invented. Times a million, times infinity, plus one. We're just waiting on for some of the other matches to finish out. So yeah, Yakun was, so yeah, you see Yakun was an OCV right there. Right. So it's a double OCV for the Yang team. Jesus. Wow. Double OCV, yeah, so that means, yeah, both teams got OCV by the Yang team. He had Ice team. Yeah, it's a scary ass team. Yep. Wow. Rough beat for the uh, match team. Now, yeah, I'm still wondering what's going on yeah. with block six. Is that. Are we still. Uh, they're, they're, they're still playing it off. I'm still waiting, yeah. Uh, we so. might not actually have a feed on that particular one. Right. <sighs> yeah, shout outs again to Kokujin's team with Gunfight. Man. I'm rotating on. So again, folks, make sure you are following twitch.tv slash GameNewton underscore US. If you'd like, give us a follow. Uh, give, give us your commentators a follow on Twitter, at Duralath and at Arliath. We'd love to hear from you guys. Let us know how you feel about the stream and what you're seeing. We're going to try to uh, incorporate some improvements tomorrow, including, um, including win counters, uh, team names, uh, the, the members we're, of each team. We're going to make it look like a full stream. Yeah. Again, I want to give a shout out to a lot of the Third Strike groups out there. Two of my most favorite ones are, uh, well, actually more than two, but uh, first of all, Third Strike Europe. Again, to all the guys and gals playing in Europe, shout outs to Third Strike Europe. Shout outs to This Is Third Strike, uh, primarily New York based, but they're bringing out a lot of the Third Strike, they're bringing Third Strike back to America and keeping that alive. And of course, uh, the largest group for Third Strike players on Facebook, Third Strike Junkies. Again, if you are not on Third Strike Junkies on Facebook, please go ahead. Join up with the group. We'll put you in there. I have to be again tooting my own horn, but I am one of the moderators there, and I'd love to see you guys there. We want to hear how you guys feel about what's going on here at Co-op Cup and some of the events that are going on you ahead. You just want more people to abuse your power with. I am not abusive of my power, okay? Gosh. Boy. I am not power mod. I, am, I, I imagine myself a fair and just moderator. You individually approve the applications of each person who applies. Yeah, but when I'm in a really good mood, everybody gets in. Uh, <laughs> there we go. Your best song in dance. <laughs> All right. As, as, see, as soon as I say it, yep. They, if I say it, they will come. All right. My data here is a little slow, but yes. Shout out to Arturo and Tony, David, and Matt. Welcome to 3SJ. Post up, say hi, meet players. That's the other big thing about this. Now, Third Strike doesn't survive unless players are willing to play amongst each other. Now, there's going to be a lot of debate with who plays on what. If you're going to play on PS3 or 360, Fightcade, if you have access to a machine, in my opinion, as long as you're playing the game, that's great because you're supporting it. Now, if you get a chance to play an arcade, like Arliath and I have had in the past, it is a much different experience, and it, it, it's it's amazing to play alongside real people offline, especially when you're on a cabinet, on the cabinets we have here. There's about 20 cabinets here, some of them, half of them being used for tournament, half of them being used for casuals out here. But you see the, the camaraderie between Third Strike players. It's just amazing what we're seeing here. So thank you guys for joining in on the stream, and make sure you're tweeting the links out. Make sure you're promoting twitch.tv slash game newton underscore us this is the english broadcast stream it might be a little hard for others to may not understand the commentary we wanted to provide this service to you guys and make sure you are giving shout outs to twitch because without twitch we don't get this so make sure you give them a follow make them proud we love seeing you guys so we want to make sure that we get to do more of this stuff in the future all right i'm gonna keep it out shout out to elton thanks for joining Shout out to my buddy Nick Shapiro. You wanted a shout out? There you go, buddy. Good stuff. Yes. And again, share your information, guys. I can't stress this enough. Spread the info that you're that By you're the getting. By the way, yeah. just so you know, um, 
we can't show any games right now because we have no feed on any games. Right. Even the Japanese players, uh, or the Japanese stream has no game showing right now. Right. So... So we're um, waiting right now, so... Yeah. Doing a little bit of riffing, that's that's quite all right. So we, we can we can show we can show this or you you can you can see our our beautifully ugly mugs. Yes, our mugs after uh, how many years of having uh, you know, having to sit here and uh, commentate. We've been playing for eighteen. We've been playing this game for eighteen years, dude. Yeah, well, some of us have. I, I started a little late. I started right after the. I admit, I started after the Daigo Perry. Well, okay. To be fair, I started at a small arcade and I didn't like the game because I was a, I liked CVS two better. Uh, then I started playing it because more people were playing it and I just wanted to compete against people. And then, after I saw the Daigo pair, I was like, I can do that. Uh, was in 04? Yeah, that was 04. Well, I started in 03, but I started taking it seriously in 04. And to be fair, like, spoiler alert, yeah, I totally was terrible at the game. But, like, I wanted to play. And, like, sure. it was so much fun because I saw sick stuff. Like, when Arliath and RKF were commentating, RKF was referencing an old, like, the first FFA video with John D. <laughs> right? The one that was recorded on a camcorder using a karaoke machine as a mixer. Right. Which I had to help them set up over the phone because I couldn't be there physically because I was sick. Right. And I was like, yeah, 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 plug this into audio out. And then you got this going to the S video in. Right. And then I didn't know what happened after that because, of course, there was no stream back then. And... You know, right. uh, we didn't even upload it to YouTube back then. We just, we had to like self-host it on our own freaking website. Yeah. Like, uh, we ordered off Bluehost. Like, they had these things called FTPs, FTP <laughs> servers, file transfer protocol. Yes, that, that ancient, <laughs> that, that ancient protocol that oh is my still gosh. being used. It is still being used. Uh, it's, it's, you know, it, the, the, believe it or not, some of those videos are indeed on YouTube. If you search some of the old Rambit, like that first video yeah, is on YouTube. True. So you can search like that. That was the beginning of magic. Oh, a shout out! As, as soon as as soon as we watched it, as soon as I watched it, I knew like we had gold on our hands, and I was getting text messages from friends like, "You need to be here. You need to be freaking here right so now. Good. This is godlike." Yeah, the uh, I remember that video is uh, where I saw uh, Renick. Yes. Hi. That's the reason why he's the reason why I started playing Alex. Uh, I saw that video and I was like, oh, Batista bomb. <laughs> I want them to yell that if I ever land. German. German sausage. <laughs> sausage. <laughs> I was like, oh, I got it. I got I want people to yell that if I ever land that. Oh, but, man. you know, it's, it's stuff like that where the community gets involved. So if you are a third strike player and, you know, your scene might be a little small, take steps to evolve that scene. There are players in Alaska, even, that have a cab and have made strides to improve their scene. So it's possible for anybody. It does take a little bit of work, and of course, Third Strike's kind of a pariah of you know the fighting game, you know, of all the fighting games out there. Did one of you bastards just call my face an 04? You can call me an 04 because I technically am an 04. I will admit that freely. <laughs> I will highly admit that because that's when I got serious about the game. But you know what? It got me here, and now I get to be commentating on the English stream. It's the effort you put in, so. Now, Tom, Tom, uh, we'll talk a little bit about your history. You were actually on the first non jap like, you were on one of the first teams to go to SBO. Uh, that, you know, that wasn't a Japanese team, right? Team Moto. Yeah. Yes, you were, uh, you were on, uh, so SBO, Togeki, well, one of the premier tournaments for just all fighting games in general. Back then, I, as far as I remember, it was, you know, 3v3, it was 3v3 mm -hmm. and the third strike team. Who was, who was on your team for that? Uh, that was uh, the original Frankie 3S from uh -huh. the West Coast. Frankie right. Frankie Melendez and uh, Pyro Lee. Pyro Lee! Michael Faustage. Michael Pyro Lee Faustage. <laughs> and we had, we had a road trip uh, to go up to NorCal. And uh -huh. the way that worked out was, it was actually the, the way that that uh, qualifier was being held is they were going to take the top three, uh, top three placers of that tournament. And it was a double elimination, single person tournament, not okay. a team tournament. Okay. Because there weren't enough players to oh, form teams, right? Oh, okay. And so what ended up happening was we were all thinking, hey, wouldn't it be cool if all three of us in the car managed to actually qualify? And we did. Oh, right. Which is funny. And then the reason we got our name was because, no, we shouldn't go into that. No, we're um, not going, yeah, no. That, that, is a, that is a story that I might share in my stream sometime. <laughs> It, it'll take a little while to uh, to tell, but it's a pretty funny one. So if you want to see that, that story being told on our live stream, our live, where should we find you on your stream? When you're back at, when you're in... Twitch.tv slash our live. Twitch.tv slash our live. I'm just trying to set you up, man. Come on here. <laughs> but yeah, 
Uh, definitely follow our live stream. You might have seen him on a lot of SF5 streams because he's been one of the guys da mining data and making sure that all the frame data is correct for season two oh, of Street Fighter. No, 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 no. We don't talk about that dirty, filthy game here on this sacred, holy stream of Third Strike. I apologize. I will wash my mouth out with Zima. <laughs> you can still get Zima here. It's still really freaking popular. Shout outs to... Uh, who was it again? Who, who, who was the big Zima drinker back in the day? Visant? Visant, yeah. Never mind. We're not, we're not, we're not going there. Team Purity? Team. <laughs> who I think probably lost a couple notches of Purity because of Zima. All right. Change the subject. All um, right. So let's, look, uh, let's see. What time is it right now? It is about 421. Man, still no games. This is a long break. It's a long break. We're, I think we're a little behind schedule. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So yeah, they're setting up. Playoffs, uh, starting up again soon. Yeah. We. I might have. We might need to send our uh, representative up. Uh, our team, both Arliath and I, were on the same team, the Makoto team. We did make it to the losers playoffs. So. Okay. Oh. Okay, so both Arliath and I have to go support our teammates as well as our other lead commentator, RKF. We'll be stepping off for a little bit, so we'll see you guys shortly. Wish our team luck.
dear God, hold on. Hi, hi, hi. Oh my God, it's so loud. Who's shouting? Hold on, guys. Is this audio too loud? Room is Alright, the lo arguably the lowest tier versus the highest tier in the game. In a uh, otherwise unwinnable matchup. But Q with that one stock, can he use it? Twenty five seconds to make something happen. Red skull, Justine. Red Skull just goes to the legs. Oh, the slap! Kick is that? Knocked his shit out. Somehow Q took it. Q put sunglasses in broad daylight. Let me know if I have to turn off the uh, turn off the game audio. I'll turn up after this. Q down again. Safe lunge punch. Twice she has dodged that command throw. Gets punished for the taunt again. Gets her spot safe from that distance. Come on, what are they cheering for? <laughs> They're going wild. Yes, if I was a filthy tiny user, I too would also hide my face in chamber display. Hold on, I'll turn on the game audio. Give me a second.
right now. So if you guys are wondering why it's all crazy, again, Losers Playoffs, what it is, in Losers Playoffs, each team selects their best member. And it's one game, single elimination. Oh. Wow. Show it, show it. Yep. Short, short, there super. And there it is. Well played. Did that really happen? That really happened. That second round was nothing short of insanity. Jesus. All right. Player cams are good. We're swinging it on. we we'll shift our camera back over here. You got a nice shot of the man, Kokujin himself. But unfortunately, we're going to the English stream here with us. All right, so. There are plenty others. Yes. Wow, so uh, again, here we go. We're going to switch oh, back to go. Ryu team versus Oro team. Nice. Okay. So here we go. Even the Japanese company is trying to figure out Trying to figure out what's going on here. Yeah. What? How's it going? Oro is on, on the brink of victory. Oh. Fighting away. We got Oro using Super Super Woo 3. Tengu, that's that's your game. That's game. No, no, I don't. No, there's no way. Uh, oh, okay. EX Tengu Stone. Yeah. Oro team advances. Even, even if he EX Tengu Stone, he would have gotten hit by the stones. Yeah. Um, yeah. Thor? Get in, get in. Oh, uh, okay. This distance. Got it. Yep. All right, so we're switching back. Damn, I gained weight. Oh gosh, <laughs> that's quite all right. All right, all right back, back to the next match. We just started Ken versus Chun Li, the quintessential third strike matchup. There we go. Nice throw, Tech. Chun Li with the toe tap gets out of the corner and now with the corner pressure. Hey, what are you? All right, low forward. Nice, the jab goes under the roundhouse. Chun-Li jumps right, out now. I, I caught one of them being Hebodio. I don't know who the other one is. I'm sorry, who was it? Uh, oh, thank you. All right, Shirokuro and Hebodio. Okay. Oh, the bird! Uh, it's punished by a throw. Okay. The throw not enough. Oh! 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 Sometimes you need to be a little more liberal with your punish. Confirm the kill. <laughs> He was off by mere <laughs> pixels. Nice, oh. uppercut, stops. Chun-Li threw a button out there. Oh, right. no. You know what, it's okay. Chun-Li only has a meter now. It's true. But a fierce. Uh, tried to walk up the throw, but gets thrown for his Whoa. efforts. Strong, not canceled. Ken almost has full stick. Nice, got himself out of the corner. Strong into Shippu. Woo-hoo! Got the game, uh, the taunt. Back dash, go for it. Ooh. These guys are slugging it out. Chung is down. One to one. You know what? There's gonna be it. Oh, look at oh. that. Oh. Ring. He's like, oh, I got one more. Back. I got one more round, man. Yeah. All right, here we go. Throw tech. You, you guys don't understand just how much pressure everyone is under because your entire team, your entire, the fate of your entire team right now, oh. is rest upon whether or not you can win these match, this match with one person. Let's throw. Throws to mid screen this time. Low forward, nothing. Oh. Low forward would hit that. Okay. Strong Pierce. Strong corner. Nice. The strong stops the jump away. Low forward, no. Wow. No confirm. Missing a lot of. Oh, right wow, no Three confirm. missed opportunities. Throw. And put it in the corner. Ken on the ropes. Oh, he's oh, no. That's game. That's game. Wow. wow. Chun Lee So many advanced. errors. So many unforced errors on the Chun's part. Still one. Without uh. a sweat. Like Tom or Lyoth was saying, the nerves are racking here. It's as if you are on your last you are on your last character, because every team only gets one player and it is one game. It might as well be 4-4. Four, four. Yeah. Like the score might as well be 4-4 four, four for every single team that's fighting right now at this payoffs. Right. So there are multiple brackets that are going on right now. We're gonna switch up again, we're gonna get to another game in just a second. Right. We're just waiting on. There oh, we man. go. Yurian versus Q. This is the first Q team. Oh. 
Boom. Hey. You guys, can you hear that in the background? Oi. Oh, nice. Samaris, tackle. Agus. Shoulder, shoulder. Oh, oh doesn't get the carry. Sick. Oh, the late hitting roundhouse hit, but he didn't cancel to a tackle. Chop, chop. Hughes still with a li huge life lead. Sweep, no good. Oh, dash up. Go forward. Okay. Q1 run away. Yes, Perry, low forward. Not too much of a punish there. That's what you could probably could do. Chop from Urian. Dash punch. Oh, That's this Hyrule killing team and uh, I forgot the other one. Crap. Okay. <laughs> there wasn't enough time to, hear, to, to get the information. Because these are single games. That might be RKS team because... Uh, Tyrant killing? No, 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 yeah, never mind. No, not that. No, not that. Yeah. That's, that's other team. It's not our team. Okay. Q's still sitting on full meter. Oh, good approach. Okay. Got to push it. Oh, nice. Nice. Off to go Punt. for the EX. Swipes. No. Oh, oh, he missed there. super right there. I could have clinched it. Nice. Yuria team still alive. Tyrant killing machine. Oh, wow, nice. Yeah, Tyra kill it. Oh, oh! Got your daily bow. Hey. Oh, taunt. Yes, there we go. He only one taunt. One taunt is great. That's going to be so useful for this match right now. All the defense is going to help. Oh, the parry. Tackle. Yeah, Vegas. Carry. Yeah, good thing you got the taunt off earlier. Only two. Oh, one nice. Oh. Uh, he was, oh, the Vegas saved him. Wow. That was gotcha. a good save. Oh, oh, nice. That roundhouse, so tricky. Wow, caught two. I caught him out of the headbutt. Jump back Pierce, counters the throw attempts. Oh! Oh! He needs to get this one touch. Uh, oh, oh, no! It's choked. Choked, no. Aegis, no, Aegis, no, Aegis, set up. Where the hell is Aegis set no, up? No, no! There it is. There it is. Can't do a super to get out. He's got to tackle one more. Tackle one more. Okay, fireball Aegis. Overhead, no good. Overhead! Oh! oh. oh. Get this man up here! I got him! Whoa! 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 Yes! Oh my god! Oh my! Wow! That is. You could not have asked for. So holy crap! There's a little bit of invincibility. If you guys are wondering what happened, there's a little bit of invincibility on the first uh, few pricks of Q Super 1. And he travels forward so he can go through stationary right. objects or fireballs. And he does a lot of chip damage. Yes. Yurian has absolutely no life left. The only thing Yurian could have done there is parry. And I was hoping right. he Right, but he already, he already committed. He, he already committed to an attack. Right. So at that point, the Super, you're going to touch him. Game over. That was amazing. Whoa. I want that match highlight. I'm pretty sure if there's a DVD of this, <laughs> uh, of this tournament, that's like got to be top five of matches. You know what? I think if the Urian had was able to survive one block yeah. of that super, he could have read Perry. He didn't even have to read Perry well, because the it would have he would have been he would have stayed inside the Aegis. Yeah, the Aegis would have yeah the Aegis would have hit him and it would have and yeah. he would have killed him because he had no life. He literally had no life yeah, left. He was zero pixel at that point. Nothing else he could do. So, wow. Uh, for those of you who are low tier lovers, there you go. Q winning a match. Yep. Only a cooperation cup. Only a co-op cup, so folks. But you see a, a high-level Q match get this far. Oh. I, I, we're we're going to be talking about that match for, yeah. for many, yeah. many a year to come. Oh, my gosh. Man, I wish I could do an instant replay right now. Oh, an instant replay would be amazing. I, I wish I wish I had Kyobi. Oh. Shout out to Kyobi at level up. We'll probably end up talking about that... Uh, we do we do a, a, a live stream that also gets turned into a YouTube VOD. House of Strikes. We do that usually yeah. uh, twice a month. Features myself, Mika Ko from uh, New York, Mutant XP from New York, and also KDL from from Texas, and then Carson uh, Lee from okay, uh, okay. from Toronto. So yeah. kind of going all over North America here with with our uh, with our Dirt Strike. So House of Strikes. Follow up with the uh, the uh, This is Dirt Strike crew because they'll be posting up for House of Strikes. 
I'm pretty sure that the next episode we film is going to be jam packed, <laughs> jam packed with just recaps of Cooperation Cup, everything that happened here. You can't. Oh, that is going to be the episode you want to tune into. If you are a Third Strike fan, so please do not miss House of Strikes. It's going to be on, usually stream on Nika KO's channel, so twitch.tv slash Nika KO. Make sure you're following that one. We'll be posting up for the House of Strikes. Once we all get back from Japan, we want to see you there so we can talk with you guys what we love that Cooperation Cup. But for now, we're going to stay here with a little more Cooperation Cup action. We're just waiting on the next matches to start up. Wow. I'm still really breathless from that last match. Yeah, I need to smoke after that. Holy crap. <laughs> Whoa! I don't that, even smoke. It was that good. It was just that good. So right now, I think we're just talking it all out. They're trying to figure out brackets. Yeah. Trying to figure out who's still going to move on, who gets to go. Yeah, they, they have to make a whole new set of brackets right now. Right. Oh my god. Uh, great stuff, guys. Great stuff. <laughs> So right now, they're organizing, they're getting things in check. The players are still talking about that epic match, the epicness of all the matches we just saw. Uh, shout out to everybody who's watching this uh, and also retweeting us um, on Twitter. Um, oh, yeah. Marco Sourdough Jack. Yes. Uh, Crackron. Uh, Jane. Uh, Chulch, yeah, thank you. Yeah, thank all you guys for, uh, for tuning in and uh, checking this out. Like I said, like a community doesn't, a, a community does not flourish unless its people actually stay active with it. So, uh, vicious also, Jeremy. Vicious. Shout out to yes. Jeremy. Shout out to Majin Obama. Oh yeah. Yes. Hey guys, remember, we love seeing you here. So make sure you are tweeting out the link twitchtv newton underscore us for the English stream of Cooperation Cup again. This isn't just today, it's also tomorrow, and tomorrow yes. is when the big guns are all out. That's and, when all the real teams And are we will out. have more, hopefully we'll have more features on the stream as well. Right. Uh, we will have the names, and we will have uh, the scores on the on the sheets. We'll be moving on up, yeah. Yeah. We'll have a, we'll have a much more control over the stream, so. I uh, apologize for uh, for any inconveniences today, trying to keep up. Uh, shout out to Hizmet third for uh, being awesome and uh, keeping everyone informed as to what the current matches are and uh, who's playing. Uh, I, I'm only able to tell like last second from the from the callers that are really information. Oh, it's going to be starting soon. See, the Japanese player, the Japanese uh, broadcasters, they actually get their own set of brackets. We don't get anything. Right. So we, we, get, we get their live stream. That's it. Yeah. All right. So here we go. Looks like I, I'm literally peeking over their shoulders to see half of this stuff. If you can pull a team name, it's sorry. The Hold Q on. team is up. Uh, Q and Chun. Q team and Chun team. All right, here we go. And we've got to give a shout out, to, of course, to uh, the main man here, Z, for you know, making sure that we were taken care of and making sure that our English stream has it on here. So here we go, Q versus Chun-Li. Nice, okay. Chun-Li, low profiles under the dash punch. Oh, nice. Capture and deadly blow. Dash punch, dash punch. Taunt. Two taunts. Nice. Okay, a throw from Chun-Li. But Q's already got two taunts in. So the damage boosts the Q very high right now. It's going to take a lot. That's okay. Q can afford to uh, let that rip. Oh, this is going like you. All right. So here we go. Chun-Li now with no meter, but... Almost working on one. Q sitting on that full stock of the deadly double combination. One touch could spell doom for Ch for Chun Li. Oh, oh nice! Deadly oh. double. Oh. oh no! Bounces out of it. Wait, but he's still winning. <laughs> he is still winning. But now, in fact, he, he, has, he has a chance to get more meter. He does. Now, if he just plays solid defense at this point, he'll be he's, okay. Uh, the throw is going to be... Did he get any taunts in on here? He's got two. Okay. <gasps> oh! Yeah. But it doesn't matter at this point. chun -Li confirms it's a super willing to burn it. This is not a good match. It's not an easy match for Q. Until he gets three taunts. Right. Whoa. Again, chun -Li able to low profile under the, the, the regular dash punch. Nice anti-air with a sweep there. Throw. Uh -oh. Another throw? No. Jumps out. Uh -oh. 
There's the other throw. Uh, That's Roundhouse. Oh, no. Oh, this is not looking good. That's Barry. Oh, oh. Kelsey Nelly Bow. Hey. Screw Tony at this point. Oh, he's trying to get the, the BD overhead and the super. Oh. oh. Okay. EX, EX slap. swipes. Oh! Could not get it. That was indeed. I'm looking at the screen. He tried to parry that. He tried to parry. Uh. <laughs> well played. All right, so. We're looking up the uh, stats on the Q team real Eight quick. Team. Oh, I see. The Q5? Yeah. I uh, really uh, don't know. I really wish I had a copy of that bracket that they made just now. That? Uh. Well, I mean, you got that bracket right there. I mean. No, it, this is a new bracket made of... Oh, oh, you of want the winners. full bracket, yeah. Yeah, they they just made a new set of brackets. So I'm seeing, let's see, is this? We we are the second tier citizens at this stream, sadly. Oh well, we do with what we can. All right, let's see what we've got here. Q team, they, they called for a side switch. I think that's what happened. Ah, <laughs> amazing. Or, or did they? Or are we going to a different, completely different team here? Are we? Are we? Is that a completely different team now? Because I don't see any of those shuns there. Did they switch over? I wait. What? What is going on? This is the. Wait. What? Are there? Did did two cute teams? There what? can't be too cute. I don't. I, did they allow for a, a character swap? What? <laughs> what is no, going on here? There's it no is character swapping. It's I'm Cooney, so yeah, it's Cooney versus uh, Hanmono. Hanmono, yeah. Hi, <clears> hi. <throat> Keep it simple and go for it. Oh, oh. Hey. Hey. Uh, I, I, I don't agree with the, the burn of the meter, but it looked cool. Oh, I think there's still single match, uh, single player matches. Oh, okay. Wait, single player matches? I think so. Okay. Hey, activate Dungeon. No, hey, no, no, hey, 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 hey! <laughs> Damn, they're even cheering this. The they're freaking taunts. Oh, oh, that's fun. Oh, man. We have to cut. Worth it. Oh, so it's still uh, losers playoff. Yeah, I think so. Okay, so that's what happened. That's part of it. So Cooney, Cooney advances his team. Yep. Q teams eliminated. That's what's going on right now. Apologize for the inconvenience, folks. We are now kind of on the same page. Great stuff. Great stuff, guys. Wait, one. Need my glasses back on. Sorry. Great. Well played. So. Uh, oh, no, awesome. Okay. So I'm gonna take a uh, quick breather. I'm gonna put RKF back on the mic. Guys, uh, it's been a pleasure. I'll still be here on the side, but please give a warm welcome to the man, the myth, the combo machine himself, Mr. RKF. <laughs> Thanks, guys. Hi, stream. I'm back. Hey. Basically, I did nothing, man. I don't win a pre. I went at day two. I did nothing today. <laughs> so embarrassing. It's so cool. Sorry for my teammates. <laughs> we came to rain. It's supposed to be like this, but uh, got this from Nika Ko. And where are we now? Uh, looks like you know what? We need to get a copy of that bracket. Cooney um, and um. So wait, is this? See, they have a copy of some playoff bracket over there. Okay. And, and oh yeah, I think, I think we, we had it. We had it. We had it. I don't know. Do we? <laughs> Kuni and Shirokuro, right? Kuni and Shirokuro. Yeah. Oh. Oh, I see. Really? Chun. 
Okay, well, it must be somewhere. Oh no, it's something totally different. Yeah. All right, so this is Kuni and Shirokuro. I think this is the, this is the playoff. Yeah, it's playoffs. Shirokuro, you know where he is? You know where no. He's from? He is from Okinawa. Whoa, that is how far. And he, ha Okinawa is the most southern island of Japan. Well, basically, well, well, sorry, uh, to be strict, it's Tokyo, the most <laughs> southern island. Sure, sure. Yeah, it is, it is, it is. It is. It is. But Okinawa, the yeah. most southern island in general. And he's come to Tokyo a number of times before the event to, you know, practice. Yeah. Play a lot of games and then get used to all the, uh, the Tokyo guys. I, I, I'm sure he went to Game Union and played Tony and others as well. Okay. So he should be pretty confident. He's been putting in, in a lot of time and effort. So, is this a lose and you're out situation? I believe so, yes. Okay, so. Oh. So, yes, as Kokuji was saying in the Japanese thing, this is. Oh, he missed the, he missed the fireball. Oh! Boy. This match is heavily in Chili's favor, he says. Overhead, overhead. Nope. nope. Hey, well, what, that, was, that was a DP, I think. Yeah. Or oh. standing fierce. Oh, uh-oh. Yeah, no point in charging up a dungeon there. He he should fire to secure the round, but well, he said he's the EX. But what if Chun Li did a wake up super? Well, that's mind games, and there are times where you can try to screw up the input. Okay. A bit too greedy right there. A little bit too greedy. Chun-Li wanted to conserve the meter. But this round is heavily in the player because she has she has two beat, two bars. Basically two hits and it's over. Ooh. Oh, there we go. There zero it is. Frame, zero frame link. Nicely done. Only works on crouching. That could be game. Bop. Oh, game. Nice. Good work, Shirokuro. So this is basically a uh, Western and Southern Japan team. Uh, it's Takami Chun-Li mm -hmm. with a big smile, without the mask. And so sure. Oh, so they they lost in the pool. So there's because they're in the playoffs. Ah, uh, wow, yes. Wow, this team lost. Wow. <laughs> wow. Mad killers everywhere. So obviously, oh. I would like some of the people that are watching. See if we can ask him for uh, for that bracket thing, for that set of brackets. What? So we got Kokujin on the Japanese stream. Oh, thank you, thank you. Thank you. Whoa. So where was this? Kuni right there, right? I guess so, 31. Playoff B? Wait, so this is the playoff? Looks like it. Okay, so playoffs, we're, we can't see, we can't show you. Oh, well, we can't, I, I guess we yeah. can't show you. Brackets like this, <laughs> and we got 16 teams total. Notab notable teams that are. This is a playoff. This is not actual. The, the actual. Wait, does he need it back? What? Does he need this back? What? 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 That We're is. using paper. We're using VCRs. Are we using VCRs? Maybe DVDs. DVDs, yeah. All right. <laughs> oh, yeah, sure. So, th sorry? Switch to scene. Oh. Switch back? Yeah. Okay, 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 okay. Okay, we're good, we're good, we're good. We're good. All right. So yeah, we did our best to show you the brackets and uh, some notable players. This is a playoff. This is not at the final of a tournament. We got killers everywhere. 
like the first team, they got Hightani, Boss. Uh -huh. And next team is Moto, the 12 team, Endangered Species. Very well named. And Sorry, yeah. I think I think I switched it to the wrong one. All right, here, I'll just hold it a little well, bit. Well, well, I can't read it then. Yeah. But, Okay, okay. Kind of get the idea, right? <laughs> All right. That's good. All right, so we have... Let me start from the beginning. We have Haitani. We have the 12 team with Moto Bistachio. Bistachio was a winner of the, of the Quad Cup um, in 2000. 12 or 13, I'm sorry, hey, sounds, that sounds familiar, yes. And we got the Oro team, and we've got Yuri, another Yuri in with Shinobu. We've got Match, the number one Goki, he's in the playoffs. Yes. And we've got BBK Yomura Fujiwara, they're in the playoffs. And the Alex team without Genki, Kazuya Sakurada. Ah, and, okay. and we have YSB Hayao, we got Piero, and RX, uh, make third strike great oh. again with Nika KO. And we got another Oro team, Munakata, said to be the best Oro. And we have Higa, said to be the best uh, Ibuki. Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna take a picture of the bracket on Twitter. All right, that's nice. And ooh, Yakun, Yakun is in oh, the playoffs. Oh wow, he's been, okay. And Ushi also a show. They're in the playoffs. And Kuni, he's in the playoffs as well. Yeah, post on Twitter and then and we'll we'll post the link inside. Uh, post the link inside Twitch. And you know what? If I'm not mistaken, of all the names that are listed just right now, only one team, only one team, will be going to the final eight. Yeah. So nine, nine So. Oh, that's brutal. So 15 out of 16 will be dead. Yeah. So now we got new tech, right? We got Twitter. We're tweeting to you as well. Okay. Great. So you guys check out check out the tweet to see the brackets, and they they are in uh, they are in. Wait a second. You get it? Uh, still waiting. Oh my freaking phone is gonna slow down. Careful, uh, care, careful with the language. <laughs> my freaking phone. Uh, is that is that? Is that okay on street? <laughs> Freaking vote. Freaking is okay. Okay. Uh, here we go. There we go. Yeah. Okay. Uh, I will retweet and then I will copy oh. link. Oh. Okay. So it wasn't our copy after all. I oh, know he's updating it. All right. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, yeah. yeah. So, so sorry. Uh, the last spot was not Cooney. He just lost to Chun Li. Shirokuro, Okinawa Chun Li came from far away, but I guess you traveled farther than he did. <laughs> yeah. So everybody check Arlieth and Duralath and all those Twitter accounts yeah, to see the brackets. Uh, uh, she can hook you up too, but just uh, at G, Jeep, Jeep, Jeep. So what do we have? We have the playoffs and then we have the final eight, eventually. Right. So all the teams that you saw, Previously in the stream are mostly dead. Done. They're done. Come come back tomorrow or come back next year. Yep. Next year. Yeah, it's it's just straight up murder at this point. Single elimination, like well, it, it's not truly a single elimination tournament here. It's you know the way that the pools and stuff are uh, are run. Yeah, but even if it, well, but even if it's double elimination, it's the same thing. Like nine nine yeah. nine percent of teams will be dead. It, pretty much. It's not easy. Um, let's see. Some of the matches that seems interesting are. Uh, Remy and Yurian. Probably Piero and RX. I see. And RX does not like playing against Piero. Really? He does not. He does not. But it's Remy. Yeah. Is it, a, is it that bad? Does he know him that well? It's just, it's just, a, it's just boring. Okay, okay. There's not much action, okay. and uh, well, Piero is the type of Remy that goes in, tries to go in a lot, right? Because he, I, I don't know, I don't know if it's by logic or uh, by instinct, I don't know what it is, but uh, he, I think he senses that uh, there is no good in using Remy and staying back, right? Because so just go in. Yeah, he can just throw dishes as much as he wants. Give your opponent meter. Yeah. Right. That's dishes. 
we, yeah, okay. Oh, okay. oh, 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 we get it. Okay, okay. So got it's it, got dishes it, or it. saucers or whatever. Uh, when I went to New York, it was called China. Fine, fine, China. <laughs> okay. So we called right. it China. So, right. Yeah, whatever. So we're in the China. Dishes, China, whatever you like. Okay. So there's no point. You might get a little bit of damage, but but I mean. By pairing those Chinas, I mean, you'll get a lot yeah, of meat. Yeah, exactly. So, so Remy can basically die off of one or two hits. Right. He can, he can get stunned very easily. He has low life. So it's not good for Remy. So I think you would see uh, Piero's Remy dashing in more. All right. So this, yeah, they've been playing for a long time. I think uh, from the uh, 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 Gamers Vision days. Yeah, wow, in Yokohama? Uh, yes. Yeah, I have, I have case, never case. been to uh, Visions. So. But okay. I heard they've been playing for a long time. Yeah. So that's what match I'm looking forward to. Okay. And uh, damn, gamers vision. There is the Ibuki team and Yakun's team. So wait, wait, wait. Yakun's team is Yakun Ko Kenzo yeah. and Issei and Mester and Hiathis. Yeah, that's a little stacked. Wow, they lost. <laughs> oh yeah, that's right. Wow, they lost. I, yeah. It's it, it, it's hard to believe, but they lost. Wow! I remember getting shocked at that too. I can't remember who they went, who uh, beat them in their pull though. And also, the Tetsuzanko team. It's Darren, Orga, El, Ushi, and Sho. This is a uh, Kyushu Okinawa team. Yun, uh -huh. plus the Kanto uh, Kanto Tokyo area Sho. Uh -huh. And they lost. They lost. Wow! Dude, this is a brutal tournament. Yeah, I know it is. You know how brutal this is. I know it is, but uh, you know you got five of the best guys you can yeah. think of. And you're teaming with them, yeah. and you're thinking to yourself, "Okay, I'm gonna body everybody, but just in case I lose, just in case I, I got four guys to back me up." So everybody's right. thinking that way, yeah. and then everybody loses. Wow! How bad that can momentum it be? is? Momentum is really good in this game. Momentum is very, very important, and uh, nowadays uh, you don't see like brand new players, very, very new players at a very high level. It's like the usual guys, like you know. Like the names I mentioned already. Yeah. Are they? I mean, everybody's familiar with them, and so it's more of like a, not like a character versus character, but it's more like a, uh, the human individual versus another individual. It's like a, it's like sure. a person. Psych like psychologically. Yeah. And I so, see. when it when it comes to playoffs, uh -huh. meta means a lot. Right. Because let's so like for example, you got Yakun Kenzo, Issei, Mester, and Hiyathis. Who's gonna come? Right. And you don't know, like you don't know who's gonna be first either. Oh, no, it, it, or, I don't. Or is it declared who's the first? But you don't know who's gonna be second. No, I think I think it's I think I think it's one guy, right? Oh, for this time. Oh, one actually, guy. we don't. Oh, it's right. You still playoffs. I forgot. It's one guy. Okay. So, one guy out of the five will be coming, and right. who's it gonna be? So you have to make a guess first of all. Ah, uh, is it blind pick? Ah, uh, yes. You, your opponent will know. They they do know. No, they don't. Know. They, don't know. they don't know. That is blind pick. Yeah. They're blind yeah, pick. Yeah. yeah. So, um. Yeah, it's decision, decisions. So you got Higa's team. People think Higa's the best in, best in Japan, and he's said to be the best. But the reality is, he hasn't been playing. Sure. He hasn't been playing. And when you don't play, your defense skill get rotten. Because you, you can't block, you can't attack. And Ibuki. Oh, we have and, updates. We have and updates. Ibuki being a low life character. She can die pretty easily. Right. Can't, she can only make two mistakes and she's dead. Yeah, so you can't say like, okay, okay, back off, back off. Let me just catch my breath. Right. Or anything like that. You'll be dead by then. Okay. And it's just one game. See? So you got to make a guess who's, who's going to come up. All right. And uh, it requires a little bit of luck, I guess. But it's going to be hard. I think all the, all the matches will be on stream, I guess. Oh, from here on out? I think so. Oh, that'll be good. I think so. But well, maybe they might... Uh, wait, wait, wait. I'm sorry. Uh, maybe they might use two caps. But okay, but then it's, so they might alternate between one and two. Yeah. Uh, okay. We are not, we are not on schedule. I'm sorry. Oh. Okay. So there's gonna be an announcement from Kokujin, I guess. Playoff B. All right, let's do this. Okay, so we are using. Oh. We are using two caps. So this is uh, Boko 12 from oh. Northern Japan, Tohoku area. All and right. we have, uh, what's that, Boss? I think, it's, I think it's Boss, right? Oh. Okay, okay, so, yes, this is Boss. This is Boss versus Boko. Makoto 12, people think it's bad. It's not that good, but Boko is a very, very 
experienced skill 12, so you might, you don't know what's going to happen. Uh-huh. So 12 needs a knockdown, needs a cross-up oh. roundhouse. Ah, Not going to happen in this round. The boss says he doesn't, he doesn't care? Yes, a 12 team has made it this far in the tournament. Well, they lost. They lost to the New York team. <laughs> sure, but they still made it this far. At least they won. Yeah, they, they've won matches. They've been winning matches. Ooh. Wow, good punish. Good proper decision making. <laughs> I like that word, by the way. Woo! Good eye. Oy. That's a good punish up, by the way. That is a lot of damage. Cross up. Oh, no, a nice block. Oh. Oh no! Uh, wait, but what, how much damage see, did he do? See, that's the sad part about 12. He, he has no conversions. He has no good punish. Can he do oh, it? Yep. Makoto. What did he do? Oh my, that's... Just kind of like bulldoze over 12, but he... I think 12 did his best, and yeah. uh, he has some chances. But the sad thing about 12 is that he doesn't even have a good punish when he doesn't have meter. Yeah, so exactly. we just saw that. So this is match. You with the demon. Oh. Who's this? I wonder who this is Dudley. Match on Yomoda. Yomoda. Okay. Oh, you know everyone's colors. Yomoda. Oh, no, no, no. They got. We got a circle. Oh, oh they have a circle. Ah. And Yomoda, okay. my teammate for tomorrow. Oh, nice. Good luck. Overhead super. Uh -oh. Two, oh, more, two more. Two more. Two more. Oh. He had a punisher up there. Yeah. It doesn't matter how like how unsafe or optimal. If your opponent isn't expecting it, it might work. It might work. It might work. <laughs> Two more hits, two more hits. Oh. Two more hits, two more hits. One more hit from Goki, two more hits from Dudley. <laughs> Let's go! Let's go! Oh. 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 May I even say it once again? He's my teammate. By the way, we played him. I played him in the first round pool today. Oh, we lost 5-4. Holy crap. And the other team, it was uh, the Chobi team, we won 5-4. It took the longest. Our 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 matches were the longest by far. We were the only ones playing. So, okay, we've got next Sakurada. Alex, yes, he's seated right there. And we have uh, Yahoo. And it is said that Alex Hugo is not really good for Hugo. Yeah. Yeah, why are we getting switched? Oh, is that Hayao? This is Hayao. Oh! Oh! Hogan versus Andre! WrestleMania! I don't know what's so bad about Hugo in this matchup, but oh, I heard it, it is pretty bad. Wow. Hugo throws, I got the off throw. We saw heat splash right there. Wow, good out of here. See, the roundhouse we've been talking about. Sakura is sniping the roundhouse. Bullet club! I'm sorry, that's not Hulk anymore, it's Kenny Omega. <laughs> it's just Kenny Omega. So, so move. Hayao wants to play a little bit slow. He's got the meter now, he doesn't mind anything now. Actual air meter speaker for you. But this is round two. He's in a roll. He would like to build meter for the next round. Yes, he's doing it now. Oh, Eight squash up for the KO. <laughs> and, he, and he stares at the camera. Jesus. I mean, yeah, we, we want both of them to win, right? Yeah. Well, he, hey, it's always a shame that only one of these guys can complete can yeah, dance. 15 out of the 16 die here. But hell, what a what a free match. Wow, good punish. I'm oh, sorry, good good conversion right there. Batista ball. Batista ball. Good, good, good way punish with the jab. Uh, oh, wait, oh, he's got the did I get the EX? EX. The EX right now. He's not going to die with Genius. Oh. The same situation. Oh. 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 Got the last pistol. Oh. Oh. Sakurada. Clutch oh. win. It beats Hayao. So I'm sorry, Street Hayao is out. That was a good fight. Wow. Who do you got? Who do you got? 
Three third strike caps. It's it's, it's, it's kind of strange because all of these like flashy new games are surrounding third strike. <laughs> right. And you've got a bench to sit on like the like owner was like like. Sorry. Okay, so it's. Oh. Alex. Now. No, it's Sakurada versus. Oh, uh, lost. So Yomoto lost already. Oh. Oh man. So wait, Boss versus Sak yes, Sakurada? Yes, this is the semi this is semifinals. Hey! Oh my god. We're already at semifinals? Hey! Semifinals already. Up, Damn, up this the is Good meeting. Oh, it's time to combo that, that link. Uh-oh. So they're using SA1 in this matchup. Uh, most people use one, yeah. Okay. Because Alex is stuck with one hit. Guaranteed throw. Powerball. It's been working. Another powerball. Good back jump. Wow! Ooh! Good! Got a super ready. Get tense! Oh, and SD Jeff goes short! It's a super Z favorite! Wow! 
Not that many can do that. Ballsy. Not many can do that. That was ballsy. You're basically responsible for all your teammates. Oh. Uh oh. Okay, that happened. Ooh. Two boots. Oh, wow, good, good yeah. reaction. That's so tricky too, because the jumping right now actually doesn't have a whole lot of active frames. Nope. Oh, that's the strength of Makoto. Oh, so nice. Powerball working again. He needs two more reads to get the sun. He doesn't have a punch right there, but Makoto doing work. One more hit. One more hit to do. And he's really tricky to the timings of the jump around house. Low short. Oh, oh, accidental. Oh, it's not going to catch. Oh, oh, he's so caught him. Powerbomb. What do you think? That totally should not have happened. None of that should have happened. By the way, by the way, this, this is high level place, right? By the way, uh, that power bomb at the end of the Boomerang Raid, yeah, it builds meter. On this? On this? Yeah, j just what we saw. Oh it my! It builds meter. What? Maybe it's first in OE, but it does build meter. I don't think it is. I think it was intentional. Oh, RS at Shiro Kuro, right? Okay, now what you'll leave. Now this, I would like a little more real yet, but... Cool. Okay. But it, since the game from far away... Yeah. You could give it a win if you like. <laughs> but the Urian team has been complaining a lot that no Urian teams are uh, showing up in the top 8 for free for... Uh, maybe never. Ever. Wow. Interesting. Oh. Nice, nice back there. Nice, good punish. Uh -oh. Ouch. Oh. Might be done. He didn't have meter. See, I like it. I like it backing off. I like to turn me backing off. He's like, you come to me. Fine. Yeah. Like, why chase him into the corner? Yeah, you come. You come to me. Why chase him into the corner and then get set up with his baking room? Oh. There it is. RX is out. So we will not be seeing the Yurian team in top eight. I'm responsible for that all, also. <laughs> so, it's gonna be, uh, who was on the left side? It's uh, Boss, right? It's Boss Makoto and Shiro Kuro Chung Lee. Yeah. Boss to Shiro Kuro. Ah, okay. Up here, and down here. Ah, okay. So, the winner of this secures the place in top eight final tournament. But, you know how they, you know how they choose the brackets? No. You kind of, Oh, do you you pick him out of a hat? Um, yeah, you pick him. Yeah, you pick him out of a hat, and then the number does not indicate where you are in the bracket. The number gives you the order to place your team and wherever available in the bracket. You get a pick. You can pick. So what? Is, so this is a originally uh, we call it the K1 style because K1 is kind of was this kind of a like a martial arts kind of oh, festival yeah, yeah, game. Yeah, yeah. And, it's martial arts. Yeah. Yeah, and so K1 kind of like a. Oh shit. K1 kind of like a, was the first ones to like uh, use that kind of uh, picking. Uh -huh. So the, the team that uh, the winner of this team will not get to choose from the pick, from the from the hat. So they will be like placed in the corner, and the other teams that will be picking and uh, will place their team in wherever an open bracket in order. So the seventh guy will not have a, will not have a choice. Nice. So if you think this team is free, you go right next to it. Right. So it's, it, it's pretty hot. It's strategic there. Okay. It's, it's pretty hot. So the winner of this advances to top eight, if I'm not mistaken. Boss and Shirokuro. So what do you think, Tom? You think Makoto Mako can do this? Well, it's boss. It's boss, yeah. It's not Makoto, it's boss, right? It's boss. Okay. It's not Makoto anyway, it's just boss. Well, it's Chun-Li. But it's boss. Okay. Chun-Li doing well so far. Red parry to punish. Oh, that card throw is so nasty. If you're mid-screen, wow. If you're mid-screen, you can try to oh, you can try yeah. to so, so basically, this round, Shirokuro made no mistake at all. Right. No mistake. So yeah, sometimes I'll try to use a neutral roundhouse in order to climb up out of backwards. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. But that's, if it misses, you're screwed. Kinda. Oh, hey, he went too greedy. He uses two, spent two, two years. Just, wow. What, what's he gonna do? Whoa. Overhead whiff. Oh, Meaty back face. One more hit, one more hit! No. There is no boss factor, there is no X factor in this game. This is a legit game. Yes. 
Wow, 4,000 people joining the stream. Thank you for tuning in. And so, playoffs should be over, I think. Right. I think it's over. So, as I said, people, Hi Tiny Boss out, Moto out, Match out, uh, BBK Yomoda out, Huju are out, Kazuya out, Sakura out, YSB Hayao gone. So many good teams are Piero Take gone, RX gone, Frankie 3S gone, Murakata gone, Ringo Higa gone, Yakun Kenzo Issei Master gone. Wow. Ushi Show gone. <laughs> that that Yun team is gone. The well, winner is Shiro Kuro. Congrats to him. Yeah. Now, to secure a place in the top eight, final top eight. And it used to be final 16 in 2000. Uh, 13 or 14, I forget which, but I was in top 16. I was teaming with RX at that time. Yeah, so we're friends after all. So, I have a question. So, I, uh, I was looking at graphs of the uh, participation in Cooperation Cup uh -huh. over the years. And there's a huge jump between 2013 and 2014. Uh, probably they changed the venue, I think. Or uh, maybe, or maybe at that time, uh, online edition uh, was very, very active. Because okay. online, although, I'm not complaining, I'm just telling the truth, although that is not a very, very good port, online edition, it is still playable. Yeah. Some people still play it online because that, because they don't have any arcades close to them, and your, and your phone is running out of battery. <laughs> All right. And so, yeah, um, online, I think, had an important role in the Third Strike scene. It helped people come back. Interesting. Okay. So it, so it, did, it did good. It did it, some good. It did good. So there were teams, there were, there are actually um, online teams also this year. They did have it last year as well. Two years ago, they did have it. So they would have like the letters OE somewhere in the team, uh, usually. I see. So it's like, it. you know. Like the hell at OE. Yeah, or something like that. Right. So, you know, Japan's a small country. It doesn't have any, any different time zones. So when you're living in Tokyo, it's 11.30 at night. It's so everyone is playing. Yeah, everyone is 11.30 yeah. in Japan. Everyone's playing. Right. So uh, it was a thing, actually. Okay. It was a thing, and uh, it was said that Xbox 360 version was better than PS3, so a lot of people stick to that one. I agree. I oh, actually agree. Yes. Although the PS3 version was free, they did not have to pay for the license or anything. It was just better on Xbox. Yes. And so a lot of people played. Like, Mimora played. Uh, Hayao play. Uh, and th I mean, this is what you can do after midnight, after the train stop running, yeah. after the arcades close. Or uh, yeah, or like you didn't have any time no, to no, go to the arcade. I have a question for you. Okay. Have you heard of the legend of UFC Jim? Yes, I've met him a couple of times. So, met him meaning I've never played him. Right. Of course, no one ever I played, played him. him. But you encounter UFC. I Jim. did. I did. I did. Okay. So there's never a Japanese version of UFC Jim. You just ran into UFC Jim. Even well, in Japan. Yeah. I mean, that's like, amazing. I mean, like, what is he? What is he? Where we is he? We don't know. Okay. We, we know there's a person behind it. And if I ever see that, if I ever see and find out who UFC Jin is, I might commit a couple felonies. <laughs> but I was just wondering. I, like, I, I didn't think that uh, their account would actually be able to uh, t to disrupt um, the gameplay over in Japan as well. So you should give out a brief explanation of what UFC Gym is. I, I think everyone watching here okay. they, just, they should know. knows what UFC Gym All is. All right, so UFC Gym. <laughs> yeah, um, I mean, like the first encounter, I didn't know what was happening. Right, you're just like, are they, are they there? Uh, yeah, I, I pushed my green button <laughs> on my Xbox, <laughs> and then I was waiting for him to push it. Oh, right. maybe it's not a him. But I was waiting you for the UFC gym to push it. Right. And I was waiting there. And he didn't push it. He wasn't pushing it. So I thought, okay, maybe he went to the gents or the ladies or whatever. Yeah. I was waiting. I was waiting. <laughs> I was like, all right. So what's happening here? And I didn't know. So I asked my friends, hey, did you ever meet this guy UFC gym? And everybody was like, yeah. <laughs> Even in Japan. Wow. And we were all like, yeah, he doesn't play, right? No, he doesn't play, he doesn't play. So, right. <laughs> Legend of UFC Jim. I don't know if he's still there. Uh, no, no, I think they can't go. Eventually banned. Okay. Eventually. But so, it took a couple years. So, yeah, um, get back to my story. I mean, Xbox 360 was quite active. Like, I played, Kazoo eventually played, 
and uh, Matsuda, uh, SPO winner, he's still playing. Uh -huh. And uh, who else? Macho Banana, he's not here, but Kyushu Chun Li. He plays all, he always plays. I think he's going to be here tomorrow, but um, he's the winner of Quad Cup 2012 or 11, I think. And so a lot of uh, big names uh, played in, played in uh, OE. It, was, it wasn't that bad, it was actually pretty good. Because, you know, a lot of people say the Japanese internet is really good. Yeah, it's all fiber based. It is light fiber based. Yeah. So, uh, yeah, I mean, there's no reason not to play, right? Yeah. Hey, but I also feel like uh, a lot of Japanese games uh, that are developed, the netcode does not really have to take into account uh, a whole lot of latency, a whole lot of jitter, and everything because the quality is so good. And then you, you bring that, that game over to America, and it's just like, uh, uh, yeah. Uh, I heard it's not that good in yeah. the States. Hey, it's, it's a lot sketchier in the States. <laughs> And you, and you got time zones, right? Yeah, so, and we have time zones. Yeah, it's, it's yeah. a big country. It is. So yeah, um, I don't know if it's that active right now. I don't think it is now. But um, yeah, people can still start with OE. Like I said, OE in Japan is not that bad. Yeah. And, it's still get, and it's still getting played right now, even, even today. Man, well, mostly on Xbox. You know, it's like you have, you have like less people, so there's less traffic. <laughs> Less traffic, True. better gameplay. Yeah. It's also bike as well. Alright. I think we're going to be starting. Uh, no, I think we're taking a break right now. But oh, we're doing the break? Okay. Well, are, we allowed to, are we allowed to talk about fight game? Yeah. Okay. I mean... Yeah. Capcom's not in the back. Okay. Okay. <laughs> proof, proof, proof. Shout out to fight yeah. We're all like, looking at the sponsors. <laughs> So fight game, basically, I've tried it before, and uh, you know that's an, that's an emulator, right? Mm -hmm. Basically, so yeah. you're not you don't, you have no worries about the big game being a, like a bad port or anything. Yeah. So it's basically the game itself. It's emulated. Yeah. Yeah. yeah the question is like, can your system run it well enough? So OE, although it was patched multiple number of times, it still had its flaws and its you know yes issues. Uh, you, uh, actually, what are uh, for for the viewers, so do you have any examples of okay. Okay. okay, I've got a lot. Okay, <laughs> I've got a lot. Sure. Number one, probably the most famous. Scaling is different. Damage scaling. Damage scaling. Ah, okay, okay. Damage scaling is different, and uh, the most famous example is the Zen Potential Command Grab really? during Gen Asian. Okay. It before it was passed, it used to do massive damage. It was unscaled. Wow, because what isn't it supposed to be? I think somewhere around forty percent. Uh, yeah, scaling? I think you're right. Yeah, I, I don't know the exact numbers, but it was not, it was um, not scaled. Right. So Yun was top tier, got tier. That's ridiculous. That is ridiculous. Okay. So it's like you know, you know the you know the basic tactics of the game. When they activate, when they're in your face, you block low. Yeah. And then you know you wait for the command grab. Okay, you grab me, fine. Yeah, but the damage gets scaled, so no yeah. big whoop. Whoa. Yeah. But then now you're sitting back. You're, you're, you're holding down back. Yeah. They grab you, and you lose 40% life. It's like, what the? Right? Yeah. Right? So they fixed that, kind of. Kind of. Okay. Kind of. But still, it's not fixed completely. Right. So the scaling for Gaijin is pretty bad. Okay. And uh, another funny story is that they have this Nesica version. You know about uh, the yeah, yeah. Nesica, right? Uh -huh. the, like the beta version of Nesica, uh -huh. it didn't scale as well. Oh my god. So yeah, um, as a development moved on, they kind of tried to manage how to scale it. And probably they copied a lot of the codes from the OE to uh, the Nesica version. That would explain a lot. So um, Nesica version, they kind of had their own development as well. Uh -huh. But it's kind of like a mixture of the uh, OE and Arcade, I think. Okay. I think. I do not know, I do not know exactly what it is, but uh, of course, it's not like the uh, direct port of anything. Right. So yeah, uh, others. Um, stun. Uh huh. Uh, meter building and combos. Yes. Uh huh. Uh, they are slightly different from o arcade. Okay. So, you know, I made combos. I make a lot of combo games. Maybe you might not know. Sure. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Yeah, maybe you might not. Maybe know. I don't know. I've never. I've never, I didn't even know you made combo bits. Okay, I made G. combo bits. Sorry, really? uh, if you don't know, go to YouTube RKF eighty one ninety one whatever. So, you know, I tried them out both in uh, uh, OE and in Fight K or like the uh, Final Burn or whatever. Yes. So, and I tried them out in both get both formats, and then the result, the outcome is not always the same. Mm. There are some certain combos or setups that only works 
in like OE or only works in uh, 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 the arcade. It's arc okay. arcade. So, so it wasn't just a damage difference. They just did not work or did work. Somehow they have this kind of new logic or stereo, whatever. For like the collision yeah, well and the... Our God knows what. I don't know, but wow. uh, as you said, damage is different. Uh -huh. uh, meter building is different. Meter, I say, I should rather say it's like meter like recollecting during a combo, like uh, when you yes. juggle. Yes. So that is different, and uh, the stun is also different. So uh, if I'm not mistaken, um, OE does more stun, I think. Wow. So there's like a certain setup you do with your EN. It's like a launch into whatever, into whatever, and then like launch again, and then EX headbutt for the stun, but it does not work in the arcade. So I don't know if you're going to call it a major or a minor difference, but there are differences Okay. Uh, between the two. And But if you only well, have... And the material differences, they're not cosmetic at all. Oh, yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. 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 These, are, these are mechanical differences in the game. Mm -hmm. All right. So I, I heard that um, in order to like make a good port mm -hmm. from like arcade to whatever, any console, it, c it can be like Third Strike, it could be like any like shoot ups or anything. I've heard that um, if the CPU of the board, main board, the CPS3, no, uh, the CPU itself. Okay. The CPU itself, like like in the PCs. Yes. If the CPUs have like a different brand or anything, I heard that the, the port porting is very very difficult uh. because what it is is that um, if the CPUs are the same, basically you can use the same code. Yes. For example, but it's interpreted differently. So yeah. Um, that's what I heard. I've never like experienced it myself because I don't okay. I don't make games. But uh, so probably I'm guessing they had to make OE from scratch, or use the code uh, from uh, material from PS2 version. Ah oh, right. Because right. Dreamcast came out first, and then PS2 version came out late next. Did the PS2 version have system direction? They did. Every, okay. Every because, console did. Because uh, in OE, somebody accidentally stumbled into like there was a glitch that happened, and then oh? he stumbled into the system direction. A menu, which was not really supposed to be there, but it looked, but it basically implied that it was a code port of one of those earlier uh -huh. versions. Yeah, but I heard from a friend of mine. I I never accounted this, but uh, yeah, he said there was a glitch in the OE version of Xbox 360. Uh -huh. The exact same glitch happened in PS2 version, which uh -huh. is like he told me that like when he was playing the CPU, uh huh. He went to the second guy, a second opponent, and then he did some kind of, some kind of, I don't know what it is, but whatever he does, he said the uh, score resets to zero. So it, so it doesn't hurt you. Sure. It doesn't hurt you, but he, he told me about that, and he tried the exact same thing on Xbox. And, and he happened. said it happened. Wow. So basically, I think it's PS2, it's copied into Xbox. Interesting. So, wow. okay. Of course, it's not the best way. Of course, you're gonna play. We're gonna have tournaments in arcade. Uh huh. So, but console gives you a lot of help. I want to encourage a lot of people to play a lot more console mm. and um, practice because practice makes perfect. Not only practice makes perfect, but uh, all the players that you've seen so far on stream, they practice a lot. <laughs> okay. A lot. I tell you, they practice a lot. It took them a lot of time and effort to get here, to even get to the playoffs, and they even lost, and, and still you lose. Yeah, 18 years later, playing <laughs> this game. So there's a reason that uh, this game has been played for such a long time. Mm -hmm. One is that uh, it's a good game. It is. It is a good game, and the pairing itself is very, very addicting. You like it, right? It's so there's this concept uh, socially called uh, agency, right? Okay. It's like the the, the feeling of having control over, your, over yourself, your own destiny, like what you want to do, right? And Perry gives you that. Uh -huh. like you never feel trapped. Like you always feel like you have options. Uh huh. Oh, now we have mood lighting. Well, we're like, you feel like you trapped your opponent, rather. Yeah. So, so okay. Yeah, it is a very addicting feeling. Yes, it is a very And uh, the truth is, uh, it is an addicting feeling, so people just get like, you know, crave for that feeling. Right. And on the other hand, People quit because of because of that pairing, right? Because it does seem silly. It does seem like stupid at times. So it made a lot of people play. It made a lot of people stick to this game, but it also made a lot of people quit. Right. So that's it's very the reality. Polarizing. Yeah. It it's, is. it's a community. It is. It is. Okay. So some people, some of the names, I think you know, I'm not gonna mention any. It's like the pro gamers and stuff. Some of them say they don't like it or strike. Mm. See. But look, <coughs> look what we're seeing now. We're having an English stream for the first time ever, and we are having 37 view 3,700 viewers. Wow. And we are currently waiting for the top eight. 
we are going to have an entrance ceremony using that red carpet. <laughs> wow, they really did roll out the red carpet. So uh, I think we're not really on time, on schedule. So wait a second, let me check. This is a Japanese tournament. It should run on time. That's <laughs> true. Okay, well I'm Japanese. <laughs> I was told not to, not to. Yeah, uh, uh, now stop. <laughs> So wait, let me... So, all right, so the top eight is shown right now, so we should switch. Uh-huh. Nice. So here's who we got. Shiro Hedy, White Snake, Ikeyama, Tamu, Yoshihara, Yoshihara, the, the, the illustrator, oh, Sugiyama, yeah. and Bacchus, Necro Team. Uh, I need to grab some. Okay. And we have Kur Kuroobi, Kuroobi, Tominaga, Mimura, Chance, Luka, and Shibu. Shibu, good friend of mine. Uh -huh. And Okuni, I, I, have, I do not know how to read this team. But we have Rikimaru, Mochi Oru, Pearl Ice, and Tarokichi. And Shuka Tenjitsu, this is a Yang team. And Roshi Hikari is absent because of his flu. So they only got four guys, but they made it up here. Ken Masters, Hirai, Deshikan, Shie, Matsuken, Kosei. And we have a Q team. Wow. Ben Toya, he's a good friend of mine. We live very close by. TN, Masa, Kasuku, and out. Wow. And we have Pizza, Pizza Beast. Pizza <laughs> Beast. That's that's Lori, Kokuji and Ike, Hirahata and Gunfight, who was on the mic earlier today. Yes. And we have Yamazaki, Haruno Kopan Matsuri. This is the Chun Li team. So we have two Chuns, one Dudley, one Yang, one Necro, one Ken, and one Q. Whoa! A Q team A made Q it. A Q team made it. Wow! Holy crap! So, I mean, this is the, like the best part about today <laughs> is that uh, all the uh, so-called like rare characters gather and they make a team and they make it to top eight. Wow. Yeah, how, like when else do you actually see a Q make it to top eight? Never. Literally. Never. Literally. Never. 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 I don't think they have made top eight ever. And so, yeah. So like I said, uh, bento yas are ridiculous though. Bento yai body melt with all the time. <laughs> cop, we, cop, we play bragging. the same arcade. <laughs> I know. Play spot big one, which is an awesome arcade. If you if you have the time, if you're ever in Tokyo and you have the time to come out to Saitama, definitely, definitely go to play spot big one. Play spot big one second. Amazing. Play spot second. Yes, it's a godlike environment. And if you contact me, I will show you around actually. So please. Please make some spare time when you come over to Japan at this time. I will try to show you around if you want, if you have, if you're interested. And so, um, when does it? When was this supposed to start? Are we on schedule or not? I just want to know. Nope. I don't know. Sorry. Uh, sorry, stream. Womp womp. Oh, we have a schedule here. All right. Nice. Okay, we're 10 minutes late. <laughs> wow, that's an eternity. And you know what? It's partially our fault because my team in first round, first round. Pool, oh yeah, that's right. The three-way playoff. That was four-five, five-four, and then playoffs. That wow. was ridiculous. So we have that. All, we have that everywhere. Yeah. Yes, come over. Come over to Japan. Play, that was, that play at Cock Up. I was talking with Nika Ko earlier. That I know it is a hard. Was, uh, it, it will be a tall order because you had to uh, find four buddies, reliable, yeah, it is. good friends, and come over to Japan at this time. So it's not easy, but I hope you guys come because I, I thought, I talked to him directly, but I thought Nika Keo would never be coming. But he ended up coming this year. Nice. I'm glad he did. I'm glad he finally did. Yeah, I'm glad he did. Set to be the best, best American player right now. What do you think? You know? What? He is pretty damn good right He's now. He's pretty damn good. Yep. He's so I thought it was either uh, Mika or uh, uh, Yuki. Right. But right. Yuki is, I guess, semi-retired right now. Kind of. Kind of. Yeah. He might get back. Yeah. I, I mean, like, between the two of them, I would say Yuki has an edge. But 
like right now, active players, uh, yeah, I'll give Deloitte. Yes, I like um, how much time and effort he's putting in the third strike. Not only playing by himself, but like streaming and uh, hosting events and all yes. everything. Yeah. So yeah, everybody should like should have like helped him come over, but he came by himself this year. So nice. And yeah, we have we're not gonna we don't we don't have him in the top eight because they use Ken. We <laughs> can't even use Yang. <laughs> So team number four, the Yang team, uh, they defeated uh, uh, the New York team in second round. Right. God, that's such a stacked team also. So what do you think? Top eight teams, we got Chun Chun, Dudley Q, Ken, Necro, Makoto, and Yang. What do you think? Durla, start from you, what do you think? Uh, I love the character diversity that we're seeing right now. Uh, if I'm gonna put, if I'm gonna pick favorites, I don't want a Chun team to win. Uh -huh. I'd love to see either Tominaga's uh, Makoto team or the uh, Kokujin Dudley team to win. All I would right. love to see those guys take it. How about you, Tom? Um, I would put uh, my first pick for this to win, not my favorite, but my first pick to win would be the Yang team. Okay. Uh, then probably the Chun, like one of the two Chun teams, and then uh, and then Tominaga's Makoto team. Okay. But Tominaga factor is strong. Okay. Uh, incredibly strong. So who knows what's going to happen? Okay. Well, I, what I think is that the black belt. Uh, Kuro Obi, the Makoto team, yeah. they won twice. That's, yeah, that's they true. won twice. Yeah. yeah, we want something fresh, right? <laughs> so I don't mind them going to the finals, but Breaking they don't... I mean, if, if the Necro team somehow won or the Q team somehow won, like, I I don't know what I would do. Okay, well, I don't think Q's going to win, I'm sorry. But uh, Makoto has a chance. Yes. But I, I don't want to see the same winner three times. And you know what? Chun-Li hasn't won this for the past three years, or four that years. Is, that is amazing. After the Ghidorahs, uh, when Ricky Mara wasn't playing, it was MOV and Nuki that played. It was two years ago, 2015, and they were playing the playoffs, and they had the team captain format, uh, and first player, MOV, he went one and one, so it went to the second round. Uh, and then that. Nuki played, he went one and one. So he went one on one. Yeah. And they ran out of players, actually. What? So they were out. And Mochi's team and the Goki team were in the same playoffs. Uh -huh. And eventually the Chun Li team advanced. So the the two uh, Ghidorahs are th their team's name was um, Dual Head Dragon at that uh, time. Oh, Dual Head, okay. Dual head. It's not Two Head, it's Dual Head. Okay. It is uh, from the Final Fantasy III originally. Uh. So now I think we're about to. Not start, but we're having the entrance ceremony. Right. And, and so yeah, as I was saying, I don't mind Chun Li winning now. Mochi's a good friend of mine. I'm, te I'm teaming with him tomorrow. There you go. It's gonna be. I I'm excited for this top eight. So we'll cut to it as soon as we get the camera on there. It's gonna be. Yep. There we go. It's gonna be one heck of a, one heck of a top eight, man. I'm I'm really excited for this. <laughs> well, we don't have Alice or Yuri and either. All right, so our characters can't make it. Yeah, we suck. We, we had no, we had a, a lot of support in the chat saying you know, they kind of sad they didn't see a Urian team make it. So uh, yeah, Urians don't make it to top eight. Right. I don't know why. I think uh, a lot of the a, a lot of the allure from uh, Urian from Urian players are starting to play a little better defense. Uh, they're starting to figure him out a little more, and I feel that maybe he might not be you know as previously strong as he's seen but you know still Yurian's just such a sick character altogether agreed 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 so so entrance ceremony there starting there we go Elena's team Elena's team Tominaga I love that outfit that's amazing <laughs> so we don't Shibu Shibu we always go up to dinner. Right. <laughs> we play at the same arcade. <laughs> Take him home, drive him home. Yes. Oh, that's such a good team. Do we have the final eight or not? Do we have... Oh, oh. wait, 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 wait. I can figure it out, I think. Okay. Somehow. <laughs> so there this team, uh, with a little bit of change of members every year, Basically, Chance, uh, Mimora, and Tony Naga are stable, but right. the other two, uh, they've been changing. They've been changing a lot, and uh, but still, they managed to make it to top eight already. And Shibu, good friend of mine, he is very solid. I want to see. I want to see. I want to see him play a lot more. Uh -huh. But we'll see. I'll see. As I was mentioning, so right. they are. Seems like they're number one. 
so they get to oh wait, wait wait i'm sorry about the playoffs my bad so the, so the winner of the playoffs i think also gets to choose their position in the bracket right so the kodo team will be placing them their team at the upper right hand corner kuro obi okay so a li would that be the third match that gets played then I uh, mean, it, it should be it should, it should be, be. So that gives them a little time, the way I see it, it gives them a little time to kind of scout the first couple matches. And of course, when they're the first ones that get to play, now they've dictated who wants to play. Uh -huh, do they, uh -huh, does anybody uh -huh. want to avoid them or do they want to yes, really yes, find yes. the tournament so, back? So now this is pretty exciting, so let's see. Because um, Sugiyama, Sugiyama uh, loves playing Chun-Li. Oh yeah, you're right, you're right. And there's two teams, two chun teams. And Sugiyama, if he was like facing his team a little bit later, after he sees one Chun Li team in the bracket, he would have definitely chosen chose right next to them. Easily. But, but, as we see, we don't have any Chuns yet. Yet. Yeah. So let's see. Uh, now I do wonder though, if Sugiyama's team is placing, do the Chun teams avoid him? Do they? That's do they a good point. That's yeah. a good point. No, that's the that's the fun part about this. Yes. So yes, I, I'm sure they will be avoiding Makoto. Right. Do they go? Yeah, they're pointing at the opposite end of yep, the bracket. Yep, 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 Complete. Yep. So Necro doesn't mind playing Q. Right. Necro doesn't mind playing Q. So there it is. White Snake. She don't hit me. White Snake. Oh. All right. So yeah, it's. Uh, I'm so I'm so glad now that I get to explain to all you 3,700 of you watching right now of what's going on. Right. Because previously there was no English explanation, so we would see this on camera. Uh, everybody would be like, hey, what, what are they doing? Right. But now, I'm really glad I get to, I get to like explain. Oh, what is this? This is... Oh, TMC. <laughs> oh. Wow. Ventoya. The, the surprise, the surprise top eight of Qualifier. Q team. A lot of people have been waiting for this, and many thought this would not happen, but it did now. Right. All right, getting those team photos ready. So I wonder, where are they going to get? They have a uh, Makoto team and a Necro team available, so I'm sure they're going to be avoiding. But avoiding them, Todd, the BA. Yes. 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 yes, yes, five of them. That is beautiful. I mean, three times is enough, they got five. They got five right there. Look at the defense. <laughs> All right. You think they'll see themselves in... I don't know. It's interesting. Oh, wait, wait, wait. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Yeah, the chun -Li team cannot pick. I'm sorry. On the lower right-hand corner, the chun -Li team that oh, came through right. in the playoffs, they cannot, they cannot pick their own position. Okay. So like I said, I'm sorry. Correct myself once again. So yes, they can avoid Makoto. They can avoid Necro. They can avoid Chun. Right. But, it, but so they've got Ken, Yang. Oh. Yeah, that's fine. Because they've avoided, they've avoided the somebody on the team. They've avoided Necro and they avoid one Chun. So they've got chances against what? Chun, Ken, and Yang then. And uh, Yang would not like to play Q. That's I agree completely. Yang would not like to play Q. So, so I, I I wonder who's coming next. Let's see. Who's it gonna be? Isn't this fun? This is amazing. This is amazing I, right? I, I like the way this is done. Ken Masters! Ken Masters! Inari, last year's day two winner! Alright, here we go. What do you think? Alright. Ma 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 Ken doesn't like Q. He doesn't like Q. He doesn't like Q. He doesn't like Q. He doesn't like Q. And he doesn't like playing an STM. Uh, okay, so not Q. Definitely not Q. I mean... And Ken Necro isn't easy. It's not easy. It's not easy. Some people, I heard recently, some people say it might be a Necro's favorite. You know, they could go up against... I wonder, do you take a chance and play the, the Chun team in the 8th seed? Because you know what, that Chun team might be a little tired. They've been playing longer than everybody else. Yes, but Deshi Ken is a Kyushu player, and oh. that team is a Kyushu team. Oh. So you would not want to play your homie. Right. Oh, a very, very great insight. Let's see. So? So what's it going to be? What is it going to be? What do you think? Q? Oh, look at that. Look at that expression uh. on his face. It's, it's like, it, 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 this is exactly pick your poison. Right. <laughs> exactly. Hemlock or... Yeah. Hemlock, cyanide, I don't know, what it, whatever it is, ricin. They should have some kind of chest block or something to right. give them a time limit to think. I agree, like because, one minute. Yeah, because they can think for five minutes and still come out, not come out with a conclusion. Right. I think at this point... I'm trying to read his lips, but I don't know what he's saying. So... 
By the way, folks, if you're wondering who or helped organize the English stream, shout outs to Z over here. He is in the chat as well. Please give him a, a huge shout out. Thank you for organizing the English stream for Thank you for having Chicago. me. Yep. All right, so. Pleasure to be commenting with you, Jerla. Thank you, RKF. All right, so here we'll open the placing. Oh, he picked Necro. Necro. He picked Necro. Oh. This is interesting. Yeah. I thought they would go for Q, but they didn't. They went to Necro. No, I think the defense on that Q team is a little daunting. <laughs> I think you could still fight Necro. It's going to be a slugfest, but I think yeah. well, best thoughts. Yeah, no, but basically this is saying, oh, Necro, you're free. Oh, oh Necro, you're free. So here we go. Oh, the Dudley team. That's my gunfight. Gunfight. <laughs> They've either oh, 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 oh. the future beast himself. Well, think he's showing his charisma. Yes, yes, yes. Yes, yes. Yes, thank you. <laughs> Call me Zeus. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm thinking if Necro space is available, uh -huh. Dudley would have jumped into Necro. I agree. But since Necro is no longer available, they would not want to play Makoto. I, I agree. I was going to say they should pick Makoto team. No, they would not like Oh, they not. Oh, really? So I'm thinking they would pick Q. You're going to pick Q? Yeah, and let, let the Chun-Li players kill each other. How's that? That's a smart play. Yeah, good, good idea. I think Q, Q, Q. I told you so. I told you so, Q. All right, so... All right, so the next team only has... The next team's going to pick Makoto. Or Chun Li. Unless it's the unless it's Chun team? Pick it, pick it, poison. Right. So, yeah, is it Yang or Chun? It's is it Yang or Chun? It is. It's Chun team. It's Chun team. Whoa! Ricky Maru! Ricky Maru! Pearl Eyes, Tarakichi, and Mochi! <laughs> you know what? Mochi, a good friend of mine, he desperately wants to win because I, he lost in the finals two years ago really and it was by a random tosanami from tominaga oh. and he saw the super flash and it seemed like chun had a little short out but everybody watching it thought he blocked in time really he blocked in time but it somehow it hit and mochi lost wow and kuro obi the makoto team claimed the title at that time yeah they're pointing at the makoto team right now or, or, then, or? are they well, he pointed up first at Makoto. Now that they're thinking about it, do they want to eliminate the other problem? <laughs> but I don't think they don't mind playing. Oh, hey, they're playing rock, paper, scissors. <laughs> John Cannon to the side. Ricky Mara places. Top or bottom? Top or bottom? What's it going to be? Uh, oh. to eliminate the other problem. There can only be one Chun team. Oh, I like yes. it. I like it. I like yes. it. Ricky Barr style. I like so it. So we are now forced. Makoto versus Yang. Yang. Uh -huh. And let's give them their grand entrance. Yeah, check that out, guys. Wow. So the Okinawa team. And by the way, Shirokuro, uh -huh. who was the captain, who yes. played for the playoff, and Mochi and Ori, they're good friends. Okay. Yeah, they're good friends. But you gotta kill each other, right? Yeah. <laughs> hey, in this game, it's all battle. All <laughs> battle. So, Yang team. They got no choice. <laughs> Makoto Yang, that would be fun. Makoto Yang would, but they've got only four players. Oh, I didn't realize that. What happened to their fifth? Roshi Hikari has a flu. Oh, he, he's okay. not allowed to go out. Okay. What the best for all of us here, too? I mean, yeah. Uh, so, they do have a handicap already right. with four players. But we'll see what happens. I'll, I hope that they turn that handicap around and just play their hearts out, play harder because, you know, they understand they're at a disadvantage, so, you know, like, give it your all. Huh? But, I mean, like, if the first player beats, the fir beats their first player, they're even. Right. So, yeah. A little bit more work, but, you know, oh, <laughs> wait, wait, wait. <laughs> Yosh. I like it. All right. Oh, they want to rip off the Corona. So, there it is. Top eight. Oh. Last team entry. Team that went to the playoffs. Yes. I team with 
this Takami Chun Li in yeah. 2004, I think. He was a Ken player. Yeah. <laughs> I team with a lot of guys. Uh, you know, you know your players. That's the. That's well, the best I was like absent from 2005 to like 11. Okay, I was a blank that active. So um, yeah. Oh, uh, let's, let's see. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, Z, for the brackets. Here we are, Jorla. Oh, Final eight. Excellent. Just making sure that we retweet out. And again, if you are watching this, make sure you re you tweet out or Facebook. <laughs> Make out this stream, twitch.tv slash game newton underscore us for the English stream of Cooperation Cup, guys. This is free Cooperation Cup and it's already sick. We've had another day of third strike action. But remember, you do not want to miss this, guys. It is happening live. It is happening right now. That is our bracket. You are seeing it on the screen right now. This is what's going to happen soon. So it's Q, Dudley, Kent, uh, Necro, Makoto, Yang, Chunli, Chunli in order from top left. Right. So, oh my. So Kent team said, Necro, you're free, and they jumped in. Uh huh. And Dudley team said, nah, I'd rather pick Q than Chun or Mikoto. And they jumped in next to Q. Right. And Chun Li team, Rikibar team, had their choices. They could have played against Mimora and said not to. And, cho and chose to play the mirror match. And Mochi does not mind the mirror match. Right. He likes it. And Yang had no choice. Yang had it, yeah. To jump in next to Kurobi. So what do you think? After watching this, what do you think? Okay, so Delhi Q. And the, okay. the obvious advantage, yeah. Okay, left side, left side, who's gonna win? Who's gonna, who's gonna come to the finals on the left side? Ah, that's that's tough. You know, it's the TM TM being there just makes I, I want to root for the the, the Q, Q team, team. Uh -huh. but I mean I, I already said I like the Dudley team as well. Kokujin and Go Gunfight they're playing out of their minds. That's a strong team as well. So I like that uh, between the Ken and the Necro team. I gotta give it to the Ken team. I oh mean, really? I, I, mean, I like the I like the Ken team. It's just a, a safe pick. Okay, so it's gonna be a Q for the Ken. I actually, I'm, I'm taking Dudley Ken. Okay, Dudley Ken. Ken. And who's gonna win? Uh, between Dudley and Ken, I still like Dudley. Okay, I just, so, so Dudley from the left, from I like, the right, from the right side. Makoto Yang, it's Tominaga. Okay, Tominaga. Okay, Tominaga advances. Okay. And then so Chanti, Rikimaru. Rikimaru. Okay. Yeah. So Tominaga and Rikimaru. Tominaga, Rikimaru. Oh, gosh. Pick your poison. But uh, you know what? I'm rooting for Tominaga. Okay. I mean, I played Makoto in this tournament earlier, and I'm a huge Tominaga fan. So. So it's gonna be Dudley versus Tominaga, and it's gonna win. Yeah, I got it. Those are the two teams I picked. I want, I want the double team. So, uh, let's look it out. Here we go. First, so, first match. It's it's gunfight and Bentoya. Bentoya. I never believed he would make top eight. Right. He is one of the guys that you know deposits a lot of coins in a big one because a lot a lot of people like feast on him. Uh -huh. But now I'm rooting for him from the bottom of my heart. Okay. From because uh, we play the same arcade. All right. So home arcades. Home arcade. Okay. Big damage. Off big big opening. Hey! Oh, but he gets the first one hey! here. Boy, look at that roar from the Q team. Wow. You can, e everybody's behind him. You can hear the excitement right now. Q team. And actually, Bentoya, the red Q, he did all of the work to make all the Q teams, like four Q teams. Really? All the work. He, he contacted every single Q and he, he made four teams. Four teams. Right, so nice. credit to him. So, oh, wow. Three oh, overheads. That's good. Good punish right there. And punch in the chest. Oh. Gunfight has been playing out of his mind all, night, all day today. Gunfight is not just like a foreign player that like relies mostly on reflex. It seems like he's got this game plan, but right. it's really, really hard to see. It really, really Look at the pressure. Oh, that's the back strong. To alleviate some of that. Now Q with the corner pressure. He's got meter. What's he looking for? Any air, I guess. Yeah, any air. Yes. There it is. Ops, just keep pressure. Oh, over it. Because, just because Dudley is one of the most fattest, fattest characters when he's crouching. Yes. It works easily. Now. Now, he's the original murder face, I should say. Really? Yeah, he's the original murder face. <laughs> okay, went late there. Looking for the air to air. Boom. There it is. We saw that first round. Gets a hard knockdown. Oh, good, good luck, good luck, uh, good jab. Oi, that was good lucky. Wow, nice good punish. Nice, another one 
Okay. So you know what? You know what? So, uh, uh, a little special about gunfights uh, moves. Uh -huh. The uh, the decision making is a little bit uh, like unusual because when you have 1.8 or like even more meter, uh -huh. you would want to push buttons that you could link into super. Right. That's short, short, standing strong, right. ground strong, forward, forward, whatever. Yeah. But instead, gunfight was pushing a lot of jabs and forward towards strong that do not link it to super. Uh -huh. So that's just like simple pressure and it's risky because you got no follow-up. Right. But still he managed to work it managed to work out. Because he kinda sensed that the red Q was trying to block with all his might. Right. So he's like, okay, so you're not buffering parries, so I'm just gonna go in at you. And right. it worked. Like you just hit buttons, keep keep on put momentum going and yeah. get you into a bad position. Yeah, and so what I wanna see is he saw the second player out, he saw how gunfight played. Uh -huh. So if he's gonna stick to the same game plan, I'm sure Al will be buffering more now. high parries. Right. So we'll see. Let's see. Alright, let's see. Let's see. A little early on the overhead. Huh? Wait, good out here. He's got one of his own in back strong. Uh, different super stuff. The first match. Super for hard knockdown. Wow. What's good about that is um, it's not like he's moving in. He's not being greedy to get like five sleeps. Right. He doesn't mind with one sleep and ducking uppercut and super. Right. But it's hard to read. He's giving it really simple. Yes, it is. It is. Basic, but very effective. Uh -huh. yeah, nice. Miss That's really hard, by the way. That is really hard. Roundhouse into jab machine can blow. I guess he was really hard. Right. Is he a, is it because he's a bigger body when he yes, falls? Yes, okay. yes, yes. You can sweep, sweep, that makes it a little easier, but... Uh, super! He's pushing the button, man! Ton! Ton? No, no. It's punishable. Oh, very good. It's punishable. Dash up and yes, machine can blow. It's a good punish. Oh, very good. Okay, that's airball, so it's, it's, not, it's not, like, crucial. So like, so like, super. That's third strike, that's third strike right there. Yes. That is third strike. Oh. Overhead blocked. Accidental, but still safe. Ducking, ducking super, no? Ducking super. Oh, hey. Good fight. Good fight 2 0 right now. 2 0. I have never like heard news about gunfight playing third strike recently. Right. But he's managed, he's doing his job right now, and everybody's happy on the team. And you hear the roar from the Q team every time they hit, they land a hit. Right and well, I'd be biased, but Q, I would like to see more of them. Right. At least, please, not 5-0. Yeah, not, not, not a 5-0. Not a 5-0, please. Yeah. It's, a, it's an uphill yeah. battle for the, for the Q it players is, when, when is, they look at I mean, if Gunfight is playing so strong, and he's only the first player, and you've got, you know, E.K. Dudley as well, and then, you know, this raging pizza beast in the back in Cobra Jin. Yes. Alright, so yeah. Who do we have here, Q-wise? Moth Q or Moth Dog? I, I think I can tell by the color. Okay. So, Say, uh... Black, okay. Uh, I think it's Dusk Q. Okay. Dusk Thunder crosses up and already gets corner pressure. I'm, not, I'm sorry, Shree. I don't know every single player's name, name and face. Even though I'm a Japanese, I'm sorry for that. That's alright. Oh, nice. You take the good there. pressure, good pressure. Boy, lucky. That was a lucky hit. Okay. Oh, he pushed the button. Is that a little short of mighty good? Jump on. He jump on. I am sorry for the late startup of the super. Right. That's like six or seven. Now, it's, a, it's a super arc and it's like seven. Wow. The weird thing is, yo, know, certain characters you throw him out of that. Uh, yes, yes, oh, yes, yes, yes. That's not throw him invisible. The gunfire picked up his face. Wow. Oh, overhead. He called out to the neutral jump. I think he saw Q hit a button. He might have tried to pick the roundhouse. I think he saw the pull. The EX Look at the reactions gun by 3-0 right now. Last five seconds of the match, he did overhead and EX uppercut. That's all. Yeah. <laughs> That's all. That's all. So this is the really, really scary part of Dudley. It's like it just works. Yes. There's Masa. 
Masa is said to be the best Q. Really? Probably. He lives a little bit uh, western part of Tokyo, and uh, you, you remember his face? He got uh, he got hit by three tackles and a headbutt with our by our which is not really ideal. I'm uh, not sorry, it's not optimized, but still, it's still good. It's still good. So gunfight, unstoppable right now. Let's see. Can he keep it up? Or have they gotten enough info? Well, I'm sure he has no pressure at all. Right. Like I said, he's got four others to back him up. Play very freely at this point. Uh huh. Oh, that's a deadly. So, think, hey, the so that's what he wants to land, actually. We did not see any of them in the first two matches. Oh, he decided not to go for the not to go for the roundhouse index machine gun because sometimes he's airborne. Wow. Hey. Okay, Q finally showing that defense. He's known for. Well, no, Masa, no. Oh, Masa. Oh, right there. As you say it, short, short. Short, short. Oh, that was so sick. It's like, I know this stuff, son. <laughs> I know this stuff. Don't turn it on at me. I know this stuff, son. That was the coolest thing I've seen today, too. Or I top five, at least. That is, uh, when you train with a Seichu Sen, with Makoto, you have a jumping out there. Oh, really? Yes, you do. That defense. I think they've got a number of they've got handling gunfight, but gunfight responding nice with a nice jumping combo. Oh, this input right there. And by the way, that um, EX uh, super trade with the rose, it only is airborne, so you only have like a roundhouse for the next punish. I see. So you can't throw them or anything. There it is, that is. Yeah, super for a hard knockdown. No rose. Yeah. No rose, no rose, no rose. Is that gonna be enough? Masa, if he's going to continue doing this for like the next three matches, he's going to be exhausted. Yes. He's going to be out of fuel. But he is known for his like, you know, passionate play and he is known to really, really, really focus in the match. Mm. And so he pulls off like miracle wins. And that wasn't a miracle. I think that, I think he uh, like deserved it. He played it very well. Very well, yes. And he taught Gunfight a lesson not to throw a rose at like that. <laughs> so. Oh. Oh. And because. Red Bull. And because. They're friends, they know each other. Uh, they know each other. So, Masa, I know you. I know what you're thinking. I know what you're doing. And Kokujin prefers, prefers the second player side, as you all know. Yes. So he's on the second player side, and he's thinking. Yeah. Wow, I'm playing Kokujin here. Kokujin, Masa still sticking with Super 2. Right. Now. I think both works, but the way he uses it, Super 2 is good. Lock it up for good. No, no coke sir, bro. Wow. Good, good block. Wow. <laughs> wow. EX. Oh, he wanted EX. Good block. Sweep. Sweep. Two, three, four, five. Thank you. <laughs> and the hard knockdown. Uh huh. Oi! Greedy! Oh, that's gonna hurt! Wake up! Let's see! Nice! By the way, five sweeps and a ducking, ducking uppercut gives you one bar. Really? It does right. give you one bar. Now! So guaranteed super at that point. Uh huh. Oh, there the it is, that's Kokujin. I get so frustrated by that. <laughs> if I get hit by that, I'm like, well, what? Why? <laughs> Nice, the back swing blow. Red is habit right there. So she can throw rolls right there. Let's see. Another one. Actually, yeah, that's game. So there it is. His plan worked out. I know you, Masa. All right. Is it up to TM? It is up to TM. Okay. So, last hope for the QT is TM. TM no slots though to be so. He is scary. He is very scary. I agree. Because he's got like. See, that's not even a back fear. Right, that was new to this, right? And already, Kokujin down 25%. And he's a one player side. <laughs> oh no. So he wants to get back. Yeah, he did. Oh, he got it. Wow. Get back there. 
Wow, step. Wow, neutral phase is very, very dangerous. Two, three, another. Oh, scary, scary. That's scary. Jump, jump, Jordan. Rose for the Rose overhead. Yep. Oh, no. One more. That's DX Shepa. One thing you have to respect is that every time he throws out the DX Shepa, it's a reversal. Yes. Reversal. It is not easy. He wanted to bait the super. There it is. And it looks like a hit the first. One. Nope. Wow. The jab stops the crab punch. They have a long reach. There's a, there's a target combo you don't see every day. Oh, that's mainly for Annie here. Yep. Decided not to let, let her rock, but he's in the corner in bad position. Good block. Nice. Good escape. Good escape. Really he wants to meet her. Wow. Wow. You can see the range of the car in those Dash up. Dash up. Usually you would want to build meter in that situation. Instead he went. That is oh wait. I'm sorry. He's trying to stand around out there. Oh no. Higher low. Low. High. Overhead and super. Still alive. Still alive. Low will kill, but high will not. So chose to go for high. Gokujin takes it. Doesn't he advance Alright, next is Ken and Necro. This is going to be interesting. This will be a lot of slug war, I think. I think it's going to be more uh, slow-paced matches because uh, Ken's going to like sit back and not press a button. Oh, okay. So he can take his time with take his time with Necro. Uh, because Necro's standing strong is too good. Ah, very true. It's it's um it's kind of like Shoto Killer. Really? Kind of okay. on, on the ground. But okay. like, except for like Goki or uh, Akuma, or whichever, because he has access to Necro from the air. Uh -huh. Demon flips, uh, air fireballs, dive kicks. Right. So he's got a, Goki has access from the air, but uh, and Ryu has a better fireball. He has fireball. Right. So Ryu can like kind of like try to. Uh, Little photo op uh, for the uh, record there. Yeah, so uh, yeah, Ryu can uh, fire a lot of EX fireballs and apply like ground pressure. But Ken's EX fireball is not that good. Mm. And uh, Necro's any air is too good. Very good, yes. Very good. He's got uh, Crouching Strong. Crouching Strong. Shock. Shock. Uh, back back fierce, fierce. And back down back Fierce. And well, jab might work sometimes. Jab would work. For he's probably, if he's got the right angle, he could probably do the uh, the, the background house as well. Oh yeah, sure, sure, sure. Yeah. So he's got a lot of anti airs, and um, Ken does hit hard. Yes. And Necro is easy. One of the easy dummies to land a double double DP. Right. He doesn't need Kara for that, right? He does. He does. Oh, does he? In corner, he doesn't. Corner, he doesn't. Okay. He doesn't. So if it's a mystery, he does. So um, Necro doesn't want to get touched, of course. Mm -hmm. Right. And uh, Necro, if he has meter, let's see if, if, he, if he has full meter. And if he la lands one combo into one mix-up, done. Oh, done. Wow. Okay. Necro has a lot of damage output. Yeah. So, All right. Let's switch back to the cameras oh, here. So they said it's Kose, and we have we have Yoshihara, known for his illustrations. Illu oh yes, that's right. Uh, uh -huh. Every single picture you see regarding this cooperation cup is drawn by him. Shout out to him, Yoshihara. 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 Right, here we go. So Yoshihara, I don't know how how much he's been training since uh, last year because uh, the year before he didn't seem that comfortable. Although he was teaming with Sugiyama before, like he did now. Right. So I don't know how much he's gotten better. We'll see. But Kose, uh, Kose. And I think he knows Ken Necro isn't that easy. So right. Ken would like ideally want to maul him. Right. But as you see, they're playing a ground game. You see? Yes. Fireball. You don't see many fireballs fireball from Ken, right? Right. Just general, but nice. That good punish. He knows he knows this matchup. He knows what he's what he's doing. Or see, and that distance is not bad where the low portal reaches. When, when it's a little bit outside, it's back for Ken. 
they both know each other's weapons. So Kent wants to like move in a little bit more or do that. Yeah, it's crossed under on the deck. See Kent in his face. No, this is dangerous. Two more. Oh, yeah. no. One more, one more. Could be the end of the round. Woo, scary. Step kick. Woo. Electric Snake would have sealed it. Uh, Read on him, Ken, and it's over. Oh, yes, fireballs. Yes, that's that's one of the things that you use often with against Necro. The EX fireball. Oh, because since right. Necro doesn't have a really now. sharp, fast jump in, okay, it's pretty safe to uh, fire the EX fireball. Uh -huh. But if you're using meter at the same time, so it, it may be questionable by time. So oh, max amazing. punish. One more read could be the end of the round. 60% stun right there. Cross under. Oh, cross over. Excuse me. Got away. Wow, right, little strong. Emperor uh, punch into super. Taunt. Nope. Build meter. Wow, he went greedy. There it is. Solid play for Ken. That's where you want to put put him in. Nice. Good punish. He read wake up buttons both times. Yep. Wait. Punished it correctly. Secured the win. Yes. That so much to show in that round. He could have gone in a little bit more when he had the stun. Right. So, Bacchus, he says. Bacchus. Bacchus is also from Kyushu area. I think he's rocking that gold necro. Gold necro. And sorry, Street, I, I, I have not checked my Twitter for a couple of hours. I've been busy playing matches. Yes, we've been, we've been doing the Lord's work by playing third strike. Yeah, we've been doing a lot of work, man. Yep. So we still got a day to go, but... All right, now. game two. All right, Ken already on the offensive. Necro wants him to stay back. There's that Sam Strong oh, you're yeah, talking yeah. about. Bad guy. Punish. Shot. Three, no punish. No punish. See, yep, no punish. Far. Yep, too far. So I guess uh, since Bakas is from the Kyushu area, he's been playing with a lot of camps, I guess. Uh, including Deshi Camp, maybe. So maybe he's used to the camp, camp, camp matchup. Shoryu Shoryu. Shoryu Shoryu, that hurts a lot. Neko doesn't mind, he's got a few stuff. Oi, there he is. Cool. Too good, too good, too good. Too good. Now. So now Ken's a little bit worried. He now realized that this Necro knows the matchup. Using that standing strong and back strong as well. Yes. Oi. I'll save it. Probably didn't come out. <laughs> yeah. I heard the I heard the button. Oh you did. Okay. I, heard the, I heard the button. Seems like get off me. And then you're trying to come in? Sure. Get off me. Get off me. Strong. Wow, Ken's walking in. So brave right now. There. Nice little strong. Does he have any kind of mix-up? Corner push? Nope. Safe front. Back strong corner. Okay. Four wow, those. nice button. No punish, right? No punish. No punish. Oh, yes, there it is. Oh, it, it reached. I'm sorry. Close enough. One more throw. Can do it. Right, Low nice. short standing jab into DP. Break your first. Final round. Go. Guy doesn't have meter. He decides to go in. Gets stopped by the drill kick, and he's in the corner. Uh -oh, that was a bait. That was a bait. Not the best punish, but but good enough. It's corn. It's bad times when in the corner against Necro. You don't want to get thrown. You don't want to get thrown. That last thirty percent not almost done. But death at the same time. That's game. That's game. So as you see, not easy for Ken. Yeah. Not easy at all. And it seems like Bacchus, this Necro, knows what what he's doing right now. Oh. Not in his head, saying, all right. Yep, yeah, I got this, I got this. We're on I got the board. This. Yep. All right. Ken team is sending up. She She okay. Purple Ken? Purple Ken. Well, no first footsies, but... As I keep on saying, footies don't really work against this character. Right. Yeah. Standing strong, standing strong, too strong. Right? Yes. yes. Too strong. It's the button no. of strong. 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 Yeah. strong. Too strong. Too strong. There it is. Strong. Good punish. And the air. As, he wanted something else, but he got a short instead. Better than nothing. Yes, that's the that's like the first step against Necro. Carry the DP. Meaty. 
taunt for the damage boost. Oh, that would have that would have hurt so much. Max punish. Oh, that's gonna hurt. Max punish. Sun, sun. Wow. Yes. Hi, hi, hi. Shock, 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 shock. Yes. Save the meter. See what I mean by damage that boost? He does a ton of damage and stun. And look at Neko's meter. Wow. Plenty. Plenty. I mean, Kevin's looking really good up until. Yep. Up until he got he got low parry. Right. Make a burn. One more, one more, and he's dead. It's game. It is punishable. That was punishable with the super. Gets the overhead into super. He doesn't have meter, so he wants DP. Red the button. Nice throw attack. Nice attack. So Necro can't get stunned, so he's got to find out some other way. But now since he doesn't have meter, the electric snake is safe on block. Good tech. Can burn the meter. I don't know why, but it's like get off me. Nice empty jump into the throw. Again, he woke up with a button. Yep, and he whipped it, but no punish because it was a short back short. See, look at that. Look at that standing strong. So that was basically safe, and that was proper decision making because unless he red paired the last hit, right. it was not it was not punishable. Right. He's too far. Yeah, was, oh no, he didn't have, he didn't he have no meter. He yeah. had no meter. So Matsu Ken is up. So as I keep on saying, it's, it does not seem like an easy ride for Ken. No, not at all. Especially when Necro knows what he's doing. So I'm guessing like all the foreigners, they don't have like much experience in neither of the matchups, so right. they don't think, oh, Ken's too small. Right. right. You see what's happening now. Right. And this is the Ken Masters, man. Ken, I mean, struggling. It's not easy. It looks like an uphill road right now. Open up with a fireball. Interesting. Uh, Matsu Ken was the guy that was actually talking about the fireballs and he has fireballs. It's like, it's like, yeah, you gotta fire them anyways. We got no other like effective tactics or anything. Unless you get them in the corner like this. Right. But good buttons, good moves. Oh, nice back strong. Nice back strong. Damage boost. Scary. Ooh. There it is, but he doesn't have meter. What, what's he got? What's he got? Cross Ambiguous cross up. Oh, nice. Sweep. No, it's sweep. Dude. So Necro does want a little bit of meter, but he gets uh, the back throw. On the ropes. Oh, let's go for it. Let it rip. Let it rip. Do or die. <laughs> Why not? You're going to die anyway. <laughs> <laughs> there are a lot of situations like that in this game. That's yeah. why people don't quit. <laughs> wow, that was Cap nice. tornado. That was nice. It's basically safe on block. Ah. That does mad stun, as you see. Middle kick. See, he doesn't have like a big punish after that. Back strong one again. more, one more. He needs one more, whatever it is. Nice. Oh no. YOLO. So you see, Necro's meter's full again. Wow, Necro builds meter mad fast, you see? And he's probably going for an overhead, I guess, soon. Right. Leap attack or uh, the Viper Fang, maybe. Viper Fang. He's he's shown it twice already, so maybe he's not going for that. Gonna go for that. Good box. Let's see overhead. Right. Good box. And just slowly getting whittled away. Uh, oh, hey. Well, set the fireball. Wow. <laughs> Impressive. That was impressive, actually. Great composure by the Necro. Yeah. Exactly, exactly. I mean, he's playing it very, very well. Another back strong. It's a super. Can't get, doesn't get the super. I don't know why. Mott's getting a bit nervous, I guess. Oh, he's, maybe, maybe not. Throw to super. Came with a small lead. Oh, he gets him in the corner. Wow. It was, it was a cross up. It was a setup, I guess. Let it rock. Super. Super. Oh, that could be good. Nice. Yes. But I think Bacchus did very well. Yes. He beat two of them. And now it's uh, Matsuken, Deshiken, and Hidai. Is that left? Okay. And this is Ikeyama. Ikeyama, okay.
Okay. Ikea, Tamu, and Sugiyama are left. It's looking like a good match already. I like it. Yes. And Ikea went over it very, very solid play. He, I think he played a first attack against uh, Matsuke uh -huh. and gave me. I think he won. I think oh. he won the first attack, I guess, against Matsuke, if I'm not mistaken. It was, I think, 10 to 7 or 8. It was a close match. I think. But he knows what he's doing. He knows what he's doing. Wasn't expecting to be uh, fierce there. Nope. Fierce up. This match feels a little faster paced than the previous ones. Yep, but as I said, like it, some people like take their time, right? It was yep. like the clock was down to like 30 something in the previous match, so now they're, it's gonna get tense. I'm starting to play a little bit slow. Likely almost even at this point. Yep, but meter. The meter, yeah, that can end up with favor. Can only one bar. He spent an EX earlier, so. Yeah. Wow, good buttons, good reactions. Yeah. That is what you call a DED setup. DED, yes. Because DED is a player from a uh, player from Okinawa. Uh -huh. He was a Ken player. He is said to invent that that setup is that uh, when you have just the right amount of meter, right? You just like the meter confirm. Yeah, meter confirm. Just just like let it rock and it automatically come out. Right. Uh, if the opponent blocks or carries, you don't get enough meter. But if it hits, it yep. does. Thank you. Thank you for the explanation. Thank yes. you. Another? Nope. Good buttons again. Oh, so tense. Yeah. See, Z Ken doesn't really jump. See, that's what happens when you jump. Wake up buttons. There it is. So Ken really has to do it. I mean, I think you know what I mean by him doing it. Right. It's like waking up with buttons and stuff. It's like he does, he can't really like really think about his wrists anymore. He's in the corner. Right. He's got to do it or he's gonna die. You gotta fight your way through. Yes. Yeah, so um, wake up buttons. A lot of people complain about it. I don't like it. I don't do it. I, I don't do it a lot. But when you, but you gotta do what you gotta do sometimes. I heard a friend once say that you know, with, with a lot of fighting games, you gotta have nine smart decisions in your pocket and then one really really dumb one. Because <laughs> sometimes you just gotta go dumb. Well, waking up with a standing strong, it's a five framer, so yeah. it's, it's not throwable. Because yeah. you can't throw until the seventh frame. Uh -huh. Sixth frame here, you have throw invisibility. Nice. Tamu is up. I saw Tamu doing a lot of work in, I think, second round duels, I think. But it seemed, oh, once again, accidental back jump, I guess. Oh, he got caught. Snake Fang, taunt for the damage boost. He doesn't care. Walk up throw. Walk up throw again. Good. Get in. Wow. Get in. Ooh, I'll just save the meter. Oh, got over. Oh. It's like wow. up back, right? Up. It, was, uh, it was up front, but it was up back. Yes, oh. kind of. Oh. I got through. I got through. Uh, The so Necro does want a little bit of meter, and it's not, it's not that much work for Necro to build meter, but not with this. Overcut. Oh no. Okay, good punish right there. Get him in the corner. Yep, and but still. Uh oh. Uh -oh. This, this may count. This may count. Besides, let her rip. Shaw, new, Ken. Win. You nope. got another round to go with anyway, why not? It was not a reversal, but still, it is very hard to perform a sh meaty short or meaty light kick or light punch or whatever. So, we have to go for it. It worked, and now we have to anchor Sugiyama. Sugiyama, nice show. <laughs> take a minute, take a breather. And here we go. Go for it. Good, power into throw. The so Matsuken is playing more of an offensive game. Uh. And it's working out so far. He had just about a meter. He had just... That, that's the round. We'll see some stun combo. Yes. 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 That's what happens. You don't sleep on him. 
13 or something. No, wait, I'm sorry. Maybe I'm wrong. He doesn't have meter. Wow, wow nice break. Wow. Almost done. Wait. Wow. Hey. Hey. Wow, that was impressive as hell. Yeah. That was, uh, I never expected that, but. Way to convert with that elbow cannon. Wow, that was, that was impressive. Oh. So Hirai. It's all up to Hirai. We're at the show for each team. Nope, we have Dashiki. Oh, we have Dashiki. So, oh, my mistake. My mistake, folks. I'm sorry. I apologize. Ten team still looking strong. Matsuken died pretty fast that round, so maybe Hirai might be a little bit anxious about what happened. Oh, okay. That's good. They uh. Tornado uh -oh. Oh, oh, oh my gosh! Got him. One more hit. So are you, Ken. In fact, they're so good. They're like anime games. <laughs> Get on, folks. Back strong. Miyama so looking mighty confident. See, see them firing the fierce fireballs? Yes. It's like there's no place to fire, uh, use a super. Oh, nice, good, good reaction. Good read. Oh, that dash back. Red to throw. Wow, he's walking up. It's scary. Oh, the movement. Wow. Necro. Necro doesn't mind. He's got a round to spare. Or a corner pressure. Can't watch this game. Super. Yep. Yeah. Staying alive. He said, why not? Wow. Let, her, let her rip. So. Oh, Necro. Have any left? No, no. Necro's down to the last round, so. Wow. Oh. Now he's jumping. Target combo. Super. Necro doesn't have meter, so he's not gonna die. That's why he fights with DP. Now Necro needs a little bit of meter. A little bit of meter. There it is. There it is, yes. Back throw. Oh. Oh, let's look at the uh, strike map. No punish on this. Life is about even because Necro has a little bit low health. Now he's got meter again. What's he gonna do? The X hard ball. Oh, that's it. That's, that's it. 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 Wow. Well done to the Ken team. Ken advances. All right. I'm going to switch off to the mic, folks. Thank you, guys. I'm going to bring back our Lion. Our Ken, thank you so much for the insight. I'll, be, I'll still be here. I'll be in the chat, guys. But please, give your regards and thanks. Bring it up, our Lion, on the mic. Thanks, guys. My voice already. Uh oh. Yeah, unfortunately, you're also irreplaceable for the team. <laughs> and I'm gonna be here tomorrow as well, right? Yeah. Yep. Exactly. Personal shout out to everybody that's playing Search Strike around the world. All the communities uh, in Europe, Brazil, everywhere, UAE. Please support your scene. And if you have a chance, come over to Japan and participate in this, in this big, big tournament. It should be mad fun. Okay, I'm not even checking my phone. Oh. I'm, guess, I'm getting mad messages, but I'm not even checking it. <laughs> so yes, we have Delta as the winner over Q and Ken over Necro. Now, we're going to have Tommy Nunn uh -huh. and Yang player. Yang team, sorry. And as I said, Roshi Hikari is absent, so Yang only has four. Oh. Oh, damn. But they made it this far. So what do you think? Well, well, you would, you would like, you would like Makoto to win, of course, right? Of course. 
But I have a feeling that I have a feeling that uh, aside from Makoto team, Yang has Yang team has highest chance. Oh, even though they have four players, even though they have four players. Okay. So chance is up first. Uh, who's it gonna be? All right. Who's it gonna be for the Yang player? Kuro is up. So what do you think about this matchup? Um, I actually think it's a Yang's favor. Oh? Not by much, right? Not by much. Slightly Yang's favor. He's thinking about the super. He's gonna go with super too. Magnetic okay. storm, right? <laughs> Magnetic storm. I don't know. Only, yeah. I do not know why they, they didn't fix it. Kuro going in already? This is gonna be this is gonna be fast. Oh. Full on offense. Yeah. Wow. Oh. It's gonna be, I said it's gonna be fast, right? Yeah. It was yeah, fast. Yeah. Are you ready? Go. So Makoto, he wants to, he, Makoto, she wants to build that meter and land it as early as possible and then rebuild round. it immediately. Yes. But instead he is, she, she, she decided to use the EX. Do you disagree with the EXs? What's that? Do you disagree with the EX use? Oh, no, 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 no. If it, as long as it hits, haha. -ha. <laughs> uh oh, that stun bar is going out. One more, one more. One more, one more missive is done. Oh, wow, nice good jab, check, good nice check. jab. One more hit, one more hit, but she, she's got meter. Oh, that's a super! That was a super. That was a super, and that would have been the end of Yang for that for, for round two. So, Oro. Very confident. They have, they lost chance, so they now have Shibu, Tominaga, Mimura, and uh, uh, Luka. Oh, Luka, okay. Shibu, yes, Shibu. One of my buddies at Big One, plays oh. Big One. Shibu. We always drive back home after the arcade closes. <laughs> he's in the back seat and he's always snoring sometimes. Oh man. No, he's not snoring. He's like barely awake. <laughs> but in the back seat. Like yeah. That. And Shibu, uh, known for his very, very solid play. Very, very low risk. Very solid play. What is he doing? Uh, he's not. Never mind. No, never mind. <laughs> Don't mention it. <laughs> So I don't want to be biased, but I do want to want to root for Shibu. Go. Because we're like wear like training buddy. And he did play a lot against Mika KO when he came over. Oh, all right. On the fifth this month. Nice whiff. Nice change of timing. Huh. Wow. By the way, you would consider uh, Makoto's uh, SA1 to pretty much be the predominantly stronger one for most matches, right? Um, for a uh, character with low health, I I think it's a good good decision to choose Super 1 because Yang can almost die now. Yes. Greedy. Wow. Fearless. They both are command throws, but... True. There it is. Oh. Like I said, he wanted to, he wanted to use a super bar as fast as possible. Got to build that meter. Yep, got got half life already. Oh. And since Makoto doesn't have meter, Yang's gonna go in. I ain't scared of you, right? Wow, yes. that was lucky. Now that Yang's got a meter. He, he's gonna build it. Wow, oh, that was low tech. Trying to be in a throw. A little bit of stun recovery. Yes. Get off me. Ooh, oi. Yeah, this is fast. Oh my god. Trace. Oh! Wow, he teched! You I did not. You gotta be kidding me, yeah. You're right. Oh! So Kuro pulls it off. See, it's like basically Yang wants to be in your face. Yeah. And that's how what he did in the past two matches. It worked out. And so we have Luca. Luca is the, probably the youngest by far in the team. And I heard that Tominaga and Memora wanted to team with Luca. That's why they have this team. Originally, they, I think they were the original three members on the team. And Furo still looking confident, I guess. 
Tempo. Launch into Roundhouse. Uh, this jab's working really well. Check. Okay, Yank can die any second. Yank can die any second. Just one guess for him. He needs one more. He needs one more. One guess on either side. Yep. Oi, 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 oi. That's overhead. Was not enough. Yes, 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 so, like we saw oh. in the last match, he's gonna go in. Oh, interesting. Another both out of meter. Interesting. Start to use meter. Oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Got out the corner. Uh uh uh. Nice punish. Far, far. Got nice, out. nice jump. Good, nice good back run. decision. They both almost have a meter now. Oh. Accidental for sure, but it worked out. One more, one more. Ex. Oh, nice kill. jab. Nice jab. Oh. oh. All right. Didn't see it this time. So, uh, Makoto can spend the meter early, or she can save it. Use a little bit of ex. Uh, in this case, just use it. Nope. He's not, nope. He's not gonna. You can use it under pressure. I would love to see it after the crouching uh, uh, board kick there, but... He should have, he should have used it. The recover stun at least. Yes, yes, he should have used it. I think. Oh, oh I just want to park it now. <laughs> oh! Oh! That is that is Makoto's legal weapon. Yeah. Because that middle kick, jump middle kick is, is out for so long. Yeah. It's out for like seven frames or something. And priority hitbox is great on it. Yes, yes. And it hits. If it hits, there it is. Yeah. So that one caught in. One caught in the Kansai area. They lost I swear, it feels like more than seven frames. Oh yeah, it, it, it feels like a freaking eternity. <laughs> you're right, you're right, you're right, you're right. But I kind of like look at the hitbox. I counted it as seven, so uh, I would believe you if you told me it was eleven. Okay. Anyways, so one tower ends up, and uh, Koto has three left. Uh, so does Yang, right? They got. They both have three. Three people left. Does one tower's name mean something? One tower is basically uh, a name from originally from a comic book. Ah, Sakigake Otokojuku. It, 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 wow, that was fast. That was fast. Sure, what, do sure. Sure. what do you think? You, you, you should still use no. the two. Well, I think either one works. works. I, I, well, I mean, in this in this particular matchup, yeah, Super One is definitely the way to go. Okay. I never would use Super Two against Yang. All right. So, I was wondering it as a general rule. Yeah, the super one hurts a lot on Yang because they got low health. Oh, and the threes, he's Ooh. got them. Oh, oh. God. died in the first hit. So, one out. Now they have. Uh, oh, my so uh, Keiko and Kodai. Keiko right. and Tokyo player. Kodai S? and Yusuke player. Wow, he got S on. <laughs> S. <laughs> <laughs> what's, the, what's the worst you ever got? Uh, I had an E plus plus. Are you ready? As a win? As a win. Yeah, I done that. I had a, that I was a, those were some lame matches. I think I had G plus plus maybe. Oh, that's right, you need a G's. Mixing up, mixed up city. Whatever. Oh, act of friends on stupid punch. <laughs> that punch just got Ikari. Looking for a stun and death at the same time. Overhead for a little bit more damage. Oh, that's right. All of our uh, normal attacks do have. Wow. Like Makoto looked mighty, com mighty comfortable in the last match, but you know, different player, different character, different player. So are they both on their fourth or third? Sorry, they're on the third. Okay. They got, or I should say, they got three more. Okay. Yeah, only have, yeah, only had four, right? 
Oh, it's right. I forgot. Oh, yeah. Makoto pretty scared to go for Karakta. So I don't know why. That's a nice thing. Better the jabs into uh, Mantis. Oh, wow. See, it just goes by so fast. I swear, if this Yang team wins, Roshi Akani would just be like, yeah, I'm awesome. I never played the tournament. I'm gone. I, I still won the tournament. <laughs> Sorry, that was not Kika, that was Kodai, I'm sorry. Uh, okay. And we have Yamora and Tominaga. Oh. And Tominaga, we will see some Tosunami. He is the only person I know crazy enough to use Tosunami against most of the cast. Yes. Even the Unity. So they are talking about the 100% uh, beating yes. instant kill. Touch of death. Exactly. So Yang is a pretty character that wants to go in, right? So Koto doesn't mind being in the corner when she's in the corner. Sure. Right. So we'll go. see. We'll see. That risk reward. But the reward is awesome. The reward is you win. Yeah, you yeah, win. Yeah, reward is you win the round. Now, I heard uh, Boss was the one who uh, developed the 100 combo. I do not know. Because I heard from a Saitama player before. Okay. So I don't know. It remains a mystery. I think I actually learned from Kominaga back right? in like 2004 when oh, I was yeah. at SBO. Okay. <laughs> Tsunagi for the tip. The chip or uh, was it hit the air? I think it I think it's the... Oh, it was the chip. Yeah, chip, chip, chip. So, Tominaga's fully loaded now. He's, he's got enough meter. Oh! Say your prayers. Hey! 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 hey. hey. Oh. That was the plan. Yeah. Yep. You know what was interesting? I've never seen that before. Is the use of I had to, to dash under. He created that like a year ago or something. Wow. Okay, I've never seen that before. It makes sense, does it? It does. It does. Does he car it or just do it? Uh, no, I don't. I don't know. Okay, I'll have to experiment with that. Yeah, I had so never Kaker, seen that before. Kaker, anchor. And, they, and Makoto team has told me I got four off. <laughs> wow. We got 4,900. Wow. Four, almost 5,000 people just watched. Wow. Just watch like coming style out on him. Well, it's optimal, not style. <laughs> True. It's or optimal. <laughs> <laughs> to be honest, we're tired of it. <laughs> yeah, because you've all been hit by one. Yeah, I mean, nobody plays with frequent. <laughs> So Yang is down to your anchor. See what he can do. Oh. Yeah. Oh, oh hey. Ma Makoto. And he slays Tominaga as the king. Before he even gets meter, right? Right. Yep. That's the right thing to do. Or that's probably the, the only right choice. The mode is still alive though, right? Yes. Okay. Ow, that hurts. That hurts. That hurts. So Tominaga has enough bar to kill already. Not, yeah, kill, I think. Yeah, uh, no, he yeah, no, no, he does, no, he does. Ah, uh, he doesn't work there. Boy, good mix up. Ooh! Oh, no. Is it gonna reach? It will reach, it'll reach. No, I don't think he's got the room. Nope. But it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. That is what you call a reset. That is what you call a reset. Go. So is Kurobi gonna pass for the third title? Or can Yang just hold back and have Mimora play as their anchor? Oh, well, good read. Game. Good read. Good read. Like it. Uh oh. Uh oh. No. Oh, oh, safe. Saw that coming. Oh, I mean, it was worth trying. Because you win otherwise, and what, yeah. what's gonna happen? But. Or like you advanced <laughs> already. <Yeah. laughs> it's their anchor. Oh. He's gonna play in a meter. Oh, I don't yeah. know. I don't know the punch for this. Really? Wow. That was impeccable timing. <laughs> I was about to say I don't know the proper punch for that, but he landed with the best solution. Right. Best answer. Oh, I'm supposed to say right. What an answer. Right. <laughs> I'm supposed I mean, to say what an answer. If you're James Chen. 
No, I mean, like, what, what would have been your, your, uh, pen punish? I don't know. I thought it was going to be, like, EX Chesto or something, but... He landed in close enough. I, I figured what would have been optimal would be to, like, dash forward, crash stab, dash forward, and then jump in. Uh -huh. uh, because as you dash forward, uh, Yang is continuing his forward momentum, pushing towards the screen, and he wasn't at the corner yet. But then you would possibly still get a jumping combo. Maybe. But, maybe. On the other hand, super. Yeah, super. Perfectly, yeah, perfectly timed. Perfectly timed super. Just for the kill. So we got. Okay, we got a Chun Li mirror. Wait, wait. Seriously? Because the Chun Li's decided to play against each other? Ricky Maru said, you're free. Bam. Like that. It can only be one Chun Li. Wow, just like that. Just. Ricky Mar was like, uh... You know what? Nope. I, I, they did us all a favor. Because now we don't have to watch Chun versus Chun Grand Finals. You don't like it? I don't mind. See? 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 That's what basically killed Third Strike outside of Japan. Because people hated Chun-Li so much that they decided to quit or not pick up her and pick up Chun-Li because everybody thought she was boring. But, I mean, highly technical character. Yes, but for us, Chun Li, as I keep on saying, was a necessary villain. We had to right. we had to kill her. So all the other players that use all the different characters, aside from Chun, not Chun Li, they put in their time and work and try to build some solid tactics in order to kill Chun Li. Right. Right. So yeah. Well, because they intentionally made her the, the strongest character. Um, or one of the strongest yes, I heard that they like made her intentionally a very very strong character. I do not know about the car throw. Right. I don't know if that was intentional or not. But I would have to say that the damage of the super is just crazy. We have pearl rice on player one side. So stream here to see at least five matches of Chumera. <laughs> at least. I don't mind watching Chumera, but some of you think that it's boring. Well. It, you know, the only problem with, uh, with Chun Mirrors are the noises being made. It's almost like watching a Marvel match, Marvel 2 match with Storm vs. Storm. Oh! Yeah, 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 right? Exactly. Uh -huh. Yes. But it, but it becomes really, really tense. That's so, true. Yeah, so just enjoy the atmosphere, enjoy the game. Oh! All right, this is not really boring anymore. That was not a good punish, actually. He should have went for the low forward after he parried the spinning bird. Right. But instead, he went for a throw. I don't know why. You know, they're doing it out. Like they're they're getting in there in each other's faces and they're actually scrapping. So this is, I don't care. Yeah. On both sides. Burr Ice known for pushing a lot of buttons. He pushed the button. Oh. He pushes buttons really fast, and a lot of them. I still can't believe that's a five-frame heart attack. <laughs> wow, good, good, good walk up. Oh, nice match. So Pearl Rice. Oh, Pearl Rice was using blue. So Pearl Rice is uh, is a black chun okay. usually, but he was furious that his opponent took his color. So oh, yes, you fight for your own color. You, you know what American player was famous for using that tactic? For stealing colors? Uh -huh. Mike Watson. Oh, I heard the name. I do that all the time. And what he would do is he would wait for you to pick your character. You pick his the same character, right? Uh -huh. If it was Ken vs. Ken. He'd go, wait, wait, sorry, sorry. I picked the wrong super or something. Repick. And then go over there and immediately pick that color. <laughs> he put it against But it seems like Pearl Rice is now using green again, so he didn't get his own color yet. Whoa. What? Sorry for him. See, this is fun to watch, right? Uh, yeah, because they're not, they're not walking back and forth. Let's see. Uh, Put him out their little low roundhouse. Anti air. Low forward. 
clapping for himself. Wow. Oh, that's, so, that's funny. Go to it, punish. This is gonna be fast. He's not gonna spend it. Oh, he's not. Oh, he's not gonna spend it. Full bar. Both players. Full bar. It's gonna. It's gonna go fast, man. This is gonna go fast. Good. The faster, the better. <laughs> Maybe I'm biased as a Dakota player. <laughs> That table, though. That who, is. Thought, who thought a table that blocks out that lower por portion of the body? <laughs> thought that was a good idea. Wait, I'm sorry. Maybe the same people who thought that let's play on a plane, a moving plane that's tilting back and forth, would be a great idea. That, oh, let's play on a beach. Well, that's, that's covering half our feet. Well, that's like the same idea as the original SD on the USSR stage. You got this kind of block. Oh, oh yeah, that's right. Good tech. Woo. Fifty fifty. Fifty fifty. Fifty fifty. Oh! The PC off to select. I don't know what that means. But he was giving him a twin. <laughs> I don't know what that means. <laughs> that, I know, that's a whip, a whip beating throw. No, whip grab. Yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah. yeah, he made it a throw. Oh, yeah, yeah. So, Karokichi, yeah. Uh, you have a long time. Uh, throws actually have a lot of um, recovery time in this game. Uh, it's like 27 frames. 21? Uh, 21 frames? Yeah. That is a lag, that's right. There's no, there's no lag, input lag. So, it's, it is still easier to react to it. Yeah, especially when you're looking for it. Yeah. Visually, for me. Huh? What was that? The dude in the carpet shirt. Oh. Okay. Oh, wait. Taroki, you got the round, right? Taroki, the first one player side. Taroki, you got the round. It's hard to tell. It's hard to tell because they're both using the same character. <laughs> <laughs> wow. This is going to end pretty fast. Good evasion. Oh. What the hell? Not going to hurt. It will hurt, but not going to hurt. Yet. Would that have also countered EX uh, Spinny Bird Kick? Uh, lower down house? Yeah. I guess it should. should. Okay. Saro Kichi! Uh, I think so, yeah. What's that? Just a build meter, or 30 frames, or 30 seconds straight. That's what Justin Long would do. Well, it makes sense, right? Yeah, it does. It does. Make sense. And, he, and he, plays, he plays in a very effective manner. It's also really frustrating. Haha, <laughs> I don't mind. <laughs> Shoutouts to uh, all all the people in America that are watching this. At <laughs> what time is it? Literally two in the morning on the West Coast to five in the morning on the East Coast. But we are in, we are in top eight. Uh, last match of top eight. Next will be semifinal. 
It's a weekend, you don't need to sleep anyways. <laughs> You're right. I noticed a lot of jump players using uh, crouch jab into, into hot cake. Crouch jab, when you when Chili blocks low, it's full slide. Really? Because Chen has that extra block stun. Oh, that's right. Okay. Oh. When it comes to chun mirror match at, uh, at, 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 at like a big tournament like this, I don't want to see any like uh, uh, like miss kid confirmed super. Right, you you want solid play. Yeah, and I, I don't mind people messing up, but I don't want them to just like you know miss hit confirm. And so far it has not happened. We're so, also on top eight. Yeah, yeah. You know, like, so, all the teams here are should be good. Yeah. Yeah. So it's because it, all the matches are very, very solid. And wow. And so far, I like watching it. And sorry, I'm not talking too much, but uh, I think Chum, Chum Mirror is a matchup that you don't really uh, have to commentate much on. Yeah. Because um, it's it's. Like car throws, slow forwards, and then ground game, right? Basically, but you do see a little jump in. And so far, you there. see like either tech or obviously, like said, that. Wait, 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 wait. He just said, he just said, I'll let you have your color. Really? Yeah. Oh, do they normally play the same color? See, apparently they do. This is Takami, used to be a Ken player back in Kyushu. Man, you know what? I just realized, like, and they, starting from like the Niners and stuff, they don't really realize. The, the struggle of like a uh, color colors and stuff. Because he had a limited number, he had a limited pool, and he couldn't tell who's got the color uh, a lot of times. And I, I cannot play on uh, other color unions. I just can't play. Yeah, because you get confused. Not only that, but just so you take it personally. Yeah, I just, uh, it just, it just like, I don't know. I, I, I just don't, I just don't feel it. I just don't feel motivated with the other color. <laughs> I see. Accidental, but it worked. Taro Kichi is on fire right now. One player time. He's doing whatever he, he's doing whatever he wants. Like I said, he's got Oreo, Mochi, and Ricky Maru behind him. So he doesn't really care what he's doing. What? Yo, that's psych out. Oh. Wow, he, just, he was just sitting there, and then Ricky Maru just like just gave him advice right away. He said, "Push buttons, <laughs> push buttons, push buttons," and then he pushed low forward, and he goes, "Yes, that's the way." So it was instant uh, advice from the champion. Fifty-fifty, oh. fifty-fifty. That was front. Yeah. Could have been death. Wow, how 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 encouraging <laughs> encouraging it is to play third strike, it's a good game. Yeah. <laughs> I mean how encouraging encouraging it is to have Ricky Mario give you advice from behind you. True. And it works. Like at the moment you listen to him, it actually works. Impressive. Are they down to the last player? Shirokuro, right? They finally, yeah, they finally, they finally are. So, Ricky Maru said, you guys are free. They stick right next, they went right next to him. And it seems like they are. They, Shirokuro needs to beat four more. Oh my god. Maybe he can do it. But Mochi is very confident in this mirror matchup. Wow. And so is Ricky Maru. Oh. He's got a mountain to climb, that's for sure. But you never know what's gonna happen. He's from Okinawa, he's traveled a long time. I'm so amazed that there are no units in this top 8. And that's a good point. But there's no uh, there is a Ken, sorry. Yeah. Cool. So basically, I mean, you don't want to make very obvious mistakes in this matchup. Like, you know. They take him from a super and let, let, your, let your meter go away. Or unnecessarily jumping. Uh-huh. But like, with Ricky Mario behind you, give me good advice now and then. There you go. He is on fire. 
I did not know he was this good. He is, he is originally a KOF no. player. Really? Yes, he plays KOF 98. I see. But he's been playing Third Strike for uh, quite a long time now. Okay. But I did not know he was this good. Oh my god. He is on fire. Is, is this going to be an OCB? Uh, no. Pro Rice uh, beat right one of them. Right, right. One, one, one. Wow. Okay, he's, he's, he's in his face, man. It's like, oh it's like, it's like a gotcha corner. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Fire throw coming up? I think so. Oh, he tried. He tried. Okay, he was a little bit too greedy. Right. But still. Ricky Morris. Ricky Morris. Decision worked out. Jesus. That was a good decision. That was a good. That was a good spot to pick on the bracket. Yep. Ricky. I guess nobody expected Tarokichi to beat Furuba. No, because Tarokichi is not like the you know the main hero or the main guy on right. their team. It's not either not. it's either Ori because he doesn't have tomorrow because he has work, or Mochi he's been putting in a lot of work, or Ricky Maru as you all know. But Tarokichi, I would say he's the underdog, kind of, just like beat everybody somehow. Jesus. So now we have Dudley and uh, Ken. Okay. What do you think? Um, what do you think? What do you think? Oh, yeah, I already called Dudley earlier. Yep. Yep. Tom, what do you think? I really do believe in the Dudley team. Oh? Do you want to see Dudley in the finals? Dudley versus Chili? I don't know. I don't think I'd want to see Dudley versus Chun-Li. Sorry, what'd you say? I don't know if I'd want to see Dudley versus Chun-Li, but who else could uh, the Dudley team take against if they win this one? Oh, I see. Mako Dudley versus Makoto team would be great to watch. Oh, yeah, I would exactly. love to see that as a, as a final. So we are we are in the semifinals. We are down to the last four teams. It is Dudley, the Pizza Beast, Pizza Beast with Koki and Aiku. All right, and Aiku is the first player. Shie from Osaka, Aiku versus Shie, first match. This it has been under debate for quite a long time. That it, on paper, it, on paper, it's Ken. But when you actually play it, Ken can die in a flash. So I feel like part of it is because Ken doesn't really feel stun damage like Dudley does. Uh, like whenever, whenever Ken gets a good opening, it's, you know it's usually the end of the super. It doesn't really go stun, but it, but it, it sets him up for like a, you know, something happens afterwards, right? Uh, when Dudley gets an opening, like, mass amount of stun gets generated, and you set him for Not now, not now, not now. Not now. Not now. See, I'm Ken's tools are just like, too honest. While well, Dudley has like a 13 frame overhead and he has a 16 frame low, low, low right? 13 frame, Jesus. Okay, it's 13 and 16. So it, so it is basically purely impossible to both see them coming, the 13 frame overhead and the 16 frame Kanipan or the low roundhouse. Right. It is impossibly. It is a differentiated block. Yeah. So you got like fuzzy guard or buffer Mary or something. That explains a lot. And you know his his uh his wake up options when he has the road. Right. It, it gives you uh, even more frame advantage. So. Kose Kose is up. So um once Ken's in the corner, he does if he doesn't have meter. I mean he's, it's not hopeless, but it's. Very, very bad. And uh, Ken is a pretty easy dummy to like juggle, so you don't have to do anything fancy against the Shadows. And so Ken, Dudley can keep it like like a simple stupid and still get enough damage and everything. Oh, good crossover on the quick rise. Uh, that's risky. 
Because you get yourself in the corner. You don't want to be in the corner against Billy. That was DP on on Perry. On reaction to Perry. Now he's in the corner. Low. Wait. Oh, that parry was scary. It worked out, but it's scary as hell. See, look at that, look at that, look at that. Like, he's pushing the right button. The right button. Upper, up, uh, lower right hand button. He knows this is bad. DP. So he could have actually died from that. Right. If, if the DP was parried. That's or, true. Like, one mix up. Good reaction. But he has no choice but to try to parry all of it. Like, oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They yeah. call it the multiple hits. So Ken's really got to commit as well. Oh, oh, no, no oh, super. super. No super. No, it was supposed to be anti air. Super from, super from behind. See, now this is what we're talking about. Two more. He's trying to back off. Respect the wake up. Backing off. Dudley needs two more. One hit. Oh, wow. One more. One more. One more. One more. Really good block. Oh, it's scary. It's scary as hell. Good block. Accidental super. Thanks. By the way, the overhead to uh, the second hit. What is it on block? Uh, it's it's uh, oh, wait, it's about even. About even. I'm sorry. Yeah, so save on block. Right to save on block. I see. Because. He's down half life, but he's got he's got three bar. Back, back up scoop. Ooh, it's good. Oh, oh, he's not getting the super. Wow, dropping it. Still in a good position though. Not anymore. Oh, in the nuts, in the nuts, yes. Oh, oh, back punish. That was probably the worst I don't know, time. I, I don't know why I did not link. Oops. Oh! Wow! <laughs> that is because you are the first player at the team. That's true. You can get away with doing random stuff. I mean, even though, even though you die, even though you lose, you got four others. Gunfight, dude. Oh! He was on stream earlier. He nearly OCB the entire Q team by himself. I, for, I forgot which team he played. I can't remember, I can't remember which Q team it was. I don't think it was back to the Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's right. That fight, he has like really, really fast reactions. I don't know where it comes from. Fight is great. He's, 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 he's very unique. Well, he lives in Tokyo. He does live in Tokyo. I was even playing uh, Street Fighter Five on uh, streaming. He's very unique. He's a, he's, a, he's a very different. He has a very very different play style than the others. Oh, oh just has to spend a meter. Go through a cut. Wanted to detect, wanted to detect that. You don't want to get, you don't want to be in the corner. Oh, good parry. Good escape. He wants a little bit more meter. He's gonna get us soon. Good sweep. All right, now he's got good punishment. Oh, nice block. Yeah. Good reaction. Oh. Wow! Wake up, wake up overhead. Still wow. And blocked. <laughs> wow. Wow. Uh -oh. that's, like, that's like a that's like a jackpot. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Ah, wanted the roundhouse. Nice. Ooh. Missed me punish. But it's okay though. One hit, one hit to be over. One hit, one hit to be over. Roundhouse, one hour, one hour. What's good? Done, 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 done. done. See, you're scared when you play Dudley. You are scared. Yeah. So you want to like hold up back, but if it's not in time, you get scooped. And it's funny because that scoop is so slow. 16. 
it's like you you most sweeps are what nine frames? Eight. Eight frames? Seven. Somewhere around there. Okay. But but it hurts so bad. Yes, that's why you're scared. But I must correct myself. Scoop is a term for a throw in Marvel, right? Um, scoop talking dots. Yeah, Marvel, Marvel too. Scoop is for throw. Lunch. Oh really? Yeah. Like uh, oh yeah, yeah, sorry. Okay, scoop, so scoop I'm, him up. Yeah. yeah, I'm I'm learning Marvel Marvel terms. <laughs> sorry. Marvel will never die. <laughs> two, 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 please. Well, this is their second. Sorry. So Deshikan is up. Yeah, we've all been waiting for this. That was a DED setup. This early? Uh huh. You don't get the second DP on against the deadly in the corner. From a lows forward, you do have. Mad fast reaction. Go for it. Oi, oi, oi. Oi, 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 oi. Defense is pretty good right now. Um, Jesse Ken is set to uh, punish the ducking. Roundhouse ducking. That but he's not doing it. He's not doing any right now. Red him like a bug. Red him like a bug. I mean, this is gonna be epic if Golf Five beats Josh Kang. Right? It was also really funny because for those past couple seconds, no one is saying a freaking word. Uh oh. Uh oh. Bad news here. Just do it. Uh oh, oh, the chest. He's got two bars. Yeah, sure. Whee, that was scary. Oh, that been it. Oh! Oh! So Kent was not playing his um his usual game because as I said, he wasn't punishing any of the ducking where he said he would be, and people said he does. But he wasn't punishing any of them. So he was maybe a little bit nervous. I don't know. But. Now, Gokujin. Oh, the third player. Okay. So he's only the third player. Okay. So who do we got left? We got. We got Lodi and Hirahata left. And the Ken team has. Uh, Fox can right? Okay. Wow. Alright, so Both. still really even. Both sub players. A good fight put up a good fight. Yeah, he did, he did. Wow. Oh. By the way, that that jet uppercut had barely has invisibility. Really? Barely has invisibility. But not not until the first active frame. Uh, I, think the, I think the upper half of the body was a little bit invisible. I see. So I hit the low. Oh, low. that's done. There you go. Yeah. Uh, go two hits. Again. Yes, two hits. Good pressure. Off that spend a meter. Still, still pressure. One more button. It's, uh, it's done. Oh, wait. It's, it's a DD setup right now. Oh, oh my god. The comeback. Lodi Dudley, you might not know it, but um, he does things. He does things. You'll see what I mean, I think. He does a lot of things. He is like, he is like, just do it. I think you'll get to see it. Punish! Negative six on block, I think. Oh, no time to do it, but... Prepare to strike, now! Oh, 
How, how did he input that? I don't know. I do not know. It came the other way. One too many. It might cost him the round. Uh huh. Nope. Not the best punish, but. Back up low strong, low, low forward. The way he used that low forward is probably the strongest way because it, it only has a hitbox at the, at the tip of his uh, tip of his uh, soul. I see. So that's like the best way. And so they are down to their final player, I guess. Hirahata. Hirahata is from Kyushu. And he needs to be three more. It's Deshiken, Wikidai, and Matsuken to keep his team alive. Into the heat of battle. Go for it. Wait. Hirahata and Deshiken, are they on the same team tomorrow? Maybe they are. I don't know. Maybe they are. That's again on point. Draw you can with the green. Wow. With the P. He is focused. He's got plenty of bar. Wow, accidental. Mac good punish. Yes, yeah, so our ball is to push him over. Did not have it. So Kent advanced it for the finals. So Kent versus Dakota. So dear left, Kent advances. Kent advances. So we're gonna see the other semifinal, which is going to be uh, Kurobi, Makoto team, Tomi Nakamimura. And so, and the other team is Riki Maru. So we, hopefully, we get to see like Mimura versus versus uh, Riki Maru. Oh, this is gonna be sick. This is, this is yes. This is what I wanted to see. <laughs> okay, exactly what I wanted to see. And a tournament like this. Hi, Mom. Hi. Third time, fourth time. Hi, Mom. <laughs> I love this shirt, by the way. Which one? Like, this shirt's shirt got like. Are you not seeing this? Uh, what is this from? Is it from Game or something? No, not at all. It's just a shirt that got popular in America. Okay, and he or she has a chainsaw. Two. Two chainsaws. Yeah, two chainsaws. Yeah. Just because. Make it rain. <laughs> Wait, oh, you can't see it rain, but man, that would be a great Marvel show. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Make it rain. Yeah. Oh, rain. That yeah. would be a great Marvel show. Just have Storm. Great. That's all you need. Yeah, so we we didn't get to see any, any Ricky Maru action uh, in, the, in the top eight, but I, I, I hope you get to see some Ricky Maru, right? You want to see, see some Ricky Maru? Oh, yeah, because Taro Kichi did, did all the work. Well, I, hi, I'm Aroku, and uh, hi, Crazy Buzz. All right, you know what? If I start saying hi to everyone, this is hi to me in chat. It will never end. So, so Luca, first player on Makoto side, and Pearl Rice, as usual, the first player. So Tom, who said this is not serious? All right, good point. Good point. This we are all serious as hell. And not many people believe that still Japanese play third strike for fame and glory and not for money. And not many of you believe in me, but we are not playing for money right now. How much? How much is it going to be for? No, we're, we are not playing for money. Oh, not playing for money. It's just for glory. Fame and glory, whatever. Honor. Honor. Yeah. So, Luca. Not commit sympathy. 
Not commit step poopy, yeah, yeah, exactly. So Pearl Rice and Taro Kichi oh. has been making a lot of contributions to his team, yeah. to their team. So they've been doing their work. They don't have the OCB, they've got strong, strong players behind them. So. Oh, overhead. God. Not, not a good penalty punish, but still. Oh, oh it's out of range. Okay. okay. Interesting. Interesting. Oh, yeah. Mass throw. It was a little bit questionable to use the meter right there, but. Okay, so it seems like, it seems like Pearl Rice is not, not going to stay back. He's going to move in. He's known for pushing buttons really, really fast. Got the throw, got plenty of meter. Got the meter roundhouse. Good punish. Chunk and die, one hit. Chunk and die, one hit. Oh, yeah. Chunk and die, one hit. Didn't get the fireball. It's super. Chunk and die, one hit. Chunk and die, one hit. One hit, one hit. That was, that was, that was, that was, that was game. I can't even sit in my chair right now. You okay, Tom? No. right <laughs> now. <laughs> Third strike is a very, very fast-paced game. It is very fast. Go for it. It's a. Uh, it has a different speed, like not like Marvel 2, but uh, it is a very, very fast-paced okay, well, game. Oh wow, I thought it was gonna go straight to super. Yep, so did I. He's not getting to low forward, but not low forward super, but still, it's working. Oh, accidental, this is what I was talking about. Max punch of him. Oh, I'm trying to go for the follow. That could have been game. That's true. He's still alive. Even a super won't get a kill. Not quite. Fierce in the punch, fierce in the face. Yeah. Oh, Ricky Morrow is, hap is happy with his performance. So, oh uh, yeah, Jesus, exactly. <laughs> you know, this is also a game oh. that uh, was not designed, was not, didn't seem to really be designed in terms of balance, but just more fun. Like, I want to make every character really uh, I don't know, I heard stories about uh, development of uh, Remy. Uh, oh, what happened? Like they didn't have much time or something. Oh, because he was the late. I guess he was the late. He was the Same with Q. Ah, uh, I don't know about Q because Q has the most pictures, most animation pictures of all the characters. More than Komodo? Uh, I think he does. Wow. Oh no, wait. Maybe it was a, a little, but his, obviously his powering animation. Is yeah, that's true. That's true. But Makoto is also like pretty well detailed, also. Yeah. And it feels like she got the majority of the budget. Wait, no Capcom, right? No Capcom. No Capcom. Okay, so no. Capcom 1999. They're they're awesome. <laughs> <laughs> so Shibu, yes, my buddy, my training partner. I would like him to do, do well. Man, this is fast. This is fast. This is so fast. Oh, hey! Mass throw! Yeah. Wow, there's 7,000 people watching right now. Yeah. And there should be like the same amount or something. Like that. Yeah. Can't stream as well, right? Most likely, yeah. And I guess it's a Nico Nico stream as well. Right? Yeah. Oh, this is only day one, man! Uh, um, stream, another streaming service in Japan. Oh wow, they're great. Sick great. Was that Chun Air Legs right there? Chun, yeah, Air Legs. Five. Five. You're right. Oh. Wow. I don't think it's really uh, appreciated just how good Makoto's neutral jumping, jumping attacks are. Um, yes, but I can't breathe it. Oh! oh I'm back! But he is out of meter. And Chili has full bar. That means third round could finish like in a flash. Makoto needs meter. 
She's getting it. She's getting it. Whoa, good swing. He just did it. He just did it. He just did that. Get out. Yeah, get out and get that meter. And he's going to get it soon. 70%. Oh, oh no, my god, no more no, no. 80%. 50-50, 50-50. Oh, good block, good block. Oh, that's it. It's gonna do it. Yeah, that's it. Yeah. It'll do it. Four ice beats two. Luca and Shibu. Who's up next? There's Tony Naga, Mimora, and Chance left. Chance takes a seat. They are going to leave Tominaga and Mimora behind, All right. as they always do. Yeah. So Pro Rice! playing really, really, really freely. He's doing oh. whatever he wants. And it's working out. He's just hitting buttons and all in Yeah, 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 yeah. That's his play style. He, play, he pushes buttons a lot and really fast. He, he, he kind of does play like an American. <laughs> but they all seem to hit your face. Yeah, so he, he knows the right time to push him. Last around, right? Yep. Uh-oh. Pearl Rice. Gotta respect him now. Good, good bad jump. Good, good airborne. Oh, good kick. Good kick around house. <laughs> I love that kick. Did I, people used to think that kick was like useless. Uh, that kick has so much utility to it. It does have its usage. Nice. You have to kick and send it. Yeah, yeah. Is he gonna stay back? No meter? No, he's going in. Okay, it worked out. Yeah. So he didn't want Chun to have two bars, so he decided to go in. Final Interesting round. decision. Now. I would have stayed back and build a little, a little bit more meter. So let it go. Oh. Let it rock. Uh, Max punish from this. Max punish from top. Wow. Couldn't even catch him on the jump back. Haha, <laughs> Chun's good. Oh, seems like. Is it, he's gonna go. Oh, 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 spoke oh, spoke oh, too soon. Oh, it's okay though, he has meter. Oh, didn't, uh, didn't chase him in. Oh, oh no! Airborne! Oh, man. That was the worst possible, that was the worst case scenario. So nice. Chip, 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 chip. Oh, oh you bitch. Oh, my God. Is it going to be so, the year of China? So this is his strength. This is Pro strength. He does not hesitate at all. He just goes in, does it as fast as possible. So that's his strength, wow. basically. No so, doubts in his mind. No doubts. Oh, what doubts do you have when you have Mochi and Ricky Martin behind you, right? True. And you're the first player on the team, and you're beating three, three people already. Right. Oh my. So Mimura is up. We see that opening before. Did, did he get the win punish? Wow. That's probably the first Karaka we've seen, right? Right, it is. Because Chun usually has a ton of uh, ultra slicks against it. Uh -huh. And she sees it coming. Not really, but... Uh, but. So he's going to go in? Yep, he's Memora. Whoa! Shimmy. Dash forward, Shimmy. cross jab, dash back, dash forward. Shimmy. Yep. <laughs> By the way, Makoto's dash is like, what, 11 frames? Uh, no, it's 10. 10? Yeah. No, wait, it, it might, it, 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 I something, think it's 10. Something obscene. I think it's 10 total. Okay. What? Yeah, that doesn't give you a meter, but... Now she's just teleporting. <laughs> These are online tactics, Makoto, right here. Oh. Online Makoto's mad strong, by the way. <laughs> So, Pearl Rice is about to go down with the, with the last hit by Seichu Sen. He knew he missed the link, that's why he, he changed the TC. Oh, I see. Dash it, go forward. Is it gonna do it? It's gonna do it. But Mimura has bar. Pearl Rice only has one. It's trying to hard to keep up with his pace. Back first. Just stuff the dash up. Dash up. 
Maybe he can do it. Maybe he can do it. He's this close. Oh, my. oh! Sick parry. Wow. He had to burn the EX. Good punish. He's gonna get the meter. Yes, he did get the meter. He's, he's one hit away. Makoto's one hit, one hit away. Wow. Was that a whip punish? I did not see it. The hate? No, no, no. The, the, the chest though. Was that a whip punish? Against, it was against the hate. Okay, so it was a whip punish. Yeah. Alright. It was a whip punish. But that. The window to do the whip punish against Hake is pretty tight. It is. Abochi! Oh my god. By the way, I'm teaming with him tomorrow. <laughs> Bastard. I've been saying this. You and your staff I I've been saying this the whole day. Oh, uh, he's a murder base. Good lord. Are you ready? Go! So, Torokichi did not come up. So, Mochi came up to play Memora. He didn't let Torokichi come up, so that means he's confident in playing Memora. Interesting. Do they play together the same. Uh, no, no, no. They live. In, they don't live in the same region. Mm. One lives in Chiba, one lives in Tokyo. Alright. So, Mochi probably has a read on him somehow. Yes, or knows what's up. You need that fireball just in case it might miss against Makoto. Crouching Makoto has a weird hitbox. A hurtbox, I'm sorry. Yeah, she's bad. Sometimes Ro is skinny. Whoa. Whoa! That's invisibility you get after the after neutral throw. Yes, yeah, so you get like 30 something frames. It's because it overlaps with the, the recovery frame from uh, uh, Linky. I didn't. I did not know. Yeah. They, they the so, so when they did that, they also copy pasted the properties of the frames. Wow. Okay. Yeah. Teach me something. No. So so she out. It kind of yeah. lends credence to the uh, the notion that they were kind of rushed for time. You know something I don't know. <laughs> That's a first. <laughs> well, that could have been a punish, I think. But yes, just so. What the? Hey, am I seeing? You are seeing Mimora. Top gear. I, I am seeing you are seeing Mimura top gear. I, I am seeing animations just glitch into each other. <laughs> I mean it's not optimal. Like he'll get he'll like he'll get a clean crouching strong that could have gone to a super for the win. But, uh, but whatever. But speed can take you yes. far. Oh my god. That was Baldi. Haha, <laughs> Baldi. Done! There we go! Mimura, known for winning the title on day one and oversleeping for day two and being absent at last year or something. So if he wins tonight, maybe he might not be in tennis tomorrow. Because he was so happy he drank too much, he overslept. <laughs> it is a legend. <laughs> it is a legend. Whoops. Yeah, that's a big whoop. <laughs> I mean, if that does happen, you're happy when you win. Sure. And yeah, then whoops. So, as I said, Ricky Maru. Oh my god. So now they got Mimo and Tominaro, right? And Chunks have Rikimaru, Oryu, and Taro Kichi. They are ahead in numbers, but it's Mimo and Tominaro. That's true. <laughs> and so, if Rikimaru can take down Mimo right here, it's going to be very, very relieving for the Chunks team. Yeah, it's a lot of pressure on Tominaga. Uh -huh. On the other hand, playing against Tominaga is a lot of pressure. But it's really hard to land a double Fukiyage on Chun Li, as you all know. True. But I've seen him do it before. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. He, he, he did lock assist. Yeah. Now, Rikimaru. Yeah. It, it will be his first time claiming the title if he wins with not being a Ghidorah. Go. Ah. <laughs> no short serve. What the? I don't even recognize what's this going game on. Anymore. Right? I don't even recognize this game anymore. <laughs> oh, 
Like, you, you thought mash like, spamming, spamming with moves is because of like that? Nah, yeah. oh my god. Now you can build meter like this. Basically, you can't whip punish, whip punish on those kind of moves, yeah. So the after frames are so, are so good. Oh, oh, boy. Tomi Naga! Tomi Naga! Being the anchor of the team, must defeat Rikimaru, Tadokichi, and Oryu to stay alive. You see how cruel this can be? I mean, <laughs> yeah. I mean, see that. See, this is why we don't really have to play for money, right? The, the competition itself is harsh enough. I mean, it's it, it's, it's it's pretty bad. I mean, it takes you a long time to get yeah. there, and you're not even guaranteed to win. But you know, you have what sixty people, five people. That's you know. Like, 300. 300 people show up for the free tournament without for a, a tournament without a prize, and then tomorrow like almost five hundred. We got we got even more. Yeah, for a tournament without a prize. Well, I think they're giving us something. Not not cash. Not cash. A trophy or something. Yeah. yeah, I think they were giving a headphones or something last year. That's nice. I don't know for day one, but they have some. Well, I mean, like, they are sponsored. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Right. All right, so let's see. Tommy Naga. So it's but, said that uh, Tosanami does not work effectively against Chun Li. But somehow, somehow, yes. Naga will make it work. Hopefully. I believe. Hopefully, he'll hopefully um, he can land 100% for all the stream monsters. Oh, good punish. He's gonna go for that stun. He, he better. Easy way to win. Just that one. He saw that little short coming. Oh, wow. Really? That was Amber River Ball. Amber River, Amber River Ball. Whatever. Is this the end of Tony Lagos Reign? I don't know. Not yet. Oh wow! Happened, she right? is Makoto after all, so she can do yeah. she can do a lot of things. But Ricky Mar seems to be on point. Uh oh! Dash up. Okay. Oh, uh, so? Oi! No, no, no! That was supposed to be a read against the backdrop. Oh, I see. So alive! So alive! It's not over yet! It's not over yet! Can't tell me never stay alive. Little short, short, short. Oh, so alive! So alive! Chip, chip, chip! Oh! Moves on! Oh, yeah. Moves on to the finals! <laughs> and for the first time, uh, with, no, with Taihei's announcement, I now know how to read the name of the team. It's Okuni Tama Ginger, but I have no idea what it means. I don't even know if this ginger, this ginger part is really the ginger. Uh oh. That we eat or that we use and uh, that we use for cooking. I wonder if it's. I don't know. Maybe it's. A I pun. have no maybe idea. It's a pun. But I know the story that um, Ricky Mars team came up with a very very inappropriate name, and they sent it to the tournament organizer with Matsuda, uh -huh. and then right after they sent their ent their entry through the internet, a call came from Matsuda. No, you can't go with this. I see. <laughs> Before they went to print. Yeah. They, they didn't even again print it. No, they didn't even make it on the website. <laughs> <laughs> so it was it was inappropriate as hell, and I forgot what it was. Oh yeah, yeah I remember what it is, but I should not mention this on stream. So fair enough. Well, it, this will be one so, of those yeah, the offline easy, after yeah. tourney so beer the, and drinks. The easiest way to know the name. The original name of their team is to become friends with Mochi because he speaks a little bit of English. I see. You can tell. You can ask Mochi, "Hey, what's the what's the original name?" And he'll go like, "Oh, no, 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 Beep beep. So yes, we have. Uh, and, uh, hold on. We need a uh, we need a band. I don't know. I don't know how to. We have Cap Masters and uh, Ricky Mars Chun Li team, it's, which is very very interesting because. Ken Masters has never won a pre-cup title. Set to be one of the top three characters in this oh, game. Arcan oh, thank God. And so Ken has never won the title, so they're really, really hungry for it. And Deshi Ken is like, you know, he's like fully fueled now. You saw how he played right now. So Deshi yeah. Ken is just playing phenomenal. He might have a good chance. And well, on the other hand, Riki Maru uh, has won a number of titles at pre-cup. Being a Ghidorah, one of the three Ghidorahs. Right. 
but he has never played in pre-cup, not being a Ghidorah. So I think this, it's the first time that he's actually teaming with four other Chun-Li. And Mochi Oryu were finalists at 2015. They oh. lost to Tominaga. Right. They lost to Tominaga. Right. Tominaga. So they made their revenge right here, just right now. Yes. With a little help from Rikimaru, their captain. Right. So, yeah, Rikimaru probably wants the title for their, you know, for his students. Yeah. <laughs> for his teammates. Got it. Because Mochi basically kind of learned um, third strike from Rikimaru and also from MOV as well. So that's why he's, he's really, really solid. And uh, obviously he doesn't play as well as Rikimaru, some would say. But uh, Mochi does have his own style, safe and solid. So he's... I thought he would be. I thought he could be uh, like the anchor of the team. Not he doesn't. Re he doesn't really have to uh, rely on Ricky Martin to be anchor. I think he's that solid. Mm -hmm. But it seemed like he stepped up against uh, Memora because he was confident, but it didn't work. But Ricky Martin covered him, so it it all worked out. Okay. So yeah, um, Mochi and Oryu, they're craving for this title because they lost in the finals. They would love to win. And what I'm worried is that I'm worried that. Mochi wouldn't use up all his gasoline today because I'm teaming with him tomorrow and I don't want to see him exhausted because I'm sure he would go drinking if he won if he wins he he loves to drink by the way I see and we are going to have an interview and I am not going to even try to translate no. while they are being interviewed unless it's really really juicy yeah really juicy talk, yeah all right let's switch over all right Oh, that's, this is Matsuda, by the way. This Matsuda, tournament organizer, owner of Game Newton. So, Pearl Rice. <laughs> Yay, Pearl Rice! <laughs> He's saying it's like a dream. All right. Oh, you meant. Well, he earned it. I mean, he yeah. did a lot. He, he did a lot of work. Tarokichi. This guy. He's on fire. Ooh, so. Shout out to Izumi, the Okoyama Chun player who didn't make it today, and to also to the KOF players. And, um, uh, few. Wait a second. So, although he is using Chun-Li, he is, he is doing the best he can. So he's not really like patient or he's not like calm anymore, but... Oh, see, he's talking about the, uh, being the finalist. So he says he, he, has, he has Ricky Marl on the team, so the only thing left is he's got to win. Looking at the camera, checking the camera. He, he says he's won multiple titles, he doesn't feel like losing. But uh, he's a little bit he's a little bit worried about Deshikin. So, <laughs> so that was a little bit of microphone from Ricky Mara. He's, he's telling Deshikin, I'm gonna beat you bad. Here I He's thanking his uh, teammates for being up here. And he's also mentioning that uh, Ken has never won a title. It's true. At pre -cup. So he'll do the best he can, uh, his teammates as well. Kose. Let him talk. <laughs> I could not catch. I could not catch a single word he was saying. <laughs> he said he just wants to win at the end. All right. Shie. He's happy that he was able to make a team like this. 
and he feels a little bit um, strange that he's standing at this at the stage right now at the finals and he's also talking about the, um, the first first title that Ken might be able to get mm, I see Matsuken <laughs> he said he caught a cold and he's he lost his voice ah um. so his voice is a little bit rusty So he's been losing for using Ken for a long time. He could not win for for the past few years, and since he since he's been uh, since he's now here at the finals, he really wants to win. But he's also saying that Chun Li might be a bit too strong. Right. And he'll, but, he, but he said he'll give it his best shot. And now we have Deshi Ken. Ooh. So 2012 Cooperation Cup, Deshiken beat Deshiken beat Ricky Maru, and on the KOW, which is another tournament, uh, Ricky Maru won. So it was it's one on one even, and Deshiken also <laughs> Deshiken Deshiken also mentioned at the end that he would love to play Ricky Maru and win. All right. So yes, uh, Taro Kichi's uh, speech was a little bit long, so uh, I got uh, well, so a little bit more explanation is that he wanted to make a shout out to um, the Kewa community as well, and as well as the Iz Izumi is a Chun-Li player in Okinawa, mm. to, to him as well. Okay. And a couple of years ago, he was a player that would, who would buy a T-shirt, these, these official T-shirts, and ask for players' autographs or signs, signatures and stuff. Wow, and they so, a long way now. Yeah, it's a long way. He came a long way. So she says, she says he doesn't believe that the situation he's in right now. Oh, I makes, see. Well, it makes sense. Yeah. Because he was a fan. Now, and now he's a now, finalist. Now he's beating them. He's yeah. eliminating his, the people he looks up to. Yes. Now he's he's at least a finalist. He yeah. might get he, he might, might be actually the winner. win. Yes. Yeah. That is that is unreal. That is that is very unreal. So and it's not all dependent on his teammate. He did a lot of work. That's true. He did. Yeah. And so stream all of you watching all over the world. This is the finals. Uh, Cooperation, pre cooperation cup. By the way, do you yes. know how much heckling in America this would have gotten if this was live, like a five on five? Uh, I cannot imagine. I mean, it would be pretty hilarious heckling, but nevertheless, it would be. But it would, have, but it would never run a time. That's true. <laughs> We'd all be asleep anyway. Here's the next problem. How are you going to get five people? Well, I don't know. You know what I mean? Oreo! Oreo is off! We have enough trouble doing interesting. She and Oryu. Uh, Alright. So what do you think? What do you think? What? Five teams, five teams. Five teams. Okay. That's the one. That's the one. Five four. Five four. I think five four ten. Five four ten. Both the commentators said five four ten. I would like to say five three Chun-Li. But 5-4 will be more tense, so I would like to go with 5-4 also. What are we betting on this? I don't know. Beer. Yeah, we're just making guesses that way. So, Ori, I just said he's, he's absent tomorrow. So he's given all he's got right here, right now. Oh, wow. Nice follow-up. Ori, you looking pretty good? Ori, looking pretty good. Wait, that was a late low forward. <laughs> that, was, that was a late low forward, which is very, 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 very difficult. But Chung has a lot of meter, so she doesn't mind spending two right now to secure the round. Larry oh, Perry. That is the first time I had seen a uh, target combo be getting parried this entire tournament. Uh, by the way, Oreo is very young. Very young. He's in his mid 20s. So he seems to know how bad it would be to try to do that. No, he's, uh, he's oh, good. really good reflexes. That's and that's 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 I that's see. That's Got it. He has to spend a meter. Hands to the DP. Hands to the DP. Nope. Oh. Sorry. Wrong guess. Wow. That's just fun. Oreo is in there. <laughs> Punch in the face! Punch in the face! Now. Wow. Good, good anti-air dash under. 
One third of life gone. No meter. No parry. Waited for a super. It didn't come out. Punch him in the face. Punch him in the face. Wake up throw. Master throw. Go forward. Wake up, go forward. That risky, but she turns out to have meter, so it's pretty safe. Late low forward, just like he did. So, let me explain. That was a low forward, right? Low forward. When you parry that, that's plus three. Plus three. No matter, no matter how fast you can cancel the super, you are automatically plus three because it's a middle move. And then you parried it. And Chun's low forward, I'm oh, sorry, low jab is three frame. So, so he can't do anything. That is a guaranteed punish right there. So, yeah. The moment Ken was parried, he was dead. And, and good execution from Oryu. And it's not that easy because you can you have a lot of moves that get mixed up because you're, you're pushing jab and then like short at right, right after another. So you might like get a throw accidentally. Right. So Oryu did the right, the right thing. So now we have uh, Jose. It's a good start for the Chun team. Walk up, walk up lightning legs. That is uh, not charge position, but uh, lightning legs position. You can do that. You can tap, you can tap kick three times to walk up and then put the fourth button. It'll come out. Accidental, no punish. He has fireball to get the knockdown. Fast throw, it's working. Get out of there, back jump. Ooh, that was scary. Stayed in there. First round, Chun-Li. Are you playing very, very well right now? He's um, avoiding a lot of risks and uh, he's pushing buttons at the right time. So, I mean, like, when Ken makes a good decision, good choices, and, I mean, it's, uh, you do suffer some damage. I mean, that's that's, that's the game. But yeah. aside from that, Chun Li is doing pretty well. I say Ori is doing pretty well. That is really strong. That is really, really strong. So, before Tominaga team. Oh, he missed it. He, he missed the super right there. It's, it's not easy. I accidentally he didn't get the super. See, uh, Oreo, he, at the last pixel, uh, he went for the universal overhead. And because he's like, he's just, he was just like, oh, I don't care. You're down to the last pixel. I'm just, I'm just, I'm just going to push that buttons. Because after a low forward, Ken is minus. Right. Right. So but he did actually get super. Good I know. Uh, if it's Shippu, yes. OK, but not not the uh, oh, okay. It's one more frame forward. Yes. OK. So. She knew what was going on, and when when uh, when Ori got uh, Ken in the corner, he pushed a lot of buttons, and then he said, "Okay, I'm jumping out when he sensed danger." So he uh, he he like basically controlled the ground very well, and he didn't suffer any like uh, unnecessary damage. That's why he was uh, he was in the life lead. But now Master Ken is known for backing off. He doesn't mind like. Being in the corner, I think. I guess I don't know, yeah. but who wants to be in the corner against Chun Li, right? <laughs> Can I already have meter? <laughs> or you being a little bit too offensive? Can't see that ambiguous cross the okay. table. I can't. He doesn't mind. He doesn't mind going in. He doesn't mind going in. He wants to kill. Woo! If it was super buffer, he would have been. Could not, could not react in time. Didn't have a buffer. Matsu can't take the challenge. He went for the fireball. Go. Could not react in time. If it was an EX, maybe he maybe Chunli would have gone through it because you react to the super flash. The, the EX flash, the gold flash, right. and then you buffer when you, when you have a buffer. Go to the punish! Nice tech! What? 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 Gets the double! Wow! Is it it? No. Quite not. No, not yet. Not quite. He's gonna get the meter. Low, short, short. Good. The monster kind of stuck 
Oryu, but Oryu takes down two. And Matsu, oh, it's, so it's Matsuken and um, Hirai and uh, Deshiken are left, right? Okay. And so, yes, they're having a conference right now. Oh, I have a question. Yes. So, before uh, King Hitora team was wrecking out for like three years, who won before that? I don't remember having a, I don't remember. Do you know what, you know what, uh, what character oh, wait, wait. I don't think they had a brief. Oh. Oh, I see. So look back at look back at history books. I don't know. I don't know. Every single one of them. But 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 the time I played back in 2005, there was no brief. Okay. The pearl rice. Like. Rice. Pearl rice. Pearl rice. Rice doing a lot of work today for his team. Takate Kina. Yeah. One last read, one last read. Yeah. It was, I'm gonna kick you in the face, and it was a bit off me back there, which works. Go for it. Push the button in the right time. Ken desperately wants a knockdown, that's why he fired that EX2 EX fireball, and he gets a super. He wants this damage. He wants damage right now, right now. Oi! Chasing her. It's not he gets a double again. Push him, push him, wake, wake the button. That is so called the anchor when he puts her a punch. Yeah. So, Chun has max meter, you don't want to get hit by any of them. It's gonna be a 50 50 when you get hit by one. Could not react in time. That was risky, but he bet on it. But he bet it, bet it. Should need a little bit more meter. That was should have been a super buffer. He's got bar. He got got Chun in the corner. Wait for me. Hurts. 50-50! There you go! There it is! Stunned. You went to right about this. Um, that is what we call the dark side of Thirst Right. <laughs> yeah. Because it's just like a it's just like a very, very unfair guess. You get hit by one, super. And like you still have to deal with losing no, half your life again. And then you get stunned, you die, just like that. Right. So that's what we say about the dark side of Go Strike. Oh, now Hirai is up. So Deshiken is going to stay back in, as anchor. Go for it. So let's see. Right. Hirai, last time, last year's winner. Not pre-cut, the main Corporation Cup with the KO family. Wow, I mean... I, 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 I did not know Pro Rice was this good. I didn't either. But then again, I hadn't heard I, of it before. I, 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 I played him time to time, but... Everything's working. Everything's working. I, I, I am very, very impressed by his gameplay. He has no pressure. He's feeling no pressure at all. He's doing whatever he wants, and it's all working. He is really, really focused. It's gonna hurt. Not the best combo, but it, hey, it works. Better than nothing. Give him some oh, he didn't give you uppercut. Need a DP. Good luck. Not pressing buttons. No, too, too scared. Yeah. Uh. One last hit. Oh. Uh, he needed ex right there. Oh, the wall jump. Originally, Chun Li was a character that was that was supposed to jump, but on third strike, she was designed not to jump. But she's still good, even though she jumps. <laughs> she's got the tools. Now we have Deshiken as anchor. Are we gonna have like an epic ending or is just like Power Rice is gonna close it out? Oh we'll have to see. Did you call this to be 5 3? I said 5 3. Now. Uh, what, 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 what? 
Half life. Cut, cut, I know, I, I, I knew that was coming. What? Kina. What is this? A clinic. A clinic. That's how you do it. Well, it's rare he misses the key. Oh, it's oh, rare. He, it's rare he missing those the car, car off. Oh, I tried it. Oh, that's super. That, that's short with oh, super. Oh. This? Dash again. Stays alive. Oh, so Ricky Mara wanted to wanted to wanted to have a seat, but he did. And Taro Kichi said he wanted to go. So we have Taro Kichi, Mochi, and Ricky Mara. Taro Kichi has winning, winning, winning like so many matches today. And that's gonna scale. That's gonna scale because the fireball hits. Didn't do as much damage. He doesn't he didn't care. DP. Mix ups. I can't, I, can't, oh, I can't see that. Yeah. I can't see that. Yeah. Good box. Uh, he uh, just the meter. Dead, yes. <laughs> he just used the burn that he has to adjust the meter to, to keep it in a DED situation. And he doesn't have to hit confirm. Low forward into no. super. He can just let it rock. Not bad of a punish. Low forward super. So, if Kawakish takes this round, it's over. Right. Ken is down to their final round. Ken can do this. Tournament point. Ken can do this to keep it alive. Stay alive. Oh. Staying alive. Oh, that was scary. Kakate Kino for the damage boost. Good box. That is it! Dash again! Stay alive again! So is it? Oh, it's Mochi! Oh, I'm teaming with him tomorrow. <laughs> so, so part of me thinks, well, Mochi is a friend of mine. I'm teaming with him tomorrow, so I want him to win, of course. Yeah, but part of me says, I want to see you tomorrow because Dash again. I see. It would be a more epic matchup. Uh, then I don't. Then I don't care which, which team wins. <laughs> if it's like down to the final final player, it's right, good, it's, right. it's good enough. It's, it's a good match. Yes. Well, good tech. Oh, he didn't push first. That was a BD situation. Pull it off. Gets him in the corner. Corner pressure. He, he's waiting for that DP. He's seen a, he's seen enough of it. Get his teammates wrecked. Stutter that DP. Good oh, punish. Good reaction. Good way punish. Shawty, can show you guys. Who? Who? Oh, 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 That fist pump from Deshi Chan, it's not over. Yeah, we've seen that. Oh. We are down to the final match. This is it. He's up, yeah. Ricky Maru is up. So, okay. Um, Shreem, this is the last match of the day. This is the last match of the day. Grand, grand, grand.
Well, we were all wrong. Oh, sorry, I was wrong. <laughs> well, now it could be 5-4 Chun. 5-4 Chun, again. Well, whichever. You know. But, you know, your initial guess looks pretty accurate. Yep. I don't think we have time to breathe for this. Is it going to be Rikimaru or is Ken going to claim the first title? Wow, them, them sweeps. So many Two more throws. One more, one more, one more. Roundhouse, I have you. And she is safe for this. She gets married. Oh my god. Could be the last round. Tournament point. Push him out to the right time. Low throw super. Gets him in the corner. Low short. Low short. Nope. Corner again. That's a two frame. That was a mean ass miss right there. So Rick Kamaru, last point, last point. Last, last round, last round. This is it, last round. Oh, pre cooperation cut. Oh, he Congratulations to all the Ken players everywhere uh, throughout the world. It's your first title. <laughs> Ken Masters, Ken wins free cup for the first time ever. Wow. So yeah, Desha Ken just did everything, man. Just he just killed everybody. Yeah. Thank you for tuning in. For the US stream. Oh yeah, for, for the US, US stream. Yeah, US stream, yes. So Desha Ken, uh the Mochi, I'm sorry for him. He ended up just. Oh, wow. One round. So. What? Yeah. Yeah. So. 13,000. Okay. So, yeah. Um, wow. <laughs> so. I I How can't I can't believe that just happened. You? That was only pre co-op cup, y'all. <laughs> that was only pre co-op cup. So you got to make sure you tune in tomorrow because it's going to be even more hype, more craziness, more stacked teams, more stacked teams. Uh, for those of you who are wondering, so uh, we had a lot of questions in the chat earlier about what's going on. For today, pre co-op cup, the majority of the teams, in fact, I believe almost all of them were just all single character teams. So like five kids, five chunks like you saw. Tomorrow's teams though are a little more uh, even now. You'll see multiple characters on different teams. But like I said, the teams are different. It's going to be wild. You guys do not want to miss tomorrow. <laughs> okay, now we're gonna have teams that are constructed to uh, to cover each other's weaknesses. Uh, or like if they have a concept or something. Right. So, Ken Masters are gonna have gonna have an interview, I guess. Sure. All right. Switch over. So I guess they are shedding tears, I think, or not? I think they should. <laughs> wow. Well, like, something very strange seems to be playing here. All right. So I could not catch a single word that he said. I'm sorry, stream. Oh. He said he didn't have any, he didn't like, could contribute too much to the team, and he just said Deshikan was just, just too good, just too good. Thank you, thank you so much, Deshikan. Uh, 
he just said, he just said, Deshikan, thank you, you're awesome, and thanks for teaming with me. Oh, this was Heat Eye. Yes. And I could not hear what she was saying. He says he is so, so, it was, it has been so long, he says. So he says, it's, uh, it, it, it's, it's all due to my teammates, thank you so much. The hero! It's all because of uh, his, his training partners in Kyushu and everybody that cheered for him, root for it, rooted for him. So, so people said that people said that um, Ken was a strong player and um, Ken was not winning the title. So he stepped it up. Now he's got it himself. He should be proud of himself. So we are going to have the second second place team, the runner up as well. Classic. <laughs> <laughs> so they're, go they're going to have some kind of prize, I guess, but I don't, I don't know what it is. Maybe. So day one is almost over. How was your day? This was, this was freaking awesome. This was awesome. Okay. Glad, to hear that. Glad I made it out, even though I didn't really have a team like set up before I came over here in the first place, uh -huh. or you know, on the this trip, but. Uh, if anybody uh, loved First Strike and was, you know, kind of had second thoughts about coming here, you should just freaking come here anyways. <laughs> You'll find a team. <laughs> something will happen. Get it, like, it'll all come together. I'll be helping you out if that happens. Yes. Uh, uh, please, uh, if you speak English, it would, it would really help. <laughs> Japanese or English? <laughs> so runner up. Atmosphere is amazing. Runner up. Second place, give it up. <laughs> even though he lost, even though he lost. That's, that's he, what you get. He is still Ricky Maru. No cash. No cash, no nothing. They got a pack. It's like a pride here. So we don't get an interview from any any of them, but uh, <laughs> that's that photo op. So um, that is the end of day one pre cooperation cup. Basically teaming with the same characters, five of you. I mean, what Mochi's drinking already or what? <laughs> it looks like a Corona. Oh yeah, that is hella, that is hella Corona. So they're gonna be awarded with something. I don't know what Here. it is. Oh, they're drinking. Oh, that, that's Corona for sure. That's yeah. poor oh, rice. Yeah. Oh, wow, they've been drinking so fast. <laughs> they started drinking from the moment they lost. <laughs> Give it up, the winner, <laughs> Ken Masters. You get a better plaque for winning. Oh yeah, you get an HG pack. There you so, go. So, gentlemen, what was your favorite match? Oh man. See, you're asking us to pick a favorite match out of a tournament that hype? Well, you can pick five or ten if you remember them I mean, all. What was that? There was, there was, there was one of the Neko matches. Against what? Was it Neko vs. Q? Neko vs. Q. I, I did oh, not no, see there, that. Probably, there I, probably I missed it. There was a Q match that was like that we thought was like match of the night. Uh, my match of the night is uh, still the. Q versus Urian, where he supers last hit. Oh, oh over, over there, there, over there. Okay, over it was Q versus Urian. Okay. Oh, they got one except and everything. They got T-shirts. Oh, they got Twitch shirts. Wow. Yeah. And Utah? All right, that would that would have been my pick. Okay, okay, yeah. okay, okay. So probably I missed that because yeah. I was over there. But right, okay. um, yeah, there were good matches all around. It was really hype, man. Who said it was? This was for fun. Well, it is for fun, yeah, of course. But um. Yeah, we're all serious, right? Serious competition. You saw them all, right? Just right now, mm -hmm. up on the stage. So please, uh, people, I just keep on saying, please support your own scene. And if we play Third Strike, 
please think of coming to Japan at this time of year, maybe next year. Or it could be tomorrow if you like. Dress warm. Very warm. Uh, I'll preface by saying, guys, uh, let's go left on the mic here. This, was my, this is my first time in Japan, and to come here for my first time and experience this, it's nothing short of mind-blowing. And I, I guarantee you, you will have a great time if you do this. Come out to Co-op Cup next year if you guys can. Start saving now. It is definitely worth the trip and more. You will not get a better experience. Uh -huh. Thank you, Durla. Um, I've been playing since like 2013, I think. 13, 14. Uh, wait, 14 maybe? I forget. But yeah, it's always fun to play. Even though I don't like taking airplanes to get over here. But. So wait, Matsuda's going to close it out? We started up from 10 to 10 a.m. Okay, wait, wait, just a second. So it's been it's been 10 hours plus, and it was a long day. And he says this is just day one, so we're gonna have a day two. And he's not gonna have any kind of like special special ending or anything. So please tune into the stream and see you later tomorrow. And so that's it. So. Thank, thank you, Tom. Thank you. For thank you, girl. Thank you. It was an honor. Likewise. An honor. Thank you, Twitch. And uh, please tune in tomorrow as well. Same bad time. Same bad channel. Right? Yeah. 10 a.m. 10 a.m. Well, 10 a.m. Japan time. 10 a.m. Japan time. So, yeah, we will see you tomorrow. We'll see you tomorrow. Thank you. See ya. Bye. Bye. All right. Yo. All right. Well All done. Right. Hey. Oh. Hey. Hey. We did it. Uh, Alright. <laughs> One more day of this. Hush. One more day. Arigatou One day more. Another day, another just leave. I don't even have lunch. Oh.